Li Yun rushed to the back of the mountain, swept the flashlight, and he saw a small figure running away hastily. Don't run! Li Yun's pistol only had less than five bullets left, but it was enough to deal with the old Tianyan who had run out of oil and the lamp was dead. After a while, Li Yun caught up with him, hitting him with one punch and one punch, making him thin. The body flies out like a kite. Puff! The old man of Tianyan opened his mouth and rolled out a mouthful of dirty blood, because he had dealt with ghosts all the year round, and his whole body, including blood, was full of toxins. Where the dirty blood splattered, the flowers and trees immediately withered. The soldiers who came from a distance were taken aback. After seeing this scene, their contempt for the cultivator was also put away. Without Li Yun, they really wouldn't be able to kill this half-crippled old man. It's overcast old man. Li Yun's tone was flat and said, Surrender, we might still keep you alive. Having said that, he also knew that it was more impossible to surrender such old monsters than to kill them. Sure enough, the old man Tianyan stared at Li Yun fiercely with a vicious look, Don't think you can eat me, kid, wait. After I die, my ghost will keep entwining you until I die. You drag into the 18th hell. Hearing his curse, Li Yun sank his face, without saying a word, he stepped forward with another punch. Boom! Yu Yang Fist is fierce and domineering, Li Yun is at a vigorous age, plus there is a justice value bonus of up to 15,000 points. Therefore, his Yu Yang Fist is full of power, and there is a faint flash of fire on his fist. With one punch, the old man Tianyan turned into fly ash. Everyone looked at the corpse in shock and spontaneous ignited by Wu Huo, and they were extremely surprised, but after another thought, this might be the difference between the cultivators. Although Li Yun didn't say anything, everyone regarded him as a cultivator. Ding, the host makes a choice to help Li Hua defeat the old man Tianyan, rewards has been distributed. Li Yun was very satisfied. Saving a life was better than building a seventh level pagoda, and the justice value also increased a lot. With the blessing of justice value, he is full of righteousness his nine sons' heavenly suture will be more powerful, and his spiritual power seems to be boosted because of this. After he left, the lady at the front desk who was left was stunned for a long time, holding the pill in her hand. She thought for a long time and decided not to throw it away. In case she is really uncomfortable, maybe this pill can really save her life. Li Yun came to the twelfth floor, turned left, and didn't walk far in the corridor and saw that the door of A1201 in front had been opened. It was a coincidence that Shi Taining was standing in front of the door, ready to go in. When he saw Li Yun, he was taken aback for a moment, and then he became furious, mortal, you actually followed me and wanted to die. After that, he stretched out his hand and wanted to pat the belt around his waist, but Li Yun had already walked up to him and said coldly, Shi Taining, if you don't want to die, Put your hand down. Shi Taining's hand was frozen in the air. Li Yun knew his name, but he didn't know who the other party was. However, looking at the other party is also looking for the Lord Saint, then, the other party is probably also a person from the Six Demon Gates. Humph! Li Yun gave a cold snort and glanced at the bag around his waist calmly, which should be the place to store the goo worms. Goo worms are very vicious. In addition to the common five venoms, it is said that some goo worms must be fed at certain times to obtain them. For example, on the fifth day of the lunar calendar, the poisonous gas is strongest on this day. People who control goo worms not only need to feed the goo worms, but also use special techniques to obtain the most powerful goo worms. Fortunately, Li Yun has a detoxification pill and is not afraid of it at all. You. Shi Taining's eyes flashed with a gloomy anger, but he had to suppress his anger. Don't conflict with him for now when you don't know who the other party is. Be sure to let me know who you are. Shi Taining glanced at Li Yun bitterly, and walked inside the door first. Li Yun smiled faintly, and walked in. The hotel rooms are very large, 
with three bedrooms and one living room, kitchen and bathroom furniture, etc., and the decoration is also very luxurious. It is conservatively estimated that the cost of a day is 500 yuan, which is very luxurious. But for concubine Wan Qing, it seems nothing. Li Yun walked in and saw a strange woman sitting on the sofa in the living room, about 27 or 18 years old, dressed like a professional woman, black silk skirt, black glasses and elegant temperament. Behind her stood two maids, with their heads hanging down, respecting her. Li Yun didn't need to guess, he knew that this professional woman must be concubine Wan Qing. 2. Please sit down. After Yi Rong became a professional woman, Concubine Wan Qing's voice also changed, crisp and sweet, not at all charming. She didn't even ask who Li Yun was, she directly greeted him to sit down. Li Yun also changed his face. Li Yun and Shi Taining sat down, and the three of them were in the shape of characters, with different expressions. Li Yun's expression was flat, and Concubine Wan Qing's attitude was gentle, Shi Taining looked at Concubine Wan Qing's eyes slightly fiery and there was a trace of fear. Please have tea. When the two maids had tea, Li Yun thanked him and took a sip from the teacup. But Shi Taining didn't move. He glanced at the cup of tea with his eyes, and sat down honestly, feeling extremely surprised at Li Yun's boldness. The disciples of the six demon sects should not only guard against those in the hidden sacred valley, but also guard against conspiracy from the same sect. If you don't pay attention, you will be counted to death by the other party. For this reason, the saints who are neutral are becoming more and more important. The saints of the past are important personnel responsible for communicating with each assignment. Concubine Wan Qing smiled lightly, and said, Actually, I put the puppet Gu Subgu in the tea. In an instant, the surrounding air seemed gloomy and cold. What? Shi Taining stood up in shock and looked at concubine Wan Qing with a wary expression, but Li Yun, who drank tea, did remain calm. There was a sharp contrast between the two, and concubine Wan Qing couldn't help laughing. Ha ha ha, sit, sit down, don't stand, I just made a joke to enliven the atmosphere. Her laughter was very pleasant, with unconcealable sarcasm and contempt, which made Shi Taining flushed with shame. Li Yun smiled slightly, but the two maids couldn't help laughing directly, and they looked at Shi Taining with a slight contempt. Concubine Wan Qing just made a joke, but Shi Taining reacted so strongly, it can be seen that he is not a big business person, and he can't hold back at all. There is no such calmness and calmness that Taishan collapses and is not surprised. Master Saint Shi Taining's face was gloomy, and she became angry and said, this joke is not funny at all. Hey! The concubine Wan Qing was innocent, like an innocent little girl, and asked, Isn't it funny? But, who would use goo poison as a kind of abuse? So as long as it is a normal person, he you can tell that I am joking. Goo poison, is the next three abuses? Shi Taining's face is very wonderful. He is a cultivator who uses goo worms. Isn't he also a mischievous thing? Ha ha ha. Li Yun couldn't help but laugh, especially after knowing that Shi Taining had just gushed the lady at the front desk, the words of concubine Wan Qing seemed even more funny. Why are you laughing? Shi Taining screamed. He couldn't provoke concubine Wan Qing, but Li Yun should not be a big man. I laughed at you as a bad guy. Li Yun replied solemnly and the two maids and concubine Wan Qing couldn't help laughing. You wanna die? Shi Taining was furious, and just about to do it, a silver-white pistol was already pointed to his forehead. Shi Taining froze and did not dare to move, Li Yun smiled lightly and nodded his forehead with the muzzle of his gun, is it you now, or me? Let me go, otherwise, I don't mind if you die. The cold metal touched his forehead, making Shi Taining's tone more indifferent. His cultivation is not enough to make him completely ignore the bullets at close range, but if he desperately, he does have the confidence to kill Li Yun. It's just that the loss is too big, it's worth doing that. If you don't have the ability, don't be so irritable. 
not everyone is as good-tempered as I am. Li Yun's tone was flat, put the pistol back in his pocket, and patted it, saying that his gun is there, and if you want to challenge it, come. Shi Taining stared at Li Yun with gloomy eyes for a long time, and suddenly said, You are not from the six demon sects. He could see that Li Yun was used to pistols, which was rare among the six magic gates. In addition, Li Yun's temperament is not in line with the six demon gates, but more like a person from the hidden sacred valley. Of course, if Li Yun were from the hidden sacred valley, he would have dealt with concubine Wan Qing. The people in the hidden sacred valley are lunatics, even more mad than the six demon gates, and they will never die when they meet. Not bad. Li Yun directly admitted that concubine Wan Qing knew his details, and if she wanted to tell others, Li Yun couldn't help it. However, he estimated that consort Wan Qing, a scheming and unpredictable demon girl, would never reveal Li Yun's details easily. Humph! Shi Taining did not question Li Yun's origins, he even saw that Li Yun's true face was hidden. He guessed that Li Yun was an outside subordinate sought by concubine Wan Qing, similar to special forces and mercenaries, otherwise he would not be so proficient in firearms. With such an identity, Shi Taining can kill hundreds of times within three seconds, and he is not afraid of concubine Wan Qing's revenge. For the sake of being an outsider, concubine Wan Qing should not embarrass him. Thinking of this, Shi Taining gave a sinister smile, and shouted, Boy, I have something to talk with the Lord Saint you get out and stand. Li Yun ignored him, looked at concubine Wan Qing, waiting for her to decide. From now till now, concubine Wan Qing didn't say a word, she kept watching the dispute between the two with a smile. Li Yun is not a fool, of course he heard concubine Wan Qing's intention to explain the puppet Gu. It was nothing more than warning him not to fool her with strange pill, otherwise, concubine Wan Qing would inevitably use puppet Gu making Li Yun better than death and becoming her puppet. So Li Yun simply got up and left, and didn't bother to pay attention to this demon girl. Puppet Gu Concubine Wan Qing's expression was innocent, and she deliberately pretended to be confused, what are you talking about? I'm just afraid that you don't know the puppet Gu, so I'll explain it to you, lest you encounter in the future and don't know how to avoid it. I am caring about my friends. Yet. Friend? Do you still think I am your friend, and you have made such a mess? Li Yun was very upset. Really, you are really my friend. Concubine Wan Qing seemed to be acting like a coquettish, her eyes a little avoiding Li Yun's gaze, she bit her blushing lips and said. The two maids behind her, Xiao Qing and Xiao Lan, were very surprised. They had followed concubine Wan Qing since they were young and the young lady, let alone friends, didn't even have a slight favorite. Concubine Wan Qing has always treated the people around her with great caution. It is too difficult to be her friend, and it is almost impossible to be in the six magic gates. Forget it. Li Yun ignored him and walked forward. Concubine Wan Qing stomped her feet with anger, Hey, what do you want from me? Xiao Qing and Xiao Lan were even more surprised. The young lady is now constantly fluctuating with anger, her eyes are full of unwillingness and regret. It seems that their young lady really does not want to lose Li Yun's friend. Li Yun stopped, but didn't look back at her, and said lightly, Since you consider me to be your friend, then you should apologize to me for what you did wrong. What? Concubine Wan Qing's eyes widened, with an unbelievable expression, You, you. Do you want me to apologize? Xiao Qing and Xiao Lan were completely dumbfounded. They would never have imagined that there would be someone so bold that they dare to ask the saint of the six magic gates to apologize to her. You know, their young lady, Master Saint, is already a powerful person in the Void Return realm, and can be compared to the existence of a master in the martial arts. No, the general master in the martial arts is not the opponent of concubine Wan Qing. She can pinch it with just one finger. Li Yun died, and he actually dared to make Lord Saint apologize. No, absolutely impossible. 
Concubine Wanqing yelled with anger, and yelled angrily, Li Yun, I don't care how you die and tell you that I want me to apologize unless in the next life. Get out of here, and hope that one day you will stop begging me and die. Her voice is delicate and crisp, singing like a nightingale, even if she is cursing, it is very comfortable to hear. Li Yun was surprised that concubine Wan Qing's voice was very different from usual. It turned out that she also disguised her voice, just like Xia Fi Yeo. Get out! Concubine Wan Qing glared at him angrily, and then began to curse, You better pray not to beg me in the future, otherwise, I must let you kneel in front of me before I am willing to help you. Don't worry, I will never kneel and beg you one day. Li Yun smiled slightly and left directly. The concubine Wan Qing stayed there for a long time, and finally walked back to the room bitterly, not knowing what she was thinking. Xiao Qing and Xiaolan looked at each other. Just now, they clearly saw the sadness in Miss's eyes. Miss actually cares about Li Yun's friend, right? Otherwise, how could he be angry and haven't said to break diplomatic relations with Li Yun? No. Is the lady really angry? Xiao Qing asked. Option 1, save one's life and build a seven-level pagoda, open the security envelope, reward justice value plus 1000, blue gift bag asterisk 3. Option 2, find a way to save the security and reward justice value plus 500. Option 3, open the envelope and hunt down Shi Taining, reward justice value plus 5000. All attributes plus 800, purple gift bag asterisk 2. Li Yun frowned, there was a problem with this envelope. At the same time, his heart was also full of anger, and he wanted to kill Shi Taining immediately. This person's character has been distorted to a certain level, and if it is not as good as his intentions, he immediately kills people with goo worms, which is extremely cruel. The security guard pushed the envelope to Li Yun again and said helplessly, little brother, just accept the envelope. Maybe it's important. He also said that I must watch you open the envelope, otherwise. Otherwise there will be a disaster of blood and light. There was a sneer at the corner of Li Yun's mouth, and he would accept the envelope. But he will never open it on the spot, otherwise, next time he meets Shi Taining, Li Yun can only be threatened by him with innocent people and led by him. This is something Li Yun can't bear. I'll accept the envelope. Li Yun took the envelope and said indifferently, but I will decide when I open it. Just tell him that. This, all right. The security guard hesitated, took out his mobile phone and called Shi Taining to report the incident. He charged Shi Taining for some benefits, so he reported. Is it? On the other side of the phone. Shi Taining smiled satisfied, he just accepts the envelope. In addition, remember the following things, I will just say it once, take three dollars of mallow seeds, develop them into powder, and take them at twelve o'clock in the evening. Take it for seven consecutive days, and your illness will heal. After all, he hung up the phone directly. My illness. The security guard was stunned. He was strong so how could he get sick? Li Yun hadn't left yet. After learning the content of the call, he patted him on the shoulder and took out a small detoxification pill to him, saying, if it doesn't work, you will take this pill. That person has a vicious mind. The security guard took the pill at a loss, but remained stunned for a long time. Who are these two people? Li Yun smiled, ignoring the doubt in the security's eyes and left the hotel. He has a lot of small detoxification pills, this thing is enough to remove ordinary goo worms. Hiring a taxi, Li Yun came to the train station, there happened to be a train, so he returned to Longyang County in less than half an hour. Sister, plucking, Kaxia. When Li Yun returned home, it was just noon. The three sisters were eating lunch. After seeing Li Yun, the three girls were all pleasantly surprised. The lively and cheerful Kaxia even dropped her chopsticks and rushed over to hug him. Lived with Li Yun. Brother brother. Li Kaxia played coquettishly in Li Yunkai, 
saying that she missed her elder brother very much in the past few days, as well as her elder sister plucking way. She talked about it every morning, afternoon, and evening, when will her brother come back? Kaxia. Kaywei flushed with shame, and wanted to come over and knock her sister on the head, but was hugged by Li Yun, and her elder brother kissed her smooth and delicate cheek. Wu, brother. Kaywei was even more shy, and it was the first time her brother kissed her on the cheek when she grew up. Li Yun smiled, Kaywei, have you missed your brother these days? Yes Caiwei Wei nodded blushing. It was the first time that my elder brother had left home for so long, and was used to the plucking of his existence. In fact, he has been missing him these days. In the past few days after Li Yun left, the three sisters realized deeply that this family cannot live without Li Yun. Even the three sisters are inseparable from Li Yun, and they want to be with him all their lives. After comforting his twin sister, Li Yun looked at the beautiful girl standing in front of him. She has a tall figure and exquisite features, fair and smooth skin, tied with a playful single ponytail, and her eyes looking at Li Yun are very soft, containing a deep love and emotion, which makes Li Yun's heart full of touch. Sister, I'm back. Well, my brother is back. Tears overflowed from the corner of Li Feng's eyes, and finally couldn't help but rush into Li Yun's embarrassment, hugged him tightly, and whimpered in his mouth, Brother, I miss you very much these days. I miss you too, sister. Li Yun patted her somewhat delicate back. Only then did he realize that his sister is not so strong all the time. She is a mature and stable sister, but at the same time a weak woman who needs someone to protect her. After the four of them vented their excitement of reunion, they sat down to eat again, Kei Wei cleverly took the tableware for her brother, and served him the meal personally, saying that her brother must have been working hard these days. In fact, Li Yun usually doesn't have to serve food at home, it's either plucking Wei or Kaxia helping him. It can be said that it is a meal to open your mouth, clothes to stretch out your hands, very enjoyable. Moreover, Li Yun can still enjoy Li Feng's weight. Today is Tuesday, and the second mock test will begin on Thursday, but Li Yun and Li Feng are not panicking at all. With the help of the system, Li Yun has already mastered all the knowledge of the university. However, Li Feng's grades were very good. In addition, Li Yun gave her a lot of pills to regulate her body, her memory became better, her spirits were also very energetic, and a good grade in the exam was completely fine. The only worry was that Fang Shui had also taken the pill that Li Yun gave her. Li Feng would need to spend a little effort to beat her. However, these did not prevent the two reunited brothers and sisters from chatting until late at night. As a result, Kaxia got up at about two o'clock and went to the bathroom. When she passed her brother's door, she vaguely heard some strange noises. She was curious to get closer, but plucking caught her in time. Pluck, you, well. Cai Wei covered her small mouth, and did not speak to Kaxia, Kaxia could only follow her with her belly full of doubts. When she woke up the next morning, Kaxia saw her sister Li Feng walking out of her brother's room, her eyes sleepy, and a few strands of black hair faintly stuck together. When Li Feng walked by her, Kaxia still smelled a strange smell. Is it her brother's breakfast? I'll take a shower first, you can eat first. Kaywei bit her lip. Sure enough, my sister had a long conversation with her brother last night, and there was still something left in her hair. Kaxia blinked as if she didn't understand, but she didn't say anything, feeling a little bit sour in her heart. Li Yun walked out, put two breakfasts in front of them, and said meaningfully, Kaywei, do you think our home is weird now? It's not surprising, brother is very hard, sister is also very hard, you are my support and Kaxia. Kaywei replied in a low voice and shyly, and she understood the meaning of her brother's words. Li Yun's implicit meaning is that if her brother and sister become husband and wife, will it affect the atmosphere at home? Will she be surprised? Kaywei's answer was that no matter what kind of relationship her brother and sister became, she would not care. 
Li Yun smiled and touched Kei Wei's little head. This little girl is introverted and shy, but in fact she is very careful and sensible. She is indeed more like her sister than Kexia. But then, Cai Wei said something that surprised Li Yun. Brother Dot. Kei Wei plucked up her courage, her cheeks were flushed, and she said shyly, Kexia and I will not marry in the future, we will stay with you brother, just like my sister, brother can also be with us. She was too embarrassed to say the latter words, but Li Yun had already heard what she meant. Only the innocent Kexia was the only one who didn't know what Kei Wei said until now. However, she agrees with her sister's words, okay, okay. Kexia clapped her little hand and said happily, I and Kei Wei are not married. The four of us have been living together. We will definitely be very happy and happy. Li Yun couldn't laugh or cry and gave the two sisters a brainstorm. Okay, you two little girls don't think so much now, study with peace of mind, go to university in the future, and wait until later. Kei Wei pursed her mouth in dissatisfaction. Her brother must have seen her as a child, but she is not young anymore, and she understands everything that should be understood. After Li Yun bought her a mobile phone, Kei Wei read her favorite comics and she understood more. Li Yun ignored her, and after breakfast, went to school with Li Feng. It's a pity that I didn't meet Feng Shui at the school gate. But I ran into many classmates who admired him. Look, who is the handsome guy with Li Feng holding his arm? It seems that Li Yun is back. Damn, what Li Yun? I want to be called Brother Li, understand? Yes, yes, Brother Li is back. I'm CAO. It's really Brother Li. Brilliant. Brother Li went to Zhonghai City and opened a company with a market value of 1 billion yuan, which scared the people in Zhonghai City, ha ha ha. Ji Li is mighty, Ji Li is awesome. One person defeated hackers all over the world, no wonder Li Ji Yi scored 749 points. Li Yun was warmly welcomed by the classmates of Zhi Kei. As long as he is not the kind of person who studies hard, everyone has heard of Li Ji's reputation. Li Yun may be only slightly famous outside, but in Longyang County, in Zhike, he is absolutely thunderous. Little brother. Li Feng attached to his ear and said softly, You are very famous now, making my sister a little jealous. Jealous. Yes. Li Feng said seriously, my brother has become so good, but my sister is still standing still, just an ordinary girl, in the future you. Li Yun A clear and sweet voice interrupted Li Feng's words. In Li Yun's surprised eyes, a beautiful schoolgirl rushed over from a distance and happily plunged into Li Yun's embrace. You, you finally came back. Fang Shui cried with joy. She and Li Yun had just established a romantic relationship just when it was like glue, but Li Yun suddenly left, causing Fang Suesha not to think about food for a few days, even in class, always thinking about going to Zhonghai City to find Li Yun. Anyway, she is now getting good grades in her studies, and now she is just reviewing, there will be no new courses, and it's okay to take a few days off. Fortunately, Li Yun finally returned when her miss reached the limit. Li Yun I miss you so much. Excited Fang Shui, ignoring the crowd behind him and his classmates, hugged his neck, stood on tiptoe, and offered a kiss from his girlfriend. The girlfriend's kiss is not a kiss on the cheek, but a place that represents the lover Feng. Li Yun hugged her for three seconds, five seconds, and seven seconds, until an aggressive middle-aged man came to him, Li Yun released Fang Shui Yanhong's petals. The surrounding students booed. Brother Li is awesome. Brother Li is my role model. Tisk tusk, the holes he ke, only Brother Li can be worthy of our university Fang Hua. College Fang is so beautiful when she is shy. The two kissed so affectionately, I was moved to death. Wait, the middle-aged man who came to Fang Da Wawa, is it Fang Huyu? Li Yun had already seen this majestic-looking man but he did not let go of the left hand that was holding Fang Shui's slender waist. Instead, 
he smiled and greeted him in a humble but not confident manner, Uncle, hello. Fang Shui blushed, she did not expect that the father who sent her to the school happened to meet this scene. What's more, she had been intimate with her boyfriend for several seconds just now. Her father must have seen the scene just now. Fang Huiu had a black face, his daughter was held by a young man, and he looked at him provocatively. No matter how good-tempered, he couldn't help it. Let go of my daughter first. Li Yun did it, Fang Shui was a little lost, wouldn't he dare? Uncle. The next moment, Li Yun held her hand again, making Fang Shui both pleasantly surprised and very shy. Li Yun didn't dare, but wanted to prove the theory with his father. Fang Hui's face darkened. Fang Shui is my girlfriend. Li Yun said in an unquestionable tone, I like her very much, and she also likes me very much. Our grades have not declined due to dating. I also believe that I can give Fang in the future. Snow has a happy future. His words were extremely firm revealing a man's sense of responsibility and self-confidence everywhere, Fang Shui's pretty face was very touched, and her little hand tightly held his generous and powerful hand, indirectly expressing her heart. The people around him booed, and Li Yun said these words so well that they fully expressed their feelings for girlfriends, they should be so spoiled. Humph! Fang Huiu has been in the market for a long time, how can it be so easy to convince? He snorted coldly, his gaze was condescending, and he faintly wanted to suppress Li Yun with his aura. Can you give my daughter a happy future? Do you know how much our family spends a year? Fang Hui pointed to the roadside, the Bentley commercial car parked there was specially made by me from abroad. Do you know how much it cost me? Everyone was silent until they saw the majesty and majesty of Fang Hui's family head holding billions of assets they realized that the man in front of them was a tens of billions of billionaires. And Fang Shui, his only daughter, will inherit this tens of billions of fortunes in the future and become a true Bai Fume. With them are totally two worlds. Li Feng looked at her younger brother worriedly. She was worried that Li Yun would be frustrated and become inferior and dare not pursue Fang Shui. It's not very expensive. Fang Shui whispered. This Bentley is worth about 8 million yuan. Dad, my boyfriend will start a company and will soon make this money. Fang Hui's face was stagnant, his heart hurt. Sure enough, the daughter turned to her husband when she was older, and she started to speak for Li Yun even before she cleared the door. Fang Hui thought of her daughter's performance in the past few days. After Li Yun left, she not only felt worse, eat less, and rarely even smiled. The whole look looked like she didn't want to eat and she couldn't wait after dinner. Online and video chat with Li Yun. If Li Yun had no time to accompany her, she would be gloomy all night. But even though he knew in his heart that the matter between Fang Shui and Li Yun was irreversible, Fang Hui refused to let go. He also knew that Li Yun had started a company and made a lot of noise. However, it is not that simple to become the son-in-law of the Fang family. Fang Shui, don't talk first. First suppressed his daughter, Fang Hui then concocted Li Yun, you said you didn't lower your grades because of your relationship. Yet. Fang Shui nodded quickly, last time I took the fifth place with 671 points, this time I think I can test more than 710. Fang Hui ignored her, staring into a pair of bull's eyes and asked Li Yun, boy. How much did you score last time? 749. Li Yun's tone was flat, as if he was talking about an irrelevant thing, completely unaware of the envy of the students around him. 749 points, this Nima is still uncomfortable? It's actually 750 points. Li Feng spoke for Li Yun euphemistically, my brother's composition is enough to get full marks. Many people think so. Hey! 749 is 749, don't talk about full marks. Fang Hui had known that Li Yun had taken the 749 exam, but after hearing it again, he was still shocked. Boy! In order to conceal his inner surprise, Fang Hui pretended to say calmly, 
since you said that your grades will not decline due to dating, then it is just right. I heard that tomorrow is the second mock exam. You have to take another 749. Score or above, otherwise, I will not allow you to associate with my daughter until the junior year. Dad. Fang Shui pouted dissatisfiedly. She looked very beautiful in the first place, but she was a bit cold. At this moment, she still showed a charming look in front of her classmates, making everyone around her look dumbfounded. Fang Da School Flower, it is really a big school flower, amazingly beautiful. As a daughter slave, Fang Hui have felt a little bit weaker, but when he saw Li Yun's smiling face, he became furious. This is what your boyfriend said, and it has nothing to do with me. Fang Hui looked at Li Yun with piercing eyes, as a man, don't you know how to speak but not count? Li Yun nodded calmly, of course, I am confident of getting full marks in this mock test. There was a commotion around the classmates, but no one dared to taunt him anymore. Through a series of things, Li Yun has proved his strength. Fang Hui was fairly satisfied with Li Yun's performance, and asked seemingly casually, How is the company you and Wu Kei are doing now? You are a senior in high school, and it's really not enough to start a company. And also got him 100 million. Fang Shui was a little surprised. Is her father caring about Li Yun? It is necessary for Fang Hui to worry about being fooled when starting a company. Li Yun was ashamed and said in embarrassment, I haven't asked, but it should be pretty good now. The valuation has probably doubled. How many times is it? Everyone around looked at him with weird faces. Biun Technology is said to have invested 1 billion yuan, which has doubled. Isn't it a market value of billions? If this Nemas is doubled, it will almost catch up with all the assets of the upper family. How old is Li Yun? At this moment, Li Yun received a prompt from the system. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose the host. Option 1, show off your strength, get Fang Hui's approval, reward free attribute points plus 100, random advanced business skills, random gift bags asterisk 3. Option 2, do nothing, no reward. Choice 3, taunt Fang Hui, make him smoke with anger. Reward evil value plus 100, free attribute points plus 200. Li Yun sneered, what broken options the system gave, is he embarrassed to show off in front of the future old man? Is he that kind of person? Is it? Yes, Li Yun really is. Ahem. Li Yun deliberately showed an awkward expression and took out his mobile phone and said, well. Let me call Wu Kei to ask about the current situation of the company. Fang Hui has no objection, he also wants to hear, the high probability that this is his future son-in-law's current company situation. Li Yun deliberately turned on the mobile phone to talk to the outside world, straight to the point, and asked directly in the first sentence. Wu Kei, is our company valued at 10 billion now? The crowd gave him a roll of eyes. Nima's desire to show off in front of the old man is understandable, but you can't show off like that. Just now I said that the valuation of several billions has soared to 10 billion now? You are a student, shouldn't you think of money as a wind blowing, just 10 billion? Humph. Fang Hui let out a cold snort of dissatisfaction. This kid is a good man and has a strong talent. He dared to act and did not evade responsibility. But even running the train with his mouth full, and saying everything as if he didn't pass his head, it was a headache. Fang Shui was a little embarrassed. She also felt that 10 billion was too much. Before, she told her parents that she would try to help Li Yun's assets reach 10 billion within three years of graduating from university, but now. 10 billion. On the phone, Wu Kei chuckled, as if to say, your goal is too low really have a valuation of 10 billion? The surrounding student's eyes widened, and Fang Hui's eyes came out. Li Yun smiled and said, I'm just curious. I haven't had time to ask about the situation recently. I think the valuation should be 10 billion. Among other things, he fought against the devil army, 
the world's top hacker team, and this deed was equivalent to investing hundreds of millions in advertising expenses to promote pioneer strikes. My chairman. Wu Kei smiled helplessly. You can be a little more confident. Now that our Biun technology is soaring, it is no longer the small company it used to be. Stop talking nonsense, how much is the valuation? Li Yun scolded with a smile. Everyone pricked their ears to listen. I don't know the valuation. Cut. Everyone secretly compared a in their hearts. But the Xian Yuan's Haidun subsidiary we established yesterday, together with the Commercial Bank of China Shipping City, holds 80% of the shares, plus some large companies, such as Baoyu Tong Company, my old owner Nantian Technology Group, they account for 20% of the shares, etc. The investment amount is 10 billion. In an instant, the commotion at the school gate turned into deathly silence. After a while, Fang Huia shouted out, the investment of the subsidiary is only 10 billion yuan. His Fang family does not say that they have inherited 10 generations of famous aristocrats, but they are also considered to be rich in Longyang County. From his grandfather's generation, the Fang family has been very generous. Fang Huia's father has been in shopping malls for 30 years, but he has built a large company with a market value of tens of billions. Coupled with some shops, Fang Jia's assets are about 30 billion yuan. 30 billion yuan is an unimaginable huge sum of money for ordinary people, and a little bit of it is enough for ordinary people to live a carefree life. But compared with Nantian Technology Group, Baoyu Tong, a behemoth with a market value of 4 trillion, 30 billion is just a small fraction. The students who were watching were all stunned by this terrifying amount. Real or fake? Nantian Technology has also invested? My CAO, Li Ji and Su Tenjiun have a good relationship in the future, can I be released from prison by the Yang Feng Dungeon account? Nima's a bit of pursuit, okay? Given the relationship between Brother Li and Nantian Group, you can have as many dungeon accounts as you want. Baoyu Tong and Nantian Group have always been rivals, now they actually invest in a company. The Commercial Bank of China Shipping City is leading, I am afraid it is not simple behind it. Some students who are sensitive to business have guessed the truth. Zhike is a private middle school, and many rich second-generation students study here. Fang Huia quickly figured out that it was probably the commercial bank that saw the potential of Li Yun's hacking technology, so he made bold investments. The facts are also the same as they guessed, the program structure Swan Yuan's shield given by Li Yun is the real goal of that tens of billions of investment. Li Yun said, let's not talk about the subsidiary, what is our current valuation of Biun technology? Wu Ke vaguely guessed the current situation from the exclaims of the people around him, and also knew Li Yun's mentality that he wanted to act in front of the old man. He he, the boss is a senior in high school, and it is normal to want to behave in front of his girlfriend. However, with so many beautiful girls around the boss, I don't know if the city gate will catch fire in the future. Little worried for Li Yun, Wu Ke deliberately said in a casual tone, I haven't asked a third-party institution to evaluate it, but... But what? Pioneer cracked down on global downloads reaching 300 million. The day before yesterday I tried to add an advertisement to the opening interface of the software, paying according to the exposure, and the daily income can be about 1 million. Wu Kei's words made everyone gasp. 1 million a day, 10 million 10 days, 30 million a month? Is this money really brought by the wind? At least for Li Yun, it is estimated that money is really earned casually, tens of billions of dollars is nothing at all. Fang Huia was speechless, patted Li Yun on the shoulder, said, be nice to my daughter, and left without looking back. His cheap son-in-law has a super talent, but he fell in love with his daughter while forbearing. In the future, the two will share joys and sorrows. Fang Huiu is not worried that Li Yun will abandon his daughter. This kind of husband and wife relationship is the most stable. On the contrary, when a man marries a woman, he is most likely to change his mind. Yun, you are amazing. Excited, 
Fang Shui put a lip print on Li Yun's cheek, holding his hand with a smile, full of happiness and joy. Her father had admitted her relationship with Li Yun in a disguised form. They would do whatever they wanted in the future. Even if Li Yun had something super intimate with her, Fang Shui could agree to it shyly without worrying about his parents objecting. Li Feng's expression was complicated, her brother really became stronger and became an indomitable man. So, where should she go? If it is just an ordinary college student, I am afraid it is not worthy of the identity of Li Yun's sister. Li Feng, once again had the idea to become better. Ding, the host made a choice and was recognized by Fang Huiyu, and the reward has been distributed. Li Yun ticked the corner of his mouth. Although the rewards are not very good, he can pretend to be recognized by the future husband, and make his girlfriend happy. Who doesn't like this kind of unprofitable business? But Li Yun soon discovered Li Feng's abnormality, Sister, what's wrong with you? Fang Shui also looked at her curiously. Now she and Li Feng's relationship is barely good, not only a competitor, but also a close friend of her boudoir. Together, the two of them deal with wild flowers that want to get close to Li Yun. Nothing, let's go, let's go in. Li Feng suppressed the anxiety in her heart. She believed that no matter how rich Li Yun became, she would recognize her as an older sister. This was enough. Li Yun shrugged, expressing that he couldn't understand the girl's psychology, even Li Feng, who grew up with him, couldn't see her thoughts. After arriving at the teaching building and saying goodbye to the two girls, Li Yun walked into the classroom of class 14. Brother Li is here. Unsurprisingly, his classmates made another sensation. The crowd surrounded him and asked Li Yun to talk about hackers. It was not until the early reading that these restless guys returned to their seats. After the two classes in the morning, everyone was chatting around Li Yun again. In addition to a large group of boys who admired Li Yun, there were also many girls who surrounded Li Yun, looking at Li Yun like a nympho, with shining eyes. The heart is written directly on the face. Brother Li. Wang Haoliang held the phone in his hand and said with a weird expression, Brother Li might have an opponent in this mock test. Oh. Li Yun's tone was flat, could it be Gong King Yu? Gong King Yu was not well known before, but after the last mock test, most of the students in Zhonghai City had heard her name. A score of 748, which is close to full marks, is only behind Li Yun. No, it's not her. Because of Li Yun's relationship, Wang Haoliang recently paid special attention to these talents with good academic performance. He flashed his phone in front of Li Yun, pointed to a post and said, Look, this Song Yudeo is back. Song Yudeo. The surrounding students exclaimed. Obviously, this Song Yudeo's reputation is so great that all the students in this group of classmates are like his name. Who is he? Li Yun asked curiously. He really didn't know who this person was. At the beginning, his family was very poor, he didn't have time to watch TV, and he used the internet only to play games, which was normal. Damn it! Li Ji, don't you know him? He is the national champion of the Genius Challenge. In Wang Haoliang's spitting narration, Li Yun learned the origin of Song Yudeo. Once a famous TV station held a program called Genius Challenge, which selected a large group of talented students from all over the country to answer questions on the show. This program caused a huge sensation at the time, with a rating of 15%. Because of the perverted memory and superb mental arithmetic ability of those geniuses, many viewers knelt and watched it. To summarize in one sentence, these geniuses are so awesome. In the end, it was Song Yudeo who defeated young talents from all over the country and won the title of Genius Challenge. What's more awesome? Wang Haoliang exaggerated, in the finals, Song Yudeo crushed the second place by a full 300 points. At that time, I scolded CAO directly in my heart, and felt that it was impossible to rely on me in my life reading to stand up. Because this song Yudeo was so strong, Wang Haoliang lost confidence directly. 
first place in the Genius Challenge. Li Yun smiled and looked at the post, then, what does this genius want to do? This post was posted in Songhai No. 1 Middle School, and the title of the post is Song Yudao vs Li Yun, which one do you like? There were as many as a thousand replies, and the discussion was quite hot. Li Yun clicked in and took a look. The people who supported Song Yudao accounted for 87%, and 5% of the people joined in the fun and chose to support Gong King Yu. Only less than 8% supported Li Yun. I scored 749 points last time, but the netizens couldn't see it. Li Yun was extremely depressed. He thought he was very famous. He didn't expect that in the eyes of his classmates, he was still inferior to Song Yudao. But think about it, this Song Yudao's experience is also amazing. From elementary school to high school, they are the first in full marks. Junior high school began to get various gold medals in mathematical Olympiad and physics competitions, and they are also the first in full marks. After that, the talent challenge was added, and it became famous all over the country. It succeeded in the role model of the good child in the minds of countless parents and became a legend. It is said that Song Yudao went to a foreign royal aristocratic school as an exchange student in his second year of high school, where he was also a crushing victory, and his talent can be described as the world's top. A genius with an IQ of 300? Brother Li. Wang Haoliang asked with a worried look, are you sure to defeat this guy this time? Not sure. What? Everyone was taken aback, Wang Haoliang hurriedly laughed and laughed, in fact, you are also very good at Brother Li. No one will understand unless you pass the test, right? I believe Brother Li. Yes, we all believe that Brother Li can beat this guy. Li Yun couldn't laugh or cry, I said I was not sure to beat him, but I didn't say that I couldn't be tied for first place with him. Li Yun shrugged, he has a high probability of getting a perfect score. How can I beat him? Only tied for her first. It suddenly dawned on everyone that they could not be defeated, but they could tie. Zhonghai City No. 1 Middle School, Class 1 In Zhonghai City, No. 1 Middle School, No. 3 Middle School and Experimental Middle School are all key schools. In previous years, Zhonghai City's college entrance examination champion has a 98% chance of coming from these three schools. The top 1,000 college entrance examinations are among the three middle schools. 700 Positions It can be said that the students in these three middle schools are top learning talents. The students in Class 1 are geniuses among geniuses. Although their family background is not as good as the students of the experimental high school, thanks to their strong learning talent, they also booked the top universities at home and abroad early and did not need to take the college entrance examination. For example, some people who have won gold medals in high mathematics are directly qualified for admission to TOP2 universities. The college entrance examination is just a cut scene for them. As for mock exams, these geniuses are not even more concerned. This was the case in previous years, but this year is exceptionally different. Brother Song, are you sure to defeat Li Yun that arrogant fellow? A boy asked indignantly. Surrounded by him and everyone else is a gentle-looking boy who is the winner of the first genius challenge and the most famous champion ever, Song Yudao. Li Yun. Song Yudao's expression was indifferent. Originally, he didn't want to take any mock exams. After all, he didn't need to take the college entrance examinations. Why waste time? However, someone spent half a million to ask him to take the exam, and Song Yudao recently returned to China for vacation, so he came to take part in it. Otherwise, the so-called mock test is not in his eyes at all. It's the guy who took the 749 in the mock exam last time. Another boy agreed to answer him angrily. Song Yudao nodded lightly, 749 points, not bad. The faces of the classmates in class 1 showed a strange look. It is estimated that there are only a few people in Zhonghai City who can say domineering and arrogant words like 749 points are okay. 
Li Yun, Gong Qingyu, Fang Hao, and Song Yudeo in front of him. A girl said with emotion, Li Yun can get 749 points on the test because his strength is only 749 points, but Song Ji can get 750 points because the test paper only has 750 points. Everyone laughed, their hearts full of strong confidence in Song Yudeo. Brother Song will be able to defeat the arrogant guy and give us a nasty breath. A boy shouted passionately, waving his fist. Everyone nodded repeatedly. The first middle school is a key high school, but the last mock test was actually suppressed by a boy from a country school. Not only did the third-year students lose face, the first and second-year students also felt very embarrassed when they laughed at their seniors. Fortunately, they have Song Yudeo. It is much better than the situation where there is no genius in the third middle school. This time Brother Song will be able to kill Li Yun. The arrogant guy. Song Yudeo was unfamiliar with the situation in Zhonghai City, and asked casually, what did he do? Everyone was silent for a while, and then babbled Li Yun's arrogant words. He said that next time he will get the highest score in the mock test, no one can stop it. He also said that he has mastered all the knowledge points of an undergraduate course. This guy also boasts that his painter is comparable to a master. It seems that Li Yun's paintings are really amazing. He also said that the number one and number three middle schools are scum, a group of mentally retarded children. Everyone added fuel and jealousy, Song Yudeo couldn't help but couldn't help but said, OK, I know what happened, defeating him is just easy. Just wait and see. With Song Yudeo's IQ, he had already guessed that the person invited him back to take the mock test just to defeat Li Yun. But even if he saw it, Song Yudeo didn't bother to pay attention to it, his strength was enough to make him invincible in the world. The calculations of those little people can only make people laugh in his eyes. At the same time, everyone in the specialty class of experimental middle school had similar conversations. But Song Yudeo was replaced by Gong King Yu. Song Yudeo. Gong King Yuking didn't have the slightest expression on her cold and beautiful face, and said faintly, No matter who he is, I will definitely get full marks in this mock test. In other words, she must be first, even if it is tied for first. If she knew Li Yun before she knew the genius Song Yudeo, she might have some interest in him. But after knowing Li Yun and knowing that his abilities were hidden, Gong King Yu had no interest in such ordinary geniuses. Top score? But so. She also watched the genius challenge, but it was the same. As long as Gong King Yu wanted to do it, she believed that she did nothing worse than Song Yu Dao. But Li Yun is the goal she can only look up to. Perhaps only in study, Gong King Yu can defeat Li Yun once. Great. Come on, King Yu. The classmates in the experimental class were rejoicing. Song Yu Dao was very strong and Li Yun was also very strong, but Gong King Yu was also terribly strong. Some students who knew Gong King Yu's details even looked at her with admiration. Gong King Yu not only has good academic performance, her martial arts training is also amazing, the two go hand in hand, can be described as a monster genius level. Number defeating Li Yun is just a breeze number. Number Yudeo, Gong King Yu, Li Yun number. Even if Li Yun is arrogant and pale. In the evening, Keixia held her mobile phone and sat next to Li Yun with Kei Wei and the three sisters of Li Feng. Keixia's slender little fingers pressed and pressed on the phone, mumbling about hot topics on Weibo. Brother is on a hot topic again. Cai Wei's personality is soft and even her worried tone is extremely gentle. It doesn't matter. Li Yun's tone was flat, and he reached out and scratched C.A.I. Wei's little nose. The touch is soft and smooth. After eating the skincare and beauty pill and the small Zuji pill given to her by Li Yun, the three sisters are now more beautiful, and their skin has become much more moist and smooth, like freshly peeled lychee meat. Just as tender. Brother is confident to take first place. After comforting the sensitive plucking, Li Yun received a prompt from the system. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose from the host. 
Option 1, defeat everyone in the second mock test, get the first place, reward Gong King Ye favor ability plus 4, experience value plus 300,000, free attribute points plus 1,000, purple gift bag asterisk 1, additional rewards are random as scientific knowledge reaches the doctoral level. Option 2, tied with others for first place, reward Gong King Ye's favor ability degree plus 2, Experience value plus 100,000, free attribute points plus 500, blue gift bag asterisk 2. Option 3, can't get the first prize. Reward skill, speak madly. Li Yun was speechless. What is this option? Is this first item under his control? If others have the strength to take the first place, Li Yun can't cut their hands for rewards, right? Spicy chicken system. Forget it, there is no reward for option 2, I'll choose 1. As for the skills of Rance, Li Yun wouldn't ask for it. This is cheating. After thinking about it, Li Yun casually posted a Weibo. I hope this mock exam is as difficult as possible. Not long after, his Weibo, which has 5 million followers, was overwhelmed by comments. Yes? Are you human? What is the harder the better? Boss, please be a man. I cried, knowing that Brother Lee is a genius, but you can't cheat us. You don't want Song Yudeo to be tied for first place with you, do you? As for pitting us so much. I hope this mock test is as simple as possible, so that I can get a perfect score, tied with Gong King Ye for the first place. In just half an hour, Li Yun's Weibo comment reached 100,000 and it was forwarded nearly 200,000, and it quickly rushed to the hot search list. Li Feng spit out a little fragrant tongue after seeing it. This group of netizens had long expected her brother to be embarrassed. After all, it has been more than half a month since Li Yun released his cruel words. Netizens' emotions have grown to the highest point, and now they are just breaking out. But then, Two microblogs of related personnel completely detonated the heat of the second mock test in Songhai City. Song Yudeo, it just so happens that I think so too. He didn't name it, nor did he forward the Weibo of at, but everyone could tell at a glance that he was responding to Li Yun's Weibo. In an instant, the dialogue between the two geniuses caused a large number of netizens to watch, but unexpectedly, another person joined the battlefield. Chinguo Minjiu, the best score, who is it? At the end of King Wo Minjiu's Weibo, a cute cartoon style picture was attached. In the picture, a cute little girl with a chubby face was standing with her waist pinched and laughing. In front of her, there were two boys who were beaten up by the little girl. One of them was marked with an arrow by Ching Kuo Mingyu. The arrogant little hacker. There is no doubt that arrogance and hacker is Li Yun's label. As for the two boys who were defeated by her, the other unmarked must be Song Yudeo. This comic has a lovely style and delicate composition, which quickly attracted the attention of many netizens. From the fragmented information, everyone inferred that the owner of this Weibo was Gong King Yu. Wow, is the blogger still a schoolmaster? The comics drawn are so cute. Follow me, I like it, beauty and cartoonist and swiba. L.S., there are no photos, how do you know it is a beauty? According to people from Zhonghai Experimental Middle School, Gong King Yu is a cold and classical beauty who scored 748 points on the mock test last time. Classical beauty? Is there a photo? I stole this from the post in the Experimental Middle School. It is indeed a lady with classical temperament. Miss. I have to say that all of the netizens are supernatural and good at speaking. No wonder everyone likes to surf the internet, and they like to stay and surf the internet. After everyone clicked on the pictures, they were all dumbfounded. In the picture, a classical beauty with a cool temperament, a graceful figure and long black hair is walking out of a luxury car. There were two maids standing beside her, and four bodyguards in black waiting not far away. All of them bowed their heads to show respect to this classical beauty. Just from this somewhat vague photo, everyone can make up for the image of a daughter of a big family, with a cool temperament, 
and an extraordinary lady. It's so beautiful, I decided that this classical beauty will be my girlfriend in the future. Following, the beauty is about to post a selfie. Student Gong King Yu, the girls in our fifth high school support you, defeat the two arrogant boys, and regain the dignity that belongs to girls. The shouts of the three top geniuses, the declaration full of gunpowder, and the strength of the three of them, made this mock test instantly become the focus of everyone's attention. Coupled with Gong King Yu's classical beauty, the character design of the eldest daughter, it makes the wolf friends scream with excitement. Not long after Lee Yun's Weibo was posted, he received calls from beautiful girls he knew, or deductions from the internet. Hu Xiaomeng and cute, big brother, big brother, how are you preparing for this mock test? You must cheer, but I promise in front of my classmates that the big brother will definitely get first. Li Yun couldn't laugh or cry, Hu Xiaomin's button name is really, cute. Rest assured, the top score is not a problem. Hee <laughs> hee, it's good for your elder brother to be confident. By the way, people are going to go back to Longyang County to see my grandfather, and then I will go find my brother to play with you. It is good. Li Yun agreed that Hu Xiaomeng had an extraordinary background, and her grandfather was a retired great general. His influence in the country has not receded, and there is no harm in a better relationship. Just after talking with Hu Xiaomeng, Li Yun received another message from Gong King Yu. Chinguo Minjiu, Li Yun, are you ready? Yunjun Yunchu, of course, what about you? Are you ready to be defeated by me? Li Yun's screen name is generally called Yunjun Yunchu, which is taken from the phrase in Cai Gen Tan, do not be surprised, watch the flowers bloom and fall in front of the court, leave unintentionally, leave the sky with clouds and clouds. Hey! Gong King Yu sent him the picture she drew specially. Li Yun looked embarrassed. Aren't you a cold, classical beauty, King Yu? How cute the style is! After chatting with Gong King Yu for a while, Su Muxin, the little pepper, found him again, saying that she had just returned from learning hacker knowledge from the library and saw the hot search of brother Li Yun when she went online, so she couldn't wait to contact him. Of course, Li Yun has also been chatting with Fang Shui, which means that he is chatting with several beautiful girls at the same time, so Li Yun suddenly feels that he is lack of skills so he has to ask Fang Shui to review and let Xiao Jiao take a bath and send them away. Husband Just after taking a breath, Li Yun unexpectedly received a call from his fiancé. Ye Yeo Well, it's me. Xia Fi Yeo's tone is very cute, tender, and tender, like a newly born baby bird, soft and waxy milky voice, like a feather in the heart of people, making Li Yun's heart itchy. Ye Yeo have you been practicing sword recently? After opening a room in the hotel last time, Li Yun and Xia Fi Yeo said goodbye. She followed the senior sister back to the martial arts, but was also confined by her parents for two months and told her to calm down. Fortunately, Xia Fi Yeo said that her parents were actually very talkative, and Li Yun was not too worried about her for a while. Yes, husband. Because of the previous events, Xia Fi Yeo's favorability for Li Yun has already reached 100. In her heart, she already regards Li Yun as her husband. Chatting with Li Yun in private, she has always behaved like a meek and well-behaved little wife. She is completely the ancient wife who obeys the three obediences and four virtues. She is extremely mild-tempered. She regards her husband as the heaven and listens to Li Yun. Of on the ordinary days, ye yeo, I usually get up at 7 in the morning and go to practice sword after washing up. After 8 o'clock in the morning, I eat breakfast, and then I go to read, write, or learn to be a female actress with my mother. After dinner, I will practice swords at 2.30 in the afternoon until the evening. Xia Fi yeo talked about what she was going to do during the day, without a trace of concealment. She even used the ancient style bath barrel to bathe every day, and went to the bath exclusively for her every three days. The petal bath all speak out. One petal bath every three days. 
Li Yun laughed teasingly, no wonder my ye yeo is so fragrant, I smelled it in the first place. Husband, husband, don't make fun of me. Xiaofi Yeo's tender face turned red, but she didn't blame Li Yun for teasing her. It seemed that it was normal for the husband to tell his wife these boudoir secrets. She had secretly heard her parents say this when she was a child. It's not a joke, it's true. After joking with his little wife for a while, Li Yun was very satisfied. Xiaofi Yeo is completely his belonging, this kind of wholehearted dependence on him can greatly arouse a man's desire for protection, and Li Yun is the same. He can't wait for himself to be an innate master now, and then go to bring Xiaofi Yeo back to gain the approval of her parents and everyone. Now Xiaofi Yeo can only use her mobile phone secretly at night, and Li Yun can only wait for her to contact her, which is very regrettable. Xiaofi Yeo couldn't use the phone for a long time. Li Yun chatted with her for a while, and she hung up when she said something to miss him in her coquettish little milk voice. Unexpectedly, just after hanging up the phone, another person called. Hello, Li Yun. Concubine Wan Qing. What surprised Li Yun was that he received a call from Concubine Wan Qing. Didn't this guy just have an unpleasant incident with him? Oh, right. Li Yun thought of something and smiled slightly, Consort Wan Qing, have you used the detoxification pills for others? How do you know that I am for someone else? Concubine Wan Qing is in a good mood, her voice is crisp and tactful, and she faintly reveals the charming and charming of a girl, which is completely inconsistent with the image of Concubine Wan Qing's enchanting girl. Li Yun shrugged, I wonder if you don't look like poisoned, so the detoxification pills can only be used by others. It's quite smart, he he dot. Li Yun was stunned for a moment. Concubine Wan Qing would actually laugh like a girl. This laughter was as beautiful as a spring hitting the pebbles. It was unbelievable that concubine Wan Qing had made it. Hey, why are you in a daze? What a fool! As if seeing Li Yun's expression at the moment, concubine Wan Qing smiled again and said in a soft tone, After this is my voice, you are the first person to hear my true voice except for the Holy Mother. Listening to her round and round voice, Li Yun's heart trembled. This concubine Ching Ching lifted up a man very well. A voice specifically said to a person, this kind of special treatment, a man will feel extremely proud. Ahem. Li Yun coughed, what is your real voice? I will feel honored when I take a look at your real appearance. Others say that girls with nice voices don't look very good. Wouldn't you be like this, consort Wan Ching? Li Yun joked. But to be honest, even if concubine Wan Qing is not good enough, her exquisite figure and superb disguise skills alone are enough to make a man feel unbearable. Aren't you raising your appearance because of this? Concubine Wan Qing sneered. When I first saw you, I was the real one. Humph. Concubine Wan Qing had nothing to say, but she quickly smiled and said, If you want to see my true face, you have to work harder. If you give me 10 or 8 detoxification pills, I might just I will show you my peerless face. Hearing this sentence to Li Yun, perhaps she just thought she was really arrogant. But after concubine Wan Qing said it, her pure and beautiful face blushed. This sentence seemed to be a confession to Li Yun. She seldom showed her true appearance, let alone showed her looks in front of men. So in a sense, showing your face giving everything you own to the other party. 10.8. Li Yun smiled with anger, Concubine Wan Qing, do you really treat my detox pill as a popular product? Tell you. Okay, I'm sorry. Concubine Wan Qing interrupted Li Yun, and said in an apologetic and extremely soft tone, I know your detoxification pills are very expensive. That sentence is a joke, Li Yun. Actually I thank you very much, really. She spoke earnestly, as if showing her heart in front of Li Yun, sincerely thanking him. Li Yun was surprised at first, then his face became very strange. Concubine Wan Qing refused to apologize before, but now she took the initiative to say sorry to him. 
The contrast between before and after is too strong. Li Yun thought to himself that this might be the effect brought by the 85-point favorability degree, and concubine Wanqing already trusted him extremely. Okay, don't mention the past. Li Yun said a bit more, but I hope that in the future, between you and me, there will be no deception, distrust, or threats. I do not eat this set. Li Yun did not say this sentence, but I believe concubine Wanqing can hear it. The other side was silent for a while, and then said leisurely, OK, I see, you can ask me what you want to ask in the future, provided that I want to answer you. Thank you, Li Yun. Nothing, I want to thank you too. The two of them were like ordinary friends that they had just met, and after being polite and polite, they met to hang up. Li Yun didn't take this matter to his heart for too long. Concubine Wanqing was like an unstable factor, and she was involuntarily in the six magic gates. It was undoubtedly stupid to put hope on her. But Concubine Wanqing has been unable to calm down for a long time. She opened the delicate wooden door, holding her smooth and round chin, and staring blankly at the distant mountain gate. In her sight, the divine light of the valley in the night was shining and fairy animals and animals were faintly screaming and flying among the mountain peaks, as beautiful as a fairyland. It's just that concubine Wanqing is in a mess now, and she has no intention of appreciating it, and she has already seen too many beautiful sights in front of her. Li, Yun. She whispered the name softly, and a warm current gushed out of her heart, which made her feel warm and very useful. But concubine Wanqing rationally told her that this kind of mood was the most undesirable. If you want to survive in the six demon gates, you must be cruel and never allow anyone who is concerned about it, otherwise, it will easily become the handle of others. Li Yun, what should I do with you? Concubine Wanqing sighed quietly, stood up, and stretched her body, her graceful figure is undoubtedly revealed under her light clothes. The pure temperament combined with her pure looks can make every man's heart hot. It is a pity that there is absolutely no possibility that a man would dare to step into her small building, otherwise he would be ruthlessly attacked by concubine Wan Ching. Ching concubine. At this moment, a crane made of paper flew over. This crane was extremely delicately made. With its pointed mouth opened and closed, it could really speak human words. If someone from outside sees a crane and can speak, he must be frightened. Mother-in-law. You come over to me. It is good. Concubine Wanqing agreed neatly. If there is anyone in the six demon sect worthy of concubine Wanqing's attention, it is only the one she calls the holy mother-in-law. Concubine Wanqing put on makeup, then concealed her true face, took her own weapon, and left this small building. Her two maids, Xiao Qing and Xia Lan, did not follow. Consort Wan Qing wore a long black dress like ink, walking through the valley of the six demon gates. Along the way, I don't know how many eyes peeping at her in the dark, a pair of weird eyes, changing to a stranger, I am afraid that I will be abruptly scared to death. Mother-in-law. Concubine Wan Qing came to a remote, low and dark wooden house, and knocked respectfully on the door. After a response came from the inside, concubine Wanqing opened the door and entered. The strange thing is that the inside of the house is not dim, the space looks much larger than the outside, and the clean and tidy furniture looks very beautiful. Mother-in-law, are you recovering again? Concubine Wanqing was very pleasantly surprised. The space in the house was much larger when she came in the morning, which proved that the Saint Mother's skills were quickly recovering. Soon, the Holy Mother-in-Law will be able to get back her powerful cultivation base again, enough to move mountains and seas, and the sun and the moon will be dark. Then who will dare to resist them in the six magic gates? Not only that, but the appearance of the Holy Mother has become much younger. The haggard and yellow cheeks that had been dazzled by the external forces inside the body were now hydrated and smooth again, as if they were a beautiful woman with lingering charm. The detoxification pill you brought is amazing. The Saint Mother-in-law smiled, pulled concubine Wan Qing to sit with her, and asked carefully the origins of this Jidug pill and Li Yun. 
After listening, the Holy Mother-in-law pondered for a long time before she said. In the past, I was betrayed by the of Fan Ling Long, and was caught off guard by her. Although I gave her a backhand with the Emperor's magic power at the last moment, Fan Ling Long has not died until now. I should have found a way to solve it. Concubine Wanqing nodded gently. Fan Ling Long of the Hidden Sacred Valley fought with the Holy Mother-in-law for many years, and finally fought both sides. The Holy Mother-in-law had to live in seclusion for many years, and had almost no right to speak in the magic gate. She could only stay on her for many years until concubine Wanqing accidentally obtained Li Yun's detoxification pills, and then recovered. After I retired, the Lord of Heaven and Humanity took the opportunity to seize power and completely held the six magic doors, but it's a pity. The Holy Mother sneered, the sky fails to meet people's wishes, and the rise of human science and technology in the outside world will destroy the scarce aura of the outside world with cannons, causing our six magic gates to be affected. He is unable to return to the sky and can only be doomed. Concubine Wanqing asked, Mother-in-law. Shall we summon the demons and hold the six demons in our hands again? Do not. The Saint Mother shook her head, although I have been a blessing in disguise, the Emperor's magic skills have reached the 18th level that no one has ever been to before, but the of heaven and humanity is not a waiting person. His method of transforming the devil's mind was 30 years ago. He has already entered the state of transformation, and now at least half of the elders support him. We are not his opponents for the time being. Concubine Wanqing nodded, it is better to be more cautious. In addition, the Holy Grandmother looked solemnly, the last time you said that someone was spreading spirit sticks and spirit sticks, did you find out who is behind it? Both of these things came from the six magic gates, and the master behind them could only be found in the magic gates. Consort Wanqing shook her head, I guess it was done by a certain lord, but no evidence was found. Moreover, the spell on the spirit stick seems to have been changed a bit. I didn't see the purpose. The Holy Mother-in-law thought for a long time, and concubine Wanqing fixedly looked at her, her mother-in-law has indeed changed for the better, and even her appearance has recovered. It is said that the Holy Mother-in-law had a common title in the Demon Gate and the martial arts of the outside world, namely, Holy Fairy. It means that her temperament is as noble as a saint, and she has a beautiful face like a fairy, so she is called a saint fairy. Although fifty years have passed, the face of the Holy Mother-in-law remains the same, and after years of precipitation, it has become more charming. I don't care about this for now. The grandmother took out a piece of paper and wrote something on it, then folded it into a paper crane, imposed a charm on it, and handed it to concubine Wan Ching. This thing, open it after you go out to the outside world, it will find that bitch. Consort Wanqing was a little surprised, mother-in-law, why did you contact her? Hee <laughs> hee, it's just killing someone with a knife, go, mother-in-law, I want to rest for a while, waiting for the day when we fight again with Fan Ling Long. Li Yun naturally didn't know the conversation between concubine Wanqing and the holy mother-in-law and he also didn't know who concubine Wanqing used the detoxification pills. But he understood that even if concubine Wanqing trusted him, it was impossible to tell him more secrets. Because Li Yun's current level is too low, he is only a warrior in the middle of the acquired realm, and he is not qualified enough to know about concubine Wanqing and the six demon sects. Therefore, Li Yun didn't ask too much, so he prepared for the mock exam with ease. The next day, Li Yunggong and Li Feng went out after breakfast. Before they reached the school gate, they were besieged by a group of journalists carrying guns and cannons. Hello, are you Li Yun? I am a reporter from Entertainment Weekly. Are you going to take the mock exam today? Nonsense, you all came to surround me, don't you know this? Li Yun couldn't help but give these reporters a blank look. Hello, Li Yun. I am the editor of EXIN News, would you like to take a moment to talk about mock exams? Student Li Yun, are you confident to defeat Song Yudeo? Where is Gong King Yu? 
I heard that you have a very good relationship with her, is it true? Hello, beautiful lady, are you Li Yun's girlfriend? Are you living together? Li Yun, tell me what your goal is for this exam. A large group of reporters were clamoring and clamoring. In the current heat, they would like Li Yun to say a few more words. It is best to use the kind of hot news to make their news flow more. Li Feng tightly grasped his younger brother's hand, and tried to speak several times, but was stopped by Li Yun. These entertainment reporters have no limit at all. Li Yun said that he is confident to win the first place, but the news headline of these reporters will be, shocking. Li Yun uttered wild words, Song Yudeo was not in his eyes at all, why did he say that? Wait, anyway, the news headlines of the reporters are shocking and shocking. In the end, Li Yun was impatient with the quarrel, and said directly, I will definitely get a full score in this exam. I will leave it here. Go write news. After finishing speaking, he took Li Feng's hand and walked quickly into the school gate. The reporters did not dare to enter the campus, so they could only take a few photos of Li Yun face to face, and each went back to write news and compete for traffic. Soon, as soon as Li Yun finished reading early, Wang Haoliang took the cell phone to report. Brother Li, you are on hot search again. Li Yun was speechless, this Nima, he went on hot search every day? These reporters are really idle. What did the hot search say about me? Hey, the 15th in the hot search list. Wang Haoliang said with a smile, reporters said, you live with a beautiful school girl and are very close. Li Yun shrugged and expressed his disinterest. Even if others knew that he and Li Feng had intimate behaviors beyond the normal range, Li Yun was not afraid at all. Why? Because Li Yun and his elder sister are not relatives at all, the reporters knew that the siblings were adopted after checking, so there is basically something wrong, Li Yun is not afraid of being scolded by someone pointing his nose. At most he scolded him for being handsome and fluid, stepping on a few boats or something. But having said that, when a young man is proud, doesn't he just want to hug the left and the right, and enjoy the beauty and beauty of the world? However, Li Yun let him go to reporters, and let him ignite again. The second mock test can get full marks. Brother, I am waiting for your performance to see if you are really awesome or bragging. With the attention of countless netizens, the second mock test of Zhonghai City finally began. At 9 o'clock in the morning on Thursday, the language test. If Li Yun writes with divine assistance, he will be full of thoughts when writing the essay. After two and a half hours of examination time, Li Yun only took less than one and a half hours to finish the examination and hand in the paper directly. Seeing Li Yun stepping onto the podium with a confident face to hand in the papers, the classmates in the examination room became agitated. Brother Li is too fast, right? Men can't be so fast. Brother Li is awesome. Just now, every time I looked up, I saw Brother Li writing, without thinking at all. Brother Li writes too fast. I observed it and finished the 800-word composition in 15 minutes. This, I just achieved reading comprehension, and the composition hasn't been reviewed yet. Li Yun, wait. The invigilator picked up his test paper and looked at it suspiciously, only to fill in all the answers above, not a single one. Turn to the back of the test paper and see it as a essay. The handwriting is clear and the segmentation is reasonable. A cursory glance shows that this essay should be at least 56 points. Are you, sure to hand in the paper? The invigilator was shocked. He had seen English exams hand in papers in less than an hour, but there were a lot of questions on the Chinese exams, plus there were essays. Generally speaking, a genius would take at least two hours. The invigilator looked at the table below and found that it took only half of the time for one hour and fifteen minutes. Confirm to hand in the paper. Li Yun nodded calmly. You have to think about it. The invigilator once again persuaded, you can't return after you hand in your papers and leave the examination room. You have to check it before you leave. Besides, 
don't you want to take the full score? The invigilator for the mock exam is also from the school, so the students in the exam room did not complain about Li Yun's extra care. Li Yun smiled slightly, if I don't have this confidence, then I dare not say anything about getting a full score in the test. After speaking, he strode out of the examination room, leaving behind a group of stunned classmates. This is the confidence of a perfect genius. The invigilator smiled bitterly and shook his head. This is the first time he has seen such a genius since he has been a teacher for 20 years. Soon, the news that Li Yun handed in the paper more than an hour in advance spread quickly across the internet, and also reached the ears of a middle school classmate. Hey, there is nothing great about submitting papers in advance, the key is still to look at the score, right, Song Ji? A classmate slapped Song Yudeo's flattery, but the latter did not look good. His language test took an hour and 45 minutes, which was half an hour longer than Li Yun. This is unbearable for Song Yudeo, who is striving for the first place in everything. No, I must hand in papers earlier than him for the math test in the afternoon. Song Yudeo clenched his fists, a touch of determination flashed in his eyes. Experimental Middle School, Special Class After finishing the Chinese test, Fang Hao was proud of the spring breeze, and said to the classical beauty who was sitting quietly, King Yu, I heard that Li Yun finished the Chinese test in just over an hour. Gong King Yu didn't even look at him. Fang Hao didn't get angry, and continued, King Yu, I don't think how long it takes is important at all. The important thing is whether a person can fulfill his promise. Li Yun said that he wants to get the first place but he doesn't pay much attention to the exam. He just said that there was no action at all. This kind of man is undoubtedly the kind that girls hate most. Gong King Yu put a smile at the corner of his mouth, Fang Hao, the grades haven't come out yet, how do you know he can't be the first? Fang Hao was speechless for a while. Don't talk to me anymore. After dropping this sentence, Gong King Yu packed up and left the classroom with his school bag. Fang Hao was left biting his teeth with hatred. The math test starts at 3 in the afternoon and ends at 5, after which the teacher immediately changes the paper, and basically gets the ranking on Monday. Before 4 o'clock, Song Yudeo stood up and handed in the paper in the eyes of everyone, leaving behind a group of stunned classmates. The second mock test is the most difficult, because there is a third mock test, which is easy so as to build confidence for the college entrance examination students. But the second time, it can be said how difficult it is to do it. The questions are all about torture the candidates to death. Many students with good grades can't finish it in two hours, but Song Yudeo can hand in the paper in less than an hour. This is incredible. This time, I won. Song Yudeo walked out of the classroom and immediately took out his mobile phone to search on Weibo but did not find Li Yun's Weibo for leaving the examination room. Obviously, no, it means that Li Yun has not yet handed in the paper. After all, there are many reporters waiting for them, and they were photographed as soon as they left the examination room. Hehe, <laughs> it seems that Li Yun just writes fast, not very talented. Song Yudeo showed a satisfied smile. Although one question was a little strange, he promised that his answer must be correct. As for that strange question, I can only say that the level of the teacher in Zhonghai City is too low, and it is not his problem. The other side. After finishing all the questions, Li Yun looked back at the fifth question of multiple choice questions. A conical bus bar is 13 centimeters long, find the side area of the conical shell, reward all attributes plus 500. Option 2. Fill in C, reward skill Dan asterisk 1. Choice 3, choose both, reward purple gift bag asterisk 2, justice value plus 30. The corner of Li Yun's mouth twitched. The system is quite generous at this time, but this question is really difficult to choose. He now has another choice event. After he gets the top score, he can get Gong King Yu's full favorability. If you make a wrong choice, lose 5 points for this question, which is basically insulated from the full score. 
Li Yun pondered for a long time, then glanced at the title, then looked at the options given by the system, and thought about it. Wrong. Li Yun was surprised to find that choosing the three systems gave a reward purple gift bag, and also rewarded justice value. Although there is only a justice value of 30, there is no doubt that this is the correct option prompt given by the system. Maybe it is correct. Damn it, don't care. Li Yun made a ruthless message, and directly wrote the answers of B and C in the fifth question of the multiple choice question. There are two answers to multiple choice questions. It is estimated that all Zhonghai City, no, he is the only one in the world who dares to answer this question. Ding, the host made a choice, and the reward has been issued. After Li Yun's math test took a full hour and thirty minutes to walk out of the examination room, everyone looked at him with different eyes. Pity, regret, gloating, disdain, ridicule, etc. Song Yi took only 55 minutes to take the math test, but Li Ji, one hour and 30 minutes, so much difference. Brother Li, probably has reached the limit. Alas, there is no difference in simple subjects like Chinese, but when it comes to mathematics, the gap between evildoers and genius suddenly becomes obvious. Song Yu Dao is an evildoer, and Brother Li is just a genius, the two are simply incomparable. It deserves it, I can't understand him holding Fang Shui, it's cool now. Everyone shook their heads and sighed. The reporters were so excited as if they were beaten up, similar to Li Yun walked out of the examination room and shook his head and sighed, Long Yang County genius has reached the limit Song Yu Dao firmly took the first place, and the gap between Li Yun was obvious. Wait for the news, it has been unceremoniously dumped on the internet. For a while, Li Yun's Weibo was once again occupied by netizens who came to watch. Ha ha ha, you can't do math, right? Fortunately, you are still a hacker and don't know how to math. I have a question, the blogger, your last war against global hackers or something, wouldn't it be the hype of the product launch? Hope dog, Nima is really disgusting. Fang Hao was so excited when he saw this. He couldn't wait to find Gong King Yu and talk about it the next morning. Li Yun finished all the topics in 50 minutes. Gong King Yu was annoyed and told Fang how this matter in a cold voice. 50 minutes? Math test? Impossible. Fang Hao's face was full of grim expressions. Song Yu Dao and I are both Olympiad gold medalists, and we have to finish writing in nearly an hour. How can he possibly be 50 minutes? Besides, why doesn't he leave after writing the test paper? I think he is better than but Song Yu Dao and I lied to you King Yu, right? Men want face. The surrounding students also expressed that it was the case. Gong King Yu had nothing to say, she was thinking about the fifth question that Li Yun said to her last night, could it be? In summary, two and a half hours of exam time. Li Yun's time, one hour and fifteen minutes. Song Yu Dao time, 1 hour 27 minutes. English, 2 hours of test time, the end of listening time is 45 minutes after the start of the test. Li Yun's time, 45 minutes. Song Yu Dao, 49 points. At the end of all examination subjects, everyone was surprised to find that Li Yun actually overwhelmed Song Yu Dao in the examination time of the three subjects. But everyone didn't think it was Li Yun Kiang, but he smashed his face to fill the fat man, and wrote the answer without careful calculation, in order to beat Song Yu Dao in the exam time. Zhonghai No. 1 Middle School Brother Song, this Li Yun is too disgusting. Yes, I can't match Brother Song in hard power, so I'm here to build a human mentality. The classmates rushed to express contempt for Li Yun, Song Yu Dao shrugged indifferently, after the exam is over, only the score is the most important thing. I don't need to worry about other things. I will get the full score. In case. There is no if, if there is, then the marking teacher in Zhonghai City is too to see the beauty of my answer. Everyone was shocked by Song Yu Dao's domineering, and they said that the full score is full marks, and the answer is still beautiful, dare to ask who can do it. 
just as everyone was crazy to flatter Song Yudeo, a classmate screamed. Brother Song, that kid Lee Yun's math grades have come out. Full marks. No, only 145 points. I'm CAO, that kid is embarrassed. Onwe Ibo. Ha 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 ha, no more, I'm going to laugh to death. A certain genius who preached full marks before the exam, but as soon as the math exam was over, his test paper was rated 145 points by the teacher. It is said that the arrogant arrogant was deducted 5 points for multiple choice questions. I, CAO, can make multiple choice questions wrong. This is also called swiba. If you don't understand, just ask, is 5 points a lot? Hee <laughs> hee. Five points are not many for the scumbag, but for the scumbag, there is only one possible deduction for the math problem, and that is because of carelessness, the steps are not clearly written, and the steps are deducted. Five points are deducted for multiple choice questions, which is too careless, so say, don't be too arrogant. After learning about Lee Yun's math scores, countless people tweeted and laughed at him on Weibo and only 10 minutes had passed since the end of the English test. So Li Yun didn't react at all. He still wanted to get feedback from the teacher after the exam. He didn't expect his test paper to be exposed so quickly. Forget it, just write. A smile appeared at the corner of Li Yun's mouth, and the person who exposed it might help him. He just needs to watch the show. However, will the teacher change it? Special Class of Zhonghai Experimental Middle School The news about Li Yun's math test was only 145, which was obtained by Fang Hao, the math group leader who bought Tong Zi. After he knew the information, he immediately smiled and posted it on the internet without much thought. Sure enough, a single stone caused a thousand waves of waves. Some netizens who could not understand Li Yun laughed at him. All kinds of malicious language were posted by the irritable netizens. If you change to another blogger, you will probably close Weibo long ago. Comment to avoid the limelight. But who is Li Yun? He already doesn't care about the ups and downs on the internet, he doesn't bother to care so much, let him go. Fang Hao didn't find Li Yun's response, but it didn't matter, as long as Gong King Yu's perception of him decreased. King Yu, have you seen it? Fang Hao couldn't wait to find Gong King Yu, who had not left school, and said excitedly, Li Yun only scored 145 points on the math test. It can be seen that he is completely bragging and is not trustworthy at all. Not worth relying on. And Fang Hao, the pre-admission student of Plinton University, and the future famous mathematician, is the reliable guarantee for Gong King Yu's happy life in the second half of his life. Everyone secretly said that it was a pity that some students who went to the press conference to watch Li Yun play against the Demon Army, and those who had a good impression of Li Yun felt even more regretful. Mathematics is difficult this time, but in the experimental class, there are many students with a score of 145 or more. They only get an imperfect answer on the last question. The full score of multiple choice questions is certain. Gong King Yu's expression was indifferent, her small, blushing lips pressed tightly, and she didn't say a word, fully expressing the restraint and coldness of the ladies. King Yu, don't you think Li Yun is very unreliable? A trace of resentment flashed in Fang Hao's eyes. Why is Gong King Yu still lifeless after Li Yun blows such a big cowhide? You are really annoying. The impatiently quarreled Gong King Yu finally spoke, looking at him with a cold look, saying every word, Fang Hao, let me ask you, the fifth question of your math multiple choice question, what answer did you choose? Question 5 The students in the specialty class were taken aback, and then immediately remembered that it was a question for finding the area of a cone. Choose B, isn't this a matter of course? Fang Hao replied affirmatively, the fifth question is not difficult at all. You also chose B. Fang Hao turned his head to look at the students, and sure enough, everyone nodded. Mine is also B. Gong King Yu said lightly, but the correct answer to this question is actually C. 
The answer is C. The students in the specialty class were stunned, and then immediately rejected the answer in their minds. Impossible, absolutely impossible. It is understandable to say that a person did the fifth question wrong, but it is impossible to say that all the top students in the experimental middle school special class have done a wrong question. Don't talk about the fifth question, just talk about the last one of the most difficult problem. It is absolutely impossible for everyone to make a mistake. Someone will be able to answer it. Therefore, the fifth question is definitely B. But Gong Qingyu didn't explain too much. He packed up and left the school gate, and walked onto the luxury car, the BMW M960, which was parked on the side of the road waiting for her. Hateful. What the is going on? Fang Hao gritted his teeth with hatred, took out his mobile phone and contacted the ZK Math group leader. Unexpectedly, the other party sent him a picture, Fang Hao clicked and opened it, and he was stupid. Did you choose B and C for the single choice question in math? Fang Hao's words stunned the students in the special class again. Li Yun chose two answers to his math question. Hee <laughs> hee, really stupid, I think the answer is stupid, right? Fang Hao reacted, with a mocking and gloating smile on his face, turning his head and smiling at everyone, this stupid ratio is really amusing, no. I have to post it online to let the majority of netizens see how dumb he is. After finishing speaking, I directly posted the picture on Weibo without considering the question of where the sample of the test paper has not been unsealed. It's really stupid. I'm afraid Li Yun is crazy, right? Some students in the specialty class followed to mock Li Yun, but most of them were very calm, and some had already begun to recalculate what was going on with the fifth question. Wrong. Soon, a male student with strong mental arithmetic ability discovered the pitfall of this question. He said with a dazed expression, I, CAO, it seems, it seems that the answer to this question is really C. Other students also screamed. This Nima, the answer is approximate. If one more significant number is retained during the calculation process, the answer, is 113. So that's it this question is a ghost. After repeated calculations by this group of geniuses, they finally came to the same conclusion as Li Yun before, which was also a shocking conclusion. According to the textbook example, the answer to the fifth question is 112. But according to the Examination Institute's rules on taking approximate numbers, the answer to this question is 113. After the conclusion came out, the classmates who had mocked Li Yun before were even flushed with shame. Fang Hao, it seems, eh. Everyone wanted to tell Fang Hao the news, but unexpectedly, he had already left the school. What's more unfortunate is that Fang Hao has posted the breakthrough of Li Yun's math test papers online. Posted in Zhonghai No. 1 Middle School. A bar friend named Tomatoes Fried Green Onions posted a post. Awesome, admire. Mathematics single choice question, someone actually chose two answers. Many students from number one middle school curiously clicked on the picture and looked at it. At a glance, they saw the two English letters B and C in brackets in the fifth question. Who is so stupid that there are two answers to the math multiple choice questions? I, CAO, I have only seen you in my life. 6666 this IQ should go back to herding cattle, learning is not suitable for him. Wait, I'm CAO, the name of this test paper is Li Yun. I slowly typed A. Really? That arrogant guy got five points here. It's true, it's crazy now on Weibo. Just how famous Li Yun is in a middle school group can be seen from the number of replies to this post. Post it, followed by 100,000 people. The number of replies to this post was abruptly piled up to 2,000, and it was within half an hour. This shows how much pressure was placed on them when Li Yun defeated a middle school student last time. Now Li Yun finally made a mistake, and it was still a very low level and stupid mistake, which gave them a sense of carnival excitement. Driven by this kind of emotion, 
this group of middle school students frantically spread the news to various deduction groups, forums, and chat tribes, allowing more people to take a look at Li Yun's ugly attitude. On Weibo, after Fang Hao posted Li Yun's test paper, the popularity about him skyrocketed again. It can even be said that this is a stormy wave. The discussion on the topic of number number unexpectedly overwhelmed the love enthusiasm of a traffic star official with a hundred million fans. Surprised, who is this Li Yun? As a result, the newly joined melon-eating crowd laughed when they saw that someone had chosen multiple answers to a math question, and replied with a silly ratio and mentally retarded, and they enjoyed watching the show. When Li Yun and his sister went to the vegetable market to buy groceries and got home, they even asked the uncle who was in the community, Li Yun, you guys don't do well in exams. Are you making a joke now? Don't do it next time. That's it. You have to take a good exam and a good university in the future, so that you won't be sorry for your grandpa's cultivation. Li Yun couldn't laugh or cry, uncle, I, well, forget it, what the uncle taught. I can't tell the uncle. I can only follow the uncle's meaning. The uncle janitor waved his hand to signal Li Yun to leave after another verbose warning. In fact, the uncle is very good. Li Feng said with emotion, and then looked at Li Yun tightly, My good brother, what's the matter with your question? Both answers are correct. What? I'll explain to you later, let's go back and cook first. Okay. Li Feng nodded helplessly. Her brother became more and more assertive, and she was almost unable to suppress him as an older sister. After the twin sisters Kei Wei and Keixia came back, it was not surprising that the sisters also heard about Li Yun. With Li Yun's popularity, it spread throughout the middle and high schools of Zhonghai City, even elementary schools. While making dinner, Li Yun successively received calls from his girlfriend Fang Shui, his prospective girlfriend Xiao Xiao Su Muxin, and the little fox Xiao Ming. They all asked about the math test papers. Li Yun was very moved. Okay, okay, I'm fine, don't worry. After comforting his girlfriend, Li Yun received another call. Wu Kei. Boss, do you want me to help? What? Mathematics test papers. Wu Kei smiled, although I don't know what the boss is doing. Public opinion is not good for the boss now. I can ask some people for public relations to reduce the heat. Li Yun couldn't laugh or cry. He didn't expect Wu Kei, his most contemptuous navy, to use it. Of course, public relations is not necessarily to invite the navy, but to settle some influential big V, or simply withdraw the hot search. No, the mere rumors on the internet still can't affect me. Li Yun said lightly. Well, the boss is different. Wu Kei gave a little flattering, and then said, We have a large job fair on Wednesday, and we will recruit more people by then. Are you coming? Wednesday? All right. Li Yun agreed, thought about it, and called the math teacher. Unexpectedly, as soon as the call was over, the teacher immediately assured that the principal was already dealing with it. ZK, 7 o'clock in the evening. Many leaders did not take time to eat dinner, and they all waited. The mathematics teachers in the school, other groups, teachers who participated in marking the papers, and the directors and leaders were all called to the meeting by the principal. All talk about what is going on. The old principal projected a picture of Li Yun's test paper onto the projector, but it was not necessary at all. Everyone had already seen this picture. There was silence, and everyone did not dare to breathe. Tell me, what the is going on? The old principal slapped the table severely, and many school leaders and the teachers standing around were taken aback, but quickly bowed their heads. In this case, it was caused by their negligence in management and had to admit punishment. Teaching director, tell me, how did this picture spread on the internet? The old principal's old face sank, and he said very solemnly, If you don't figure it out this time, you don't want to change your paper, but you must summarize your results on Sunday morning. In other words, you can change your paper as soon as possible. 
only to work less overtime. The dean is newly appointed and is also the person in charge of this mock exam. After receiving instructions, he immediately turned his head and said to the group of teachers who approved the paper, who among you saw someone taking pictures quietly. Everyone shook their heads, the math group leader was sweating coldly, and his body couldn't help shaking. The dean of teaching noticed his anomaly at a glance, and immediately turned his head and shouted, as the leader of the math group, you must know who is good at opening the seal of the test paper, and who did it. Yes, yes, it's me. The math group leader couldn't help but confess directly. Everyone looked weird, he was completely guarding and stealing. The old principal's face became more gloomy, what the is going on? Yes, a student asked me to do this, saying that he wanted to know Lee Yun's grades earlier, so I just... The math group leader also regretted it. Originally, even if the results were revealed in advance for this mock exam, it was not a big deal. It was not the college entrance examination, but each school approved the papers. As the team leader, he knew in advance that a student's grades were nothing. Unexpectedly, Fang Hao's cheating guy posted pictures of Li Yun's test papers online, and it just so happens that Li Yun's current popularity is astonishing, and all of a sudden it became popular all over the internet. As a result, the math group leader was tragic. You have to be glad this is not the college entrance examination. The old principal severely criticized, there is no organization and discipline. Don't sit in the position of the math group leader. The former math group leader paled. In addition, this matter must be reported to the GIU Bureau, and how to deal with it is up to the leadership to decide. Still the same sentence, fortunately it is not the college entrance examination, otherwise, the person who leaked the question will definitely be detained and await trial in court. After dealing with the black sheep, the old principal asked seriously, what is going on with Lee Yun's test paper? Why did he write two answers? Did someone change it secretly? In an instant, all the math teachers shook their heads quickly. No, it's not me, the principal, it's really not me. The former math group leader almost cried and waved his hand to indicate him. If you just leak your results in advance, it's just a matter of punishment within the school, but if you secretly modify the test paper, it is slander, an illegal and criminal act, and you must be taken away by the police for interrogation. Humph! The old principal snorted, I personally called Li Yun to ask. Obviously, he no longer believed in the math group leader. Li Yun, don't worry, I just want to ask a few questions when I call. You really wrote the two answers B and C? But how could you? Not only the principal was surprised, but the other teachers also had weird faces and couldn't figure out why anyone would choose two answers. Both answers are correct. The old principal showed a look of astonishment, and many leaders and teachers who heard these words were also dumbfounded. But after another thought, Li Yun was not a fool, but a genius who had scored 749 points on the test. It was impossible to make such a low-level mistake. Then, all math teachers, please verify what you are saying. After the old principal hung up the phone, he was shaking with excitement and exclaimed in excitement, temporarily put aside other tasks in his hands, and verify the math test paper for me on the spot. Five questions. Me, I am coming too. The former math group leader wanted to redeem his merits and quickly took out paper and pen to calculate. However, the answer to this simple question is still 112. It was not until a deputy principal who was familiar with the rules of the examination institute reminded that the math teacher changed his mind and came up with another answer. 113. This. It turns out that Li Yun is not the problem. This question is a bit too long, let's see how to deal with it. The mathematics teachers came to the same conclusion, but they couldn't deal with it. They could only say that the problem was cheating. Are you sure? The old principal asked repeatedly. Confirmed. A senior mathematics teacher nodded, I just checked the regulations of the lower examination institute, 
and the answer is indeed 113 in the case of approximate values, but 112 cannot be said to be wrong, so. Good. Great. The old principal slapped his thigh and exclaimed excitedly, both answers are correct, this is the best. Everyone was puzzled, and the old principal explained with a smile, although everyone else got it right, it was Li Yun who wrote both answers. This way, the reputation of our school will not be even greater. That's it. Everyone suddenly realized that, indeed, in the entire Zhonghai city, absolutely only Li Yun had chosen two answers. Immediately call our school's official Weibo to send a message, saying that there may be two answers to the fifth question of the math test paper, which is awaiting debate. The old principal urged, as for you, you can also post on Weibo, or wherever you are, and spread the news as soon as possible, so as not to let the outstanding students of our school suffer in vain. Everyone acted immediately, but mocking Li Yun on the internet has become a trend. Many people have made up jokes and spread faster. Because Li Yun posted another Weibo, which aroused greater indignation and ridicule among netizens. The truth is in my hands. When Fang Hao saw Li Yun's Weibo, his lungs almost exploded. Now that this guy is so arrogant, he is shameless to the extreme. Okay, very good, make you crazy, see how you die. Fang Hao sneered. Li Yun's Weibo was reposted 100,000 times in a blink of an eye, and the comments below were even more unsightly. All kinds of mocking jokes were overwhelming, and people admired the creativity and hilariousness of netizens. Fang Hao's winning ticket was in hand, and he tweeted a taunt. All the people who followed Li Yun were startled by this Weibo, and then smiled bitterly. This Weibo really fits Li Yun's character. Introverted, yet unassuming, confident, but not arrogant. Regarding the doubts from the outside world, Li Yun will only use facts to tell everyone, you are wrong, not me. Crazy crazy, blogger you are the most arrogant high school senior I have ever seen. Lenin only said that the truth is in the hands of a few people, but are you crazy to say that the truth is in your hands? Zhuiya fans came to report, the truth is not as good as brother G. I think the truth, and never repent, this is the saddest. The truth is that you make multiple multiple choice questions. Amidst the ridicule of netizens, a topic quietly appeared on the hot search list and quickly aroused discussion. Number mock fifth question correct answer number. Many netizens who didn't know why they saw this topic were all stunned. Isn't the fifth question the question that Li Yun chose B and C? I clicked in with curiosity and came to the official Weibo of Zhike Middle School in Zhonghai City and saw the explanation of the fifth question by all the math teachers of Zhike Middle School. My CAO. All the people who read it were dumbfounded, what's the matter? Post it in Zhonghai Number 1 Middle School. Post, awesome, admire, mathematics single choice questions can really be multiple. The post was still posted by the bar friend of tomatoes and green onions with almost the same title, but this time, his tone was extremely humble. I admit, I was wrong, brother Li or you brother Li. Single choice question? No, in the hands of brother Li, you are a single choice question, and you have to turn it into multiple items for me. Fried tomatoes with green onions wrote in an admiring tone, I deliberately went to the second year math book and found the same example. According to this calculation method, the answer is 112. But according to the regulations of the Examination Institute, the answer is approximate. It's 113. Dot. First floor, high school students don't understand, so what is the answer? Second floor, I'm so stupid, Li Yun really has two troubles with this B. Third floor, it is said that all the senior high school students in the school chose B. As long as a small part of them can't do it, they choose C. Original, back to LS, the answer is obvious. Both are correct. Whether it is 112 or 113, it meets the regulations. That's why I said Brother Lee is awesome, he wrote the most correct answer. Fourth floor. The classmates in my group are crazy. 
they came to the same conclusion as LZ. Both B and C are correct answers, but C is more in line with the regulations. Fifth floor, all crazy plus one, this time the first middle school, no, there are third middle schools, the senior middle school students of the experimental middle school, and all the candidates in Zhonghai City are stupid, only Li Yun is right. Sixth floor, it is said that the math teacher of our school checked the calculation overnight, trying to find out where the answer C did not meet the requirements, but unfortunately, I couldn't find it. I'm blind, is this true? My CAO. Do you want to slap your face so fast? Li Yun is not a human being, he is a monster. No, I'm only happy when I'm finished, so you tell me it's really B and C two answers. The reply at the bottom of the post was either shocked or unbelievable, but more people expressed admiration. As time progressed, more and more people posted to confirm that the answers they verified were exactly the same as those written by Li Yun. Both options B and C are correct, and the answer C, which is ignored by most people, is the more accurate answer. In less than half an hour, the wind direction of the post bar in number one middle school changed a lot. Many people posted, I'm taking it, big boss, nihility and so on. The same is true for Weibo. More and more people posted various evidences and calculations, leaving netizens dumbfounded and frightened. As people in number one said, Li Yun made the single choice questions into multiple choice questions. This is incredible. Big brother, I was wrong, you are really strong. Before I even scolded the blogger for saying that you are silly, but now I know that I was silly. Xiu, Tianzhu, Dai Hua Shou. Great brother, the entire Zhonghai city has 100,000 candidates, you are doing it right. It is strongly recommended that the Examination Institute resign and apologize, what the is this? The truth is in the hands of the blogger, I am convinced, really. Yes? Can you tell me why you are so awesome? Come, tell me, I'm sorry, Brother Li, Brother Li is awesome. Under Li Yun's last Weibo, netizens sent apologies. The facts have proved that it was not Li Yun that was wrong but the Examination Institute. The wind on the internet changed in an instant, and netizens were ashamed and pointed the finger at the first person who broke the news. That is, Fang Hao who released Li Yun's math test papers in advance. Blogger, you are very good. The official results are not available. Where did you get the test paper? Oh. This kind of person looks like a person with a small belly and chicken intestines. If they can't understand the excellence of others, they try to make tricks, which is disgusting. Published in advance, and the test papers have not been released specially by others. It is recommended that the Examination Institute of Zhonghai City conduct a thorough investigation, so that the college entrance examination will not be out of trouble. Where is the teacher from Zhonghai Experimental Middle School? Can't explain? Why do you have such a spicy student in your school? Fang Hao actually went to chat with a female classmate after seeing Li Yun being pointed out by Wan Fu, and a classmate who was flattering him on the internet had reported it to him. What? Li Yun is right. Fang Hao hurriedly searched the internet for news, the more ugly he looked at it. Finally, when he saw his Weibo comments made by netizens who were ashamed and angry, he screamed and almost fainted. Jingle bell. Fang Hao's cell phone rang and his face paled a bit when he saw the phone. After trembling and connecting, the headmaster's inquiries came from the phone. How do you know other people's test papers in advance? Yes, I got it by accident. The principal was silent for a while, shook his head and said, Oh, I was only here to confirm whether there was any wrongdoing. In fact, Zhike's math group leader has already admitted. What? This. Fang Hao, you can do it for yourself. Recently, you can take time off to review at home and wait until the limelight passes. After speaking, the principal hung up the phone, leaving Fang Hao completely stupid. At 10 o'clock in the evening, 
the Zhonghai Municipal Examination Institute issued an announcement regarding the handling of the fifth question of the mock exam and multiple choice questions in math. Finally, after the question group and invited experts and professors, it is decided after research that there are two answers to the fifth question of mathematics, B and C. In this exam, choose B, or choose C, or both, can be regarded as the correct answer. Thanks to all sectors of the society for their supervision and support of this mock test, and also to classmate Li Yun, who pointed out the shortcomings of the test paper in a silent manner. We must carefully review and learn lessons in the future work to ensure that we do not will make the same mistake again. Another, attached is the letter of apology from the mathematics textbook editing team of Zhonghai City. In the letter of apology, the textbook editor also stated that he made a mistake when he wrote it and that he should not make such a mistake, which caused the approximate value to be inconsistent with the standard. After the announcement of the examination institute was issued, it was formally announced that the matter had settled. In the event of single choice to multiple choice, which caused a lot of noise, it was Li Yun who was on the winning side. He defeated 100,000 examinees in Zhonghai City, thousands of mathematics teachers in Zhonghai City, hundreds of experts and professors, and tens of millions of netizens across the country who spray people at will without thinking. Li Yun is the winner. The truth is in my hands. Sitting on his sofa with a teacup in his hand, Song Yudeo fixed his eyes on the notice of the examination institute, chanting what Li Yun had said, and could not return to his mind for a long time. During the whole farce, Li Yun didn't say much, but just responded to everything with an extraordinary attitude. But justice and truth stood by his side from the very beginning. How can other people crush him even if they have thousands of troops? A soldier who has fallen without a fight. Song Yudeo, the top learning genius, finally showed a wry smile for the first time. There is no doubt that even if he gets full marks in this mock exam, it is meaningless. From the time he wrote answer B on that multiple choice question, he lost the competition. Li Yun, I remember you. A touch of determination flashed in Song Yudeo's eyes. He was not so easy to defeat. Next time, he must beat Li Yun. The next test is not the third mock test. It is too simple. Only the college entrance examination is the stage to verify who is stronger. Big Brother is amazing, it is really Big Brother, you are right. Little Ming. Well, it's me. Big Brother really hates me. I only recognize him now. Hu Xiaoman's petite figure shrank on a soft sofa wearing only a pair of hot pants and short sleeves, her delicate skin as white as jade exposed to the air, and her little melon seeds were overflowing. With a smile, he looked extremely lively. She has been following Li Yun's news on the internet. Like everyone else, Hu Xiaomang reasoned that Li Yun was stupid, but she quickly overturned this conclusion. Because in her cognition, Li Yun, no, Big Brother is not a stupid person. Sure enough, things have turned around and the big brother finally won. After this incident, Hu Xiaomeng, a girl who was innocent and innocent, but who was almost like a little devil with a rebellious thought in her heart, finally recognized Li Yun and sincerely wanted Li Yun to become her elder brother. If Li Yun knew that this girl Hu Xiaomeng was full of bad water, he was not innocent at all, and would even do damage from time to time, he would definitely spank her ass. Obviously, I have cooked a few barbecues for her, but Hu Xiaomeng still doesn't recognize her, so he should fight. He <laughs> he, big brother, I will go back to Longyang County to see my grandfather next week. Then I will find you, okay with the two of us. Hu Xiaomeng's delicate little face was stained with a thin layer of blush, and the young girl's spring-hearted appearance was really pitiful. It is a pity that she now lives in the luxurious apartment of the aristocratic school, with three bedrooms and one living room, plus a study room, shower room, and dressing room. Apart from the ants who will do the cleaning in the morning, afternoon, and evening, the rest of the time is by Hu Xiaoming. Naturally, no one can see the beautiful appearance of the young girl's spring heart. I miss my big brother, the food he cooked. Hu Xiaoming wanted to say that he missed Li Yun 
but he felt too shy and quickly changed his words. Li Yun smiled, Xiao Meng, you have said this sentence twice, and I have promised it twice. Let's talk about it when you come back. I hate it, this time, this time. Anyway, I want to see Big Brother soon. Hu Xiaomeng acted like a baby for a while before she hung up the phone reluctantly. Putting the phone on the table, Hu Xiaomeng hugged the pillow on the sofa, his eyes drifted a bit, as if thinking something. After thinking about it, she quickly picked up the phone and called up Li Yun's photo. After seeing the handsome and confident elder brother, the girl couldn't help but curl into a sweet smile. Big brother what to do, what to do? Hu Xiaomeng hugged the pillow and rolled back and forth on the sofa, whispering in his mouth, Xiaomeng found out that I like you, big brother, what do you think I should do? Her innocent and lovely appearance, coupled with the long-lasting blush on her cheeks, made the girl's beauty more and more attractive. Two days on the weekend, Li Yun was asked to go out again by his girlfriend Fang Shui. The two spent a whole day shopping in Longyang County on Saturday. Fang Shui was also happy to buy a bunch of clothes that she actually didn't need. Small accessories, cosmetics, etc. She gave all these things to Li Yun in the end and asked him to take them back to Kaxia and Kaiwei. On Sunday, Fang Shui came to Li Yun's house again and said that he wanted to go to the movies, but the jealous Li Fang also joined in. Li Yun suspected that Fang Shui's intention was to let Li Fang go with him, but after two days of shopping, Li Yun was almost exhausted on Monday. Girls have unlimited energy when shopping. Should I not give Fang Shui and her sister a small-sized jiden? Their physical strength is too good. Thinking of his girlfriend, Li Yun could only shake his head and smile bitterly. Fortunately, he made up classes this weekend, and he couldn't go shopping even if he wanted to. This week, let's make up for her. Li Yun, are you up? When I got up on Monday, I thought of Fang Shui. As soon as Li Yun got up, he heard her voice. Then, the door of the room was opened and a light and beautiful figure walked in. Ahem, Xiaoxiu, why did you come to my house? Li Yun was quite embarrassed, and quickly blocked him with a sheet. A man will transform into Optimus Prime when he gets up in the morning, and he can't help it. Unexpectedly, Fang Shui's eyes looked straight at him. After a long time, she suddenly said, You didn't do homework with Li Fang last night, eh? At the end, she hurriedly covered her mouth, her beautiful face blushing. Li Yun was stunned for a while, did his sister really tell Fang Shui these secret things? In this way, the relationship between the two is actually very good, and they are willing to accompany Li Yun together? Thinking of this, Li Yun's heart was hot, and almost couldn't help but want to hug Fang Shui who was standing at the door and let her experience Li Feng's feelings last night. Of course, that's just thinking about it. Ahem, Fang Shui, you go out first, I'll change my clothes before talking. Li Yun is not embarrassed, he is afraid that Fang Shui will be embarrassed. But his girlfriend seemed to have made up his mind and kept looking at him with straight eyes. That being the case, Li Yun didn't feel awkward. He just got up and changed his clothes, but he was not very good at pressing the gun, causing Fang Shui to keep his eyes on him. How is it? Li Yun smiled at her after getting dressed. Hey, big pervert, ugly. After satisfying her curiosity, Fang Shui turned her head proudly, but her fair face was blushing. She just wanted to do her responsibilities as a girlfriend. After all, Li Feng had quietly told her that Li Yun, a villain, would have a defecation anytime and anywhere, but Li Feng was the only one who suppressed him. Therefore, since Fang Shui is his girlfriend, and the relationship between the two is very good again, she thought, after the college entrance examination is over, or at some appropriate time. Entrust yourself completely to him. All this is to prepare for that day. Really? Li Yun's expression was very wrong and innocent. Fang Shui hit him shyly with a small fist, and then said quietly and quietly, very handsome, I, I don't hate it. 
Before seeing Li Yun, Fang Shui had never imagined what her boyfriend was like, but after meeting Li Yun, she felt that it would be a very happy thing to grow up with him. Li Yun gently hugged her, and the two hugged each other in a very warm scene. Ah, brother! Sister Fang! Kei Wei's surprised voice caused the two to separate quickly. Fang Shui's cheeks became more and more rosy, but Li Yun cheeky and said hello to Kei Wei, and turned to wash. Pick, pick Wei. Fang Shui's face blushed and found a topic, do you like the drawing board I bought you yesterday? Well, I like it very much, thanks sister Fang. Kei Wei's obedient answer made Fang Shui happy. She felt that this weekend was a good time, and she was able to go shopping with Li Yun and bought a bunch of things for the future sister-in-law. More importantly, it was not her money that was spent, but Li Yun's payment. After Li Feng got up, Fang Shui took a special look at her mouth and neck, and she saw a strange stain on her white and slender neck. Then, Li Feng took a bath, which further confirmed Fang Shui's conjecture. Li Feng, the stealer, and Li Yun, the big villain. Fang Shui stared at the two with anger, could she become like this in the future? After eating breakfast, the three of them walked to the school gate side by side. After Li Yun asked, she learned that Fang Shui had specifically asked the driver to drive to his house today, in order to go to school with him. It's because our student life is not long, so you want to walk to school with your boyfriend. Li Feng could see through Fang Shui's inner thoughts at a glance. It's not. After falling in love with Li Yun, Fang Shui became extremely arrogant and naturally refused to admit it easily. However, Li Feng has a way to subdue her, Fang Shui, do you want me to let you a few days? Let me what? Fang Shui looked at her in surprise. It's just that I deliberately pretended not to go to school with my brother, so I gave you this time. When Li Feng said this in a playful tone, Fang Shui immediately snorted softly, and reached out to pinch Li Feng's face, Your brother is a badass, Li Feng, you are not a good person either. Hee <laughs> hee, I know I was wrong, Xiox you spare my life. The two girls joked and joked, forming a beautiful scenery at the school gate. I can see two school-level beauties chasing and playing, which is absolutely unthinkable before and only when Li Yun and Fang Shui become boy and girl friends can the relationship between these two beauties improve. In the morning, the head teacher, who was full of spring breeze, walked in with a bunch of test papers with a few classmates. Examination paper. Change so fast. The teacher worked overtime on weekends, right? Sure, so many things have happened. Is brother Li full score? I think it must be. There was a commotion, and before the head teacher announced, one of the classmates grabbed the test paper and quickly distributed it. Among them, Li Yun's examination papers were taken care of, and every time they found one, the students rushed to circulate it. Brother Li Chinese, 150. Brother Li's math is still 150. What about the rationale? Hiss. A classmate gasped, 300, full marks. I'm CAO, Brother Lee is Brother Lee, one subject is worth four of us. Class 14 is a poor class, and many of them failed to score more than 300 in the test. It is definitely not an exaggeration to say that one subject has four subjects. What about the final English? Is it a perfect score? Is it a perfect score? It must be. Everyone eagerly searched through a pile of English test papers, so that other people's test papers were thrown on the ground, but no one cares now. Anyway, the highest scores of poor students are 70 or 80, which is not worth paying attention to. Finally, someone found Li Yun's test paper, he immediately raised it up and solemnly announced, Brother Li's English score is. Nima say it. Yes, what's the selling point now? If you drag on, I'll beat your mother so hard to recognize you. Hey, guys, don't worry. The person holding the test paper wanted to play some tricks, but he didn't pay attention and was taken away by the test paper. Brother Lee's English is also a perfect score, a perfect score of 150. 
150 perfect scores. My CAO. The class was completely boiling, and the people in the surrounding classrooms were all curiously poking their heads out and looking around. After hearing the news, more and more people rioted. Eventually, the entire teaching building shook and boiled and fell into a sea of cheers. Full score, 750. Brother Lee is too good. Brother Lee is awesome. Listening to the cheers of thousands of people, Fang Shui couldn't help showing a smile of joy and happiness. At the same time, she was also very proud. The boyfriend's full score first made her more happy than her own test score. Similarly, Li Feng smiled very happily. Li Yun is her younger brother, and the person she has depended on and closest to her in this life. As long as he has a good life, Li Feng will be happy. This is a kind of psychology of being a sister, and there is another kind of being nostalgic for one's lover. The two women were separated by a few tables, but at this moment they had a sharp heart. Looking at each other, Fang Shui and Li Feng both showed the same feelings. For them, for Li Yun, they are willing to compromise and accept each other. Be quiet. Fang Shui's head teacher stepped onto the podium and said with a spring breeze, our school's results on the mock test were quite outstanding. Li Yun got a perfect score of 750. Of course, our class is not bad. The students in the fast class were taken aback. Li Yun got full marks. They are not bad at first, meaning that they also have full marks in the class. Who gets the full score? Dai Yuan Kai? He is in the top three of his grade. Or Fang Yuan Ming? Last time he was fourth. Everyone whispered to each other, but few people guessed that it was Li Feng or Fang Shui, because although the two could get the top ten results, they were unable to succeed and it was difficult to get full marks. But this time, they guessed wrong. The head teacher announced the top five rankings while handing out the test papers. Fourth place. Dai Yuankai, with a score of 701. The third place. Fang Yuan Ming, 705 points. Second place. The head teacher paused for a moment and looked at Li Feng with smiles and admiration in his eyes, and said, This time the second place has made a lot of progress. Although the ranking is not much different, the score is better than the first. Three are over 40 points higher. What? More than 40 points? The classmates were dumbfounded. Fang Yuan Ming ranked third with a score of 705. Then the second most likely Li Feng, she actually got 745 points or more, close to full marks. Li Feng's heart thumped, expecting the head teacher to talk about her. Soon, Li Feng's dream came true. Second place, Li Feng, 748 points. Wow! The classmates in the classroom couldn't help but exclaimed, Two points short of two points, a perfect score. What's more, what kind of medicine did Li Feng take, and in less than a month, he went from about 700 to 748 points. This is incredible. This kind of exaggerated score line is difficult to achieve in the low segment, let alone the score line of 700 points, it is almost impossible. It's totally a fantasy. The head teacher smiled happily. Student Li Feng has made great progress this time. He was only deducted two points for his Chinese composition and ranked sixth in Zhonghai City. It is quite an achievement. The classmates applauded, and Li Feng was a little bit shy, but when she met Fang Shui, she saw the smile on her face faintly triumphantly. Victory? Wrong. Li Feng quickly woke up and quickly asked, the head teacher, what is Fang Shui's score? Everyone, including the head teacher, laughed. From very early on, Li Feng had been fighting with Fang Shui, especially since a month ago. The two of them have never been humbly in every aspect, and must have won the other. Hee <laughs> hee, this time I guess I was relying very well. Fang Shui looked at the class teacher confidently, who nodded with a smile, yes. Li Feng, your progress is great but Fang Shui is not bad. Even slightly better. 
Li Feng suddenly bulged his cheeks, it seems that Fang Shui is really the first. First place, Fang Shui, 750 full marks. After the class teacher announced, the classroom became quiet, and they were already frightened. The school flower, full score of 750, the same score as her boyfriend, the husband and wife both became super masters, tied for first place. Fang Shui's face blushed and accepted everyone's congratulations. She believed that Li Yun would be very happy when she heard the news. Moreover, her parents and family members would also be very happy when they knew her full marks. The school will hold a commendation meeting for you in a few days, and there will be scholarships for the first 50 years. The head teacher smiled and announced a piece of good news, Fang Shui got full marks, which means that he can also get the school bonus. Li Yun learned that Fang Shui had a full score, and after Li Feng had a high score of 748, he came outside their classroom after class to congratulate them. Fang Shui looked at Li Yun with a weird expression. According to common sense, it was impossible for her and Li Feng to improve so quickly. The only possibility is that the pill that Li Yun gave them improved their memory and made their performance improve by leaps and bounds. Speaking of which, my spirit has improved recently. Li Feng also agreed with Fang Shui. Li Yun was about to say something, but the phone rang. King Yu. Well, it's me. Gong King Yu sat in the position, holding a paintbrush in his hand, slowly depicting Li Yun's appearance. Li Yun, I heard that you got full marks on the test. Aren't you the same? Li Yun smiled. There were four people with full marks in this mock test, Li Yun, Fang Shui, Gong King Yu, and Song Yu Dao. But everyone knows that although it is a perfect score, Li Yun's score is higher than others. Ding, the host defeated everyone in the second mock test, won the first place, rewarded has been issued. Coincidentally, when Gong King Yu called, Li Yun happened to receive a reward from the system. Doctor level archaeological knowledge? Li Yun couldn't laugh or cry. He didn't have much interest in antiques, and he probably had no chance to use this skill. It's a pity that Gong King Yu's favorability level has only reached 99, which is almost 100. The two did not chat for a while, when Fang Shui suddenly intervened and asked, Li Yun, is the person who called you Gong King Yu? Gong King Yu also heard what Fang Shui said. The two did not meet. They were hundreds of miles apart, but they seemed to be looking at each other in the air, and their eyes collided fiercely. You are. Fang Shui, Li Yun's girlfriend, got full marks in this exam. Fang Shui showed off her strengths without any scruples. Similarly, Gong King Yu also introduced herself, My name is Gong King Yu. I come from a first class family in Jianghu. I have an early cultivation base and like painting. I'm already preparing to publish my first comic, and the score, the full score is easy for me. Really? How many times did you last? 748, it should be taller than you. I will never be worse in the future, because I have Li Yun. Then wait and see. Li Yun was shocked by the dialogue between the two women. Gong King Yu, a cold and introverted lady, is indeed from the Jianghu family and she is actually a congenital cultivation base, much higher than Li Yun. By the way, Li Yun, forgot to tell you one thing. Gong King Yu smiled, do you remember Fang Hao? Remember some. Li Yun's tone was flat. Fang Hao had fought him for a while. Of course, he was not Li Yun's opponent at all, so Li Yun didn't take him to heart. What's up with him? He was dropped out of Princeton University. Okay. Because he colluded with your school's math teacher and announced your test papers in advance. After being known by Plinton University, he withdrew his acceptance letter. Gong King Yu's tone contained a hint of happiness. Obviously, she had been annoyed by Fang Hao during this period of time. Li Yun shrugged, he is also responsible for this. Yet. Gong King Yu was silent for a while, and whispered, Li Yun, when will you come to Zhonghai next time, I, 
some would miss you. Fang Shui looked at Li Yun full of jealousy, and almost reached out and pinched his waist. I want to paint with you, he he gong king you added again. Li Yun looked at Fang Shui innocently, saying that nothing happened to him and gong king you, really. Fang Shui snorted. I will probably go to Zhonghai City on Wednesday, Li Yun replied. What? Gong King Yu and Fang Shui both looked at Li Yun in surprise. It was not until Li Yun explained that they were going to the company for a visit, and Fang Shui reluctantly agreed to come down, but they still muttered something like the company is headquartered in Longyang County. Okay. Gong King Yu's heart moved, and she said shyly, Then do you have a place to live in Zhonghai City? Yes, do you want to live with me? Okay. Don't, don't get me wrong. Gong King Yu quickly explained, I live in a place other than my house, I live alone, and there are many rooms here, not apartment style, enough for you to live. When I think of it, I will ask you about painting techniques. Gong King Yu added. Li Yun looked at Fang Shui, there was no doubt that even if he wanted to go, he had to agree with his girlfriend. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose from the host. Option 1, agree to Gong King Yu's cohabitation invitation, reward experience value of 10,000, and a random gift. If you agree, the host's prospective girlfriend Gong King Yu is in a better mood. Friend Fang Shui's mood deteriorated. Option 2, reject. Reward Fang Shui for getting better and Gong King Ye feeling down. Li Yun has a black line, where does the system trigger the selection event? Numa's choice will make the other party's mood worse. It seems that his merciless behavior will bring countless troubles. Humph, go if you want. Fang Shui pursed her mouth and turned her head, and took Li Feng's arm, saying that she didn't want to talk to Li Yun now. This. Gong King Yu is my friend, she and I. Under the scrutiny of the two women, Li Yun first explained the origin of Xia Gong King Yu, and then said, Xiox Yu, when I come back, I will visit your uncle and auntie once, right? Really? Fang Shui immediately turned her anger into joy, and stopped asking where Li Yun was going to live. And Li Feng, Li Yun held her little hand, the two looked at each other and Li Feng compromised. Hey! Li Yun secretly breathed a sigh of relief. Too many confidants are not enough, tiring. Reward experience value of 10,000, a random gift, a comic outline and a brief introduction, Gong King Yu's mood becomes better, Fang Shui's mood becomes better, congratulations to the host, and choose the hidden option. Li Yun is speechless, hidden options? It's all messy, but the outline of the comic is pretty good, Gong King Yu should like it. Time passed quickly, and it was Wednesday in a blink of an eye. In fact, the school originally planned to hold the commendation meeting on Wednesday, but after learning that Li Yun was going to take a leave of absence, the principal insisted that the commendation meeting was held yesterday. This time the scholarship was very generous. Li Yun and Fang Shui each received a scholarship of 100,000 and took a group photo, saying that they wanted to stay in the school history for the admiration of younger students. Li Feng ranked second with 748 points and also received a scholarship of 50,000. Although Li Yun has a lot of money now, he can earn 50,000 yuan with his own efforts, which makes Li Feng very happy. If this were placed two months ago, when Li Yun was still working at a food stall, Li Feng would not even dare to win a scholarship of 50,000 yuan. There is no doubt that all these changes are due to her brother. Wednesday, 8 o'clock in the morning. The D1031 train arrives in front of the station. It is the terminal station of this train, Zhonghai City Tianqiao Station. Please get off the train in an orderly manner. Welcome to take another ride. With the sound of the train's announcement, the train drove into the extraordinary Dushan Qiao station. Li Yun closed his eyes and opened his eyes, took his luggage, and walked out of the station with the crowd. Tied crowds, noisy stations, tall buildings in the distance, luxury cars driving on the road. All this shows the prosperity and excitement of Zhonghai City. 
This is a huge city with a population of 40 million. Countless people made their fortunes here, and countless people went bankrupt and had to return to their hometowns. The last time I came, I was a poor boy with nothing. But this time I am here, I have become a billionaire that everyone envy. Standing at the exit of the station, Li Yun looked at a 400-meter-high building in the distance, his eyes faintly revealing an ambition, which was burning. In the future, there will be a building of my own in Zhonghai City, creating an era that belongs to me, and letting people all over the world know my name Li Yun. Li Yun is not aimless. Su Muxin's father, Su Tenjiun, has a net worth of 500 billion and a market value of 4 trillion Nantian Technology Group, and has R&D centers all over the world. There is more than one tall building owned by Su Tenjiun. The headquarters of the Nantian Technology Group, the Nantian building is 360 meters high and has tens of thousands of employees. Everyone is an elite talent in the science and technology circle, and can even be called a scientist. Nantian Group also has no less than 100 people. But Li Yun now only has Wu Ke, an excellent industry leader, and he is not engaged in research and development. Thousands of tall buildings rise from the ground, today's job fair is the first step in the development of my Biun technology. The corner of Li Yun's mouth bends, and he took out his mobile phone and called a person who had agreed to pick him up. King Yu, you are here. On your left, do you see it? What? Li Yun looked over in surprise, and he saw a white BMW car. It seemed that it was not the same as the last time. When he looked over, the window of the car had been rolled down, revealing a man wearing a white costume dress, waterfall style. A beautiful girl with her black hair rolled up and dressed as a lady. This beautiful girl smiled brightly at her, and she was so beautiful. Everyone who came out of the station was dumbfounded. What a nice view. Who is this by Fume? So beautiful. Classical beauty, my god, how can it be so beautiful? I'm so sour, who is this man? In the envious and jealous eyes of everyone, Li Yun walked over opened the door of the BMW car and entered the car. The moment the door was opened, everyone saw the classical beautiful girl sitting in the car. Although she was wearing complicated ancient costumes, they could still see how slender and slender this beautiful girl was, in any aspect of the girl. Are enough to be called perfect. After entering the car, Li Yun smelled a light girly body fragrance, as charming as an orchid. When Gong Qingyu saw his nose move, he knew that this guy must be smelling. Thinking of this, Gong Qingyu's cheeks flushed, and she quickly lowered her head. Qingyu, trouble you. Hey, don't say such things. Perhaps it's because Gong Qingyu often watches anime, and her tone of voice at this time is the same as that of the girls in the anime, tender and soft, which makes people very enjoyable. The luxury BMW car drove towards the city center. Outside the window was a lively scene of busy traffic. Inside the car was a quiet and lovely classical beauty. This kind of enjoyment is estimated to be enjoyed by few men in the world. Li Yun took out his cell phone and contacted Wu Ke, then turned to ask her, King Yu, have you had breakfast? Hmm. Not yet. In fact, they had already eaten it but Gong King Yi wanted to eat with Li Yun, so he panicked. Sorry, let you pick me up early in the morning, are you hungry? It's okay. Gong King Yi glared at Li Yun angrily, and said with a small mouth pouting, I didn't eat breakfast and you didn't know that you would invite me to go with me, really. Li Yun smiled bitterly, I also want to go with King Yu, but my company's job fair starts at 8.30, so, should King Yu eat alone this morning? I'll book it for you at the hotel seat. It just so happens that Minjiao building has a place where you can have breakfast. Hey? Forget it. Gong King Yu's slender palm touched his belly, I'm not too hungry yet. Li Yun nodded. Generally speaking, girls are really hungry when they say they are not too hungry. As long as they say they don't want to eat, they are really not hungry. The BMW car went all the way and half an hour later, 
it came to Gong King Ye's school, which is in front of Minjiho building. The two got out of the car in front of the building and asked the driver to drive the car into the underground garage. Gong King Yu thought that Li Yun would go upstairs directly, but he did not expect that he took her little hand and led her to the school. Li, Li Yun. Gong King Yu's cheeks became more flushed, and her hand was gently held by Li Yun's big hand. Gong King Yu could clearly feel the temperature of his palm, and the unprecedented contact with the boy made this martial arts family born. The girl with a very strict tutor blushed. Let's buy some breakfast, King Yu. Do you know where there is a snack street near the school? Generally speaking, there are snack streets around the school. Li Yun smiled, Gong King Yu's small hands were white and smooth, as a man who often draws cartoons. The hands are also very slender and slender, and they are very comfortable to hold. The two mates who had been following Gong King Yu were dumbfounded. The lady is really going to buy breakfast on the street? The two mates glanced at each other and they both looked like they wanted to talk, but the young lady seemed very happy now, and they were not interested in disturbing her. I, I don't know. Gong King Ye blushed and lowered his head, without freeing Li Yun's hand, and whispered, I rarely eat breakfast outside, so I don't know much about the school. It's not very few, is it not at all? Li Yun broke Gong King Ye's little lie, and made the latter pout in anger my family wouldn't let me eat out, saying it was unhealthy. But I don't think it's anything. I decided to make an exception this morning and eat out with you, Li Yun. Li Yun pretended to exaggerate and said, it turns out that you are still a young lady, King Yu, would you like to eat at the roadside stall? What's a roadside stall? I can still eat a mobile food stall. Gong King Yu said unconvinced, so Li Yun really bought a breakfast with her at a street food stall. A meat bun, a vegetable bun, and a cup of soy milk, here you are. Gong King Yu didn't come back to his senses until the hot bun really put his finger. This, this is the meat bun on the street. Correct. Li Yun couldn't laugh or cry, Gong King Yu held the meat buns with the action of treating rare treasures. Fortunately, she was already cultivated. Otherwise the meat buns just out of the oven are very fragrant, but they are really hot. The skin of Gong King Yu's small hands was very delicate and could not stand the torture. Li Yun's words are not exaggerated at all. Gong King Yu looked at the meat buns in the bag over and over, saying what to experience the life of the public, and observing the texture and texture of the meat buns would help draw better cartoons. Li Yun felt that Gong King Yu was just talking nonsense. Did she never eat meat buns at home? However, given that Gong King Yu only said these words proudly, as if she was selling cute, it would not be offensive. The two mates behind him did not speak during the whole process, for fear that the lady who was experiencing life would anger them. Come on, let's go up. Okay. The four people entered the building and came to the 30th floor office area where Byun Technology is located. Walking out of the stairs, and not long after walking along the passage in the building, Li Yun heard a loud noise coming from the front. This is a kind of noise made by many people gathering together and everyone talking quietly. The two walked over, and they saw an office area of more than 500 square meters, which was neatly decorated, with desks and chairs, computers, coffee machines, water dispensers, and other office supplies. There were more than 200 people waiting for interviews. So many people. Gong King Yu, carrying a bag of buns and soy milk, was surprised, are these all coming to the job fair? If not. Just as Li Yun was about to answer her, a man's voice came in. He glanced at Gong King Yu up and down, and a faint flash of surprise flashed in his eyes, Beauty, aren't you here to participate in the signboard? As mentioned earlier, Gong King Yu is a cold, classical beauty, even though she behaves like a normal girl in love when she and Li Yun are together. But Gong King Yu was in front of outsiders, but she was still that independent, arrogant, and deserted daughter of a big family. Therefore, Gong King Yu didn't bother to answer this man's question. He only glanced at him with a cold look, 
then turned his gaze to see the specific process of the interview announced by Wu Kei and several HRS. These things she has never experienced before, and may be helpful for drawing comics. You. Ignored by others, or ignored by a classical beauty, the man suddenly became very angry, Yin and Yang cynically mocked. Don't think that you can be arrogant and arrogant if you are a beautiful woman. Who do you show in an ancient costume? I don't know how much the clothes of this sorrow bag cost. It's not a 100 yuan piece of goods. Sincerely speaking, Gong King Yu's white dress is elegant and gorgeous. The waist is tied with a waist to set off Gong King Yu's slender and graceful figure. The cuffs, bow tie, and waist are also embroidered with beautiful patterns. The overall dressing style is very elegant and smart, it is impossible to buy 100 yuan. But Gong King Yu held the steamed soy milk at the roadside breakfast shop in his hand, and bought it for less than 5 yuan. This low level breakfast completely destroyed the ladylike like temperament of Gong King Yu, if it weren't for her to be really beautiful. Everyone thought she was a swollen face and pretended to be fat. Uh. Li Yun realized that something was wrong. Gong King Yu was wearing a classic undergarment. She shouldn't buy steamed buns at a roadside stall. Instead, she should sit in a beautiful palace and enjoy the service from the maid servant and breakfast. Well known chefs carefully prepared various snacks and snacks three minutes in advance. This is in line with Gong King Yu's noble, dignified, and cool temperament. I'm sorry. Gong King Yu smiled faintly, my wide sleeved fairy dress is for people who like it, not for some yin and yang. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose from the host. Choice 1, maintain your prospective girlfriend, make her happy, reward experience value plus 50,000, medium sized Jiden asterisk 1. Option 2, do nothing, no reward. Li Yun was a little surprised, not because of the system prompt, but because of Gong King Yu's words. Is it a disguised confession for someone who you like? After all, Gong King Yu came here to pick him up this morning and put on this fairy dress. You. The man became even more angry, and gave Li Yun a sour look. The young couple must be in a relationship. The woman is very beautiful and proactive, which makes people very enviable. Why don't they have such a girlfriend? Many people around who applied for the job looked over, without exception, when they saw Gong King Yu, both men and women showed amazing expressions. Gong King Yu's beauty is enough to make everyone who is a woman feel amazing. Who is this beauty? Looking at a young age, didn't you come to apply? Haha, <laughs> never come to apply for a receptionist. I think it's really possible. Think about it. You didn't come to apply for a receptionist. Who would wear an ancient skirt? I'll go. If she is a Taiwanese lady, I would be willing to come to this company with a 30% pay cut, this beauty is too beautiful. It's really beautiful, like a beauty who came out of a costume drama. If only she had her micro words. A touch of unwillingness flashed in the man's eyes. Why is this beauty someone else's girlfriend? Can't it be hers? With the mentality of ruining if you don't get it, the man sneered, and said mockingly, Little beauty, this is not a place for you to watch the excitement. Get out now, what nonsense. Do you know what this place is? What is this place, I think I know better than you. Li Yun stood up and gave him a condescending look, are you here to apply? My name is Li Yun, don't you know if you recognize me? People around exclaimed, and Wu Kei not far away showed a smile. But the man thought that the exclamation around him was because he couldn't understand Li Yun's breaking in behavior, so he said more arrogantly, My name is Zhang Wei, I'm applying for the position of Deputy General Manager of the Marketing Department at Baiun Company, and, I don't need to know you as a young person, don't think how much face you have. Deputy General Manager? The people around who applied for the job showed expressions of astonishment and looked at Zhang Wei with foolish eyes. He actually dared to apply for the deputy general manager, but he didn't know who Li Yun was. Isn't this a fool? The corner of Gong King Yu's mouth bends, revealing an expression of watching a show, 
and he opened the bag and took out the meat buns. Well, it's actually quite delicious. Gong King Yu opened his mouth and took a bite, tasting the taste. Everyone couldn't help but look at her a few more times. This classical beauty was very beautiful when she ate, and her small cherry mouth was as moist as a crisp. Even if she was holding a meat bun, her appearance was quite elegant. Zhang Wei was stunned for a moment, and was attracted by Gong King Yu's elegant and beautiful eating. This kind of beauty, if this kind of beauty were his girlfriend, that would be great. Li Yun smiled, my face is not great, but it is not small, enough to make you unsuccessful in the interview, nothing more. What? Zhang Wei looked at him in surprise, you said you made me unsuccessful in the interview? Why? Just because you have such a beautiful girlfriend? Pooh. Li Yun smiled faintly, whether you believe it or not, this is true. Mom, mentally retarded. Zhang Wei gave Li Yun a roll of eyes, are you two idiots? With a five Yuan bun, don't think that you are the eldest lady, are you worthy? Miss. Gong King Yu interrupted, I live in the rental sector. I heard that a house was sold last year. It was not big, it was only 300 square meters, worth 12 billion. What do you think? Am I the eldest lady? Rent boundary? Everyone was taken aback. It was a product left over from the old times in the rented realm of Zhonghai City. It is close to the busiest wharf, the busiest commercial street, and the most famous attraction in Zhonghai City. Anyone who has been there knows that there are more than 20 bungalows built by the invading foreign aristocrats more than 50 years ago. As time comes to the new century, the leasing sector has become a beautiful landscape in Zhonghai City, and the more than 20 bungalows there have become one of the most famous attractions in Zhonghai City. Outsiders don't even know the price of each bungalow. Many people even think it is officially owned, but they didn't expect someone to live there. Moreover, Gong King Yu also revealed the price of those bungalows, 12 billion, 300 square meters. It is equivalent to saying that one square meter is worth 40 million. This exaggerated price is many times higher than the so-called Emperor Community and Tian Gong Community on the market. I heard that the courtyard houses in Beijing had sold 1.2 billion five years ago. I didn't expect the houses in Zhonghai City to be more expensive. Someone murmured. Sai Heiwen, I'm CAO. Owning a courtyard house on the second ring road of Beijing, where the land is worth a lot of money, is equivalent to owning a golden mountain. Everyone was shocked, but after thinking about it, it seemed to be taken for granted. Most of the courtyards in the capital were the residences of former wealthy families. The palaces of those princes Baylor had long been nationalized. However, the houses in Zhonghai rented the territory of I, but once lived in the nobility, symbolizing rights and status, of course, the price is different. 12 billion houses. Zhang Wei was frightened, and he was stunned for a long time before he came back to his senses. He insisted, you said you live in a bungalow worth tens of billions? Hey, I also said that I live in the first ring of the capital, which is the Oni Palace. Yet. Yeah. Are you a eunuch? Li Yun asked immediately. What? Zhang Wei didn't react yet. The also lives in the palace. Li Yun shrugged innocently, you said you live in the palace, not an eunuch, what is it? Ha ha ha, yes, the also lives in the palace. Everyone laughed, Zhang Wei, a guy with a bad personality, is also like a majestic emperor but just the kind of who makes small reports and is very sinister. You, you, you. Zhang Wei blushed with a thick neck and roared, I am the emperor. Everyone continued to laugh, this guy is also the emperor? Then they are the Jade Emperor. Ahem. Wu Kei came over, cleared her throat and let everyone look at him, and said to Zhang Wei, I don't know if you are the emperor, but here, even the emperor has to listen to our chairman. So, please you left. Wu, President Wu. Zhang Wei was stunned, why did Wu Kei come over? And also opened up to maintain Li Yun. Wait, he meant, 
Li Yun is the chairman? Which dare to come to our company to make trouble? Qian Hu brought his little brothers over aggressively. After seeing Li Yun, he immediately opened his eyes and smiled, flatteringly moved, Hello boss. A few HRS behind Wu Kei glanced at each other and shouted to Li Yun in unison, Chairman, good morning. Good morning, Chairman. The three steps are completed, and then the scores are integrated, and the top ranked ones have the chance to get a formal contract. Of course, these three steps have nothing to do with Li Yun, he just took a look. Originally, Wu Kei wanted to add an interview with the chairman of the board at the end, but Li Yun found it troublesome and rejected it. It's not that he doesn't understand interviews. Li Yun has advanced talent management skills, as well as superb hacking skills. Ordinary interviews can't bother him at all. Li Yun, I'll eat it for you. The interviewer at the front was waiting nervously, while Li Yun and Gong Qingyu at the back were sitting side by side and eating meat buns. Moreover, Gong Qingyu took three small mouthfuls and handed the meat buns to Li Yun's mouth, with an expression that asked him to eat the buns he had just bitten, without realizing that Li Yun would bite them down. It's like kissing indirectly. Isn't it delicious? No. Gong Qingyu's face flushed, and he stuffed the meat buns into Li Yun's mouth, and said embarrassingly, when I went out in the morning, Sister Xia had already prepared breakfast for me, so. So. Li Yun looked at her with a smile, and took the meat bun in Gong King Yu's hand. So, so, that. Gong King Yu's dignified face flushed more and more, and finally forced to be helpless, closed his eyes and shouted, So I just want to have breakfast with you. Ha ha ha, all right all right, next time, no, tomorrow we will have the opportunity to have breakfast together. Gong King Yu's shy appearance is very cute. He plays with a classical beauty and makes her show a shy expression. This anger, shy, gentle and gentle appearance gives Li Yun a full sense of accomplishment, and his heart is full of righteousness. The pampering intent of this beautiful girl. Then you have to eat a little more, otherwise I can't finish four buns by myself. Li Yun took a bite and then handed her the meat buns. Gong King Yu pursed her mouth in dissatisfaction, but did not refuse, and obediently opened her rosy little mouth and took a small bite of the meat bun. It was really a small bite, she was cheating. Hee <laughs> hee, now it's your turn to eat. Behind her, the two mates of spring flower and autumn chrysanthemum were completely stunned. Their young lady, the eldest lady of the Gong family, one of the first class martial arts families, actually ate a meat bun with a teenager with a smile. This is incredible. If they hadn't seen it with their own eyes, they would never believe that the girl who seemed to be in love before them was Gong King Yu. But those who come to the interview feel normal. Aren't many teenagers and girls in love so close? It's just that men are envious. They look at Gong King Yu and their eyes become very hot. There is such a beautiful girl who is cold and noble in front of outsiders, and acts as a girlfriend in front of her boyfriend. Li Yun must be very happy. Right. What? After a while, Gong King Yu woke up to what she was doing, her cheeks flushed again, and she hurriedly sat down, acting like a lady. Li Yun smiled and said, Well, don't pretend to be a big lady until now, King Yu, you have been red. Humph, I blame you. Well, blame me. The four buns are finally finished, come, let's wash our hands. Gong King Yu followed Li Yun vigorously, looked at him for a long while, and laughed out loud again. She also didn't expect that one of her would be so close to a boy. However, it doesn't feel bad at all. Gong King Yu felt very happy, happier than when she was hiding in the room and drawing comics. After washing their hands and returning, Li Yun and Gong King Yu continued to sit behind to watch the show. As a result, Wu Kei sent him a text message saying that after Li Yun and Gong King Yu came back, the interviewers were obviously a lot nervous, and many people paid close attention to him. Li Yun was speechless. Is it possible that the interviewer is afraid that the chairman will be dissatisfied? 
or is it that you are afraid of making a fool of yourself in front of the daughter Gong King Yu? King Yu, we did not participate in the interview, but it seems to have played an interview role. Follow me. Li Yun took her little hand, and the two of them walked to the front of the stage and actively nodded with the interviewers, which was equivalent to walking around and asking the topic and returning. Only then did Gong King Yu understand that Li Yun was afraid that they would be too nervous so he did this to show closeness and don't need to be too nervous. He he, Li Yun, you are quite good. Gong King Yu quietly said to him. Nonsense, when did I be bad? Hey, arrogant, hey, look at that man. Gong King Yu made a stern gesture, and Li Yun turned his head and looked around and found a man in his thirties sitting at a table and chair, typing on the keyboard of his notebook intently. His focused appearance was exceptionally different from the people waiting anxiously around him. Li Yun pretended to be surprised and said, King Yu, do you like this kind of uncle? Hate, you know what I like. Gong King Yu blushed, twisted Li Yun's waist, and said angrily, You are not allowed to talk about this topic in the future. You are jealous, I am still jealous. Sorry, I'm not good, I admit it. Li Yun hurriedly begged for mercy, and finally coaxed his prospective girlfriend, he shouldn't make that kind of joke. Gong King Yu explained in a low voice, I heard him gently say to his wife just now, don't worry about the mortgage, he will definitely find a job. Li Yun frowned, you pity him. When a person reaches middle age, he has lost his job. Gong King Yu may not understand it. But after the death of his adopted grandfather, Li Yun has experienced this kind of powerlessness. A little bit. Gong King Yu admitted honestly, but what caught my attention is because he seems to be making a game, and then I prefer to play games. Speaking of her hobbies, Gong King Yu Xiao his face was flushed. It is hard for outsiders to imagine that Gong King Yu, a classical beauty with noble and dignified temperament, actually loves things that are full of Leda-like atmosphere such as piano, chess, calligraphy, and painting, but anime and games that Otako loves. Li Yun nodded, just about to say that giving him a job is nothing, the system selection event prompt happened to sound. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose the host. Option 1, give Feng Rong Chan a job, reward justice value plus 1, random gift bag asterisk 1. Option 2, acquire the game being written by Feng Rong Chen, with no reward, the game has a high probability of being popular. Option 3, ignore, no reward. Hey? A flash of surprise flashed in Li Yun's eyes. In the choice given by the system, the justice value added a pitiful point, but it also meant that it was right to help people in difficulty. Everyone needs a job, but the priorities are different. If Li Yun works for Feng Rong Chen, it also means that some people lose their jobs. But the person who lost his job might find other jobs easier than Feng Rong Chen, so the system gave him one point of justice. Li Yun wanted to understand that, just like caring for people with disabilities, middle aged men are also disadvantaged when looking for jobs, and helping them is tantamount to a slight bias towards justice. Currently, Li Yun has only discovered two uses for justice. The first is to make him have a great righteousness, which can deter evil spirits and ghosts, but it seems to be ineffective against zombies. The second is that it has miraculous effects on cultivating certain exercises, such as the Nine Suns Heavenly Sutra that Li Yun currently has. With the blessing of justice, the power of true energy in his body can directly rise a step. Although the use has yet to be developed, Li Yun has to get everything for granted when he encounters a choice event of justice. King Yu, let's go and see. A look of curiosity flashed in Li Yun's eyes. This middle-aged man who is looking for a job, will the game developed by him become popular? Gong King Yu didn't say much, but kept up with Li Yun's pace. She is actually not interested in other men, just curious about the process of playing games. When the two came to Feng Rongchen's side, he didn't seem to notice, and he was still typing on the keyboard quickly. Eclipse, Java programming software, use Java to develop games. 
Li Yun was a little surprised. The Java language does not mean that games cannot be written, but relatively speaking, C++ and C Sharp and some scripting languages are used in the game circle. Java is generally used to write mobile games. But looking at Feng Rongchen, he doesn't seem to be writing a mobile game, but a game on the PC platform. Gong Qingye glanced at Li Yun with bright eyes. People she likes will also develop games? But it's right to think about it. He knows hacking skills, and many other programming is analogous. It's not surprising that you can develop games. Uh. Feng Rong Chen finally realized the arrival of the two. After looking back at Li Yun, his face suddenly showed an awkward expression, and he hurriedly stood up, that, I'm not, sorry. It's okay, King Yu and I are here to take a look. Li Yun smiled and comforted him. Programmers always deal with computers, and it is normal for them to not communicate well. Although Feng Rong Chen is already married. Li Yun pointed to his computer, you wrote this game. The game debugging interface in the computer shows a small figure made up of square blocks. The small figure has no hands or five fingers, but a hole like thing is stuck on the rectangular arm. It should be the protagonist of this game. In addition, the items around the protagonist of the game are all composed of blocks. Trees, grass, white clouds in the sky, minerals, and even lakes are small blue squares. This is the world of cubes. Sorry. Feng Rong Chen apologized again with embarrassment, I am actually not a game programmer, but a system database administrator. Database administrator. Li Yun thought for a while and nodded thoughtfully, no wonder you are looking for a job. Correct. Feng Rong Chen was very embarrassed. He knew the identity of the boy in front of him and his hacking skills. Database administrators used to be a very popular profession. In the past, every internet company had at least three employees who were responsible for managing company databases. Unfortunately, the times are advancing. After the launch of cloud databases, the profession of database administrators has fallen into a very embarrassing state. Because all the data of small and medium-sized companies has been transferred to the cloud database, and no local personnel are required to maintain it, programmers like Feng Rongchen can only lose their jobs. Can Feng Rongchen be blamed for this? Just like the textile workers in the past, they worked diligently, but after the emergence of textile machinery and productivity improvement, these textile workers had to lose their jobs. Feng Rong Chen saw Li Yun pondering, thinking that his company does not need a database administrator, and quickly gritted his teeth and said, Mr. Li, I actually did not come to apply for this position. When the cloud database appeared, I was aware of the changes it brought about very early, so I have taught myself network security in my spare time. This time I am come to apply for a network security engineer. Li Yun nodded slowly, but pointed to the game interface and said, Can you introduce this game to me? What? At this time, not only Feng Rong Chen was surprised, but also the other people who had been paying attention here showed a surprised expression. Li Yun, the chairman of a billionaire company, is interested in a game. What does this mean? Investment, acquisition, shareholding, dividends. Just thinking of these words is enough to make a group of migrant workers jealous. Why didn't their works be appreciated by Li Yun? I, CAO, I know this person, Feng Rong Chen, who is 34 years old this year. 34 years old, many companies have retired programmers over 35 years old, which is miserable. So I have decided to go home to take a public exam after another five years. This opportunity depends on whether he can grasp it. You have to know that many people who want to start a business will not be able to ask those investors to take a look at their games or software. During the interview, the boss of a technology company liked my work and wanted to invest in acquisitions. This is really a pie in the sky. Everyone looked at him with envy, Feng Rong Chen flushed with excitement, and quickly replied, OK, boss. From Mr. Li to the boss, the relationship with Li Yun became a lot closer. 
Gong Qingyu secretly smiled and glanced at Li Yun, her beautiful eyes were full of smiles. This is a game I wrote in my spare time at work, Feng Rong Chen reopened the game and said while operating the square figure inside, the protagonist of the game is called Zhao Xiaoming, because Zhao Qian Sun Li, Zhao ranked first, and Xiaoming is the most familiar name. The biggest feature of the game is that players can control Zhao Xiaoming to freely create and destroy blocks in the 3D world, such as building a tall building, and then destroying it with TNT bombs. Gong Qingyu blinked, indicating that he didn't understand too much. Li Yun understood that it was actually because Feng Rongchen was not good at words, so the introduction was a bit confusing. I plan to add some monsters and survival gameplay later. Feng Rongchen's voice gradually decreased, because there is nothing to say about this game, the gameplay is still very simple, he has a lot of ideas that have not been added. People around started talking. This game is interesting. I don't think it will work, all the squares look uncomfortable. Will players spend a lot of time building buildings? Hey, I thought it would be an opportunity for Feng Rongchen, but now, I am not optimistic, the game is not good. It's so-so, a bit of gameplay. But Biun Technology is not a game maker. The comments made Feng Rongchen sitting on pins and needles, and finally couldn't introduce it anymore. He could only look at Li Yun awkwardly, Boss, uh, Mr. Li, what else do you want to know about this game? Have you decided on the name of the game? It's called Minecraft. Feng Rong Chen was a little embarrassed, I wanted to make a free-to-build game, but it will take a little bit of time. At present, it can only be done like this. Li Yun nodded and turned to look at Gong King Yu, what do you think? Feng Rong Chen suddenly became more nervous. He seemed to see that the young boss didn't care about the game at all. He came to ask about the game, it should be to make his girlfriend happy. In other words, whether this game has a money way, the decision is not in Li Yun's hands, but the cold and classical beauty makes the decision. All right, right. Gong King Yu is not sure, the gameplay seems to be good. But the content is so small, and the operation is not convenient, the game is not complete yet. Feng Rongchen's heart went from heaven to hell, and from back to heaven, repeated several times, causing sweat on his forehead. But what surprised him was that Gong King Yu seemed to know the game well. Classical beauties also like to play games? If this game is made, would you play it? Li Yun asked again. Meeting. Gong King Yu nodded affirmatively, the art style is very special, and the gameplay is also very special. At least I will try it, and I will continue to play if I do well. Everyone was dumbfounded, this big and cold temperament really can play games? That's okay. Li Yun finalized it directly and waved his hand, I decided to invest in this game. If you are willing to accept investment. Li Yun added with a smile. Yes, yes, of course yes. Feng Rong Chen was trembling with excitement and almost jumped up on the spot with happiness. These ten minutes are like a dream for him. Because he likes games, he makes games in his free time, and he will be admired by the chairman of the interviewing company. He wants to invest in him. This kind of thing is more rare than a pie in the sky. I'm CAO, the boss really invested. The onlookers were too envious. Someone invested, which meant that they had stepped into the ranks of bosses from wage earners. The changes were too great. Ahem. Wu Kei finally couldn't stand it anymore, she stood up with a clear cough, and said helplessly, Li Yun, do you really want to invest in this, game? He really didn't want to admit that this kind of shoddy personal work is called a project. Can barely be called a game. Correct. Li Yun nodded with certainty. It's not a big problem whether it's popular or not. The key is that Gong King Yi likes it. It's hard to buy a beautiful woman to laugh. In ancient times, there was Zhou Ya Wang, who played with lords. Today, there is Li Yun Hao throwing a lot of money to win the palace and the little lady. But our company is not a game player. Wu Kei gritted his teeth and said word by word. 
Had it not been for the public, he would have severely criticized Li Yun, saying that investment is just investment, which is too nonsense. Feng Rongchen raised a heart to his throat again. If Li Yun didn't invest, he would just be happy. I'll just say, I will definitely not invest casually. Among the people around, there are some jealous people who don't want to see Feng Rongchen being invested by Li Yun. They have a bad life and don't want others to have a good life. What does it matter? Li Yun shrugged indifferently. Neither Treasure Link nor Nantian Technology Group makes games, but they all set foot in the game field. The two companies are huge, can we compare to them? Don't worry, Biun Technology will be stronger than them in the future. I am planning ahead. Wu Kei wants to say something, but Li Yun has decided, if it doesn't work, I use my own money to invest. You can ask HR to help me find some people and start a small company. This, all right. Seeing Li Yun's determination to do this, Wu Kei had no choice but to agree. Forget it, just treat it as a young man's impulse, can understand and understand. But sure enough, Understanding belongs to understanding, Wu Kei still wants to scold Li Yun. Several HRS looked at each other, they hadn't recruited enough people at this stage, and the chairman threw them the task of recruiting game programmers. Biun Technology is developing rapidly now, and in addition to cooperating with Zhonghai City Commercial Bank to develop Xian Yuan Shield, it needs more manpower. Unexpectedly, Li Yun is still not big enough and the development is not fast enough, and he plans to start a new game business? How about this? Wu Kei intends to make a quick decision and get this matter done as soon as possible. He turned his head to look at Feng Rongchen, I have two plans here. One is to follow the normal investment method. We, no, the chairman of the board pays a certain percentage of the shares, and you are responsible for recruiting people for development. Feng Rongchen immediately retreated when he heard that he wanted to recruit and develop himself. He writes games well, but wants him to be the boss. It is estimated that the company will go bankrupt in a few days. May I ask, how much I can hold? Feng Rongchen hesitated and asked. What he didn't know was that it was very unprofessional to talk about these business contracts in the public. Generally speaking, it is between 10% and 30%. Dot. Wu Kei did not laugh at him, explaining, according to the investment ratio, and the capital you have now, and then estimate the future game revenue, the final account share. Feng Rongchen nodded, what about the second plan? Our chairman pays money and directly buys your game. Wu Kei glanced at Li Yun, your task afterwards is to assist us to complete the follow-up content of the game. The share may only be about 1%-5%. It depends on the amount of investment. Uh, do I have a salary? Of course, apart from holding shares, it is no different from ordinary employees. I choose the second one. Feng Rongchen hardly hesitated and chose to ask for money directly. For one, he is not good at being a leader. Second, he needs to pay off his mortgage now, and he needs a sum of money to help him in an emergency. In addition, he still has a salary while writing about his favorite games, which is very comfortable. The crux of the problem is whether Li Yun is willing to buy it. How much do you plan to sell? Li Yun asked directly, not caring about trade secrets, he has money now. The so-called rich and self-willed, he can handle this trivial matter in one step without making any mess. Sell money. Hearing this word, Everyone suddenly looked at Feng Rongchen and Li Yun. The big pie really fell from the sky. If it can sell for a good price, it will be a big extra. This. Feng Rongchen was very hesitant. He was unwilling to sell too much. He was afraid that Li Yun would refuse to sell. So he was very entangled. People around were talking about it. How much do you think this game can sell? 100,000. 100,000? Are you kidding me? This game is 30,000 at most. If I want to do it, it can be done in a week, and the cost is no more than 5,000 yuan. 
What about creativity? At least it is worth three to fifty thousand. It's almost the price. After all, this game is not finished, and there is no plan. Thirty thousand is a lot, and there are still shares in the follow up. Besides, he can still get his salary in the future. It doesn't matter to him that the game loses. Feng Rong Chen heard some comments, and after thinking about it, he secretly made up his mind, and his gaze towards Li Yun became firm, Boss, this game is sold to you. I only need one month's salary and one percent bonus. Oh. Li Yun looked at him with a little surprise, Feng Rong Chen didn't have a big mouth, and the price was so low that Li Yun felt embarrassed to buy this game at such a low price. Did you think carefully? Li Yun asked him calmly. Yes, I have considered it clearly. Feng Rong Chen looked at Li Yun gratefully and said, The purpose of my coming today is to find a job. Now the boss, you give me a job, and you still let me play games. To be honest, I like game programming very much and can do this. I am very happy at work. In addition, although I have worked on this game for three months, the time it takes is about half a month when converted into a working day. Plus creativity, so I only need one more month's salary. After that, Feng Rong Chen scratched his head embarrassedly, the most important thing is that I am a bit tight on mortgage now, so. Li Yun nodded secretly, Feng Rong Chen's asking price was really low, showing sincerity. Can. The answer was Wu Kei, he agreed first, then and many more. Li Yun interrupted him and said to Feng Rongchen with a smile, in fact, I am very optimistic about your game, so I will give you a satisfactory price. What? Feng Rongchen and the others were dumbfounded. Feng Rongchen has already set the price, but Li Yun still actively increases the price. Is it too much money? For a time, all the people who came for the interview looked at Li Yun with fiery eyes. With such a generous boss, the bonus of this company will certainly not be low. Hey, let me tell you that the reward given to us by the chairman is 10 million downloads, one more month's bonus. The employees of Biun Technology spoke out like a show, which surprised the interviewees. Pioneer Technology is now popular all over the world. A few months of downloads will cost dozens of months of salary. I'll give you this number. Li Yun smiled and stretched out a finger. Ten, one hundred thousand. Feng Rongchen's breath suddenly rose. His monthly salary is sixteen thousand, which is only one hundred thousand more than a month. After imagining that the mortgage problem can finally take a breath after getting one hundred thousand, Feng Rongchen is so excited again, today is really his lucky day, and Li Yun is his great man. No, it's one million. Li Yun smiled. What? Feng Rong Chen and the people around did not hear Li Yun clearly, or could not believe that he would actually buy a game for one million. Wu Kei twitched the corners of his mouth, and he would never even want to understand how this young chairman thinks in his life. It's one million. Li Yun nodded very affirmatively, I am very optimistic about this game and believe that it will be popular all over the world in the future so I decided to buy it with 1 million cash and 3% equity. Dividends and equity are not the same, but in general, equity will be better. Feng Rong Chen was excited at first, but quickly calmed down, shook his head and said, No, boss, this is too much. I imagined that the highest selling price would be 100,000 yuan. In any case, 1 million is too much, I can't ask for it. Everyone nodded their heads, buying a game that was still in the mother's womb for a million, no matter how you looked at it, it was outrageous. Okay, that's it. Li Yun patted him on the shoulder, in the future, your job is to give me this game to do my best. One million is not too much, as long as you see this game sell for one billion in sales in the future. Just don't regret today's decision. Sell a billion? Everyone laughed secretly. This is already the sales amount of many top 3A level games, a rough made game, it is impossible to sell 1 billion. Will not. Feng Rong Chen smiled bitterly and shook his head, don't say 1 billion, 
even 10 billion I don't regret it. 1 million is far beyond my work remuneration, so boss, if you want to buy it with 1 million, then I don't pay dividends. Creativity is priceless, say 3% is 3%, you don't think it is too low. Li Yun ignored him, turned to look at Gong King Yu, and said with a smile, King Yu, do you want to make money together? I am quite confident in this game. Gong King Yu blinked and said, OK, how much do I want to invest? 5 million? 10 million? The local tyrant aura contained in this sentence abruptly suffocated what Feng Rong Chen wanted to say. This group of local tyrants casually invested tens of millions of dollars, perhaps for them, 1 million is really not much. Feng Rong Chen was moved in his heart, and only felt that after meeting a confidant, he would definitely work overtime in the future and do his best to make Minecraft perfect. It doesn't need to be that much. I will find some more people to participate. The initial investment of 5 million is enough, right? Li Yun looked at Feng Rong Chen, who quickly nodded and said that this game gave him two artists and three programmers, and it took him a month to almost complete the first version. Okay, I understand. Li Yun anticipated that he and Gong Qingye would each invest 1 million yuan, and his genuine girlfriend Fang Shui would naturally also participate. In addition, the personality of Su Muxin, the little pepper, would also be invested. In addition, Li Yun wants his sister to put in the 50,000 yuan of the scholarship. Although this little money is pitiful, and Li Yun can use the money at any time, he knows Li Feng's character, if she earns it herself Li Feng will be even more happy with the money. Li Yun gave her some shares and let Li Feng own about 5% of the game's revenue. But leave these chores to Wu Kei, he can handle it. At noon, Wu Kei drafted the contract between the interviews and formally signed it with Feng Rong Chen. Li Yun only looked at the final equity drafting. A subsidiary company was established under Baiyun Technology. Li Yun invested 2,300,000 yuan, accounting for 30% of the shares, Fang Shui, Gong Qingyu and Su Muxin each invested 1 million yuan, each accounting for 15% of the shares. Feng Rong Chen 3%, Li Feng 5%, Wu Kei symbolically owns 3% of the shares, and the rest belongs to the parent company of Baiyun Technology. Feng Rong Chen took the initiative to take over the responsibility of the project manager. He hadn't done anything like this before, and only served as the project team leader. However, Li Yun said that the project team leader was enough. Feng Rong Chen was responsible for making the game, and Baiyun Technologies Advertising and Marketing Department helped to publicize the rest. Wu Kei was also instructed. The rest were trivial matters. In order to speed up the progress of the project, Li Yun remotely discussed with several shareholders, that is, his confidants, and decided to hire more programmers to make the game as soon as possible. Because the three women are very interested in this game, after all, it is the first game they invested in. It is normal to have a sense of expectation. Okay, the contract is over. Wu Kei sorted out the documents and handed them to the secretary aside and turned around and smiled at Feng Rong Chen, I heard that you know some programmers. You can try to push some people in. As long as the interview passes, you can let them and you make this game together. Yes, Mr. Wu. After signing the contract, Feng Rong Chen was full of red, and once again bowed deeply to Li Yun to thank Li Yun for his kindness. Li Yun smiled, work harder in the future. Definitely, boss. Feng Rong Chen stepped down. Rit. Then I will go first, you are busy. That's right. Li Yun walked out a few steps and turned around, call Wu Kei if you have a problem, don't come to me, because it's useless to find me. I will watch the game in half a month, that's it. Uh, good. Get out of here. Wu Kei scolded with a smile. Li Yun and Gong Qingye walked out of Minjiao building side by side. It was noon when Li Yun planned to find a high-end restaurant to have lunch with Gong Qingyu. Li Yun. While waiting for the driver to drive the BMW out of the underground garage, 
Gong Qingyu suddenly called his name. What happened? No, nothing. Gong Qingyu gave a chuckle, and said nothing, but her little hand quietly held Li Yun's hand. King Yu. Li Yun turned his head to look at her in surprise. The latter gave him a sweet smile naughty, moved a little step closer to him, and leaned his shoulders against each other. This kind of intimacy, Li Yun is not a fool, and he can naturally see Gong King Yu's intentions for him. King Yu. Li Yun was moved in his heart and couldn't help stopping her soft and slender waist. Gong King Yu's graceful body stiffened at first, and then he let out a cry, and his body softened. His head was gently leaning on Li Yun's shoulder, just like the lovers coming and going on the street. The two mates who had been following her to serve her were numb. They had already seen the young lady's feelings for Li Yun, but they were still surprised. Because Gong King Yu and Li Yun have known each other not long ago, and because Li Yun has a close relationship with other girls, neither of them understands, is Li Yun really that attractive? Although they also agree that Li Yun is a very good boy. Li, Yun. Gong King Yu called his name in a gentle, delicate, and mischievous tone. This kind of tender and sweet voice made Li Yun's bones crumble. He could not have imagined that Gong King Yu, a wayward and cold girl, would speak in such a tone at this time. Ching, Jade. Li Yun learned her tone and also called her name. With the addition of God-level sweet words, Li Yun's voice was deep and deep, as if it were a narration in a documentary, gorgeous and full of magnetism, it could be called a girl killer. At least after Gong King Yu listened, the heart of a young girl in her heart trembled slightly, attracted by Li Yun's voice. Even the two maids behind them could not help blushing when they heard Li Yun's voice at the moment, and quickly lowered their heads. This voice really kills both young and old. Lowly, young girls, imperial sisters, and even people, wives and young women cannot resist. Well. Gong King Yu came back to his senses and looked at Li Yun with a soft gaze. After a long while, he said, Actually, what I just wanted to say is that I am very happy this morning. Hey. Li Yun looked at this classical beauty, really wanting to reach out and gently stroke her cheek but unfortunately there were two maids staring behind him and could only give up. Are you happy to be with me? Li Yun asked with a shameless smile. But unexpectedly, Gong King Yu's cheeks were flushed, and he nodded gently. Okay. Gong King Yu's voice was soft as a feather, touching Li Yun's heart. I'm actually very lazy. Gong King Yu was a little embarrassed, and her voice was much lower. Others say that I am a genius and I am beautiful, like a classical beauty, sitting in the back garden playing the piano and singing. Attract people outside the wall to stop and listen to the kind of ancient lady. Li Yun smiled and said, King Yu, you are a classical beauty. Certainly not. Gong King Yu pursed her mouth and looked very cute, my mother always let me learn those piano, chess, calligraphy, and calligraphy, but also to learn female red learn the four books and five classics, etc., but I am willing to learn other than playing the piano, I don't bother to care about everything I don't want to learn. At six o'clock in the evening, Li Yun declined the kind invitation of a general-level leader and chose to return to Zhonghai City to have dinner with Gong King Yu. Well, then I won't keep you, I will invite you to dinner again when I have time. After knowing that Li Yun was going to have dinner with his girlfriend, the leader had no choice but to pat Li Yun on the shoulder with an expression that I understood, and then asked a driver to drive Li Yun back to Zhonghai City in an off-road vehicle. This place is located on the outskirts of Zhonghai City, in a hidden valley, and belongs to the station of a certain soldier force. It is usually responsible for protecting Zhonghai City from threats. Guide missiles, radar, satellite monitoring, soldiers, heavy firearms, etc., all the things for combat are available in this base. And Li Yun is here to test, if a top hacker invades, what is the security performance of this base? Mr. Li, the destination is French concession, isn't it? Yes, just drive there. Someone will pick me up when I get there. Okay. The driver said respectfully, 
you can take a break first. It will take about half an hour. I will call you when I get there. Li Yun nodded and closed his eyes for a while. It was really tiring just now. The driver glanced at Li Yun from the rear view mirror, his eyes full of admiration. When Li Yun first arrived, the leader even organized a welcome party. Everyone in the military base thought it was an important leader. Unexpectedly, it was a young man who looked only 17 or 18 years old. But what everyone didn't expect was that this terribly young teenager brought them a lingering nightmare. The monitoring failed, the electronic door suddenly closed, the radar turned frantically, the sirens flashed and hummed continuously for three hours, until Li Yun took the initiative to shut down, the controlled sirens stopped. What's more frightening is that the silo that automatically launched the guide egg suddenly started, making everyone pale with fright. Fortunately, all of this is an exercise. Fortunately, the silo is not pre-installed with guide eggs. Otherwise, if the silo is really controlled by a hacker, the loss will be incalculable. Horrible hacker power. This is a warning Li Yun brought to all soldiers in the base. While relying on scientific and technological power, it will inevitably bring great security risks. Hacking must be done to the extreme, otherwise it is extremely dangerous. After half an hour. Here, Mr. Li Yun. The driver replied respectfully that Li Yun alone could paralyze the heavily guarded base, and he could not help but disrespect the top hacker genius. Okay, thanks a lot, then I'll go first. Yes, you walk slowly and look forward to driving for Mr. Li next time. Seeing the driver drove the off-road vehicle away, Li Yun smiled. Although it was tiring to invade the base in the afternoon, the harvest was not bad. In addition to receiving the system's choice event rewards, Li Yun also brushed his face in front of the leaders of this group of bigwigs. In the future, he said that he has a backer and background. In addition to having capital to do business in Huangsu and Kuo, relationship is also a very important condition. King Yu lives. Mansion No. 3 Li Yun stood there and looked around, trying to find where the so-called Mansion No. 3 was, but was shocked by the beautiful scenery in front of him. It is located on both banks of the Huangjong River in Zhonghai City, with more than a dozen high-rise buildings in the distance including the most famous Twin Pearl Tower in Zhonghai City. The height of 400 meters, the twin structure, the left and the right complement each other, the whole building is shining with lights, which is more shocking under the night. In addition, there are green grass on both sides of the Yellow River, and there are luxuriant flowers and trees in the riverside parks, and the lights are hidden in them, bright and beautiful. The sparkling river water, cruise ships, beauties, and wealthy people constituted a scene of drunkenness. What's even more wonderful is that beautiful women with long legs and beautiful beauty can be seen everywhere in the riverside park, which is more and more attractive. Li Yun stopped and watched for a long time before shook his head and said with emotion, It is worthy of the world-famous night view of the Huangjong River. It is a treat to live here tonight. Gong King Yu lives here and can see such a beautiful scenery every day. Li Yun is fortunate to follow her to enjoy one night. But some people are not happy. Living here. The female yin and yang of a young couple gave Li Yun a weird glance. Where do you live? Do you work on a cruise ship on the river? Or sleep on a deck chair in a riverside park? Ha <laughs> ha. Her tone was very mocking and Li Yun couldn't help but glance at her and her boyfriend. This woman is in her early thirties. She is dressed up and dressed with gaudy lipstick and thick makeup. She looks good, but she has the appearance of a net red face, even if a deep groove is exposed in front of her, Li Yun sees it. There is no wave in my heart. Coupled with the big belly of the man holding her, the hair on his head is about to fall out, and the couple looks like they have a problem. Li Yun smiled faintly and pointed to a bungalow next to him and said, Isn't there a house here? He wanted to add another sentence, You are blind, but considering the woman's temper, Li Yun didn't bother to conflict with her. Unexpectedly, the system showed up at this moment. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose from the host. 
Option 1, take this big sister Wong to see the real giants, reward experience value 10,000, random gift bag asterisk 1. Option 2, give a smile, no reward. Option 3, taunt the opponent directly, and then beat him up. The reward is plus 200 for evil, plus 100,000 for experience, and plus 100 for free attribute points. The corners of Li Yun's mouth twitched. What fun is the system coming to join in? Aren't you stupid? Sister Wang, who was dressed up and dressed up, became more and more disdainful on her face coated with thick white powder. Someone lives here, are they mentally retarded? My wife, ignore this kind of stuffed buns. Her boyfriend's hands moved around restlessly, hey, let's go to the Riverside Park to play, it's darker there. The Riverside Park is very large, 10 kilometers long. If you look carefully, you will definitely find a place suitable for couples fighting in the wild. Sister Wang gave him a white look, and said with an anguish, you damned ghost want to mess around. With that, she was about to twist her hips and leave. I don't know, it's not certain who is a soil bag. Li Yun shook his head lightly, and walked along the street. What did you say? Sister Wang was furious, turned her head and glared at Li Yun, little kid, you actually said we didn't see it. You said I'm a soil bun. The pot-bellied man was also taken aback, then raised his wrist mockingly, and showed Li Yun what he was wearing on his wrist, do you know what brand this is? Li Yun shook his head. Rolex, the world's most expensive watch, 2 million won. The man was arrogant, and many passers-by looked over, and when they saw his luxurious and exquisite watch, they all let out a surprise. It's really a Rolex. The world's top, no, it should be the most expensive watch brand in the world. Local tyrant, please hug your thighs. The envious eyes of passers-by made the couple even more proud. Sister Wang hugged her boyfriend tightly, with an admiring expression on her face. The man's face was radiant and proud. Ahem, I really want to meet the rich and feel the feeling of living here, just follow me. Li Yun smiled meaningfully, I hope you don't get hit and feel inferior. I'm CAO. I'm still inferior. The successful man wearing a Rolex was furious, and took his girlfriend's hand to follow Li Yun, I still don't believe it tonight, you can find out what wealthy family to come. Sister Wang also yelled, You kid don't know where this is? This is the night view of the Huangjiang River. The commercial residential area where you can see the night view here is Tangcheng Yupin, which starts at 500,000 yuan per square meter. Do you kid know? In the distant Tangcheng Yupin commercial residential area, because of the night view of the Yellow River, the price soared to 500,000 yuan. If you really live near the night view of the Huangjiang River, or are located in the residence of the upper-class nobles in the old era like French rent, what is the price? No, there is no price at all, and no one will sell the house here because of lack of money. This kid. Sister Wang and a group of curious passers-by followed Li Yun, passing the location of the scenic spot, and walking along the way, there were fewer and fewer pedestrians, and the surrounding bungalows were very different, but most of them were hidden behind the trees and only a little bit was seen. Light. It was only then that they were shocked that someone really seemed to live here. Here. Li Yun looked at the sign at the door and said lightly, Mansion number three, my friend lives here. The man wearing the Rolex has already been cold and sweaty. The door in front of him and the hidden buildings behind them are all garden-style bungalows from the old era, with pointed roofs, elegant garden pavilions, and even the door that was blown by wind and rain. Reveal a low-key luxury belonging to the nobility. This Nima is really a mansion. The kind of place that was only seen in the movies of Zhonghai City in the old age, belonged to the wealthy aristocrats and upper-class socialites. Sister Wang glanced at the garden behind the gate. She could vaguely see the neatly built garden. She couldn't help but think of the young ladies in the gothic noble dresses in the garden leisurely sipping tea. Still standing several courteous maids wait on them. This kind of aristocratic life, 
she can't even think about it now, and only the girlhood dare to dream of such a princess-like dream. You, you, your friend. The lips of the man wearing the Rolex began to tremble, and his wrists quietly drooped, hiding the two million Rolex. There is a saying that the poor play cars, the rich play watches. But the real upper-class society, such as the people living in this mansion, their realm has long been beyond mere mortals, reaching a point where ordinary people can't even imagine. For example, to buy an aristocratic garden house from the old era, only this one called a cultural relic is enough to separate him from ordinary people. The so-called Rolex watches, luxury cars, Mercedes, BMW, etc., are nothing compared to the compelling style brought by this foreign mansion. Li Yun A crisp and beautiful girl's voice came, and the closed door was opened. Afterwards, everyone saw a beautiful lady who walked out of the movie, carrying her skirt, and walking out with light steps. Beauty is simply too beautiful, like a fairy out of the world. King Yu Li Yun smiled and hugged Gong King Yu who flew over. The soft and graceful girl's body gave him endless wonderful enjoyment. Everyone was dumbfounded, what a friend, this is obviously a girlfriend. The man with the Rolex concealed his wrist swallowed, his feet moved slightly, trying to sneak away. He just thinks he is a fool now. Hey! Gong King Yu looked at him curiously, Li Yun, who are these people? Why are so many people visiting today? Everyone dared not meet the gazes of this eldest daughter, and all bowed their heads in fear. This girl is so beautiful, she deserves to be a rich lady. Don't stand stupidly, go away, she will be dead when she calls the guard out. Visit? It seems that this woman really lives here, she is used to having tourists visiting at her door. I'm so sour, how many billions does this house cost? It's good to divide me a bit. You have everything in your dreams, go ahead and let those two idiots attract firepower. In an instant, the people who came to watch the excitement ran away, leaving behind the couple of local tyrants and shrews. They said they would like to visit the place where King Yu Yu live. Li Yun smiled. Gong King Yu blinked and looked at the two beautiful eyes, you want to visit? No, no, we just, that. What else does the man want to say? but Sister Wang said jealously, I'll just visit if I visit. I'm afraid you won't make it. She lifted her foot and walked inside, Hey, I guess you must have rented this house, how could someone live in? Snapped. Her man was taken aback, too late to stop, and slapped in a slap in the face of anger and anger, you shut me up. Sister Wang was so dizzy from being beaten, she clutched her face with five fingerprints in disbelief, and pointed her fingers tremblingly at her lover, you, you dare to hit me. Ah, you dare to hit me, okay, Gan Yongsheng, after playing with me for ten years, I only gave me a house, you bastard, scum, dare to beat me. Sister Wang was furious and rushed to grab Bao Bao. The man who had raised her for more than ten years pulled his hair vigorously. Bitch, let me go. I'm cheap. You're not a good thing either. Look at how many sneaky things you have done over the years, you're cheap. Go to hell. The two scuffled together, the scene was very messy, and passers-by who had not left in the distance looked dumbfounded. This. Gong King Yu couldn't laugh or cry, patted Bainan's little hand, and two Kong Wu's powerful bodyguards walked out of the mansion. They stretched out and they separated immediately. Let them go. Gong King Yu's originally a little sad eyes, a smile appeared, turning around and ordered the bodyguard. Big brother, misunderstanding, I'm really not. Gan Yong Sheng was bruised and swollen by Sister Wang, but he had to pay the bodyguard for a smile. Unfortunately, before he finished speaking, the two bodyguards threw the two men a few meters away. Sister Wang also knew that she was scared. After she got up from the ground, she didn't even dare to say anything cruel, and walked away with her lover in despair. Ding, the host has made a choice, and the reward has been distributed. Li Yun smiled. Although the rewards are not many, 
the feeling of slapped face is really cool. Miss. The two bodyguards respectfully saluted Gong King Yu, who nodded, Good job, go back. After speaking, Gong King Yu took Li Yun's arm and walked very intimately into this bungalow left over from the old era. Boom. The iron fence gate was closed, and the roadman in the distance was slowly relieved. They enjoyed it very much. It turns out that there are really top giants, and they hide in these places that the public cannot see. Occasionally peeping into some situations is enough to give ordinary people the capital to brag. Just like the stars that many people are chasing, no, these big ladies are much rarer and noble than the stars. Armed by Gong King Yu, feeling her soft figure, Li Yun walked into this bungalow with a history of over a hundred years. The bungalows, or mansions, are buildings left over from Zhonghai City in the last century. It used to be a place where missionaries or foreign aristocrats and comprador classes lived, so it was built extremely luxuriously. The mansion is the size of a football field. After entering the gate, there is a beautiful garden planted with exotic flowers and plants in front of it. Beautiful flowers of various colors are blooming out of season. The flowers are clustered and beautiful like a fairyland. A high fence isolates the mansion from the outside world. It is covered with slightly withered vines. A circle of large trees is planted around it. The luxuriant foliage makes it difficult for passers-by to see the scenery inside. This is where King Yu Yu live? It's beautiful. Li Yun admired. After walking through a path full of flowers, I saw the beautiful rockery in front of the spire building, the spring water is ding-dong, the pool is clear, and the goldfish of various colors cruise leisurely. The beauty is so beautiful that it is touching and happy. Hee <laughs> hee, it's okay. Gong King Yu seemed to be in a bad mood, barely smiled, and said, This house is the elder in the family. It was given to me during my birth celebration. At that time, I happened to be angry with my parents, so I came in angrily. I did not expect to study in Zhonghai City for two years. Li Yun nodded. The palace family is a martial arts family with a thousand years of inheritance. There is still some background. Innate celebration? King Yu, you were only sixteen when you were born. Yet. Yeah. Gong King Yu was a little bit shy, and said quickly, Actually, I don't care about my husband. No, it doesn't matter if the person I like is born. Haha. <laughs> Li Yun held her little hand and said confidently, King Yu, I am now in the middle of the acquired stage, but believe me, I will definitely reach the innate in half a year. At Gong King Yu tilted his head and looked at him, Li Yun, you are in the Hushan realm? Why didn't I listen to you? So, you are also a member of the rivers and lakes. The people in the rivers and lakes originally referred to the sects and families that have been passed down since ancient times. Later, all those who practice martial arts can be called the people in the rivers and lakes as long as they enter this ancient martial arts circle. The concept of rivers and lakes has appeared very early, and Zhuangzi once said that it is better to forget each other in the rivers and lakes. Not really, but it's somewhat related. Li Yun had a little conflict with a sect called Fi Human in Zhonghai City. It's great. In this way, the gap between Li Yun and her is even smaller, and his parents will recognize him. Gong King Yu smiled with crooked eyebrows, but Li Yun saw that there was a trace of worry in her smile. King Yu, have you encountered anything? Li Yun asked directly. Me? I haven't encountered anything. Don't lie. Li Yun scratched her little nose and smiled, I know your smile is not like this, let's go, did you encounter something unpleasant? Tell your husband to help you. Gong King Yu's cheeks were slightly red, and her heart was very sweet. Just as she was about to say something, an angry voice came from the front. Let go of your dirty hands. Accompanied by this angry and murderous voice, a figure rushed towards his face with a billowing heat wave. Li Yun's eyes condensed. With the help of more than 10,000 mental points, his reaction speed at this moment was incredible. Similarly, the dynamic vision of both eyes is unparalleled in the acquired realm. 
Li Yun clearly saw that the person who rushed in the raid, slapped his right palm fiercely at him, and wanted to destroy him with a single blow. Hey! Looking for death! The killing intent in Li Yun's heart was aroused, and he was about to fight back, but the system prompt sounded by coincidence. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose from the host. Option 1, run the red flame palm of the body against Yu Wenchen's infuriating vitality, and use the high-grade steel and iron bones to harden the palm. The reward experience value is plus 100,000, and the steel and iron bones are promoted to master level, but the host has a chance to be seriously injured. Option 2, fight back, kill Yuan on the spot, reward experience value plus 500,000, justice value plus 500, all attribute points plus 1,000, purple gift bag asterisk 1, host is chased by Yuan family, extra bonus skill, desperate return raw. Choice 3, take this palm just right, reward experience value plus 200,000, all attributes plus 500 and a random martial arts skill will be upgraded to master level. After the system prompts, time seems to slow down, and Li Yun can see the face of Yu Wen's hung on the opposite side. He was in his early twenties. He looks good and looks good, but his eyebrows are furrowed, and there is a monstrous killing intent in his eyes, as if Li Yun and him have the hatred of taking his wife and killing his father. Anger Li Yun was very upset. If it weren't for the Yuan family, no, it should be said that if you look at Gong King Yu's face, Li Yun will definitely kill him. This kind of despicable villain who doesn't say a word, makes a tough shot, Li Yun has no reason not to kill him. Just give King Yu a face, it's always bad to kill in her house. The cold murderous intent in Li Yun's eyes faded, and he said silently in his heart, System, add all my experience to the Nine Sons. Ding, Zhuyang Tianjing has been successfully upgraded, current level, advanced. He gained more than 2 million experiences during this period, all of which were added to the Nine Sons Heavenly Scriptures and successfully elevated him to a high level. Suddenly, a powerful force spread from his limbs, and Li Yun's power instantly increased more than twice. In the later days of the day after tomorrow, with my skills, Coupled with all-round development of physical attributes, I don't think you will die. Li Yun sneered, facing Yu Wenchen's Qi Yan palm, he chose to fight back with the same technique. Yu Yang fist. Boom. The fist and the palm collided fiercely, both of them were positive energy of the Yang attribute, and the moves were both powerful and violent. Therefore, the collision was like a volcanic eruption, bursting and the surrounding flowers and plants seemed to be burned by a fire. Withered and shriveled instantly. The bodyguards hidden around looked at all this in horror. They only felt that a wave of heat was coming, and the air was actually ignited, terribly hot. After Li Yun's punch, his body did not move at all, but Yu Wen's hung who made a sneak attack took three steps backwards, his face was blood red, and the blood in his body was surging. After staring at Li Yun two eyes, he finally couldn't hold it back, and he let out a wow. Take a bite of blood. Do you want to die? Li Yun Kiang drew out a sword, put it on Yu Wenchen's neck, and asked coldly. Everyone was stunned, where did he draw the sword? You. Yu Wenchen's handsome handsome face showed an expression of anger. He was born in the Yuan family, one of the four great masters of Jianghu and he has studied the Yandi Zhenjing in his family since he was young. Realm, but the punch just now definitely has the power of innate realm. But Li Yun's boxing technique is actually more powerful than him, with the same Yang attribute Genkai, suppressing all of his Yandi Zhenjing. This kind of exercise is unheard of in the arena, how can you let Yu Wen's hung not be surprised? Li Yun defeated him with a single blow, how not to make Yu Wen's hung angry? I ask you one more sentence, do you want to die? Li Yun's tone was flat, with a long sword in his hand pressing on his neck, and Yu Wenchen's great head would fall to the ground with just a little effort. No, no. Gong King Yu reacted and hurriedly stopped Li Yun. King Yu, you should ask what is going on with your guest. Li Yun smiled faintly, 
patted Yu Wenchen's face with the long sword, taunted the opponent fiercely, and then took the long sword back. Yu Wenchen's handsome face became distorted because of anger, but he did not lose his mind, because he knew that Li Yun was better than him, and Gong Qingye was beside him, so he was not suitable for fighting. Yu Wen's hung. Gong Qingye was very angry, and said with a cold face, What are you doing? Why did you suddenly act on my guests? Get out of me immediately, I don't want to see you again. Her tone was extremely harsh, Yu Wen's hung couldn't take care of her anger, and forced a smile, saying, King Yu, I think. Don't call me King Yu. Junior Sister Gong. Yu Wen's hung swallowed his breath. I saw this kid move your hands and feet, so. What's that? You just wanted to hurt someone. Gong King Yu choked him unceremoniously. If it weren't for Li Yun's Ho Tian, he would have been injured by Yu Wen Chen's palm, and his internal organs would be burned and destroyed by Yu Wen's Yang Qi. Yu Wen's Hung didn't dare to make another noise. The palace family is comparable to the Yu Wen family, but Gong King Yu is the daughter of the palace family head and she has an excellent talent. She was born at the age of 16 and shocked the world. And he, Yu Wen's Hung, was only the son of the Yuan family, and his talent was incomparable with Gong King Yu. He was only 20 years old and completed the day after tomorrow. Go, I don't want to see you again. Gong King Yu took a deep breath and said coldly. King Yu. Yu Wen's Hung was taken aback, and pointed at Li Yun and shouted, you are angry with me for this kind of person? What is his origin? He is my boyfriend. Gong King Yu took Li Yun's arm and said coldly, Besides, I have already said that I don't like you. No, I don't like people who are weaker than me, Yu Wen's hung. From the beginning you have no chance. Li Yun smiled lightly, holding her small smooth hand and said, King Yu, it is not guilty to be angry with him. Although he offends me, but for your face, I won't pursue it this time. Li Yun stared coldly at Yu Wen's hung, not as an example. If you dare to attack me again, I will kill you. Yu Wen's hung shuddered, he could feel that Li Yun would really kill him. Ding, the host has made a choice, and the reward has been issued. The corner of Li Yun's mouth hooked. Although it is a pity that the most important Nine Suns scripture has not been upgraded to the master level, the power of Yi Yang Fist is not bad, and the master level is enough to contend the martial arts of the innate realm. In the end, Yu Wen's Hung stayed with a faceless face. The excuse was that he found a genius doctor to help Gong King Yu treat a certain patient. Li Yun nodded secretly. It turned out that this was the reason why King Yu was unhappy. It turned out that the elder in the family was sick. The three of them walked into the mansion, Yu Wen's hung was a little embarrassed, but barely maintained his face. When he came to the living room, Li Yun saw an old man sitting inside, holding a teacup and drinking tea. Senior Huang Yu Wen Sheng concealed his murderous intent and unhappiness before, and walked to the old man with a smile, and saluted respectfully, Old Huang, we are back. I am embarrassed to keep you waiting. It's okay. Senior Huang smiled and waved his hand, looking at Li Yun, is this the little girl you picked up? Yes. Gong King Yu smiled and introduced, Lao Huang, this is Li Yun, the same age as me, and he is cultivated in the Hushan realm. Li Yun, this is the senior Huang, the elder of Tian Donmen. The medical skills are extremely superb and the people of the rivers and lakes are called the Ching Sang Old Man. The Old Man? Li Yun knew that there was a medical book in ancient times called Ching Nang Shu. According to legend, it was written by the genius Dr. Hua Tuo's life's hard work and medical experience. But unfortunately, due to various reasons, this medical book only circulated the next few pages, which recorded the contents of Ma Fei San, Wu Qin Xi and so on. The person who can be labeled as green capsule by the people of the rivers and lakes must really be a doctor with a superb medical book. Hello, old man. Li Yun saluted him and practiced medicine to save people. He was worthy of Li Yun's respect. A gleam flashed in Wang's eyes, 
and he smiled and asked, Look at your demeanor, don't you look like a quack? It's not. Li Yun admitted frankly. No wonder. Huang Lao smiled and said, You are not from the rivers and lakes, but you have gained the favor of the palace girl. It seems that you are good at young friends. This statement was full of irony. Li Yun was taken aback, frowned and glanced at the window before he woke up. You can see the garden from here, and it must be Huang Lao who saw his fight with Yu Wen's hung. Moreover, Huang Lao is towards Yu Wen's hung. A little bit of strength, not enough, it's enough to teach some people who are overpowered. Li Yun's tone was plain, Huang Lao was a bit aggressive, but he was not easy to provoke and his understatement instantly aroused Yu Wenchen's anger. You. Okay, don't make a noise. Gong Qingyu quietly stopped the fight between the two, with a soft voice, as if he was afraid of disturbing someone. Yu Wen's hung could only shut his mouth. After staring at Li Yun bitterly, he squeezed a smile at Gong Qingyu, King Yu, this time I specially invited Huang Lao to come from Donglin province overnight for the thing is to see Senior Gong, I believe that under Huang Lao's superb medical skills, he will surely cure his illness. The old man can only say his best. Huang Lao stroked his grey beard reservedly, but anyone could see the pride between his brows. Then King Yu, thank you for your help. Gong King Yu was unhappy and thanked the two. Li Yun was confused, and after inquiring about King Yu, he learned the whole story. It turned out that three days ago, an elder in Gong King Yu's family suddenly became ill, and went to the hospital that night. Gong King Yu didn't care too much either, because this elder named Gong Lian Yi was discharged from the hospital the next morning, and nothing could be detected at all. But unexpectedly, for the next two days, every night from 1 to 7 o'clock, Gong Lian Yi would have a splitting headache and had to be sent to the hospital for analgesics. Gong Lian Yi also kept it from Gong King Yi for two days, but this afternoon she couldn't keep it from her, causing Gong King Yi to become nervous instantly. This elder named Gong Lian Yi is more than 30 years old this year. She was born in the late stage of cultivation. For some reason, she was not married, so she raised Gong King Yi as a daughter, and the relationship between the two was deep. After Gong King Yi came to Zhonghai City to study in anger, Gong Lian Yi followed along to Zhonghai City, while sitting in Zhonghai City, escorting the palace family in Zhonghai City, supervising the palace family's business in Zhonghai City, and protecting and caring for the palace poor Jade. Therefore, after learning that Gong Lian Yi was suffering from this inexplicable disease, Gong King Yi was extremely nervous, for fear that something might happen to her. Li Yun touched his nose, and King Yu said that this was not her home which caused Li Yun to think that there were no her parents, so he didn't prepare gifts, and came with empty hands. But now it seems that this Gong Lian Yi is equal to King Yu's godmother. It's really embarrassing to come empty-handed, just bring some fruit. Now at 6.45 in the evening, time is running out. Old Huang looked at Gong King Yu, and said solemnly, Now I want to ask a few questions, Gong girl, you must answer truthfully. Okay, I must know everything. Gong King Yu replied earnestly, Gong Lian took her from childhood to adulthood, and her feelings are as deep as that of her family. She must cure her auntie's illness. Did the patient become ill on time at 7 o'clock in the evening for the past three days? Yes, it was true on the first day. For the next two days, I listened to the maid's report. I also asked Aunt Lian. It was true that she would feel a headache at 7 o'clock. Gong King Yu thought carefully, knowing what Huang wanted to ask, after I knew about this, I immediately investigated everyone in the mansion, carefully searched and tested everything that Auntie may have eaten or touched, but there was nothing. Find evidence of someone poisoning. Li Yun frowned and fell ill at 7 o'clock every night. What kind of disease is this? He didn't know much about medical knowledge. He only knew that some rheumatism would inevitably occur when the weather was humid. There are also some pollen allergies, which will also on time. In addition, Aunt Lien spent the night in the hospital. The environment changed and the food she ate changed, 
but she still got sick. As if synchronized with Li Yun's thinking, Gong Qingye pointed out that Auntie Lian could not be allergic. I got sick on time. Old Huang groaned for half a minute before he asked, So, the patient has already gone to the hospital, but has there been any examination? No. Gong Qingye shook his head affirmatively, Auntie Lian is a master of the late congenital stage. Most viruses can't harm her. Usually there are some colds and fevers, and there is absolutely no incurable disease. Influenza is actually very strong, otherwise it will not spread so widely, it is just not lethal. Li Yun was a little surprised. He thought that Huang Lao, who was born in the rivers and lakes, would despise modern medicine, but he did not expect that he would also value it. Mr. Huang nodded, I know it roughly. Next, I'm going to check the pulse of the patient and ask about the detailed condition. Gong Mei, I, you will lead the way. Okay, Huang Lao you come with me. Gong King Ye winked at Li Yun and motioned for him to follow. As for Yu Wen's hung, originally he invited Huang Lao, who should be respected by Gong King Yu, but because of his arrogant behavior, Gong King Ye doesn't bother to pay attention to him. A flash of resentment flashed in Yu Wenchen's eyes and a cold snort. After Huang Lao cured Gong Lianyi, and after he regained Gong King Yu's favor, he secretly found someone to kill the kid. At this moment, Xia's Hai He, a maid of Gong King Yu, hurriedly walked in, Miss, a young man came outside the door, saying that it can cure the Elder Palace's disease. What? Not only was Huang Lao extremely surprised, even Li Yun showed a strange expression. Someone appeared inexplicably, saying that Gong Lianyi's strange disease could be cured? Li Yun had reason to suspect that it was his poison that caused Gong Lianyi to become ill. After all, Gong Lianyi's illness, unless specifically inquired, it is not so easy to know. Gong Qingye was also suspicious of the people coming, but now she couldn't care about so many people. Even if there were problems, she would invite the young man in first. Soon, the uninvited guest was led by the maid to Gong King Yu. Li Yun gave him a calm look. This young man is about 23 or 4 years old. His height and appearance are very ordinary. He can only be said to be Xiao's Hawaii. The only thing worth paying attention to is that he has a mustache, long hair, and a slightly wicked look in his eyes. He looks at Gong Qing. At Yu's first glance, Li Yun clearly saw the greed in his eyes. Ding! Trigger the option event, please choose from the host. Option 1, kill M. Ol Yang on the spot, reward justice value plus 500, experience points plus 200,000, all attributes plus 500, a random martial arts skill. Option 2, expose his conspiracy, investigate his origin, reward experience value plus 500,000, all attributes plus 1,000. Medium detoxification pill asterisk 3. Option 3, do nothing, no reward. There was an inscrutable sneer at the corner of Li Yun's mouth. The young man who came unexpectedly really had a problem. But what is his conspiracy? Undoubtedly, M. Ol Yang came for Gong family, for Gong King Yu? Or is it to control the power of the palace family in Zhonghai City? Li Yun didn't know for the time being and silently followed Gong King Yu's side. M. Ol Yang's face looked like an expert hermit. After introducing himself, he claimed to be an invisible descendant of the sect. When he passed the door, he saw evil spirits permeating the mansion. He was in the spirit of saving lives and defeating the man who built the seventh-level Buddha statue. Spirit, came in and asked who was sick. Evil is pervasive. Gong King Yu frowned his willow eyebrows tightly, Huang Lao's entire face was darkened, and Yu Wen's hung was more straightforward, and he shouted sharply, You guy of unknown origin, what are you talking about? The evil is pervasive? You think we are those the ignorant villager? Get out of me immediately. Be quiet. Gong King Yu spoke again to stop him from disturbing Aunt Gong Lianyi. Haha, you are ignorant. M. Ol Yang looked smug, disdained to argue with Yu Wen's hung too much. Li Yun smiled. 
Does Yu Wen's Hung regard Gong King Yu as his possession? When you open your mouth, you get people out, wait. Evil. Li Yun suddenly thought of something. He looked at Emo Yang, his eyes sharpened instantly, you can poison. What? Everyone looked at Li Yun in surprise, Emo Yang's eyes were blank, goo poison? What is it? You mean the legendary poison of Miao Zhang? Ha ha ha, you can talk more than me. Li Yun stared at him for a long time, and after confirming that Emo Yang had not lied, he looked away. Strange, this Emo Yang really doesn't know how to poison him? I'll talk about extra things later. Huang Lao waved his hand, saying that he didn't want to listen to Li Yun and Emo Yang's nonsense, Gong Girl, lead the way faster, it will be too late. Oh yes, it's almost seven o'clock, come with me, don't make noise. The four people went up to the third floor of the mansion. Li Yun saw countless luxurious decorations along the way. For example, the floor of the mansion was covered with high-quality red soft carpets. Walking up quietly, soft and comfortable, walking barefoot would definitely be very comfortable. In addition, Li Yun saw a lot of celebrity calligraphy and paintings in the corridor. These expensive antiques were placed and decorated at will, which is extremely extravagant. Gong King Yu came to a master bedroom and knocked gently on the door, Auntie Lian. King Yu? Come in. Li Yun listened to the voice coming from the door. It was not like the patient's extremely weak voice. Although he was a bit tired, it was generally full of breath. Entering the door, Li Yun frowned slightly. It was spring, but the air conditioner had been turned on in the room, and the temperature was very low, which made people shiver. This large bedroom is divided into two parts, inside and outside. The inside is the master bedroom, and the outside is a slightly smaller reception room. The decoration is very luxurious, with mahogany bookshelves, high-end sofas, exquisite tea tables and cups, etc. Li Yun looked at a young woman sitting on the sofa in the living room. After seeing her looks clearly, there was a faint flash of amazing colors in his eyes. This young woman named Gong Lian Yi is in her early thirties. She is tall, fair-skinned, and features delicate and charming features, especially her Danfen eyes, with upturned and narrow eye corners, showing a mature woman's charm, ordinary a man's heart beats faster when she sees it. This woman's looks and figure are simply the ultimate of UGs, without deliberately pretentious, her every move can stir the flames in the man's heart. However, Gong Lian Yi's temperament is intellectual and graceful, completely different from charming looks, even her intellectual beauty has overwhelmed the sense of charm, making men pay more attention to her temperament rather than charming looks. King Yu, who are these? Gong Lian Yi asked with a smile at the corner of her mouth, showing no expression of being troubled by the illness, which made Li Yun secretly admired. Ordinary people who have been guilty of this weird disease have long been panicked, how can they calmly ask? Guru. Yu Wen's hung swallowed, and his eyes looked at Gong Lian Yi like flames. He was completely seduced by the charm of this young woman. With his countless experience, Yu Wen's hung dared to conclude that this mature royal sister must be the legendary fox beauty. Foxes are beauties, they are naturally able to attract the attention of men and make countless men give up their lives for them. The legendary Su Daji, Bao Si, Yang Gaifei, etc., are said to be foxes, fascinating, slinky, smiling, and every action can firmly attract the attention of men. Even women can't resist this charm. It's just a pity that Gong Lian Yi likes to read, causing her to have an intellectual and graceful temperament, which dilutes her fox and charming appearance. Gong Lian Yi frowned slightly. She only took a look at Yu Wenchen's current gaze, and she could easily understand what he was thinking at the moment. She had seen this look countless times since she was a child. She was greedy and fiery, and couldn't wait to swallow her in one mouthful. This look made Gong Lian Yi extremely disgusted. As a result, she didn't want to be close to a man at all, and stayed with scholars all day long, and planned to be alone for a lifetime in the future, 
so she regarded King Yu as her daughter to take care of. Gong King Yu glanced at Yu Wen's hung coldly and introduced, Auntie Lian, this is Yu Wen's hung, this is the elder of Tian Donman who is known as the old man of Qing Sang. It turns out that you are Senior Huang, the junior palace Lotus Palace Lianyi, who has long heard of Senior's name. Gong Lianyi showed a gentle smile and got up to salute, but Huang Lao waved her hand to indicate that she was a patient and just sat. Then, Gong King Yu introduced M. Oli Yang. There is no doubt that M. Oli Yang, like Yu Wen's Hung, was so charming that Gong Lianyi's fox charm was so charming that he couldn't hide his eyes anymore, and looked squinted. Looking at the palace lotus palace Lianyi. Looking from top to bottom, then down to top, this kind of obscene look, not to mention Gong Lianyi can't stand it, Li Yun couldn't help but punch this bastard. King Yu, who is he? Gong Lianyi was disgusted in her heart and asked he is instead of this is. His name is M. Oli Yang, and he came to the gate inexplicably and said that he could cure Aunt Lian from your illness. Gong King Yu's tone was flat, and he showed three points of anger. If it weren't for the sickness of Aunt Lian, M. Oli Yang would not be able to get close to the gate of the mansion. Li Yun felt that King Yu had said something wrong. She should not call Gong Lianyi aunt, but her sister. Gong Lianyi is well maintained, plus studying indoors all year round, her skin is fair and tender, full of collagen, without the slightest wrinkle, just like a young girl in her 28 years. When walking up to the eldest sister, passers-by must think Gong Lianyi and Gong King Yu are sisters, not aunts and nieces. Really, I would really appreciate it, Mr. I just don't know. How did Mr. M.O. know that I was sick? Gong Lianyi's tone was flat, and she faintly revealed a force of pressure, revealing the aura of the innate late powerhouse. M. O. Yang swallowed, and under this compelling momentum, he could only put away his eroticism for the time being. When I passed by your house, I saw evil here at the door. The evil spirit is soaring? What is the evil spirit? The bad luck that breeds in a dark and humid place, don't worry. My treatment method does not need to touch the body at all, and does not require any medication. M. O. Yang confided in his words, and everyone was skeptical. They felt that he was very suspicious, and that he might be able to try, provided that it was harmless to Gong Lianyi. An indifferent sneer appeared at the corner of Li Yun's mouth. Without contact with the body, the illness can be cured without taking medicine unless M. O. Yang is a psychologist who comes to cure Gong Lianyi's heart disease. The old man will check the pulse of Miss Gong first. The time was only five minutes until seven o'clock. According to the experience of the previous three days, Gong Lianyi was about to become ill, so Huang Lao did not delay. After putting down the box in his hand, he sat down to diagnose her pulse. Don't bother. As soon as Huang Lao's fingers touched Gong Lianyi's wrist, M. O. Yang sneered, This disease is not an ordinary disease. Even if you invite Ban Hung to come in person, it's absolutely impossible. Snapped. Before he could finish his words, Yu Wen's Hung slapped him and slapped him. The sudden slap made M. O. Yang go around in a circle, staggered and almost fell to the ground. You. M. O. Yang was startled and angry his left face hurting fiercely. To shut up. Yu Wen's hung looked indifferent, in front of the old man Ching Nang, how can you be a trash talking? Watch quietly, get out if you don't want to see it. In his twenties, he didn't even break through the acquired realm, so naturally it was waste. M. O. Yang's teeth were itchy with hatred, but Gong King Yu, the master, didn't say anything, and the rest of the people also looked calm. Humph, if it hadn't been for my heart to cure diseases and save people, I would have left. Looking for an excuse to stay, M. O. Yang's face was as black as the bottom of a pot. If it wasn't for some ulterior purpose, Li Yun didn't believe that a person with this personality would be a doctor who rescued the wounded. With a buzzing sound, Li Yun's phone vibrated. He picked it up and took a look. It was concubine Wan Qing who responded to his message. Gong Lianyi glanced at Li Yun. 
The young man entered the door and caught her attention, because he could stand beside Kingya without arousing her disgust. On the contrary, Kingya seemed to rely on him very much. In addition, the only thing Kingya did not introduce him just now, Gong Lianyi was even more concerned. The lack of introduction immediately means that Gong Kingya will focus on introducing Li Yun later. Senior trouble you. Gong Lianyi retracted her gaze and smiled slightly at Huang Lao. Her attitude was extremely gentle and graceful, and her manners and proper manners made people feel like a spring breeze. Yu Wenzhong looked at Huang Laoyi for Gong Lianyi's pulse, her wrists were white and delicate, and her fingers were slender and soft. People couldn't help but want to hold her hand and look at Gong Lianyi with affection. The graceful elder sister with graceful hands showed a shy expression. Thinking of this, Yu Wenzhong wants to get Gong Lianyi and Gong Qingyu the pair of sister flowers more and more. Lao Huang put his fingers on Gong Lianyi's veins and turned a blind eye to the beautiful little hand. His brows became more and more frowning. Gong Qingyu, who was watching, couldn't help but grab Li Yun's hand, nervously. Looking at Huang Lao. After a long while. Miss Gong, before the illness, did you feel anything unusual? Not at all. Can you take any food that you haven't eaten? Or have you come into contact with something? N.O.R. Huang Lao asked several questions in a row, but Gong Lianyi always shook his head. She frowned lightly, with a lingering sadness between her eyebrows, Zhu lips slightly opened, and said, I went out for a meal with a business partner three days ago, and I came back after eating. After the illness, I asked them specifically, but I didn't have a clue. Meaning, she is the only one who is sick. So. Huang Lao let go of his pulse diagnosing hand and stroked his grey beard. After everyone waited anxiously, he shook his head and sighed, the old man is so incompetent and can't see what disease you have. How could this happen? Gong Qingyu's delicate body shook three times, and Li Yun held her back and comforted her a few words softly. M. Ol Yang breathed a sigh of relief. This old thing really didn't see anything wrong. But it's not in the way. Huang Lao smiled confidently, the old man has been practicing medicine for many years, and he still has some experience. Miss Gong, your pulse is stable, except for a slightly faster heartbeat. Generally speaking, your body is extremely healthy. Later, I will I'll prescribe some heat clearing and nourishing medicine for you. I believe it will be enough to rest for two days. Gong Lianyi nodded, although there was sadness between her eyebrows, she was not too nervous, as if she didn't care about her illness. Yu Wenzhong breathed a sigh of relief and smiled, Senior Gong, King Yu, don't worry, Huang Lao's medical skills will never be under the semi-sage physician of Tian Dan Sex head. He will guarantee that Senior Gong's body is absolutely free. Problem. He glanced at Gong Lianyi calmly, the figure hidden in the thick skirts, even though the visual inspection was not very real, but Yu Wenzhong assured that Gong Lianyi's body is absolutely charming and enough to make a man. Crazy stunner. After all, a woman with a fox-like appearance can't be bad in figure. Hee <laughs> hee, it's almost seven o'clock. M. Ol Yang arrogantly sat on the sofa and glanced coldly at the wall clock hanging on the wall. The onset time has come. What do you mean? Yu Wenzhong stared at M. Ol Yang's face with sharp eyes like a knife, and meant to catch him directly when there was a big discrepancy. Li Yun knew why Yu Wenzhong was angry, because everyone didn't talk about Gong Lianyi's illness at 7 o'clock. Where did M. Ol Yang know about it? Humph. M. Ol Yang lifted Erlang's legs and said leisurely, I am uninvited, and I am sure to cure your disease. How can I not know when it will happen? Believe it or not, I can tell the origin of this disease. And harm? Ha ha ha. He was extremely proud. Now Gong Lianyi's attitude towards him has changed. Even Gong Qingyu looked at him in surprise. M. Oliang squinted and thought that maybe it won't take a few days for this pair of similar-looking beauties to all fall into his palm. Old Huang, do you believe it? M. Ol Yang smiled and glanced at him, his expression very arrogant. 
the expression on Huang Lao's face is very wonderful. He has practiced medicine for many years, but he can't see the disease that a frivolous young man can see. But Huang Lao has practiced medicine all his life, and he has already put his reputation on the outside. Therefore, he finally respectfully saluted M. O. Yang, and said in a humble tone, Please give me some advice, Mr. Gong, what kind of illness is Miss Gong committed? Ha ha ha, Mr. Huang, please. M. O. Yang pretended to disregard the previous suspicion, holding on to Huang Lao with a smile on his face. This bastard! Yuan Sheng gritted his teeth with hatred, he took the pains to go to Tian Donmen to invite Huang Lao to come over, but M. O. Yang made the limelight and forced him to finish it. Gong Lianyi had a weird face. She thought that M. O. Yang was the kind of villain who only fished in troubled waters and was full of lustful thoughts. Didn't expect that he would really cure the disease? Gong Qingyu looked at Li Yun. He has been watching quietly since he picked up the phone just now, but that's right, Li Yun doesn't know how to treat illness and can't demand too much. M. O. Yang was about to talk. He just saw Li Yun in his eyes, and found that he had a calm expression on his face. He suddenly became unhappy, Hey, boy, do you also know the origin and treatment of this disease? Ding! Just then, the wall clock on the wall rang, and the time officially came to seven o'clock. Gong Lianyi frowned immediately, waiting for the unbearable pain to strike. Not bad. Li Yun picked up the remote control placed on the table, pressed it at the air conditioner that was blowing the air, and said calmly, I not only know how to cure it, but I also know who is betting against Miss Gong. What? Everyone looked at him in surprise. Someone calculated Gong Lianyi? No, don't turn it off. It was just a simple action, but everyone was surprised again, because Gong Lianyi stood up swayingly and said eagerly, No, turn on the air conditioner, I, I'm afraid of heat. Afraid of heat? Everyone looked at her unexpectedly again. At the moment Gong Lianyi is wearing several underskirts, and there is a close-fitting cotton padded jacket in the underskirts, as if she was dressed in winter. Old Huang was shocked, not right. He even ignored Gong Lianyi's dress. Gong Lianyi, who was wearing thick clothes with the air conditioner on, was very strange, but because of the cold spring in the morning and the low temperature in the room, Huang subconsciously thought it was beautiful and ignored the air conditioner problem. It's okay, I will heal you soon. Li Yun blocked Gong Lianyi, who came to rob the air conditioner remote control, with a gentle tone, and smiled at her, Don't worry, bear with me, the pain will soon disappear. Gong Lianyi was stunned for a moment. Although the handsome young man in front of him was not the most handsome man she had ever seen, he had a reassuring sunny temperament. After she approached Li Yun, she still vaguely smelled something belonging to him. The masculine breath made her heart tremble, and her charming face was quickly stained with red clouds. This feeling of accelerated heartbeat is an experience that Gong Lianyi has never experienced since childhood. She hates men, but unexpectedly does not hate Li Yun. Is he a man? Come, sit down. Li Yun helped Gong Lianyi sit down, but when she first touched the sofa, Gong Lianyi's whole body was instantly tensed, and her two small hands firmly grasped Li Yun's wrist, which belonged to the strength of the late congenital power, which made Li Yun's ten fingerprints immediately appeared on the skin. Aunt Fang. Gong Qingyi rushed over anxiously, looking at her in panic. Gong Lianyi was so painful that she couldn't speak, her eyes were bloodshot. Her small mouth was slightly open and panting, her smooth forehead, cheeks, beautiful white neck, and even the scalp leaked fine sweat, making her black. Thick long hair soaks wet. Everyone can tell at a glance that Gong Lianyi is suffering unimaginable pain at this moment. Turn on, turn on the air conditioner, miss. A maid promptly reminded, Miss Fang felt very stuffy on the first day of the attack and when she turned on the air conditioner, she immediately relieved her pain. Well, I'll turn on the air conditioner. Gong Qingyu immediately wanted to do it, but Li Yun stopped her. No, 
you can't turn on the air conditioner. Li Yun's face was serious, and he was about to proceed with the next step when the system prompt came. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose from the host. Option 1, give Gong Liani a medium-sized detoxification pill to heal her directly, reward her with justice value plus 200, Gong Liani favorability degree plus 70, experience value plus 100,000, green gift bag asterisk 2. Option 2, use the method given by concubine Wang Qing to slowly and personally heal Gong Liani, reward Gong Liani with favorability plus 89, evil plus 100, and free attribute points plus 300. The host has a chance to interact with each other during the treatment. Gong Liani happened some unspeakable intimacy. Choice 3, do nothing, reward evil value plus 1. Li Yun has a black line. The system has yours, you know so much. In the second option, the treatment method given by Qing Concubine Wan is not evil, but if Li Yun treats himself personally, the two people need to be frank and confront each other, and use the Qi of the Nine Suns in Li Yun's body to control the Gu in Gong Lianyi the worm forced it out. And it will take three days and three nights. Let me ask, in the case of being frank, Li Yun still needs to use his true energy to force the Gu Worm in Gong Lianyi's body. The fragrance in this is naturally unspeakable intimacy. Ahem, we wouldn't be so evil, but Gong Lianyi's favorability. Li Yun glanced at Gong Lianyi. She was soaked with sweat on her clothes, and her dark blue silk was wet against her forehead. Her brows were painfully frowning. In addition, her fox and charming looks added to her. Therefore, Gong Lianyi is now the charm revealed at this moment is enough to make any man, even woman, be moved by it. Yu Wenzhong and Em Yang were stunned, Huang Lao was also a little lost, even Gong King Yu, as a woman, was shocked by the beauty and charm of her Aunt Lian. Gong Lianyi's favorability is still to be brushed. Li Yun felt evil in his heart, and if Gong Lianyi had another encounter with him in the future, he would take advantage of her and accept her, if not, let's talk about it. Senior Gong, offended. Li Yun turned Gong Lianyi around, put his hands on her back, and circulated the masculine nine sons Tian Jing Zhen Qi, slowly infiltrating Gong Lianyi's body. King Yu, come and help me hold Senior Gong. Gong Lianyi now has no power to resist because of the pain, otherwise Li Yun's acquired true energy would never invade it, but even so, Gong Lianyi still struggled because of the pain. Moreover, after feeling the heat of the Nine Suns, Gong Lianyi felt more painful and unbearable, and the sweat on her body was oozing out. What are you doing? Because of Li Yun's actions, Gong Lianyi's flattery was blocked by him, so M. O. Yang exclaimed angrily, Get out of the way, boy, it has delayed my treatment of Miss Gong, can you afford it? Oh? What method are you going to use to treat the disease? Li Yun frowned, Gong Lianyi's expression getting more and more painful. Why should I tell you? Humph, I have my own method of treatment, you all go out and let me treat Miss Gong alone. M. O. Yang's heart was itchy. He thought of Gong Lianyi's charming face just now and he couldn't bear to want to cure with her alone. Li, Li Yun. Gong King Yu couldn't bear to see Aunt Fang in such pain, and looked at Li Yun as if asking for help. Senior Gong was infected with a kind of goo poison called Yin and Yang two corpses. Li Yun sighed, and took out a medium-sized detoxification pill from his pocket, and explained, the principle of this kind of poison attack is actually caused by two insects, one is Yin and the other is Yang, and the two go hand in hand. Being one with each other, and only when two goo worms are active at the same time, the person who has been dropped will feel unbearable pain. Everyone was shocked by Li Yun's words. Are there really goo worms? Old Huang opened his mouth, wanting to say that goo worms are all deceptive, but Gong Lianyi's expression now destroys his previous ideas. Yin and Yang two corpses, Xi Yin, Xi Yang. Gong King Yu murmured to himself, and a flash of lightning flashed across his mind, I understand, it's no wonder that Aunt Lian's illness came on time at 7 o'clock in the evening, so it was. In the evening, 
in ancient times, when the yin and yang of heaven and earth meet, demons will appear in the day and night. The Sakura Kingdom has another name for this, the moment of magic. The scientific explanation is that in the evening, the heat absorbed by the ground during the day will be dissipated, and the fall of night will cause the air temperature to drop. So seven o'clock in the evening is a special period of hot and shady. It just corresponds to what Li Yun called the two corpses of yin and yang. Senior Gong, take this pill. Li Yun fed the medium-sized detoxification pill to Gong Lianyi, but he still couldn't bear it, unable to watch a beautiful imperial sister with a painful and intolerable expression. Even though Gong Lianyi suffered pain and treated her again, it would greatly enhance her favorability. However, Li Yun was soft-hearted, and finally gave up this method of gaining favorability. Well, Gong Lian was unable to resist, and obediently opened her mouth to take the pill that Li Yun had fed her. The soft flap touched Li Yun's finger, making his heart itchy. Such a charming beauty, if she is willing to serve him gently and well, what a wonderful thing, cough cough, too evil. Evil, sin. After taking the pill, Gong Lianyi's expression eased, and King Yu turned from sorrow to joy, and her beautiful big eyes looked at Li Yun shiningly. It should be okay. Li Yun nodded. Suddenly, Gong King Yu's heart fell to the ground with a big rock, and she was excited. She believes in Li Yun and believes that people she likes will not lie to her. Everyone on the sidelines was stunned. Li Yun actually gave Gong Lianyi a pill to restore her health? Really? Maybe it's not good, it's just pain relief. But Gong Lianyi lying in Li Yun's arms, her willow eyebrows are becoming more and more unfolded, and the catkin that she holds Li Yun's hand also gradually loosens, turning into caressing Li Yun's chest, and she collapses. In his arms, closed his eyes and sniffed Li Yun's breath. After the severe pain, this man's breath made Gong Lianyi feel particularly relieved, because it was Li Yun who cured her, and this charming and graceful Yuja couldn't help but develop a deep attachment to him. This kid. After recovering, M. O. Yang gritted his teeth with hatred. He followed the instructions of a big man to come here to see Gong Lianyi, but he didn't expect to be cut off halfway. He couldn't complete the task and he didn't know how to be scolded by that big man after he returned. Humph. M. O. Yang said in a weird manner, Boy, if you say it is cured, you will be cured? What if it is not cured and you get sick again the next day? What if the condition worsens? If there is something wrong with Senior Gong, can you afford it? With that, he glanced at Gong Lianyi greedily again. This fox beauty was sweating. Although she could not see more spring sunshine in a thick dress, Gong Lianyi's face was flushed at the moment, and her delicate and feminine posture was to everyone present. Everyone has a strong attraction. Li Yun is much more reliable than someone of unknown origin like you. Gong Qingyu glared at him, and ordered the maid to bring a towel and wipe the sweat from Aunt Lian's face. During this process, Gong Lianyi kept closing her eyes and panting slightly, leaning against Li Yunkai softly to relieve the pain just now. However, it is not clear whether Gong Lian's greed for Li Yun's safe embrace caused her reluctance to rise. Li Yun glanced at M. O. Yang faintly, and said, You said before that you can cure Senior Gong without touching Senior Gong's body and without taking any drugs, right? M. O. Yang was taken aback, his expression unnatural and said, Yes, that's it. According to the method given by the big man, there is indeed no need to touch Gong Lianyi's body. This should be the big man in order to gain the trust of the palace family. The corner of Li Yun's mouth twitched, King Yu, I have already stated the characteristics of the yin and yang two corpses, now you should know how to deal with this kind of poison, right? Hearing these words, Huang Lao immediately used his brain to think hard. As a doctor, he didn't know and couldn't cure the patient's poison, which made him very ashamed. I understand. Elder Huang thought of it first, and he said excitedly, since this kind of goo poison must exist with one yin and one yang, then you only need to fight the poison with poison, put Miss Gong in a hot or cold environment, and kill one of the worms. 
one will inevitably die. Everyone thought about it carefully, and it was really so. Yes, being in a hot or cold environment is an ordinary way to relieve the yin and yang corpses. Li Yun smiled slightly. Then the pill you gave me. Gong Lianyi in his arms opened a pair of beautiful eyes and looked up at Li Yun, with a complex look in her eyes. This is detoxification pill, which can cure you directly. Li Yun was a little ashamed, sorry, Senior Gong, I should directly give you a detoxification pill. Do not. Gong Lianyi blocked Li Yun's mouth with her soft little hand, and said in a soft voice, I know this kind of pill that can cure poison is precious. It should be me who should say sorry. I will endure it. Just one point. She was not unaware just now, she could clearly feel everything Li Yun had done for her. The faces of everyone were weird. At this moment, Gong Lian was leaning on Li Yun's arms, covering Li Yun's mouth with one hand, the expressions and movements of the two were indescribable. Gong King Ye bit her lower lip. Aunt Lian hates men, but now. Li Yun recovered, and quickly handed Gong Lian Ye to King Yu. At the moment Gong Lian Ye left, his eyes flashed a pity, this mature Yu Ji had a very good figure and was very comfortable to hold. By the way, why didn't the system reward him yet? He also wants to see how much Gong Lian Ye's favor ability is now. This still hugs the left and the right. M. Ol Yang's eyes were red. Just now, the kid Li Yun held the big beauty for so long, he must secretly start up and down, and give that beauty again, right? No, you can't let this kid continue to be proud, otherwise he will not be able to complete the task, maybe he will see this kid flying with three beautiful women tonight. M. Ol Yang rolled his eyes and sneered, do you really believe it? Everyone looked at him in surprise. M. Ol Yang was proud of his heart and sneered, after all, what kind of yin and yang corpses are made up, goo worms? Hey, it's a good idea, maybe you are for this one. The big beauty took the drunk medicine, so that she could not feel the pain. Sorry, I'm indeed better now. Gong Lian Yi slapped her face directly. M. Ol Yang's expression froze, and then he said stiffly, it's also possible that your illness has passed and it just fits this kid's bragging. Anyway, if you can't see goo worms, I have reason to suspect that your kid is making up. Many people agreed with M. Ol Yang's words, and Yu Wenzhong didn't want to see Li Yun but Gong Lian Yi, and said directly, M. Ol Yang, what you said makes sense, I think Mr. Huang, you still give it to Senior Gong. Before he finished speaking, Gong Lian Yi's expression suddenly changed, and once again he tightly grasped Li Yun's wrist standing in front of her, Li Yun, I, very uncomfortable. What? Everyone was shocked, could it be that they were ill again? M. Ol Yang was overjoyed, and continued mockingly, you see it? You still have to rely on me to get out of the way. Li Yun frowned, what happened? Is the medium detoxification pill not enough? Gong Lian Yi ignored him. Her current feeling was completely different from the previous situation where she had a splitting headache. She only felt that something was crawling in her scalp. The next moment, she couldn't help but open her mouth and let out a wow. A spit of black blood came out from the ground. Squeak! Accompanied by the screaming worms, everyone was shocked to see that in the blood that Gong Lian Yi vomited, there were two weird little worms the size of a grain of rice. This little bug is black and white, and sings and sings together, like a cricket courting in the wild, but the sound is much more eerie and eerie. Yin and Yang two corpses. In an instant, such a thought came across everyone's mind. The matter is really as Li Yun said, Gong Lian Yi had a headache because of the goo worm. It turned out that these two worms got into the human body. Squeak. The two Yin and Yang worms one black and one white, screamed quickly again, seeming to call the owner to take them back, but after no response, the two worms ran wildly towards the corner of the room. King Yu, kill them. Li Yun screamed, Gong King Yu recovered, and decisively stretched out his right hand, bringing her index finger and together, and poking fiercely in the direction of the insect. 
With a sound of qi, a sharp and unmatched white sword gas shot out from Gong King Yu's white and tender fingers, passing a few meters in an instant, and accurately hit the two Gu worms. They ran side by side and were killed by a sword aura at the same time. It is worthy of being the two corpses of Yin and Yang. As for why Li Yun didn't consciously use his hands, firstly, the acquired true energy couldn't get too far away from the body, and secondly, because Gong Lianyi was holding her tightly now, and her body kept trembling. Li Yun Gong Qingyu looked at Li Yun nervously, and Li Yun nodded, indicating that the bug was dead. Because the rewards of the system are coming. Ding, the host made a special choice, and the rewards were changed, justice value plus 100, Gong Lianyi favorability degree plus 70, experience value plus 100,000, blue gift bag asterisk 2. Additional bonus Gong Lianyi favorability degree plus 11. The justice value of the reward decreased, but Gong Lianyi's favorability reached a delicate number. 81 points, just above friends, can be used as the limit of girlfriends. Gong Lianyi has a good impression of him, but since King Yu is already with Li Yun, she will definitely not express her inner feelings. However, as long as Li Yun continues to improve his favorability, Gong Lianyi is likely to be desperate. This is the two corpses of Yin and Yang. Gong Lianyi was still leaning against Li Yun. After seeing the killed insects clearly, Jiao's body couldn't help shaking, Hu Mei's face became pale, adding a bit of a sickly beauty to her. Thinking that the worm had once stayed in her brain, and might even burrow in the flesh, Gong Lianyi couldn't help but retching. She will probably be sick for a long time. Never mind. Li Yun gently patted her on the back, then took out a pill from the inventory and handed it to her, smiling, Senior Gong, hold this pill, it will restore you completely after eating it. Clear all the debris from your body, and your body will look completely new, with absolutely no trace of dirt. Li Yun's words were very sweet, but Gong Lianyi was very moved in her heart. He took out such a precious pill to regulate her body because she didn't have a psychological burden? Li Yun, is this too expensive? No, you can rest assured to eat. In fact, this time Li Yun gave her a skincare and beauty pill. This pill can indeed remove toxins from the body and make the skin smooth and white, as tight and tender as a girl's skin. Yet, yeah. Gong Lian agreed softly, closing her palms and tightly holding the pill in her palm. Li Yun, you. Gong Lianyi lowered her head shyly, you, call me Lianyi from now on. No, just call me Sister Lian. Lianyi is too close. Okay, Sister Lian. Li Yun smiled slightly, naturally understanding Gong Lian's inner thoughts at the moment. Well, Li Yun. Gong Lianyi was full of tenderness and honey in her heart, raised her head and took a deep look at Li Yun, but quickly bowed her head in loss. She thought of an ancient poem she had read. I am born before the king, the king is born and I am old, and I hate to be born at the same time. At that time, when she read this ancient poem, she simply felt that the artistic conception was very beautiful, but now she read it, but she has a depressing power. Old Huang stared fiercely at the two corpses of Gu Worms, Mr. Li, is the corpse of this goo-worm poisonous? If you don't want it, I'll take it and study it carefully. This is a genuine goo-worm corpse. It is impossible for Huang Lao not to be greedy. He feels that even this will be his biggest gain in the past ten years. He can study the habits and coping methods of goo-worms. Then he will write a goo to teach others how to deal with goo-worms. Maybe this book is written and his Huang Tianxi's name will be known forever. Li Yun smiled slightly, I just happen to know if this Gu Worm is poisonous, so I have to ask another person. Hey, everyone looked at M. Yang who had slipped to the door. The latter was startled and ran away. Where to escape? Yu Wenzhong gave a stern scream, flashed over and easily captured M. Yang, severely shaved his big ears, beat M. Yang's nose and face swollen, groaning in his mouth, and never dared to resist. If your kid escapes again, I will break your hands and feet and see how you escape. 
Yu Wenzhong threatened, and turned his head with a smile to invite Gong Qingyu, but was surprised to find that Gong Qingyu and the others were all around Li Yun and praised. Li Yun, you are so amazing, I guessed it. King Yu, since Li Yun entered the door, he has already taken this matter into his heart, right? Gong Lian smiled, speaking of which, King Yu, you haven't introduced Li Yun to me yet. He he, I'm about to introduce him, he is my favorite, friend. Gong King Yu's face blushed. The two have a good relationship, fried chicken is good, and even eats the same steamed bun, but they are really not boyfriend and girlfriend. Little brother Li is very knowledgeable, and his understanding of goo poison is unmatched in the entire arena, and he can be called a generation of masters. With a very respectful tone, Huang Lao vigorously slapped Li Yun's rainbow fart, fancy flattery. His attempt was self-evident, he wanted to know more information about goo insects from Li Yun's mouth. It's a pity that Li Yun got the information about the two corpses of Yin and Yang from concubine Wan Qing. It is absolutely impossible for Li Yun to go to concubine Wan Qing to inquire about more goo worm information for a small matter. Seeing all this, Yu Wenchen's entire face was darkened, and his killing intent towards Li Yun became more intense. Huang Lao used rigorous methods to put the goo worm's body into a glass bottle. The maid cleaned the ground. Gong Lian Yi also left temporarily and took a shower under the help of the maid. She ate the skincare and beauty pill given by Li Yun and no longer felt nauseous in her body, but she still needed to clean her body carefully to clear the nausea. Li Yun watched Yu Wenzhong interrogate M. Ol Yang, the process need not be elaborated, Yu Wenchen's methods were quite rude. With M. Ol Yang's greedy and astringent character, they were all recruited within a few seconds. Ding, the host made a choice, exposed M. Ol Yang's conspiracy, investigated his origin, rewarded experience value plus 500,000, all attributes plus 1,000, medium detoxification pill asterisk 3. Li Yun showed a satisfied smile. The detoxification pill is really useful. With it, those unpredictable, weird and insidious goo worms are just a little chicken in front of him, which is not worth mentioning. After M. Ol Yang confessed, he was ordered by Gong King Yu to be imprisoned in the basement of the mansion. The entrance was two big iron doors, even if the innate realm master wanted to come out, it would take a lot of effort. After M. Ol Yang was life or death, Li Yun was too lazy to pay attention. He was in the same slaughter with the poisonous person, which was tantamount to sentence of death to him. After Gong Lian Yi took a shower, she sat in front of the dressing table and asked the maid to lift her hair high, revealing her graceful white swan neck. Afterwards, Gong Lian Yi did it herself, carefully stroked her eyebrows, and applied a light-toned rouge on her red lips making her already attractive double fringe more and more full of charm. Willow leaf eyebrows, light-colored lips, blue silk curled up, a white skirt, a fox look, but a gentle and gentle lady temperament. Anyone who sees it can't help but praise her, she is a beautiful lady who is curvy and graceful. Miss. The maid who had followed Gong Lian Yi for more than ten years was extremely surprised. She has been with the young lady for so many years. This is the first time that she saw Gong Lian Yi putting on makeup and rouge at night. Is she trying to make herself more beautiful and attract someone? The maid sighed secretly in her heart. The young lady actually looks very seductive, but she is unwilling to expose her seductiveness to others. She has always been dressed strictly and solidly, suppressing her seductive look with graceful femininity. But now, the young lady took the initiative to reveal her seductive side a little for whom the maid had guessed. The maid had already imagined how amazing the men would be when the lady was dressed up. Sure enough, the maid was right. Gong Lian Yi came to the restaurant at the pace of a lady, smiled at everyone, and apologized when he said that he was late. Everyone opened their eyes and looked at the peerless beauty in shock. The eyebrows are picturesque and the heart is blue, but there is a trace of charm to all living beings which firmly attracts people's eyes and cannot extricate themselves. Okay, so beautiful. Yu Wenzhong couldn't hide it anymore, and directly showed a dementia expression, 
but everyone did not laugh at him, because Gong Lianyi in front of him was really beautiful. Even Gong Qingyu couldn't help standing up, stepping forward and holding her hand, and sighed in surprise, Auntie Lian, no, Sister Lian, it turns out that you would be so beautiful if you change your outfit, hee <laughs> hee, before I calling you Aunt Lian is really wrong. You girl. Gong Lianyi nodded her forehead strangely, but secretly looked at Li Yun. After seeing his eyes express appreciation, Gong Lianyi was relieved. Fortunately, she is not very old, she is only 31, and many older women in modern times are still unmarried. Moreover, her appearance can attract Li Yun, which makes Gong Lianyi happy for her fox appearance for the first time. I have kept everyone waiting, sorry. Gong Lianyi sat beside Li Yun, who happened to be accompanied by King Yu on either side of Li Yun. It's been a bit longer, but we all ate a little fruit. Li Yun joked, Gong Lian covered her mouth and smiled softly, a lot has happened today. Thank you for your hard work. She was talking about you, but everyone understood that she was talking to Li Yun. It's okay, let's eat. On the contrary, Li Yun looked like a master. Gong Lianyi held up the rice bowl. Sure enough, there was no nausea in her heart, nor was she unable to eat because of the two goo worms. She knew in her heart that it was because Li Yun gave her a pill, which relieved her mental obstacles. What Li Yun gave must have eliminated all the toxins in her body. Gong Lianyi felt that her skin was much hydrated and smooth, and there must be no dirt left in her body. Therefore, she had no psychological barriers to eat this meal. Li Yun, thank you. Inwardly, Gong Lianyi said to him affectionately. Although Li Yun couldn't hear her voice. After a meal, Yu Wen's hung felt nothing. He looked at Gong Lianyi almost the whole time, and the evil fire in his heart couldn't dissipate. Gong King Yu is also very beautiful, classical, and dignified, with a cold temperament, just like lotus on a snow-capped mountain. But compared with her elder Gong Lianyi, Gong King Yu is undoubtedly too immature. Maybe a few years later, when Gong King Yu grows open, her beauty will be comparable to Gong Lianyi. But now, there is no doubt that Gong Lianyi won. With a frown and a smile, every move is seductive and charming, yet reserved and graceful, as graceful as a lady. The perfect fusion of charm and jiajia, this kind of contrast can be fatal. After eating, seeing Gong Lianyi's demeanor a bit bad, Huang Lao said wittily, Miss Gong will take a short break tonight. I will stay here for a few days and wait until your condition stabilizes. Trouble Senior Huang. No, no, it's not troublesome at all, besides, I want to ask more about Li Xiaohu too. Huang Lao Fuxu laughed. Gong Lianyi said, Senior Huang, I want to talk to Li Yun about my condition tonight, I don't know. Uh. Huang Lao's jaw dropped, the two chatted together at night. One man and one woman? King Yu, come with you too. Gong Lianyi said again. Mr. Huang wiped his sweat. It turned out that he wanted to be awkward. When the three of them were together, nothing would happen. Li Yun nodded and said goodbye to Mr. Huang, and followed Gong Lianyi, the three of them left the restaurant. Yu Wenchen's face was so gloomy that he could drip water, his eyes flashed with resentment, and he seemed to be thinking of some conspiracy. Li Yun didn't have the gujing in his heart. If Gong Lianyi invited him alone, he might be a little excited, but with Gong Qingyu, there would be no excitement. He couldn't flicker with Gong Lian in front of Qingyu. Li Yun likes several girls at the same time, but he still doesn't want to do this. The three of them came to Gong Lianyi's room again, opened the door and went in. The room was cleaned up, and the incense was lit in the living room to dispel all the bad luck. Li Yun, come with me. Just when Li Yun wanted to sit down, Gong Lianyi invited him into it, and Li Yun looked at her in surprise. Isn't Gong Lianyi's boudoir inside? Gong Qingyu looked at Aunt Lian with a weird expression, and found a blush on her face. Obviously, Aunt Lian did not resist Li Yun's entry into her small study. Let's go, go in together. 
Gong Qingye was in a complicated mood, but actively pushed Li Yun and signaled him to go in. Li Yun shrugged and walked into Gong Lianyi's boudoir, almost certain that he must be the first man to enter here. Gong Lianyi lowered her head shyly, and pushed open the concealed doorway of her bedroom. In an instant, Li Yun standing at the door smelled a lavender-like fragrance, which was very comfortable. When I walked in, it turned out that there was a small living room, or a small study room. The room is divided into two parts, inside and outside, with a large bookcase in the middle. Li Yun vaguely saw the beautiful light blue mosquito net inside, which should be Gong Lianyi's bed. It must be more fragrant there. In the small study outside, there are many books on the bookshelves. At a glance, at a glance, ancient and modern Chinese and foreign books are piled up in a mess, but they don't look messy. Near the balcony, there are soft sofas and tables for meeting guests. There are some books on them. There are only two teacups. It is estimated that they usually come here. Fortunately, there are sofas. Sit down, sit down. Gong Lian asked Li Yun to sit down softly. For some reason, King Yi was clearly standing by, but she felt very nervous and her voice was full of panic. Li Yun broke into here, just like breaking into her heart. Ah, no teacup, I'll get one. After Li Yun sat down, Gong Lian Yi discovered the problem and hurriedly tried to get the cup, but Gong King Yi grabbed her. Auntie Lian, I'll go get it. You guys talk first. Before Gong King Yi left, he gave Li Yun an unclear look, as if he was saying something, but Li Yun really couldn't understand it. Sister Lian, sit down too. A faint smile appeared at the corner of Li Yun's mouth. After King Yi left, Gong Lian Yi became more and more disturbed, like a shy little girl, almost pinching the corner of her clothes in a shy manner. But think about it. Perhaps Gong Lianyi had never chatted with a man so intimately in the previous 30 years of her life, and it was normal to be nervous. In particular, she still has a good impression of Li Yun. In front of the people she likes, everyone is nervous. Okay. Gong Lianyi's voice was very soft, and Li Yun couldn't help it. In order to relieve her anxiety, he deliberately didn't go to see her, but picked up a book with a light yellow cover on the table. Human Words and Words? Wang Kuoyi's book, Sister Lian, Do You Like Poetry? Do you like it too? Gong Lianyi looked up at him in surprise. Human Words and Words is very famous, but not many people have seen it. Li Yun knew that the author of this book had surprised Gong Lianyi. Have seen some. Li Yun smiled and nodded. In fact, he hasn't seen it before, but he has a system. Half a month ago, Li Yun acquired master-level poetry and singing skills, which contained the content of human words and words. Coincidentally, the system prompt came. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose from the host. Option 1, discuss poems with Gong Lianyi, write poems on the spot, and conquer her. Reward Gong Lian with a certain degree of favorability, a certain amount of experience, and a blue gift bag asterisk 2. Option 2, do nothing, reward skill, straight man of steel. Option 3, go directly to kiss Gong Lianyi, kiss her so drunk and bewildered, reward skill, domineering president, Gong Lian according to the degree of favorability plus or minus 10. Li Yun Mantu Black Line, what the is this option 3? Kissing Gong Lianyi directly, will her favorability continue to increase? or will it decrease so as to dislike Li Yun? This is a problem. It is estimated that the decision is up to Li Yun's kissing skills. Why are you so proficient? JPG Li Yun gave a chuckle, opened a certain page of the book, and said, Wang Kuoyi advocates three realms of reading and doing great things in the book. Which one do you think you are in, Lian Yi? Me. Gong Lian was extremely relaxed physically and mentally, and a slight smile appeared at the corner of her mouth, and said mischievously, I should be my clothes are getting whiter and I won't regret it, and I will be haggard for Iraq, this state. How about you? Her tone rose, obviously, 
Gong Lianyi was in a good mood now. One of the three realms of reading that Wang Kuoyi I admired was, the west wind withered the green trees last night, and he went up to the tall buildings alone, looking all over the world. The second is what Gong Lianyi said. Third. Li Yun smiled slightly and looked at Gong Lianyi's eyes and said, My name is, I am looking for him a thousand times in the crowd, and suddenly looking back, but that person is in a dimly lit place. How do you think I'm too arrogant? Gong Lianyi was stunned for a moment, then a shy flush appeared on her cheeks, and she lowered her head not to look at Li Yun again. The meaning of these three realms is very simple. It means that people want to achieve their careers, and they need to experience the three realms of imitation of pursuit of goals, persistent struggle, and natural success. Gong Lianyi means that he is in a period of struggle, working hard to achieve his goals. Li Yun is much more overbearing. He directly said that he would succeed if he wanted to succeed. He no longer needed to find a goal, let alone work hard. To him, success is a gadget at his fingertips. But this sentence, the crowd looked for him thousands of times, and suddenly looked back, but the man was in the dim light. But it has another meaning. It is also a very dark meaning. So Gong Lianyi immediately made a big blush. This graceful lady thought that Li Yun was confessing to her in disguise by discussing poetry. Li Yun smiled lightly, not abruptly beautiful, but stood up and walked to the balcony, Lian Yi, let me write you a poem. Oh! Gong Lian Yi stood up, took the lead, and docilely opened the floor-to-ceiling windows leading to the balcony for Li Yun, and stood side by side with him on the balcony. What kind of poem? Gong Lian Yi Mimu smiled looking forward to the poem written by Li Yun. Write a poem, about the Lantern Festival. Li Yun looked at the brilliant night view of the Yellow River in the distance, and had an idea in his mind. Although it is not the Lantern Festival, the bright lights look no different from the brilliant lanterns on the Lantern Festival, and the artistic conception barely makes sense. Yu and Xiao. Gong Lian Yi nodded slightly. This is a lively festival, but unfortunately most of the time, she spends it alone. Not alone, but lonely in heart. Last year at Yuan Ye, the flower market lights up like daylight. Gong Lian Yime's eyes lit up. The simple words and verses combined made them very graceful. The sentence lights as day, vividly portrayed the brilliant lights of the Lantern Festival night, which is truly wonderful. On the moon, willow heads, people will meet after dusk. After reading this poem, Li Yun glanced back at Gong Lianyi, the two eyes met, and there were inexplicable emotions entwined with each other. Infected by this very emotional verse, Gong Lianyi's heart trembled and her eyes gradually blurred. In the distance is the bustling and lively night view of the Huangjong River, with a beautiful full moon in the sky, and in front of her is a man who has a good impression of her, who is saying confession to her. Isn't it just depicting the sweet love between a man and a woman? When Li Yunyin wrote this verse, Gong Lianyi had an impulse in her heart, as if she felt that falling in love seemed to be excellent, provided that she was with someone she liked. For example, the handsome and literary man in front of you. The eyes of the two softened, their heads approached each other, Gong Lianyi stared at Li Yun, her eyes trembled, and finally closed slowly waiting for that moment to come. She cherished the emotions that she had kept for thirty years and was about to hand it over to Li Yun at this moment, but Gong Lianyi did not regret it. Ah, I'm back. A crisp girl's voice broke the lips of the two who were about to approach. Gong Lianyi seemed to feel the breath from Li Yun's mouth hit her double flanks, but the next moment, the two immediately separated, Gong Lianyi's his cheeks blushed instantly just wanting to find a hole to drill down. Li Yun looked a little embarrassed, turned his head and said to the classical girl who happened to appear, King Yu, are you back? Humph! Gong King Yu let out a proud snort that was insignificant. Ding, the host has made a choice, and the rewards have been distributed. After Gong King Yu came back, the previous selection event had ended. It's just that the system gave Li Yun a little surprised. Gong Lianyi's favorability for him is another subtle number, 89. 
it was almost 90. After reaching 90, Li Yun's relationship with her is equivalent to saying that she can do some intimate things, such as kissing, holding hands, rubbing the head, holding the waist, etc. Even more deeply, Gong Lianyi will not be disgusted. Unfortunately, it seems that it was because Gong Lianyi had concerns in her heart, or Li Yun didn't kiss her, causing Gong Lianyi's inner restraint and gaining the upper hand, and she did not dare to do anything with Li Yun. Currently, among all Li Yun girls who have a good impression of him, only one is below 70. That is the Vatican sage who has never met him. He has a good impression of 65, which is slightly higher than ordinary people. It is equivalent to saying that he can be a friend, but if you want to be a girlfriend, you can't even think about it. What are you doing on the balcony? Gong King Yu put the teacup on the table, staring at Li Yun tightly, but turned a blind eye to Aunt Lian's shy and feminine expression. Just as Gong Lian Yi's spring heart is sprouting, everyone can see the problem, but Gong King Yu just didn't go to see her, instead chasing Li Yun to ask. Ding, trigger the crisis option event, please choose from the host. Choice 1, go left and right, don't answer Gong King Yu's question, reward skill, scumbag. Option 2, be lenient in confession, strict in resistance, and no reward. If the host does not answer well, Gong King Yu may have a lower favorability towards the host. Option 3, go forward and kiss Gong King Yu forcibly, so that she won't ask about it anymore, reward skill, domineering president upgraded version. Option 4, spring. The night is short and the day is high. From then on, the king will not come early. I want them all. Reward skills, the ultimate version of the overbearing president, the host has a chance to be hacked to death by Gong King Yu and Gong Lian Yi. Li Yun swallowed hard. The system gave him four choices for the first time, and it was the first time that he didn't give him any rewards. They were all spoof skills. Seeing Gong King Yu's scrutinizing eyes, Li Yun seemed to understand that the situation in front of him could not help him not choose, no matter which one he chose, it would lead to different results. Muddle through? Frank? Strong kiss? Or do I want them all? Li Yun's mind turned wildly, and he encountered an unprecedented crisis. Sure enough, opening the harem would definitely encounter this problem and Li Yun wanted to cry without tears. The harem is not so easy to open. If you are not careful, you will catch fire in the backyard like it is now. Not to mention the system rewards or the welfare of your girlfriend, you will lose your life. Ching, King Yu. What surprised Li Yun was that Gong Lian Yi was the shyest person who spoke first. She looked sad and ashamed, and said, It's me. Auntie Lian. Lian Yi. Gong King Yu and Li Yun spoke at the same time, and Gong King Yu took a few steps forward and held Gong Lian Yi's hand, as if she didn't want her to speak first. The reason why Li Yun spoke was simple. He woke up immediately after seeing Gong Lian Yi's ashamed expression. Damn, what about his big man now, his mother in law, isn't he just behaving more closely with Gong Lian Yi? Ask a woman to stop the gun for him to defend him. Li Yun can't do it. King Yu. Li Yun said to Gong King Yu, who was holding Gong Lian Yi's hand, Lian Yi and I were discussing poetry, and then we went outside to see the night view of the Huangjong River. A smile appeared on Gong King Yu's beautiful face, and her little hand gently squeezed Gong Lian Yi's palm, motioning her not to speak for the time being. And then. The tone was soft but dangerous, which made Li Yun's heart be alarmed. Then, Li Yun said bitingly, I looked at the night view of the Huangjong River, and my poems became popular, so I made a poem for Lian Yi. And then, Gong King Yu paused, but the problem was still the same. Li Yun couldn't help but smile. It seemed that he couldn't help it. King Yu, Li Yun. Gong Lian regrets it very much. She couldn't suppress her inner emotions before and did something beyond friendship with Li Yun. Moreover, it was still in her younger generation, in front of her goddaughter and sister King Yu, being caught by King Yu, 
which made Gong Lian Yi extremely ashamed. Anti Lian, don't talk, let this guy answer. Gong King Yu's words smelled of anger, but Li Yun secretly breathed a sigh of relief. Lian Yi, ah no, Sister Lian. Li Yun said apologetically to her, Sorry, I was not good just now. I shouldn't use that kind of love poems to seduce you. I was wrong, I apologize to you. The scene suddenly quieted down, and Li Yun's words in disguised acknowledgement of the ambiguity just now. Me. Gong Lian Yi had tears in her eyes, she really didn't know whether to be happy or sad. Li Yun took all the sins over, but this sentence also means that the two will be impossible in the future. Humph! Gong King Ye was sour in her heart. She had long seen that there was something wrong with the two of them, and deliberately left them a little space to get along with each other, wanting to see if it was true. Unexpectedly, she just returned with a teacup, Aunt Lian and Li Yun. Moreover, Li Yun also called Lian Yi Lian Yi, this guy is really a flower, a pervert, a pervert. However, a big rock in Gong King Yu's heart fell to the ground. At least Li Yun did not deceive her, this is the most important thing. Auntie Lian, let's go back and ignore this big pervert. Gong King Yu took Aunt Lian's hand back to the small study room with gusto. Gong Lian Yi glanced at Li Yun with a complicated look, then entered the small study room, leaving Li Yun alone on the balcony. Ding, the host makes a choice, Gong Lian Yi's favorability degree is plus three, Gong King Yu's favorability degree is dash one. A big stone in Li Yun's heart also fell. Although Gong King Yu is the only girl who has a favorable impression score above 90, she should only be jealous, not below 90 let alone strangers. To the point. This means that Gong King Yu has forgiven him and is willing to accept the fact that Li Yun has several girlfriends. Gong Lian Yi's favorability reached 92, which means that Li Yun can treat her. Keek, can't think about it. Li Yun smiled lightly, and then entered the small study the French windows on the balcony were not closed, it seemed that Gong King Yu had left him specially. The three were seated and the atmosphere was a bit weird. Gong King Yu's expression of I am very angry and need someone to coax me, but I don't want you to coax me. Gong Lian Yi's mood is a little depressed, even the charming rouge on the double fringe seems to be dull. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose from the host. Option 1, coax Gong King Yu and reward Gong King Yu with plus 1. Option 2, comfort Gong Lian Yi and reward Gong Lian Yi with plus 1. Choice 3, I want it all, reward skill, wing 3 I fly. Li Yun wanted to cry without tears, this Nima Tuajuo is another life-threatening choice event. And many more. Looking at the prompt, Li Yun started to think. What Gong King Yu needs is to coax her girlfriend to make her happy, which means that Gong King Yu is actually not very angry, but jealous. Gong Lian Yi needs comfort similar to the caring and condolences between good friends. This subtle gap made Li Yun quickly think of a good idea. King Yu. Li Yun smiled, trying to make himself more handsome, I will give you a cup of tea, what would you like to drink? Gong King Yu's expression eased a lot, but he still said in a huff, do you know how to make tea? Don't make a cup of rotten tea just to show my courtesy, I won't drink it. He said no to drink but his eyes kept watching Li Yun's movements. King Yu, you are so cute. Don't worry. Li Yun packed up the tickets, patted his chest and said, My tea art skills are advanced, so making a good cup of tea is definitely not a problem. Advanced tea art technology? What level is this? Is it the highest? Li Yun smiled without saying a word, he began to be grateful for the messy skills he had acquired before. When he first gained proficiency in advanced tea art, Li Yun secretly scolded these skills for cheating, and he was not interested in making tea slowly. Now, it smells so good. Also, let me come. Gong Lian Yi felt that it was not good for guests to do these things, and she also felt in her heart that Li Yun, as a big man, was a little bad for serving the two women. 
Although she was in contact with modern society and controlled the Gong family's business in Zhonghai City, she grew up in the Gong family's old house and was heavily influenced by those traditional concepts. Li Yun waved his hand, No, Lianyi, sit down, I'll be fine. Gong Lianyi's heart trembled, Li Yun, also called her Lianyi. Gong Qingyu had a panoramic view of everything, and his mood became more complicated. It was unexpected that after Li Yun held Aunt Lian for treatment, he actually made Aunt Lian feel good about him in one night. No, it should be said that it is deeply rooted in love. Gong Qingyu had long known that Aunt Lian hated men and didn't want to get married in her life, and she refused the family's arrangement for her to have a blind date. Li Yun was probably the first and last man who could walk into Aunt Lian's heart. Gong Qingyu looked at Gong Lianyi who accompanied and took care of her when she grew up. Aunt Lian has always been very assertive, perhaps because of her illness in the past few days, her heart has become vulnerable. And Li Yun appeared at this time, and immediately captured Gong Lianyi's heart, giving her support. Two beauties, please have tea. While Gong Qingyu was thinking about it, Li Yun made two cups of tea and brought them to them in person. Thank you. Gong Lianyi's voice was very small, and a charming red cloud appeared on her face. Under the blessing of Hu Mei's appearance, this charm made Gong Qingyu a little lost. No wonder Li Yun could not resist. Forget it. Gong Qingyu held up the teacup. The tea was delicious. Together with Aunt Lian, the two drank also. That's all, let this bad guy be proud. Gong Qingyu glared at Li Yun. Two beauties serving a husband, and the two golden flowers of the Gong family were picked by him. This villain must have his mouth cracked with laughter. But Gong Qingyu didn't give him so much pride. She decided to discuss with Gong Lianyi, not telling the bad guy their decision first, making him anxious. He could only look at the two beauties with greedy eyes, but couldn't eat his mouth. Here, mad at him. Gong Qingyu also decided that before Aunt Lian agreed, she would not agree to be Li Yun's girlfriend, so she died in a hurry. Fancying Li Yun's anxious and angry picture, Gong Qingyu's beautiful face couldn't help showing a bright smile. Take it as punishment for this bad guy. Li Yun is inexplicable, why is Qingyu angry and smiling? Ding, the host makes a choice, rewards Gong Qingyu with plus one, Gong Lian with plus one and acquires the skill, by Isani Fei. Li Yun slowly played a question mark in his mind, what happened? Making tea for the two girls was a small method he used to coax Gong King Yu. Originally, he had prepared a few hands, including giving Gong King Yu a comic plot and an intermediate jiden, as well as flattering that Gong King Yu is worthy of being a congenital powerhouse. A move of sword chi to kill the yin and yang two corpses and so on. Although shameless, the girlfriend is just for coaxing. Unexpectedly, he just made a cup of tea for the two women, so he coaxed Gong Qingyu and comforted Gong Lianyi. Has his charm reached such a shocking level? Li Yun was complacent, and even wanted to find more beautiful girlfriends to use his ability, but when he thought that he would have a headache when there were more harems, he immediately dispelled the idea. Girlfriends don't need too much. Being beautiful is a prerequisite, and special charm is also required. For example, those internet celebrities, being beautiful is beautiful, but it is not rare for him to take a look at Li Yun. The three of them drank tea and chatted, and the atmosphere soon improved, Gong Lianyi also showed a gentle smile again, as if she knew her decision from King Yu's attitude. After Gong King Yu deliberately or unconsciously talked about Li Yun's condition, Saying that he was bothered with Radish and had several girlfriends, Gong Lianyi bit her lip and glanced at Li Yun, but did not show an expression of disgusting him. Like Gong Qingyu, Gong Lianyi was actually very happy about Li Yun's behavior that he did not hide. Furthermore, Li Yun has several girlfriends, which means that he can accept her and King Yu at the same time. The only thing worth worrying about is that the palace family might disagree. No. It's not right. Gong Lianyi's face is hot, what is she thinking? Ming Mingke and Li Yung Gong met, thinking about these shameless things. In the future, 
if you have a relationship with Li Yun, she thinks everything will come naturally. It's too early. What do you think of Emily Yang? Seeing that they were in a good mood, Li Yun changed the subject and started talking about business. In fact, this is the reason why Gong Lianyi invited him to the small study, but the three of them delayed for a long time due to emotional matters. Myron Township, Hero Tomb, this sentence is not wrong at all. Emily Yang Gong Qingyu suppressed his laughter before, frowning and said, he said that he was instructed by a big man to come here, and he couldn't tell the origin of that big man even if he was killed. I'm afraid we need to investigate. Those who dare to hurt Aunt Lian must never let it go. She added. Gong Lianyi was touched in her heart. Despite Li Yun's factors, her relationship with King Yu has always been very good. Even if she wants to like the same man with her, Gong Lianyi is not willing to rob her. Li Yun nodded, I know who instigated Emo Liang. Who is it? Gong King Yu and the two girls were not surprised. Li Yun knew a lot about Gu Worms, and it was normal to know the inside story. Emo Yang came from Fi Human, right? Li Yun asked with a smile. That's it. Gong Lian Yi nodded gently and said softly, Emo Yang is not from Fi Human, but his father is the deacon of Fi Human. Could it be Li Yun that the person who came to harm me is the head of Fi Human or the elder? Gong King Yu's eyes revealed a bit of indifference. If it were, the Gong family would never let Fi Human go. Li Yun said, the current Fi Human is closely related to the Lai Demon Man. Are you trying to say that the Lai Demon Gate is behind the scenes? The Lai Demon Sect is one of the eight evils in the two schools, four schools, eight schools, and eight evils. It is quite powerful, only slightly worse than the palace family, but not much behind. Therefore, after Li Yun spoke of the Lai Demon Gate, the expressions of the two women became solemn. No. Li Yun shook his head. When they breathed a sigh of relief, they said a moment that shocked them, the Lai Demon Sect is only a controlled sect. What? Gong King Yu was surprised, the Lai Demon Gate is controlled by someone? How could it be? Gong Lian Yi was also very surprised. As one of the eight evils, the Lai Demon Sect, disciples of the sect behaved wildly, and there were traces of their activities in various cities in the country. Bars, nightclubs, casinos, martial arts halls, etc., disciples of Lai Momin control many grey money-making industries. In ancient times, the people of the rivers and lakes were either darts or stalkers. In modern times, these rivers and lakes have changed and become the bosses of the company. They also occupy many profitable industries by force. They are very rich. With such a powerful sect, Li Yun actually said that he was controlled by a certain force? If they hadn't known that Li Yun wouldn't talk about it, they would definitely not believe it. Gu Poison Li Yun's slender index finger tapped on the table to remind them specifically. The two women looked at each other, their expressions a little disturbed. Li Yun smiled. Do you think someone used goo poison to control the elder and head of the Lai Demon sect? Isn't it? Gong King Yu and the two women are more shocked, there is a deeper conspiracy behind this? Are you sure you want to know? Li Yun's face was serious, the secrets in this may completely defeat your understanding of the world, and may also put you in a crisis. There is a saying, the more you know, the faster you die. Gong King Yu gave him a white look, Aren't you there? You can't protect us. Of course. Li Yun looked at her softly, I will use my life to protect you. Gong King Yu became shy. The classical beauty originally wanted to act like a baby, but Li Yun didn't expect Li Yun to say such words that moved her. Do you also include me? Gong Lian looked at Li Yun fixedly, said this subconsciously, and immediately lowered her head shyly also including you. Li Yun smiled shamelessly, and said, Lian Yi, you are King Yu's elder and my, friend, of course I will protect you too. An acquired realm said to protect two beautiful geniuses from the innate realm. I don't know how many people would laugh off their teeth when I said this. 
but the two women are convinced. Ahem, let me tell you something, strange things I have encountered recently. It is good. Gong Lian replied softly, we will listen carefully, Li Yun, don't worry, the enemy has already attacked me, even if I don't mess with them, they will come to me for trouble, so it doesn't matter. Li Yun nodded. He had anticipated this situation a long time ago. Even if he didn't go to trouble with the six demon gates, he would definitely encounter these people in the future. Things start when I start my senior year. Gong Lian Yi was taken aback, then lowered her head shyly. Li Yun behaved very maturely, giving her the feeling that he was a man with a degree of conversation, and didn't realize that Li Yun was actually in the third year. So, it was her old cow who ate the tender grass. The spirit stick that Fi Human placed in Xiaoxi County, makes people insane, crazy? Oh my god! Zombies appeared in Jenny's province, a suture made up of dozens of human flesh and blood. Goo worms exist, and there are even people who have raised evil spirits and ghosts. Listening to Li Yun's narration, the hearts of the two women swayed, Sanguine was greatly shaken, and the familiar world seemed to suddenly become strange. The two are not the bottom people either. They came from a thousand-year-old wealthy family and know a lot of secrets. But I never knew that there really is something beyond common sense in the world. All of this is related to a mysterious sect of the Six Demon Gate. Li Yun emphasized once again, today, you'd better not disclose this matter, and don't take the initiative to provoke them. Even if you want revenge, you must do it extremely secretly. I suggest you not to take revenge. Let me solve them for you. The two women returned to their senses and looked at each other, and both of them could see the touch of emotion in each other's eyes. Li Yun Gong Lian Yi looked at him softly, I know you are for our good, and I can understand your approach. But... She bit her rouge lips and said softly, but I want to help you. Me too. Gong King Yu took the initiative to hold Li Yun's hand with a proud expression, Don't underestimate me, I am a congenital realm, and Aunt Lian is a congenital later stage, and they are better than you. I know, I know. Li Yun scratched her little nose and said with a smile, Well, let's take a long time to discuss this matter. Don't worry, I know who the person who knows Goo Worms is. He has nothing but Goo Worms. Awesome. Goo Worm. Gong Lian Yi was a little worried and glanced at Li Yun again. Knowing what she meant, Li Yun immediately took out a few small and one medium-sized detoxification pills from his pocket, don't worry. I'm still confident in dealing with goo worms. If you are poisoned, I will just... Li Yun explained to them the usage of these two kinds of detoxification pills, first use small ones, and then eat medium ones. The two women held these detoxification pills tightly, their eyebrows were full of touch. With these things, the people who manipulate the weird goo worms are no longer afraid. They are strong innate and there are a large number of bodyguards armed with guns in the mansion. Even if the consummate masters come to attack here, the two women can confidently make him come back. After Gong King Yu's excitement calmed down, he glanced at Li Yun's pocket curiously, Li Yun, why are there so many things in your pocket? Hmm, Shanren has a clever plan, you will understand later. Li Yun made a sloppy look. If the two women have 100 points for him, Li Yun would not mind telling the secret of the space ring. After all, the 100 points for him proves that they have completely fallen in love with him and can never change. Now, I can only say that the time has not come. Gong King Yu pouted, but didn't ask further. With the detoxification pills, there is nothing wrong with dealing with goo worms. Li Yun pondered. As for zombies, it is not a big problem. It is nothing more than a body that is as hard as iron and requires a lot of hands and feet. The two women breathed a sigh of relief again. Liggy is more troublesome. Uh. The hearts of Gong King Yu's two people raised their throats again. However, the speed of Li Gui is very slow. If you encounter it, you will run lightly and run away, asking me to deal with it. The two women nodded obediently 
facing these unknown things, they dare not hold big. Fortunately, there is Li Yun. Otherwise, let alone encountering female ghosts and zombies, they will not be able to pass the Guworm level, and they can only be abused humiliated. It is a pity that Li Yun couldn't find equipment similar to the Five Thunders exorcising Jade Pendant in the gift bag. If there is, it should be able to protect the two women from evil. The three of them talked until more than eleven o'clock in the evening, and when it was over, Gong Lianyi still had an expression that was still not enough. Auntie Lian, you should rest. After all, your body is just right and you need to rest for a while. It's okay, I'm not tired right now. Okay, then we'll stop here tonight. Gong Lianyi glanced at Li Yun, perhaps because tonight's events impressed her too deeply, she was a little bit unwilling. Auntie Lian. Gong King Yu stood up, pointed to the teacup she brought over on the table and asked, Do you want to take this teacup? Uh, just put it here. Okay. Listen to Aunt Lian. Gong King Yu smiled and nodded, already having the answer in his heart. Her question just now was a tentative question. Putting the third teacup here shows that Gong Lian Yi still wants Li Yun to come to this small study and chat with her. So the teacup does not need to be taken away naturally. After she left, Gong Lian Yi woke up to the meaning of her words, and her cheeks quickly spread a blush. King Yu, Li Yun. Gong Lian Yi bit her lip and muttered the names of the two people she valued most. If, if we can stay with them in the future, even if something doesn't happen with Li Yun, Gong Lian Yi was also willing. For her, Emotional matters don't require two people to be together. Platonic love is enough. King Yu. Walking on the corridor inside the mansion, underfoot was a high-grade red carpet, surrounded by a classical beauty, coupled with the charming atmosphere brought by the dim lighting, Li Yun couldn't bear to hold her little hand. Smooth and soft, with warm fragrant nephrite, the girl's little hands are indescribable. Hey, what are you doing? Gong King Yu arrogantly stopped for a moment, and then stopped, and looked at Li Yun without a smile, but his eyes were full of smiles. I'm sorry tonight. Li Yun apologized sincerely. I'm sorry. Gong King Yu asked immediately. Lian Yi's matter. What? It's Lian Yi, you know. I don't understand, I don't understand at all. Gong King Yu shook his head shaking her long black hair, making this dignified beauty look a bit more naughty. Li Yun helplessly scratched her little nose, and said, It's me who is wrong. You shouldn't wait to be with your elders, what? Humph, you still know how to apologize. Gong King Yu whispered, I'm not satisfied with me, and he aimed his gaze at my elders, and still my most beloved Aunt Lian, are you bad guys so bothersome? Sorry. Do you apologize, you won't stand on the balcony and kiss Aunt Lian from now on. What she said was very bold, and Li Yun couldn't help but fantasize. If she kissed the charming lady, it would be. King Yu, I'm sorry for the emotional matter. Li Yun squeezed her little hand and whispered softly, You know, I already have several confidants. What about me? Gong King Yu interrupted him and looked straight at him. The two eyes met, and Gong King Yu quickly lowered his head again. Li Yun whispered, King Yu, I respect your choice. Having said that, Li Yun couldn't help but feel heartache when she thought of Gong King Yu throwing herself into another man's embrace. Do you really want to make this decision? Hearing Li Yun's words, Gong King Yu's face couldn't help but feel sad. Respecting her choice meant giving up? But... Li Yun gritted his teeth, held her slender waist with one hand, raised Gong King Yu's chin with the other, fixed her eyes on her, and made an overbearing declaration, I respect King Yu's choice, but I am not willing to give you up. I will definitely work hard to pursue you and let Gong King Yu be my girlfriend and wife. But now Gong King Yu didn't want to think about it. Her girl was moved. Only Li Yun was in her eyes and her mind was completely occupied by him. The two eyes met, and there was the tenderness and sweetness between the lovers in their eyes. 
just when Li Yun thought that the timing, atmosphere and location were all right to win the first kiss of Gong King Yu, the classical beauty, the classical beauty stood on tiptoe and actively took a bite on his lips. It was really just a bite, and Li Yun's lips showed a row of fine tooth marks. He he he, I'm not the wife of your pervert. I want to chase after me and Aunt Lian. You are still three or five years early. Gong King Yu blushed and ran away leaving Li Yun standing still. Three or five years early? Not for a lifetime? Does three to five years mean there is a chance? No, Gong King Ye was talking about chasing her and Aunt Lian. Doesn't it mean that she is willing to share with Gong Lian? Li Yun smirked happily. Gong Lian Ye and Gong King Ye looked a little similar. One was a classical beauty and the other was a dignified lady. No matter which one they could have, they could make a man extremely happy. But he has the opportunity to have these two beauties at the same time. Ding, congratulations to the host for successfully obtaining the full favorability of the fourth girl, extra bonus experience 100,000 points, free attribute points 666, and a red envelope. Red envelope, money 188, inside. After opening it, you will get a passive skill, flirting, your sunny and confident temperament will make women unable to extricate themselves, from an 80-year-old woman to a 3-year-old lowly, all have a good impression of you. Li Yun couldn't laugh or cry. It's a good skill to have high spirits, but that's fine for lowly, the old woman, no, he is really not so angry and needs to be defeated. King Yu is the fourth one with a liking degree of 100, and rewards 188W of money. So what about the fifth one? 1888W? The sixth one, 180 million. In other words, who is the fifth girl who has a good opinion of me? Hu Xiaomeng, Concubine Wanqing, Gong Lianyi, ER, Concubine Wanqing, forget it, the enchantress is covered with thorns, she will be stabbed if she wants to get close, and it is only possible to see the real Concubine Wanqing with a scar. Li Yun was already very satisfied with tonight, but Gong King Yu said that he was not his girlfriend, but his affection degree was over 100, which is even closer than his girlfriend. Call her Quasi wife from now on? Li Yun smiled and raised his foot to go back to the room to sleep. Wait, cheating. King Yu, where is my room? Hee <laughs> hee, sleep in the corridor tonight. Gong King Yu's voice came from the third floor and then Li Yun led the maid to the next door to her room, so close, it was a bit dark. The mansion is very large, with a five-story bungalow. There are at least twenty rooms in the middle building. The maids and bodyguards live in the two small buildings next to it. It is a small castle. In the evening, Li Yun lived as a gadget. After taking a shower, he lay leisurely on a chair on the balcony playing with his mobile phone while admiring the night view of the Yellow River as the tourists were gradually dispersing. After reporting peace with Fang Shui and Li Feng, Li Yun went back to the room to sleep. When he woke up the next day, Li Yun washed up and went to the restaurant to sit and wait for King Yu and the others to get up for breakfast. Huang Lao and Yu Wenzhong have not left yet, but Li Yun is too lazy to talk to Yu Wenzhong and ignore them. After eating breakfast, Li Yun wanted to continue to test the network security performance for the soldier base, but Gong Lianyi stopped him again. Li Yun, I want to talk to you about something. Gong Lianyi returned to her thick and solid dress. Her charming look was also dispelled by her feminine temperament. The expression on her face did not have the slightest shame, nervousness or shyness of last night, but a kind of friendliness and intimacy. The politeness of not alienating and not letting you close. It is good. Li Yun was stunned before agreeing, right now Gong Lianyi is her usual. Following Gong Lianyi into a reception room, Li Yun just sat down, but Gong Lianyi's face was red, and he took the initiative to pour a cup of tea for Li Yun and handed it to him like a little wife. Uh. Well, it seems that Gong Lianyi is the one in front of him last night as beautiful as a young girl's spring heart sprouts, not at all indifferent in front of outsiders. Li Yun smiled and took the teacup, took a sip and cleared his throat, 
and said, Lian Yi, what are you looking for? I have to deal with some things during the day, and I will leave soon. Don't delay. Gong Lian Yi nodded gently, I have told the driver to wait for you outside, tell him where you are going, just let the driver carry you these days. Li Yun couldn't help looking at her. Gong Lian Yi's gentle and considerate made him feel very comfortable. Her thoughts are very meticulous, and she deserves to be the helm of the Gong family in Zhonghai City. Gong Lian Yi looked a little shy, lowered her eyes slightly, did not look at Li Yun, but did not avoid his admiring gaze, Zhu Lip slightly said, I want to discuss something with you. What's up? As for the Emol Yang we caught last night, I want to let him go. Li Yun nodded. Do you think he is useless, or do you mean? Draw the snake out of the hole. The two looked at each other and smiled, sharing a certain deep understanding. Li Yun was originally afraid of Gong Lian Yi's benevolence, so he didn't talk about following M. Ol Yang to find the black hand behind the scenes. Gong Lian Yi also heard Li Yun's meaning and directly stated his own purpose, without the slightest. Hide. Okay, what are you going to do? First, follow M. Ol Yang and investigate everyone he contacts, second, find relationships to explore all the trajectories of Shi Taining's actions in Zhonghai City, and secretly investigate who he was in contact with and what he did. Be careful, Shi Taining has goo worms, he is a person from the six demon sects. I know. Gong Lian Yi's tone was gentle, but she revealed a sense of confidence. Even if Shi Taining knows that someone is investigating him, he can't find it here. Li Yun nodded. Gong Lian Yi is not a vase. She is a master of the late congenital and the most reliable force in Zhonghai City. In addition, Gong Lian Yi said again, I will strictly order everyone in the mansion not to disclose information, so that Huang Lao and Yu Wenzhong will keep the secret and know that M. Ol Yang is in contact with that big man. Li Yun pondered for a while, and in Gong Lian Yi's somewhat nervous expression, he sighed and said, Lian Yi, you are very considerate. I can't beat you. The only thing I can say is, be careful. Yet. Yeah. Gong Lian Yi was relieved, she didn't want to be underestimated by Li Yun, she wanted to occupy a more important position in Li Yun's heart. After all, there are a lot of girls around Li Yun. It won't work if you don't work hard. Okay, then I'm leaving. Li Yun stood up and smiled at her, whenever, remember to bring the detoxification pills I gave you, and contact me if you have anything. Okay. Gong Lian responded softly and stood up as well. Then, she noticed that the collar of Li Yun's coat was a bit irregular, so Lian Bu moved lightly and came to him, using her beautiful slender fingers to give Li Yun sorted it out. The expressions, movements, and demeanor are all similar to those of a gentle and pleasant wife. Li Yun felt itchy in his heart and couldn't help lowering his head and kissed Gong Lian Yi on the forehead. Lian Yi, I'm leaving. Okay. It wasn't until Li Yun's figure disappeared that Gong Lian Yi recovered from the kiss of Li Yun just now. Then, a beautiful face was quickly dyed with red clouds, and even the crystal clear earlobes turned pink. Li. Li Yun. Gong Lian Yi leaped with confidence, unable to say a word, her cheeks were blushing, and after a long time, the red clouds disappeared. She just sorted Li Yun's clothes, and Li Yun replied with a kiss. Their movements were very natural, like a couple who had been married for a long time. This elegant way of getting along with each other is what Gong Lian Yi likes most, and is also most willing to see. Gong Lian Yi's face blushed before she walked out of the reception room and began to direct everyone to do things. Anyone familiar with the palace elders can see that there is lingering joy and happiness between her eyebrows, just like a girl in love. Just a few days later, Li Yun went out to do errands, Gong Lian Yi was in the mansion, and King Yi went to class normally, or skipped class she didn't go to class half of the time. And Huang Lao and Yu Wenzhong did not leave either. Huang Lao was studying Gu Worms, while Yu Wenzhong had been cheeky with Gong King Yu and even Gong Lian. Gong King Yu hinted that he was leaving several times, but Huang Lao did not leave. Secondly, 
Yu Wenzhong made an excuse that Li Yun was still there and refused to leave. Friday night. Li Yun finally finished his work today. During the period, he earned a lot of justice points and attribute points. He met a lot of leaders of Zhonghai City, and he was familiar with him. In the future, he won't be afraid of messing things up in business. Li Yun, are you ready? Uh, this thing is really hard to wear, it's okay. After dinner, Li Yun fiddled with his clothes in the room. He felt that he was a lot more handsome, so he walked out. Gong Lianyi, who had been waiting at the door for a long time, brightened. The handsome boy in front of him was dressed in hanfu, a gorgeous cyan robe, and a jade pendant tied around his waist. Except that his hair was not as long as the ancient young masters, regardless of his temperament. The appearance is still demeanor, Li Yun is now a handsome young man. This beautiful young lady, what's your appearance? Li Yun arched his hands to Gong Lian, this was the first time he wore ancient costumes. Gong Lian Yi laughed out loud, but quickly reduced her expression, made a half shy, half surprised expression, put her hands together on her waist, bowed to Li Yunying, and said in a shy tone. Well, the sun is very handsome, the concubine looks like a willow, and it is the blessing of the concubine to be with him by the three lives. Listening to her delicate words, Li Yun's eyes flashed with fiery heat. Gong Lian Yi is now wearing a light blue skirt, her black hair hanging from her waist like a waterfall, with a beautiful step in her hair, which is dignified and elegant, and beautiful. This young lady doesn't have to be modest. Miss, you are beautiful and elegant, and the sun likes you very much. Tonight, it's not as good as us. Well, cough cough, go to the night view of the Huangjong River. Li Yun had an obscene smile on his face, and wanted to molest him. Play with a fox-like lady who has a 95-degree favorability with him, but the door to the next room opened and his prospective wife went online and gave him a jealous look. Li Yun immediately closed his mouth and smiled as Gong Lian Yi was covering his mouth. Master, son. Why don't you speak any more? Gong King Yu smiled and walked out at a light pace. She was wearing a light pink dress with a graceful curve and a waistband tied around her waist, showing her slender figure to the fullest. When she smiled without showing her teeth, her quiet and classical temperament made people think that she was born to wear hanfu. In the words of Weibo, how to dress and look good, beautiful, lick and lick. Li Yun said sternly, this lady, your looks and temperament are not bad, elegant and indifferent, as beautiful as a blooming peony. Fuck you, full of greasy mouth and tongue. To say that Xianya is indifferent, it should be a peach blossom, not a peony. Gong Qingyu gave him a roll of eyes, but Li Yun and Gong Lianyi both saw the joy between her eyebrows. Let's go, let's go to the night view. On Friday tonight, people who have been busy for a week in Songhai City will choose to go shopping on this evening, especially couples, they will appear in pairs. Therefore, the night view of the Yellow River tonight is particularly lively. Huang Suanquo's traditional culture is well protected. On festive days, there will always be people wearing hanfu to go shopping. So Li Yun went to the village to follow the customs and put on a costume. Not to mention, he is quite suitable for costumes, and he looks a lot more handsome. However, Li Yun's costume is no better than the other white man in the team. That is, Yu Wen's hung. He has long hair, a knot in a bun, a crown, and a fan in his hand. His whole person is no different from the ancient noble son. Along the way, many girls actually screamed and screamed like idiots. Take pictures with Yu Wen's hung. So handsome, my god. Which star is this man in white? How can he be so handsome? Sword eyebrows and star eyes, handsome, my god. My old lady can't help but want to eat tender grass. Hey? What's the matter? The two beauties in his team are with another man in Tsingyi instead. The man in Tsingyi is handsome, he is very sunny, I like him more. Hearing the startled voices of passers-by, Yu Wenzhong was originally very proud, 
but after hearing that the two beauties were accompanied by the man in Tsingyi, that is, Li Yun, his face suddenly became gloomy. Just let this kid be proud for two more days. A cold light flashed in Yu Wenchen's eyes, and soon, the help he asked in the family was coming. By then, he would make Li Yun better than dead. Li Yun, the two golden flowers of the palace family, and Huang Lao, the five of them walked towards the busiest part of the Huangjiang River at night. Originally Huang Lao didn't want to come out, saying that it was the bustle of young people, but Gong Qingye was afraid that Li Yun and Yu Wenzhong would have a conflict, so he used the excuse that Huang Lao would rarely come to Zhonghai City, so he went out together to enjoy the bustling night scene. Along the way, Li Yun attracted the attention of many passers-by. Not to mention the two men, just the looks of the beautiful women Gong Qingyu and Gong Lianyi, plus their temperament, one classical and dignified, the other gentle and gentle, they are simply two beautiful and ancient costumes. In the words of a passerby, it's like a lady walking out of a painting. It's worth seeing these two beauties tonight. Traveling along both banks of the Yellow River, the luxurious cruise ship on the river in the middle is decorated with neon lights, shining sparkles on the river. Surrounded by dazzling lights, tourists are either stylishly dressed, handsome men and beautiful women, showing the confidence of international city citizens, or like Li Yun, dressed in ancient costumes and personable, composing stories about young men and women. Li Yun ignored Yu Wen's hung throughout the whole process, chatting with the two beauties of the palace family, Huang Lao interjected from time to time, and it became more and more that Yu Wen's hung was an outsider. Damn it! Yu Wenchen's face was darker, and his heart was extremely fierce. When he was worried about how to attract the attention of Gong Qingyu and the two women, he saw the two rows of golden glazed tiles in front of him and the antique shop decorated with primitive simplicity, and he immediately noticed. Qingyu, let's take a look at antiques. Yu Wenzhong squeezed out a smile, I heard that Zhonghai City's antiques are quite famous. It just so happens that Huang Lao also has a research on antiques. Maybe we can pick up a few omissions. Huang Lao smiled modestly, I'm overwhelmed. The old man is just a bit older. It's not a research. The old man is still interested in medicine. The underlying meaning is that he really loves antiques. Then go take a look. Gong Qingyu looked at Li Yun. Okay, but wait a minute. Li Yun nodded in agreement, but looked at the corner of the flower garden on the street. Gong Lian followed his gaze and found a man with a slightly dull look sitting there, with an iron plate in front of him, and a speaker playing music. The sound played by the speakers was not loud, but Gong Lian Yi, who was an innate late powerhouse, was still in the noisy noise and heard what this song was singing. Heaven and earth make it, the swords and demons are frightened, and the boys are young. Gong Lian Yi was startled, the soundtrack of this song was passionate, and the lyrics were bold and unconstrained. Even if she was a woman, she could feel a wave of passion and passion in her chest after listening to this song. Do chivalrous things. Gong King Yu's beautiful eyes lit up, and then he looked at Li Yun with a smile. He's begging, let's go and see. Li Yun smiled slightly and walked over. When the begging middle-aged man saw these handsome men and beauties, he put a flattering smile on his dull face. Unfortunately, he did not recognize Li Yun. This is for you. Li Yun took out 50 yuan and put it on his iron plate. The middle-aged man was happy on his face and quickly thanked, Thank you, thank you gentlemen, you are such a good person. Gong Lian Yi's heart warmed. She hadn't noticed anyone begging at all just now but Li Yun spotted the beggar in the corner among the visitors. This shows that Li Yun must be a gentle and kind-hearted man. I'll give him some money, too. Gong Lian Yi reached out and touched her cuff, only to realize that she would be accompanied by a maid when she came out, and she didn't need to take the money. He he, Aunt Lian, let me give it to you. Gong King Yu smiled and took out a few red banknotes and gave them half to Gong Lian Yi. After that, the two classical beauties squatted down like Li Yun and put the banknotes on the iron plate. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 
The man was so excited that he kept bowing to them while sitting on the flower bed. All right. Gong Qingyu patted his little hand and pointed to Li Yun with a smile, if you want to thank you, thank this guy. He gave you the money first. Is it Li Yun's illusion? After Gong Qingyu was with him, he became more talkative and more lively. Thank you, thank you so much. The middle-aged man looked excited and bowed to Li Yun again. The hundreds of dollars were enough to cover his income for ten and a half days. Huang Lao also took out two banknotes and put them in, but Yu Wenzhong looked at Li Yun more and more upset. No matter what this guy does now, he is extremely disgusted, and he can't wait to kill him immediately. Humph! Yu Wenzhong glanced at the begging middle-aged man, and said in a weird manner, with hands and feet, but begging on the street, did your parents teach you the principle of getting something for nothing? Everyone was stunned. The middle-aged man showed a face of shame. Yu Wenzhong became more proud and said mockingly, I think you are so shameless, and you probably have no parenting. You can make money by putting a plate on the street. This way of making money it's really amazing. King Yu, Aunt Lian, and Huang Lao. Yu Wenzhong bent over, stretched out his hand, picked up the hundreds of dollars in the plate, and sarcastically said, don't be fooled by someone who is overflowing with love. Worthy of sympathy. No, is he overwhelming with peace of mind, or does he want to show love in front of beautiful women? Ha ha. Yu Wenzhong sneered and grabbed the red notes. The middle-aged man looked lost, but did not stand up to stop him. The next moment, Yu Wenchen's hand was tightly pinched. Let go. Yu. Yu Wenzhong stared at Li Yun with annoyance, you just let it go. Only you have love? People who come and go on the street don't have love? This person has hands and feet, why should you let King Yu and Aunt Lian offer love? You pretend here. He sternly asked, causing the passing pedestrians to stop and watch. Soon, dozens of people gathered nearby. The middle-aged man looked panicked but his long inferiority complex made his lips tremble and he couldn't speak. Yu Wen's hung. Li Yun said in an indifferent tone, thank you to figure it out. Don't look at people with the look of waste, understand. In fact, you are the waste. Li Yun didn't say this sentence, but the meaning is clear. Yu Wen's hung became more and more angry. He threw away Li Yun's hand, threw the banknotes under his feet, stepped on him, and sneered, are you blind? This man has hands and feet but came to beg, and put an iron plate in front of him. You can make money by playing a song. Are you still overwhelmed with love and want to give him money? You are not showing love, you are completely helping the gang to abuse. Gong Lianyi frowned slightly and said euphemistically, no, this song is very nice. The middle-aged man's face was very ashamed, and people around him talked a lot. He is a big man with hands and feet, and he really shouldn't come to beg. Hey, maybe someone has difficulties at home. Who has no trouble at home? But did you see them begging? Yes. I think the man in white is right, he shouldn't give him money. Yu Wenzhong became more proud, and provocatively said to Li Yun, Have you seen it? Does anyone around you agree with you? Hey! The eyes of the people around were on Li Yun, Gong Lianyi was very worried that Li Yun would get angry because of this, and wanted to come out and say a few words to him, but saw Li Yun bending down and picking up the banknotes that had been stepped on. Everyone felt puzzled. Isn't this Tsing Yi boy fainted? Money is a good thing. It has always been. Li Yun flicked the banknote with a calm expression, flicked off the dust on it and handed it to the middle-aged man. He said sincerely, accept it, friend, the society should help you people with physical disabilities. Have a physical disability? Everyone was taken aback, but looking from left to right, this middle-aged man didn't seem to be disabled. Yu Wenzhong sneered, say you are blind, you are really blind. To shut up. Li Yun's tone turned cold. If you dare to trample on the banknotes we gave him like a brute, be careful I will kick your foot off. 
you scold me as a beast. Yu Wenzheng was furious, but at this moment, Gong Lianyi exclaimed, that's it. Yu Wenzheng had to suppress his anger, so what? It turns out that this gentleman's feet are already. Gong Lianyi pointed to the middle-aged man's trouser tube, and everyone looked at it again, but the middle-aged man was wearing trousers and could not see if his leg was broken. Really disabled. Everyone was very puzzled, how did Li Yun see it? Uh, he is a disabled person. But the person standing on the side saw the problem, and one pointed sadly under his pants, he is not wearing shoes. No shoes? What the is going on? Yu Wenchen's face was gloomy, and he kicked the iron box that the middle-aged man had placed in front of him. The silver coins inside were spilled out, one yuan, five cents, and one cent of banknotes spilled all over the place. Really no shoes. Without the cover of the iron box, everyone can see clearly now that the middle-aged man's pants are empty, and his legs have been amputated for some reason. In an instant, the atmosphere on the scene became serious, and everyone was very embarrassed. The crowd onlookers previously accused the middle-aged man of begging with hands and feet, but unexpectedly, his feet are gone. Yu Wen's hung. Li Yun clenched his fists and looked at him indifferently, you are blind, right? His trousers are covered with dust and dirt. You can't see this. What's the use of eyes? Gong King Yu looked over and saw that the middle-aged man's trousers were actually dirty. Obviously, he was walking on the ground with his hands, causing the trousers to be stained with dirt on the ground. Yu Wen's hung flushed with his handsome face. Mr. Huang stood up and said, Wen Sheng, your temper is a little bit irritable, and you overturned everyone's things. This is really... Even Huang Lao stood up to accuse Yu Wen's hung, one can imagine how much he has committed public anger now. Gong King Yu directly said coldly, if you knock it over, pick it up, don't stand like an okay person. Yu Wen Chen's pupil shrank, you let me pick up this beggar's stuff. What? Are you noble? Gong King Yu's personality went straight and straight, and he was not afraid to say these things. Just now Li Yun can pick up the banknotes that people like you have stepped on. I think you are better than a beggar. Why can't you? Pick it up? Hey! I, how about a beggar? Yuan was trembling with anger, and his voice was so cold that he popped out word by word from his teeth staring at Gong King Yu with a horrible look that he wanted to choose someone and eat it. But how could Gong King Yu be afraid of him and glared back unceremoniously, pick it up, or not? If you don't pick it up, you will leave the palace immediately. I don't welcome people like you. She was able to challenge Li Yun in front of thousands of people at the press conference, showing how courageous Gong King Yu is, her straightforward personality, and the courage to speak up. Li Yun stood beside Gong King Yu to prevent Yu Wen's hung from suddenly making a move. Li Yun felt that he had to guard against this guy with his violent temper. Yu Wen Chen's face was blue and purple, and everyone was watching his jokes, making him want to kill everyone who laughed at him. Humph! In the end, Yu Wen's hung took out a card with a gloomy expression, threw it down like trash, and said, There are ten million in it and the password is 112401. His tone was extremely calm, and after speaking, he turned and left without even saying goodbye. Old Huang frowned. When Yu Wenzheng went to invite him, on the one hand, Yu Wenzheng was sincere and generous, and on the other hand he was treating the elder of the palace family, so he came to see Gong Lianyi. Unexpectedly, this Yu Wenchen's sincere attitude was all pretend, his temper was quite irritable, and he wanted to hurt people if he didn't agree with him. Gong Lianyi's eyes were as gentle as ever, and she did not express anything to Yu Wenchen's departure. As long as Li Yun is fine, she has no interest in other men. I remember. A stylishly dressed girl pointed at Li Yun and exclaimed, Aren't you the author of Zheng Zhang? Everyone was taken aback, their eyes turned to Li Yun. I rub. Really? It's no wonder he is so caring. Last time Li Yun also made a donation, so he sang while punching, 
so handsome. So handsome. More than that, people still have money. Li Yun's current company is amazing, with a market value of 10 billion. Facing everyone's star-like eyes, Li Yun smiled helplessly, I only noticed this because I heard my song, but I didn't expect such a thing to happen. However. After a pause, Li Yun smiled and said, If you are also willing to show love, I think this gentleman will definitely thank you. Handsome man, if we want us to show love, do you have to fight a boxing like the last time? A girl said with a grin, and soon everyone shook up and took out the red bills to let Li come and perform on the spot. There is a deep surprise in Gonglian Yaime. It turns out that Li Yun wrote this poem Zhang Jiang. She likes this song very much. From the lyrics, you can know that the person who wrote the song must be a bold knight, but it was written by the man she valued most, giving Gong Lianyi a strong sense of surprise. It turns out that the man she likes is so powerful. Ahem. Li Yun said sternly, I can do this kind of thing once. It just so happens that two of my friends are by my side. Why don't you let them show their talents this time? Two good friends. Two beauties. In an instant, everyone looked at the two golden flowers of the palace. Gong Qingye groaned, I don't want it. Ha ha ha, it's okay, just just dance. No. Lian Yi, are you coming? Hey? Me, me, that, I won't. Swordsmanship, right? Or I will fight with you, just to increase the atmosphere. Gong Lian Yi blushed and agreed, and a heart that had been thought to have been silent became vigorous again because of Li Yun, like a young girl, bright and lovely. But Gong Lian Yi couldn't do anything about sword dancing in this situation, so she had to switch to poems on sight, successfully winning the applause of the audience, and donating money continuously. Gong King Yi was a little unconvinced, and took the initiative to dance a wide sleeved fairy dance. Although not standard, her classical beauty danced gracefully, with flying sleeves and fluttering skirt corners, which made the men and women present look like crazy. Drunk, the donation rushed to the 30,000 mark. During the noisiness, Li Yun and everyone talked about picking up the fallen coins and change back into the iron box and returning them to the middle-aged man. The man named Zhang Ming was moved to tears, saying that he had never met someone as good as Li Yun. Li Yun patted him on the shoulder, and did not say much comfort. I don't want this card. After feeling a little calm, Zhang Ming shook his head and handed the card back to Li Yun, this is something from your friend. Besides, there is too much money. I can't get it. You can return it to him for me. Gong King Yu said directly, just take it, that person is very rich, don't worry about him, don't worry about using this money. Zhang Ming still shook his head, saying that he didn't want this card. While resigning, Li Yun suddenly received a system prompt. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose from the host. Option 1, take the card and leave, continue to visit the night scene, no reward. Option 2, secretly protect Zhang Ming, capture someone who has killed him, reward justice value plus 800, all attributes plus 600. Experience value plus 300,000, blue gift bag asterisk 1. Option 3, let Zhang Ming escape to the field, reward justice value plus 50, experience value plus 1 million. Seeing the selection event given by the system, Li Yun frowned. Someone who murdered Zhang Ming? Logically speaking, a disabled person's social status is very low, others will not bully him, and he cannot bully others. If someone has a murderous heart towards Zhang Ming, it can only be someone who leaves in anger. Yu Wen's hung. Humph. A cold light flashed in Li Yun's eyes. This guy walked so happily and threw a million yuan so generously. He didn't expect to find someone behind to kill Zhang Ming to vent his anger. This Yu Wen Chen, it. Li Yun, what's the matter? Gong Lian Yi who had been paying attention to Li Yun's every move, quickly discovered his abnormality and asked with some worry. It's nothing, 
it's just that someone is getting impatient and needs me to help him. Li Yun smiled faintly, and reached out to take the bank card with a deposit of 10 million yuan, give it to me. Gong Lianyi frowned her eyebrows slightly, Li Yun's words made her a little confused, but his origin was mysterious, Gong Lianyi still chose to believe him, secretly looking around, trying to find out who was impatient. After asking the address of Zhang Ming's house, Li Yun said goodbye to him and walked towards the antique street. Are we going to buy antiques? Gong Qingyu asked cheerfully. Although, as the eldest lady of the palace family, it was a bit wrong to perform in the public, but she felt happy and ignored the accusations of the elders in the family later. Besides, Aunt Lian also wrote a poem on the spot, and when that time comes she will use her as a shield. Thinking of this, Gong Qingyu was in a good mood. As for Gong Lianyi, she didn't worry about this problem at first. No, that's all for shopping tonight. Turning into the antique street, Li Yun looked back at Zhang Ming calmly, and found that he had supported his hands, tied the iron plate around his waist, and walked towards home. His arms are very powerful. It is not a problem to prop himself up. It is not difficult to walk, but it is still sad. Ah! It's over. Gong Qingyu pursed his lips. It didn't take long for us to come out to play. Huang Lao is going to buy antiques. Why is it over? Li Yun smiled without saying a word, watched Zhang Ming leave, and said, You go shopping, I want to leave. After all, Mr. Huang has rich experience in walking the rivers and lakes, and he immediately saw what Li Yun was worried about. Little friend, are you worried that someone will rob Zhang Ming? Listening to Huang Lao's words, Gong Lianyi's beautiful face showed a sudden look. A handicapped person, but there are tens of thousands of dollars in the iron box. Just now, many people saw it. If you don't know, there will be gangsters who will rob. Li Yun smiled, I'm afraid there will be more terrible things, but I can handle it myself, you guys. Do not. Gong Lianyi took the initiative to hold Li Yun's hand, and said softly, I will go with you, so I can take care of it. I, I will go too. Gong Qingyu certainly didn't feel backward. The rest of Huang Lao shrugged and said that he couldn't go shopping alone, so he just followed over and took a look. All right. Li Yun paused, but don't be too surprised when you wait. Surprised? The three said that they did not understand what was so surprising about the robbery. Li Yun didn't explain too much, and walked in the direction where Zhang Ming had left first. After bypassing the three streets, the four of them followed Zhang Ming at a distance and came to an old street near the tributary of the Yellow River. This old street is also a riverside building, but the treatment of surrounding houses is quite different from the previous one. Due to historical and environmental reasons, this tributary is frothy, turbid sewage, and smelly. As a result, all the aborigines of this old street moved away, leaving only those who came to work from other places to live, lack of human management, and it was particularly chaotic and dirty. Because Gong Qingyu and Gong Lianyi's appearances of two beauties, big and small, are so outstanding that it is inconvenient to track people, they use a veil to cover their appearance. But even so, the tall and graceful figures of the two women, as well as a gorgeous Hanfu, still attracted passers-by to turn their attention to them. Bad. Huang Lao's old face turned into a bitter melon face. He shouldn't go shopping with Gong Gaeo. If this spreads out, the elders of Tian Donmen will follow a beggar to ensure that it spreads throughout the martial arts in one night. Send a big joke. He just wanted to end it quickly and go back to study his Gu Worm. Therefore, after seeing Zhang Ming walking into an old house, he couldn't wait to say, Little friend, since Zhang Ming is home, shall we go back? In fact, Huang Lao couldn't help complaining in his heart. Didn't it happen that nothing happened? However, by selling a favor to Li Yun, he might get more information about Gu Worms. Huang Lao Ki clenched his teeth and persisted until now. Li Yun said indifferently, don't worry, the shocking thing has not happened yet, 
I can guarantee that you will be shocked later. Shocking thing? The two women looked at each other. Li Yun was always so inexplicable, but afterwards proved that he was definitely right. The three of them looked in the distance for a long time, and Huang Lao couldn't bear it again and said, Li Ziazi, are you too sensitive? Feeling a little bit? Robbery is a felony, and ordinary criminals dare not come like this, tens of thousands of dollars. It's not a lot, and it's not a huge sum of millions, is it? From Li Ziao to Li Ziazi, Huang Lao's mood has changed. Gong King Yu also felt that Li Yun might be too careful. Although she liked Li Yun, it was one thing to like it, and another to doubt. Li Yun. Gong Lian Yi blinked and asked softly, Did you notice anything? Faced with the suspicion of the three, Li Yun smiled slightly, I said, Don't worry, it's not a robbery, but, a murder. Murdering case. The three of them looked at Li Yun in horror, with shock and doubt in their eyes. Who murdered? Who is going to kill? Why kill? The killing, is related to Zhang Ming. Gong Lian has a soft temper, but after all, she has been the elder of the palace since the age of 25. Although most of the Gong family's affairs in Zhonghai City have not been questioned, she also knows a lot of bad things. Therefore, Gong Lian Yi soon thought that Li Yun was referring to Zhang Ming, but she still couldn't believe it. How could anyone kill a disabled person? At most, he would run away. Zhang Ming couldn't catch up if he wanted to chase, and he couldn't resist. Killing Zhang Ming was useless. Unless. Here is the murderer. An inexplicable color flashed in Li Yun's eyes staring closely at the three people who walked into the old building where Zhang Ming was. Gong Qingyu frowned. She didn't know the three of them, but they were all dressed in black tights, resembling Tang suits. At first glance, they were born in Lianjia, and ordinary people rarely have such clothes. However, Lianjiaza usually have family conditions that are not too bad, and they rarely come to the dark corners of such cities. There is no oil and water, it is impossible to make money. They are here to rob, no, that's not right. Old Huang quickly woke up, the person in the middle has a hideous expression and resentment. It's not like the kind of greed who came to robbery. They are really here to kill. Let's go, don't let them succeed. Gong King Yu hurriedly wanted to go out, but was held back by Li Yun. You follow behind and I will explore the truth by myself. What? Ignoring the surprise of the three of them, Li Yun's figure flickered, running his ethereal footwork, and quickly rushed towards the old building. I am going to. Gong Lian Yi is the strongest in the team, plus Li Yun is a person she values very much, of course she wants to catch up to protect him. But Elder Huang stopped her, with a trace of surprise on his face, Miss Gong. Didn't you find out? Li Ziazi's light work is extraordinary and mysterious, and it is suspected that he has reached the realm of entering the hall. Come into the hall. Gong Lian Yi was surprised at first, and then recalled Li Yun's body shape just now. It was indeed the case. His speed was extremely fast. He was not like an acquired martial artist, but a master of the late innate stage. Gong King Yu has a strange expression. People in the arena roughly divide the martial arts practice into several levels, such as beginners, Xiaocheng, Dachen, and Consummation. If you exceed Consummation, you will reach the level of pride and enter the room, which means that you can get it, enough to be a good name. For example, if someone has a strong swordsmanship, a man is called a gentleman, a young man, a fairy, a chivalrous woman, and so on. Does Li Yun's glorious service and entering the room mean that he can also have the name of Jiang Hu? Let's follow. Gong Lian Yi was relieved, Li Yun was so light, so even if he couldn't beat it, he could run away with light. The three followed quietly and walked onto this old building. Gong King Yu looked around. The walls were dusty, the mud was flying, the wires were aging, the iron railings were corroded, and everything looked so dilapidated. This is Gong King Yu's first visit to such a place. 
Zhang Ming's house lives on the third floor, and Huang Lao motioned the three of them to stop at the corner of the stairs, listening to the movement upstairs. But unexpectedly, the first words the three heard, shocked their minds. Yu Wen's hung, is it you? Yu Wen's hung? Gong King Yu opened her mouth to make a scream, but her aunt Lian immediately covered her mouth and shook her head to signal her to stop speaking before letting go. Gong King Yu was extremely surprised, looking at aunt Lian as if asking, but the latter didn't know the answer. Old Huang frowned, the development of things really exceeded his imagination. Is it really Yu Wen's hung? At this time, the three of them heard Li Yun's calm voice from the upper floor again, don't deny it. Judging from the first time you saw me, you wanted to kill me and you knew that you were a small belly. A person who is very vindictive. And Zhang Ming made you make a fool of yourself in the public, but you Yu Wen's hung left without saying a word. At that time, you must have planned to kill Zhang Ming, right? A sneered sneered at the corner of Li Yun's mouth, no wonder you were so generous and threw 10 million bank cards to Zhang Ming. Are you thinking that if you want to kill this guy anyway, let him keep the bank cards temporarily? Kill him and get it back. By the way, you can still push the cause of Zhang Ming's death to this bank card. It can be said to kill three birds with one stone. There was silence upstairs. Gong Lianyi seemed to see a picture, Li Yun stood proudly in front of the three mysterious people in black tights, and righteously rebuked their crimes. The reason for the silence of the three mysterious people is probably because Li Yun said that they were so embarrassed that they were about to furious. Sure enough, Gong Lianyi heard a familiar voice. Ha ha ha, well, very right, you are really right. Yu Wen's hung. An anger suddenly flashed in Huang Lao's eyes, it was actually him. The reason for Huang Lao's anger was because Yu Wen's hung had blindfolded him with his modest performance making Huang think that he was a mature and kind-hearted person, so Huang Lao promised him to treat Gong Lianyi. Unexpectedly, this Yu Wen's hung is a small belly chicken intestine, who kills innocent hypocrites in a small matter, what a villain. Li Yun, really, I admire your observation. Wearing a disguise mask, Yu Wen's hung showed a negative smile, but have you ever heard a word? The smarter people die faster. Li Yun smiled faintly, and said disdainfully, just because of the three of you, you want to kill me. Ha <laughs> ha. A middle-aged man standing next to Yu Wen's hung smiled and asked, are you Li Yun? Not bad. Li Yun's expression moved, and he suddenly realized, I understand, you are the one Yu Wen's hung invited to kill me, so I asked me if I was Li Yun. That's why Yu Wen's hung, you are really too murderous. It seems tonight only one of us can leave this building alive. Such a sinister and cruel villain must not be left behind for too long, otherwise there will be endless troubles. Ha 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 ha. Yu Wen's hung laughed out loud again, tears bursting into his eyes, and pointed to the middle-aged man next to him and introduced, This is the outer elder of my clan, Ya Wenji, kid, you know the big family is there any strength of the outer sect elder? Li Yun shook his head calmly. Hey, stupid idiot. Yu Wen's hung sneered, and then introduced, This is my clan uncle, Yu Wen Shangfu, in the early stage of innate cultivation, boy, don't blame me for not letting you die, understand, you will be well after you go to tell Hades, the three of us killed you. Immediately afterwards, he respectfully said to Yu Wen Shangfu, Uncle Clan, please help me kill this kid. Okay, kill things as soon as possible. I see who dares to do it. With a squeaky sound, Gong Lian walked up to the third floor with a cold face. Behind her, following Gong King Yu and Huang Lao, the form completely reversed in an instant. Originally, Li Yun was alone, and he was only the cultivation base of the acquired realm. It was easy for the three of Yu Wen's hung to kill him. But in a blink of an eye, with the appearance of Gong Lianyi and Gong King Yu, the contrast of power suddenly reversed. Gong King Yu, early congenital. Gong Lianyi, late congenital. Gong Lianyi alone is enough to beat four or five mid innate congenitals, not to mention that there is only one opposite. Haha. <laughs>
Li Yun smiled and shook his head, and sighed, Yu Wenzhong, I really don't know how to evaluate you, but forget it, you will be free after tonight, and you will confess slowly in from now on. You. Yu Wenchen's face turned into pig liver color, and the expressions of the other two also aroused ugliness. They recognized Gong Lianyi and knew that she was the genius of the previous generation of the palace family only 25 years old, broke through the late congenital period and became the youngest elder of the palace family. I also recognized Gong Qingyu, this cold little beauty is now the top genius of the Gong family's new generation. At the age of 16 he broke through the innate, and in the future it is likely to break the record of becoming an elder in the Gong family again. That is before the age of 25, breakthrough to the late congenital. With these two people, it is enough to bankrupt their actions tonight. But this is not more terrible. The old man in the acquired realm who was behind them was the reason why Ye Wenji and Ye Wen Shangfu were so terrified. Elder Ching Sang, Huang Tianji, Elder Tian Donman. Although he only had the cultivation of the Hushan realm, the name of the old man Ching Nang spread throughout the country and his reputation was extremely high. It was far from what Gong Lianyi could compare with. The old man Ching Nang is an old man, but he also hates evil. As long as he goes back and publicizes, saying that the three Yuan family kills a beggar for some trivial matter, Yuanji and others will be infamous and laughed at by the world. The decent people are even more ashamed. With them, Yuan's family will also clean up the door and drive them out. For an instant, the three of them seemed to see the tragic situation in the future, and their faces became pale. Clan, clan uncle. Yu Wenzhong said in a panic, we kill them, we must kill these guys, otherwise after tonight, we. So courageous. Huang Lao screamed, shocking the three Yuan family. Okay, the three of you have been arrested. It's okay if you don't want to be caught with your hands. You dare to have evil thoughts. What a shame. Old Huang was trembling with anger, and wished to go back a few days ago, when Yu Wenzhong came to invite him, he directly asked someone to break his legs. This kind of person is not an evil sect who acts both righteously and evilly, but a person in the demon sect, a thorough evil. The faces of the three Yu Wenzhong were extremely ugly. I want to do it, but I can't beat Gong Lianyi. I want to let it go. Their reputation will be greatly damaged. In the future, they will have no place in the rivers and lakes. Life is better than death. Okay, let's accept the plant tonight. Ye Wenji took a deep breath and bowed his hand to Gong Lianyi, I apologize to Miss Gong and Mrs. Huang, and promise that this will stop here, and I will serve it later. I apologize for a thin gift, please forgive me. Old Wang's expression improved a lot, and he gave a cold snort, but did not speak. Li Yun smiled faintly. It was him that Ye Wenji was going to kill, but Ye Wenji did not apologize to him. It can be seen that in Ye Wenji's mind, he is a little at all. If it weren't for the support of the palace, he would kill him. Lianyi, what do you say? Li Yun looked at Gong Lianyi, only to see her face calm unable to see her inner thoughts. Want to go? How could it be so easy? Gong King Yu yelled first, you want to kill Li Yun, how should this account be calculated? Let me see, you each cut off your arms and vowed not to trouble Li Yun again, and the matter tonight should be revealed. Li Yun smiled slightly, as expected to be Gong King Yu, just say whatever he wants, his character is too straightforward. Moreover, 100 points of favorability is not just for watching. Gong King Yu has already regarded him as the most important person in the second half of his life, and will naturally protect him everywhere. As for Gong Lianyi. Li Yun, I listen to you. Gong Lianyi glanced at him, the calm expression on her face was broken, she showed a gentle expression, and her tone was extremely soft. It turns out that Gong Lianyi's peace is only for other people. In front of Li Yun, she will always be the gentle lady. Miss Gong. Yuan Shangfu shouted angrily, Are you really going to offend our Yuan family for a nameless man? 
you are not afraid that one thing will not be done, causing a death fight between the two families, heavy casualties and completely reduced to a second-rate family? People who come from a sect family place great importance on family heritage. The palace is not afraid of Yu Yuan's house. Gong Lian Yi said calmly, as if only telling some unchangeable facts, besides, even if I want to leave the palace, I will never allow anyone to hurt Li Yun. Yu Wenchen's heart was shocked, and he looked at her in disbelief. Only a few short days passed before the fox beauty fell to Li Yun. Are these two people doing certain things in the room these days and nights? Or three people together? Damn it! Thinking of Gong King Yu Gong Lian Yi's two charming beauties lying in Li Yun's arms and being hugged by him, Yu Wen's hung couldn't help but rise in anger. Huang Lao gritted his teeth and also spoke to support Li Yun, the palace is not enough, and what about my Tian Donman? He quickly calculated that Li Yun had good martial arts talents, but more importantly, he knew Gu Worms, which had an important boost to the improvement of Tian Donman's medical skills. I believe that if you report it to the head, Tian Donman will support Li Yun. The two geniuses of the palace family, an elder of the Tian Donman, both supported Li Yun. This change caught the three of Yuan family by surprise, leaving their faces black and silent for a long time. What do you want? Yuanji's eyes flashed with murderous intent, I want to fight with us? I admit that Miss Gong is powerful, but our Yuan's the Yan de Zhenjing is not easy to provoke. Of. The three Gong King Yu all looked at Li Yun, waiting for his decision. At this moment, Li Yun's system issued a prompt. Ding, the host makes a choice and rewards. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose the host. Option 1, kill the three Yuan's on the spot, reward justice value plus 500, experience value plus 500,000, all attributes plus 1,000, purple gift bag asterisk 1. Option 2, let them go, and talk about it later, reward justice value plus 50, skill, swallow your breath. Choice 3, after taking a breath of bad breath, let them go, reward justice value plus 100, a random skill, white gift bag asterisk 3. Looking at the options given by the system, Li Yun frowned. Of the three options, there is no doubt that the first reward is the most generous, with a full attribute bonus of up to 1000 points, which is rare. But... Li Yun glanced at the closed wooden door behind Yu Wen's hung. The wooden door of Zhang Ming's house, which was not known for many years, would definitely not be able to stop Zhen Kai's attack. Yu Wen's hung only needs a palm to blow the wooden door, thus taking hostages, making Li Yun and others have to stop. Judging from the bad personalities of the three Yu Wen's hung, it is not strange to take the hostages. With a sigh in his heart, Li Yun shook his head and said, Everything is inconvenient tonight. It depends on your friendship with the palace family, I will spare Yu Yuan family once. The three of Yuan's family were obviously relieved and Ye Wen Chen was even more proud. This kid really didn't dare to force it, he was still afraid of Ye Wen's influence. Humph! Ye Wen Ji's face was ugly, and he glared at him fiercely. This kid really dares to speak big words. Did he rave Ye Wen's family once? But... Li Yun looked indifferent, looking at Ye Wen's hung with indifferent eyes, capital sins are forgiven, but living sins are inevitable. Ye Wen's hung, Remember what I said to you. What are you talking about? Yu Wen's hung asked subconsciously. If you dare to attack me, I will kill you. Li Yun's voice was indifferent and with a killing intent, and gently stroked the bracelet on his wrist, saying, Tonight you have murdered me again, I can spare your life, but the premise is. Everyone looked at him. You gave up martial arts and became an ordinary person. What? Yu Wen's hung was shocked, abandoning martial arts? No, it's impossible. It's better to kill me. What is the most important thing for the people of Jianghu? There is no doubt that they are many times more powerful than ordinary people. With this force, even if the family is destroyed, they can easily find a good job and continue to live a life of food and clothing. 
and without martial arts, everything is empty water pavilion, don't even think about the generous treatment. Even if he used to be a big brother, a disciple in charge, a super genius, the future hope of the martial art, but once martial arts disappeared, he would immediately become a handyman disciple, with no hope of turning over. Li Yun said indifferently, you have no other choice. Either Yu Wenzhong will abandon martial arts and leave, or the three will die here together. Yu. X3. The three of Yu Wen's family were in desperation, but after seeing Gong Lianyi who was guarding Li Yun's side, they were all speechless. The form is stronger than human beings. With Gong Lianyi, a calm innate late master, it is impossible for them to get close to Li Yun. Huang Lao didn't speak any more, Li Yun's request was cruel, but not excessive. Just ask, if Li Yun came alone, would the three of Yuan's family let him go? Even Zhang Ming will die. Gong Lianyi said euphemistically, second, the mastermind this time is Yu Wen's hung. As long as he is brought to justice, I can no longer hold him accountable or publicize what happened tonight. All the sins were pushed to Yu Wen's hung, and Yu Wenji and Yu Wen Shangfu, two innate masters, were able to preserve their reputation. This choice is undoubtedly strongly tempting. At least Yu Wen's hung was already shivering with fright, with a smile on his face and said to Yu Wen Shangfu, Fu, Uncle Fu, do you remember? You even hugged me when you were a kid. A trace of unbearable flashes in Yu Wen Shangfu's eyes, and gritted his teeth and asked, We are willing to admit the plant and tell you the compensation you want, as long as it is not excessive, I do not. Li Yun coldly spit out a no from his mouth. Either you die tonight, or Yu Wen Shen's cultivation base is abolished. There is no other possibility. Yu Wenchen's face turned pale again. Yu Wenji was shocked and uncertain, where did this kid's confidence say that he would kill them? However, Gong Lianyi firmly supports him, is there any adultery between the two? Yes, only the two have a close relationship to make Gong Lianyi stand beside Li Yun so firmly. Choose. Li Yun looked at them coldly and stretched out his hand again to press the bracelet on his left hand. As long as the two dared to move, Li Yun immediately released Nai Xiao Qian, the ghost in red, and killed them by surprise. Yes, Nai Xiao Qian is the reason Li Yun dares to stay with them so confidently. The atmosphere suddenly froze, and a cold sweat was dripping down Yu Wenchen's forehead. He had already noticed that his two clan uncles were very moved by Li Yun's proposal. Uncle Clan, Uncle Ji. Yu Wenzhong said quickly, I am willing to pay and ask my parents to pay a lot of money. As long as you protect me, I will be grateful to Yu Wenzhong. From now on, I will listen to everything in the family. The two uncles. Although it was strange to hear the words of the two at the same time, Yu Wenzhong was already too panic, and he was shaking. But there was a moment of silence between the two. It seems you have made a decision. Li Yun's indifferent voice sounded, and then he moved his feet and came to Yu Wen's hung at a speed that the three people on the opposite side could barely react. So fast. This thought flashed through Yu Wenji's mind, he was so scared that he waved his hands to block the front, but Li Yun's goal was not him. King Kong points. Sneeze. Li Yun was extremely hard pressing his impenetrable thumb on Yu Wenchen's danchen, and the masculine and mighty infuriating energy penetrated in, and Yu Wenchen's danchen was smashed into pieces. Yu Wenzhong opened his mouth and spouted a mouthful of blood. He didn't react at all, so he was abolished by Li Yun's diamond finger and his danchen was abolished. From then on, he became a useless man without the power to bind a chicken. Yu Yu Yu. His danchen was dethroned, and Yu Wen's hung, who was limp all over, knelt on the ground with a shiver, his blood-red eyes glared with anger, and he couldn't help but fainted. Everyone was shocked. Gong King Yu opened her mouth in surprise, her boyfriend's hand just now was really beautiful. Huang Lao nodded secretly, Li Yun's light work was a little higher than he had judged. From entering the hall, he reached a superb level. I still said that. Li Yun clenched his fists, 
his indifferent eyes swept over the Awan family, and said, You have committed sins and don't live. I hope you will remember this sentence and don't mess with me, otherwise, the Lord of Hell will not protect you. Get out. The words were sonorous and powerful, and the two of Yuan's family were actually forced by Li Yun's aura. They could not say a word, so they had their faces black and put on Yuan Chen and left. Especially Yuan Shangfu, he was an early congenital master, just now Li Yun suddenly shot but did not react at all. In other words, if Li Yun attacked him just now, Yuan Shangfu might also be severely injured by a palm. Ding, the host makes a choice, and the reward, white gift bag asterisk 3, has been distributed. Li Yun was slightly surprised. The skill of Prujna Palm is not bad. Although it is stronger than Yi Yang Fist, it is better than King Kong Finger. Li Yun's current fist has a male fist, and his has a diamond finger, plus the master level light gong subtle footwork, as well as the wind cutting sword technique, and finally the Prujna Palm, which can be described as a fist, a foot, a sword, a sword, well, it is a sword. The law is perfect. Of course, Li Yun still has master level spiritual resistance, advanced steel, and iron bones, plus the mighty nine sun heavenly scriptures, his strength has long been inferior to the innate level master. Li Yun Gong King Yu happily stepped forward and held Li Yun's hand, holding his thumb in her little hand and looking over and over, Are you okay? Just now you used a diamond finger? Have you studied Buddhism? Ahem, don't ask about that. Li Yun turned the subject and smiled, I didn't scare you just now. He knew that he would be crazy when fighting, indifferent and full of murderous intent, and most people really couldn't bear his murderous intent. No. Gong King Yu smiled and shook Li Yun's arm. I think you are doing a good job. After all, being kind to the enemy is cruel to yourself. The bad guys like you Wen's Hung should make him stop. Do evil. Can't do evil anymore? Yunag? This is a good idea. Gong Lian Yi smiled and shook his head, with a very gentle expression, and asked curiously, Li Yun, who did you mean by Hell Mansion? I just mentioned it casually. Li Yun didn't want to say more in front of Mr. Huang. This was a vocabulary he knew from the mouth of the old man Tianyin. It seemed to be the abbreviation of the man of Taishan in hell. Tianyin old man servicing the little ghost mentioned this word when he was killing him. After Yu Wenshung and the others left, Zhang Mingke opened the door in fear, and he was relieved when he saw that it was Li Yun. Dad, who are these people? A little lowly poked her head out. It turned out to be Zhang Ming's daughter, only six years old this year. Li Yun and a few people went in and sat for a while. After asking, they learned that Zhang Ming's wife was not in good health. Although it was not a major problem, she had been suffering from backache and back pain. In addition, Xiao Luli was about to go to school, which caused a huge expense. Stand up! So Zhang Ming gritted his teeth and went to the street to beg for his daughter, but he couldn't pull it down, so he blocked his feet with an iron plate. After Gong Lian Yi learned of it, he gave them a large sum of money, which was taken out of Yu Wenchen's ten million originally wanted to give it all, but Zhang Ming insisted not, saying that three million would be enough for his family life is rich, no matter how much it is, it is a curse. Yu Wenji went back to the hotel where he was staying with a calm face, and threw Yu Wen's hung on the sofa. He woke up with a cry of pain after falling. This is... Yu Wen's hung clutched his pubic area, but after a while he recovered, and suddenly screamed. Uncle Clan, you must avenge me. Okay. That kid Li Yun, I must kill him, I must slash him a thousand times, I want, slap. Yuan Shangfu slapped him angrily and shouted angrily, I told you to shut up, didn't you hear it? Waste. Yu Wenchen's face was pale. Before returning to the family, he already felt the treatment of being a waste. The former Yuan Shangfu loved him so much, let alone slap, he didn't even scold him. But now Yuan Shen Danchen has been abolished, and his clan uncle slapped him without saying a word, 
and didn't treat him as a human being. The difference in treatment before and after was too big. Yu Wenzhong turned to look at another clan uncle, Yu Wenji. No one is allowed to reveal anything about tonight. Yu Wenji took a sip of tea annoyed, not only did not help Yu Wenzhong to speak, but also looked at him with indifferent eyes. Uncle Clan. Yu Wenchen's face paled a bit. Not allowed to reveal it means that he can't find the elders of the family to avenge him. Nephew Sheng. Yu Wenji's tone eased a little, I know you have been wrong tonight, but it is not good for you and me to disclose this matter. Obedient, we will stay in Zhonghai City first, and wait for me and you, Uncle Shang Fu, find a chance to kill Li Yun that boy, and there is no proof, we will go back. Yes. Yuan Shangfu quickly understood what Yuanji meant, and said, As long as Li Yun is dead, no one will know what happened tonight. Uncle Clan. Okay, you go to rest first, stay in the hotel until you recover from your injury, don't go anywhere. The two left with a cold face, and took away Yu Wenchen's mobile phone, and the hotel phone was also cut off, which was tantamount to a house arrest. Yu Wen's hung furiously smashed in the hotel room. Why didn't he understand their intentions? Yu Wenji didn't dare to kill him, but he kept the matter down for the time being, and later brought him back to the family. At that time, even if the dirty things they did tonight broke out, but because they missed the time, there would be no transmission. What impact? The purpose of the two is to preserve their reputation. As for Yu Wen's hung, a waste person doesn't need to care anymore, as long as he doesn't kill him, no one in Yuan's family will help him. All of this has complied with Li Yun's words, committing sins, and cannot live. Li Yun, I broke through. On Saturday, Li Yun was lying on the soft sofa while he was idle, chatting with Gong Lianyi and chatting with Fang Shui and others on the internet. Suddenly, Gong King Yi rushed in happily and pounced on him. Li Yun couldn't help feeling stunned by the soft touch of her body. Breakthrough. Yet. Yeah. Gong King Yu smiled like a flower, unable to bear the excitement in her heart, and even ignoring her Aunt Lian by her side, leaned down directly, and put a young girl's fragrance lip print on Li Yun's lips. Thank you, Li Yun. Gong King Yu looked at him with a blushing face. Li Yun gave him a comic plot outline that was said to be capable of fire a few days ago, called Qin Chao Minjiu, and a pill that was said to be able to regulate the body of a congenital master. Leaving aside the comic outline, Gong King Yu has been able to feel the changes brought to her by the pill these days after taking that pill. She broke through her innate at the age of 16. Although she was extremely talented, her foundation was a bit unstable. Originally, Gong King Yu predicted that she could reach the mid innate period at the age of 20, and to the late innate period before the 25. However, Li Yun's medicine directly made the Genkai in her body extremely thick, and breakthroughs were only a matter of course. Feeling the beauty of the girl's fringe, Li Yun licked his lips, King Yu, verbal gratitude is not enough, only lipstick gratitude is needed. Ah, um, badass. Lian and Aunt Lian are still with him. Li Yun blocked all of Gong King Yu's resistance and hugged her warmly. Gong Lian Yi had already closed her eyes shyly, but wanted to see how they did it. After tangling for a long time, she opened her eyes slightly. Then. Close again immediately. This is too shameful. She never thought that the emotional exchange between lovers and lovers would be so sweet and fragrant. If Gong King Yu was replaced by her, how would she respond? Report, report. The maid Dong's Hume ran up to the third floor panting and came to Gong Lian Yi's study. Standing at the door, she suddenly saw a picture that made her completely dumbfounded. Her young lady, the cold daughter of the palace family, was kissing a handsome man. And another great beauty of the Gong family, a master of the late innate and also the elder of the Gong family, Gong Lian Yi was watching her across from the two. This indescribable picture made Dong Hume directly dumbfounded. Although the interaction between Li Yun and the two palace beauties in the past few days, Dong Hume had already anticipated this, but she was shocked by seeing it with her own eyes. 
could it be that the two golden flowers of the palace must marry the same man? Dong Zhume is sure that if this spreads out, it will definitely cause an uproar in the arena. You badass! After hearing the voice of the maid, Gong King Yu recovered from the drunken state, and immediately hammered Li Yun's chest with a small pink fist, with an overwhelming expression on her face. Ahem, nothing. Li Yun held her small fist and said to the maid standing at the door sternly, Your young lady broke through to the middle congenital stage and was in agitated mood. I just checked the stability of her cultivation level. Okay, what do you have? Do you want to report it? Dong Zhume couldn't help but want to complain. You are an acquired little scum, where is the confidence to ask the young lady to check the cultivation level? I'm afraid it's not a health check? Or check the mouth. At the age of less than 25, Dong Jime, whose mind was still the same as a girl, began to think about it. Gong Lianyi's face flushed, took a few deep breaths, tried to suppress the shyness in her heart, tried her best to calm her pounding heart, and asked, Dong Mei, what's wrong with you just now? Dong Zhume has a weird face. Aunt Lian sits in this mansion and is the backbone of dozens of people in the mansion. Unexpectedly, Aunt Lian was watching the closeness between Li Yun and Gong King Yu just now, saying that there was nothing in it, Dong Zhume definitely didn't believe it. That's it, Aunt Lian, the person who followed M. Ol Yang said something is happening. Oh. Speaking of business affairs, Li Yun immediately reacted, explain in detail. Yes. Facing the future uncle, Dong Zhume did not dare to neglect, she was about to speak and suddenly woke up, Miss, have you broken through to the mid-innate period? Her tone was full of surprises and surprises. Gong King Yu smiled and nodded. Dong Zhume was overjoyed, so she almost took out the phone to report the good news to her mistress. At the age of 18, reaching the mid-innate period, looking at the entire arena, they are all top-notch existences, and have not produced a super genius for decades. It's just that she is strange, why did the young lady and Li Yun immediately broke through when they talked about love? Sister Dong, let me talk about what you want to report first. Gong King Yu interrupted her thoughts, and Dong Zhume came back to her senses and quickly told everyone the information she had received. It turned out that after being released, M. Ol Yang had been in a depressed state. He didn't call a mysterious person until half an hour ago. On the phone, M. Ol Yang was scolded with a head, and then told by a mysterious person that he should come somewhere and tell in detail what happened in the mansion. How does he call that mysterious person? Li Yun asked. Master Yu. Last name Yu. Li Yun frowned. Previously, he guessed that the gooworm was a ghost of Shi Taining, but now it does not seem to be. But it's almost the same. In Huang Xian, People who know Goo Worms can almost tell that they are all disciples from the six demon sects. Unless the people of Hidden Sacred Valley will also use this stuff, it must be related to Shi Taining. Gong Lianyi asked, Where is the place where M. Ol Yang and the adults met? On the outskirts of Zhonghai City, near a highway intersection, what is Sunyang Road? Gong Lianyi looked at Li Yun and seemed to be asking if we should take a look. Li Yun pondered for a moment, and then asked, is M. Ol Yang leaving now? No, they agreed to meet at 8 p.m. 8 o'clock in the evening? I see. Li Yun nodded, a mocking smile appeared at the corner of his mouth, it seemed that this mysterious person surnamed Yu. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose the host. Option 1, investigate the origin of the mysterious person behind M. Ol Yang, kill and capture them. Reward experience value plus 800,000, all attributes plus 1,500, golden gift bag asterisk 1, justice value plus 2,000. Option 2, do nothing, no reward. Option 3, escape from Zhonghai City, reward the upgrade of danger perception, and the two girls of the palace will be killed by the enemy. Okay? Li Yun frowned deeply. Sure enough. The person M. Ol Yang wanted to meet was not simple, he should be a strong person no less than the old man Tianyin, 
otherwise he would not reward so many things. With a full attribute of up to 1,500, Li Yun looked greedy. King Yu, Lian Yi. Li Yun looked at the two women and said in a serious tone, I plan to investigate the people behind Emol Yang, how about you? This operation is very dangerous, so you should think carefully. Of course we will go together. Gong King Yu said naturally, Auntie Lian, right. Okay. Gong Lian Yi nodded lightly and said nothing, but Li Yun could feel her determination in her gentle eyes. Well, we will act together this time. Li Yun is not a mother-in-law. Since he has decided to fight, he should be fully prepared. The so-called preparation, of course, is to upgrade with experience points and open gift bags. System, add all my experience to attribute points. Ding, consume 1 million experience points get a total of 3,251 points. Li Yun gave a wry smile. Originally, 10,000 experience points would be able to obtain nearly a hundred attribute points, but now his cultivation is in the late days of the day after tomorrow, only one million experience has gained such a point. But it went well. After his nine sons' heavenly scriptures rose to a high level, his cultivation base had reached the late stage of the acquired day, and now he added many attributes, Li Yun felt that he had reached the realm of acquired consummation. Last time I opened the gift bag, there were still two medium-sized jidens left. Li Yun ate them all and added another 2,000 attribute points. This time, it was properly acquired and completed, and only one step would be enough to enter the innate realm. The biggest difference between the innate realm and the acquired realm is that in addition to becoming more pure and vigorous, there is another important feature, that is, the innate real qi is endless as long as the consumption is not great, it can be used all the time. In addition, the innate true chi can emit a sword energy several meters long, and its power is quite amazing. It's better for me to rise to the innate realm this time, but how can I break through? Others want to break through the innate from the acquired, they need the right time and place, and after making sufficient preparations, they will make a breakthrough again. Theoretically speaking, the vitality of the body is the most vigorous in the 12-year-old and 25-year-olds, and the easier it is to break through the innate. Over the age of 40, the human body gradually ages, the internal organs are aging, and the vitality is dissipated. It is almost impossible to break through the innate. But Li Yun is different. With the system plug-in, he can easily break through, which is easier than eating and drinking. When Gong Lianyi and the two women were going to prepare equipment for battle, Li Yun took out a pill that he had obtained a long time ago in the inventory. Skill Dan, upgrade any skill by one level. Yes, Li Yun intends to upgrade the advanced Nine Sun scriptures to master level and break through to the innate realm in one fell swoop. Although it's a pity that it can't be used at the master level of the Nine Suns, but now it can't manage that much, it's important to improve its strength. In other words, the true chi in the human body seems to have a complementary relationship with my attributes. Li Yun played with skill pill, thinking about the connection between the two. Zhen chi is the manifestation of life chi in the human body, so theoretically speaking, the better the body, the stronger the zhen chi. The attribute point is to improve the human body from the root, enhance the physique, and strengthen the human body's tendons, bones, blood and flesh. Forget it, why are you entangled so much? Just eat it directly, it can improve your strength. Li Yun no longer hesitated, used the skill pill, obtained a skill pill, and directly added it to the Nine Suns. Ding, the host uses skill points, and the level of the Nine Suns scriptures has been improved. Current level, master level. Boom. An energetic force poured in from Li Yun's heavenly spirit cover, turning into a masculine torrent, rushing back and forth through the meridians in his body, widening and strengthening the originally small meridians, making the true energy stronger and moving faster faster. However, after this force flowed to Danchen, it slowly lurked in it and stopped moving. Li Yun slowly opened his eyes. He still didn't break through to Xian Tian, 
but it didn't seem to be bad. The true energy in his body increased by at least three times, more than ten times more than the ordinary acquired true energy. Fighting against the early stage of Xian Tian realm, he is also confident and capable of overpowering each other. Strange, is it possible to break through innate only after I have a higher attribute point? Then what realm am I now? It's stronger than the acquired consummation, the acquired limit. Li Yun couldn't understand it, so let it go and do the next thing he likes most. Open the treasure bag. Looking at the golden treasure bag in his inventory, Li Yun couldn't help but smile. One golden gift bag, five purple gift bags, plus a lot of blue, green, and white, I don't believe I can't open good things. System, open me ten blue plus ten white plus ten green gift bags. Li Yun boldly opened ten at a time. Ding, get three boxes of fruit, a bottle of eye drops, a kettle, a flashlight, a military dagger, a bucket of gasoline. Ding, get skincare and beauty pill too, small base building pill too, small detoxification pill, and small recovery pill asterisk too. Ding, congratulations to the host, get the purple item from the blue gift bag, amulet of exorcism. Ding, get 200 free attribute points. Among the mess of prompts, Li Yun prepared to see the purple prompt. My CAO. It's equipment. Li Yun slapped his thigh with excitement. The most precious thing that came out of the gift bag was not a skill pill or something else, the equipment was the strongest. He has now obtained a few pieces of equipment, and the effects are all against the sky, all of which are related to preventing various evil attacks. This is exactly what Li Yun needs. Amulet of Exorcism Effect Exorcising evil spirits and avoiding demons, to a certain extent, protect the person wearing it from evil spirits, ghosts, worms, and curses. Explanation, if you suffer an unstoppable attack, this amulet is immune to one fatal damage. Li Yun was basically satisfied with the effect of the exorcism amulet. With this thing, it should be able to prevent ordinary ghosts and goo worms. What's even better is that there is another immune attack function and its value has risen several steps. Although it is not as good as the Five Thunders exorcising evil jade pendant of the Golden Gift, it has the function of resisting damage five times against the sky, but it is a big surprise when it comes out of the Blue Gift bag. The only entanglement is, is this amulet for Gong King Yu or Gong Lian Yi. Keep driving. Hope to get another piece of equipment. Li Yun put his eyes down for the time being his eyes were on the five purple gift bags. Ding, get an intermediate Jiden. Pit. Ding, get an intermediate detoxification pill. Still a pit, these are all purple items. Li Yun gritted his teeth and chose to open all of them directly. Ding, get experience points plus 300,000, get master skills, calligraphy art, get an intermediate recovery pill. The corners of Li Yun's mouth twitched, this Nima's hopeless expectation, what is it all? Although the pill is very good, it is not what he urgently needs, which means it is of little use. The last one, the golden gift bag, open it for me. In an instant, the golden gift bag flew in front of Li Yun from the inventory, turned into a glittering lottery machine, and slowly began to rotate. One by one, Awesome objects flashed in front of Li Yun. God level skill pill, space ring, immortal mansion spirit card, crying stick, seven star sword. Just seeing the names of these items, Li Yun couldn't wait to reach out and pull them out of the lottery machine. Every piece of Nima was a great prize, enough to make him greedy. Gradually, the pointer stopped. Ding! Congratulations to the host for obtaining the golden equipment from the golden gift bag, Beifa Peachwood Sword. Li Yun raised his eyebrows, it was not bad, it was a golden gift bag, and he finally got what he wanted. This kind of feeling is like playing a game and opening a box. After opening a few hundred dollars, there is no gross, and finally I recharged a hundred, and finally the feeling is opened. Although it was very comfortable to drive, it was expected. 
Li Yun drew the peachwood sword from the scabbard and looked at it. The sword is one meter long and has a copper-colored sword body with blood-red charms engraved on it. Looking at it, there is a faint red light flashing, which is extraordinary. Beifu Peachwood Sword Special Effects Wearing this sword can kill evil spirits and ghosts, with long fortune, and place the mansion to avoid the intrusion of demons and ghosts. Description, Peachwood, the essence of five woods, also known as Immortal Wood, Descending Dragon Wood, has the functions of townhouse, fortune, and evil spirits. Li Yun was very satisfied. With this thing, Gong Lianyi, an innate late master, would not be helpless when facing zombie female ghosts. Li Yun. A soft voice came, and Li Yun looked up. It was a coincidence that Gong Lianyi was back. She changed into a tight-fitting suit suitable for combat, and wore a black cloak. The close-fitting clothing revealed Gong Lianyi's graceful and mature figure. In addition, Gong Lianyi was holding a sword in her hand, and her heroic appearance dilutes her charming appearance a lot. What? Gong Lianyi gave a light huh and looked at the peachwood sword in Li Yun's hand in surprise. If I remember correctly, Li Yun didn't have this thing in his luggage. Where did he get it? Haha, <laughs> Lianyi is so cute. Seeing her tilting her head and looking at it with questioning eyes, Li Yun couldn't help reaching out and scratching her little nose. Well, it's as warm as jade, and it feels great. Gong Lianyi's dignified face flushed, but did not blame Li Yun, let alone avoid it, letting Li Yun act on her. Attracted by her fox and charming appearance, and Gong Lianyi's blushing face was really beautiful, Li Yun couldn't help stepping forward, reaching out and covering the slender waist with Ying Ying's hand across her cloak. Li, Li Yun. Gong Lianyi's voice trembled, and the two eyes met, and Li Yun chuckled, Lianyi, can you? I. Gong Lianyi seemed hesitant, not knowing how to answer his question. Fortunately, the development of the matter did not make her too entangled, Gong King Ye walked in. Wait for your answer later, no hurry. Li Yun smiled and let go of Gong Lianyi, looking at his prospective wife, a flash of surprise flashed in his eyes. Gong King Ye put on the tights for battle like Gong King Ye. Although the girl's posture is not as mature as Gong Lianyi, she exudes a youthful smell, which makes people want to explore her mystery at this moment. What did you do just now? Gong King Yu glared at Li Yun with the look of a wife caught cheating her husband. I was opening the gift bag just now. Come on, I will give you each one something. Li Yun smiled and changed the subject, handing the peachwood sword to Gong Lianyi and the amulet to Gong King Yu. This is perfect for two beauties, one big and one small, one person and one outfit. What is this? Gong King Yu looked at the amulet over and over again. Although it looked very ordinary, she seemed to feel the difference. There were many runes painted on the amulet, which looked strange. Things that can protect you. Li Yun explained the role of these two things, and immediately both women smiled in surprise. If you say that, I can be immune to goo worms with amulet. Gong King Ye was very happy, because since Aunt Lian was hit by goo worms, she had been worried that she would also be recruited the two yin and yang corpses. The thief is disgusting, she doesn't want to touch it. Yes. Li Yun shrugged, but only those who are weaker are immune, and the stronger ones are not immune, but it should be enough. Hmm. Gong King Yu happily hugged Li Yun's arm, and couldn't help but tiptoe and kiss him on his face as a reward. My mahogany sword. Gong Lian Yi carefully drew out the peachwood sword, Carefully observing the lines on the wooden sword, she was shocked. She vaguely felt the extraordinary of this wooden sword, there seemed to be a kind of energy flowing on it, but she didn't know what kind of power it was. Li Yun, with it, I can kill the ghosts. Gong Lianyi is still in disbelief. She has heard that ordinary ghosts are very difficult to kill with ordinary methods, and only the true energy of the strong sun attribute can attack them. Kick in. Not bad. Li Yun smiled and said, wait for the enemy we are facing is extraordinary, 
naturally we must have professional weapons to deal with it. Gong Lianyi nodded fiercely, as happy as a girl, and said softly, Thank you, Li Yun. Then, how can you thank me? Li Yun made a joke, but Gong Lianyi took it seriously. Ah, this. Gong Lianyi's eyes were erratic, her face flushed with shame, but in the end she closed her eyes and leaned in front of Li Yun, and kissed the corner of his lips in a panic. She wanted to kiss her cheek, but closed her eyes. Not allowed there. The soft and fragrant Humiu sister's depressed petals made Li Yun especially enjoy, if you ignore the jealous gaze of Gong King Yu next to her. Ahem, let's go, lest M. O. Yang run away. Li Yun drove an inconspicuous car to the outskirts, and the two beauties in the back seat sat side by side, whispering to each other. Li Yun's ears heard some of their discussions. Sorry, King Yu, it's me. It's okay. There are several bastards. Besides, this way we can always be together, without being separated because of marriage, don't you feel bad about Auntie Lien? Uh, it's good, but... It's nothing, that is very powerful, he can deal with people in the family, you see that he knows all kinds of mysterious things, the origin is definitely not trivial. Okay, but I still... It's okay, don't tell her first he will be proud of the province. Li Yun vaguely listened to it. It seemed that Gong King Ye was reaching an agreement with her Aunt Lien. It's not a bad thing anyway. A faint smile appeared at the corner of Li Yun's mouth, and he quickly converged. The highway intersection ahead. After turning a corner, Li Yun drove the car into a fork in the road, the so-called Sunyang Road, where M. O. Yang and the mysterious man met but they didn't say where they met on the phone. Therefore, Li Yun drove the car to a roadside restaurant. It was still early, and M. O. Yang hadn't left yet, and Li Yun came here first to guard. Sun Yang Farmhouse Hotel After getting off the car, Gong King Yu glanced at the sign, and after wearing a disguise mask, a smile appeared on her not pretty face. She actually liked coming to these places with Li Yun. She had never had a chance to come before, and Aunt Lian refused to let her come to such a mess. Sure enough, Gong Lianyi showed a worried expression after seeing the restaurant. I don't know how hygienic the restaurant is, whether the food is clean. Go in, don't worry, I will let the boss disinfect a few more times later. Listening to her talk, Li Yun was a little bit dumbfounded. He didn't expect Gong Lianyi to be a mother-in-law. Is it because she cares too much about King Yu's health? Gong Lianyi closed her mouth obediently, seeing Gong King Yu wanting to laugh, and Aunt Lian had a nemesis. Well, nemesis is her future husband. The three, plus four bodyguards who followed, entered the hotel. The bodyguards were temporary deacons of the Gong family. Each of them had mid innate strength. Therefore, there were six innate masters in this operation plus Li Yun. People who are no less than innate are involved in action. The owner of the restaurant was very talkative, and Li Yun asked him to disinfect the tableware a few more times, so he really disinfected more. Seven people ordered a large table of dishes, and they didn't even look at the price of the dishes. The ostentatious profligacy made the boss happy, and the waiter must be sterilized seventeen or eight times so that the group of rich second-generation young ladies can eat with confidence. As soon as the boss left with a menu, Li Yun received the system prompt again. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose the host. Option 1, while waiting for the dishes to come, tease your girlfriend, brag, and reward skill, drinking table warrior. Option 2, sitting still as if silly, reward skills, frozen green, reward. Option 3, go to investigate the abnormal situation nearby, reward experience value plus 200,000, wisdom and agility plus 500, green gift bag asterisk 3. Li Yun almost didn't spit out his tea. Is there no option for the cheating system? Actually give such a funny option. You have an IQ of 250. However, 
the system reminded him that the mysterious person about Muliang met at Suniang Road instead of arbitrarily specifying a place. This Suniang Road is weird. I'm going to buy some drinks, you sit down. Li Yun casually found an excuse to stand up, and Gong King Yu said in surprise, didn't we order coconut milk? I want to drink tea. I ordered tea. Gong Lian said weakly. She likes tea, but she is not used to other drinks. Uh, anyway, sit down. Li Yun was helpless and had no choice but to prevaricate. He now seems to understand the pain of a married man going out to play at night, he has to deal with his wife's cross-examination. Walking towards the boss who was killing the fish, Li Yun pretended to be looking at the condition of the fish, and asked, Boss, is there any fun in your neighborhood? Interesting place. The boss, Monk Zhang Er, couldn't figure it out, and the fish-killing action was a bit slow, but he didn't dare to offend the local tyrant and he quickly slapped a few locations, such as Longshan, Fengqi, Lingchuan, and even highway intersections that he portrayed as international flights. The focus of gathering is incredible. In fact, there is a funny ghost on the outskirts of Zhonghai City. The guests who come here are all long-distance drivers, or people who drive out at night for a ride, and by the way, eat supper at a restaurant. Li Yun didn't mean to do this, shook his head and said, what you said is very ordinary. What I want to ask is, is there a place that is thrilling, exciting, and exciting enough? Oh. A thrilling place. The boss showed a suddenly realized expression. Nowadays young people are playing wildly, such as parkour, extreme sports, surfing, cave exploration, and so on. The boss lowered his head and thought, there really is such a place near here. His voice turned low as if to say something terrible secret. Gong Qingyu and Gong Lianyi came together behind Li Yun and watched what he wanted to do. Oh! Li Yun became interested, what kind of place is it? Mental hospital! Mental hospital! Gong Qingyu exclaimed, and many waiters turned their heads to look at this place one after another. Some people's expressions became unnatural, as if they knew this place. Yes! it's the mental hospital. The boss nodded and began to tell the history of the mental hospital. This mental hospital is called Jushin Psychiatric Hospital, which was established more than 40 years ago. In the beginning, it only accepted some ordinary mentally ill patients, and then slowly transformed into a hospital with severe mental illnesses. Detention. Li Yun was a little surprised. Yes, detention. The boss said plausibly, those mental patients are all resting when they become ill. They have the tendency to kill and self-mutilate in their eyes. Isn't that detention? So serious? Yes indeed. The boss said mysteriously, I heard that some mental patients are schizophrenic and have some evil personalities. They laugh like they are in a horror movie, very strange. Think about it, most of your friends the time is good but once you get sick, you will laugh at your back and even pick up a knife and slash you frantically. Isn't it scary? Gong Qingyu shuddered. Some waiters in the distance couldn't stand it anymore and hurriedly shouted, Boss, the old site of that mental hospital is near our hotel. Don't scare us. Hee <laughs> hee. The boss closed his mouth with interest. Li Yun asked, the old site of the mental hospital? Did it mean it moved? No. The boss shook his head, twenty years ago, a fire burned the mental hospital, as well as several surrounding factories. It is far from the city. The firefighting team cannot make it through. The fire was so high that it was too late to save. Burned out. Li Yun frowned and asked, not only was it burned, but many people died, right? The boss's face was stagnant and his expression began to become unnatural. After Li Yun's questioning, he said something that shocked everyone. How many people died? Hey, not many people escaped at all. What? Everyone was taken aback. There are hundreds of people in a mental hospital, plus doctors and nurses, all died in a fire? Gong Qingyu asked in astonishment, 
why didn't you see the news after so many people died? Because no one cares. The boss shrugged, mental patients, it's terrible. If their family cares, they won't be sent to a mental hospital. Lee Yoon pondered, is this a coincidence? Or is there any inside story? Gong Lian Yi muttered, I have read in the book that mental patients who are seriously ill will have certain isolation measures. If there is a sudden fire, it is indeed difficult to escape. Especially more than 20 years ago, when the various safety measures were not in place and there were no fire extinguishers, it was almost impossible to put out a fire in time. Yes. The boss nodded, I heard that a patient suddenly fell ill, and then lit the kerosene lamp, and the whole building burned quickly. Yes, yes, I saw it with my own eyes. An elderly waiter, covering his mouth with his hand, whispered, after the fire started, many people went to watch. I saw with my own eyes many patients on the floor under the night. Running around, but there is no way, it's too miserable. She ended with a terrible sentence. Gong King Yu seemed to see the human body being burned by the fire. She was scared in her heart, and her body couldn't help getting closer to Li Yun. Nonsense. Another waiter interrupted, I heard that the dean was embezzling, but I couldn't hide it, so I burned the mental hospital and the only thing I could not find was his body. You just said nonsense, the fire was so fierce, maybe the dean's body was burnt to ashes. I've heard another saying that an evil spirit called for his life. It was said by a mental patient who escaped. He always heard screams at night. Ghost? Nonsense, you said you are a mental patient, how can you believe his words? Everyone was talking about it. The mental hospital was originally a taboo, and it was rarely discussed. Now Li Yun has opened up their conversation. Li Yun smiled and said, Boss, what you said about the thrilling thing is to go to the mental hospital to explore at night. Gong King Yu suddenly became nervous, Are you kidding? Go exploring at night where hundreds of people have died tragically? No no no. The boss hurriedly waved his hand, and said embarrassingly, I wanted you to go on an adventure before, but now I still advise you not to go that place is really evil. Oh? What an evil way. I know this. The former ant waiter interrupted and said, in the first two years, there were also a few college students who came to explore on weekends and talked about live broadcasting in the evening. But the next day I saw the news and said that there were five college students and only one came out. The spirit is still out of order. Hiss. Some people who had never heard of the news took a sigh of relief. The boss was even more embarrassed. He even said that he didn't mean that, and urged Li Yun not to go exploring, for fear that his second generation would have an accident and his family would come to trouble him. At this time. Boss, is my takeaway ready? Li Yun turned his head and looked over and found that the person here was not just a delivery man's costume with a yellow robe, but a normal dress and even a little sullen. He is about 30 years old, with tattoos on his arms and chest, and a scar on his face. He has a fierce temperament. Such people also deliver food? Strange. Gong King Yu said, is anyone in the outskirts of Zhonghai City ordering takeout? Okay? Li Yun woke up in an instant, this place is not an urban area, there are many residential buildings around but they don't order takeaways. The tattooed takeaway glared at Gong King Yu and shouted, Where is there so much bullshit? I can give it to the workers in the nearby vegetable shed, can't it? Gong King Yu raised an eyebrow, but in the end he was not angry. She doesn't bother to be familiar with such people. Li Yun glanced at Gong King Yu. She was now in a state of disguise, and her original stunning face was covered up. Otherwise, the food delivery person would definitely not dare to drink her. I know a lot of greenhouse vegetables in the suburbs of Zhonghai City, but the average migrant workers cook their own meals. Li Yun said with a smile. Grass. The tattoo takeaway screamed again, pointing to Li Yun's nose and swearing. The boss quickly stood up and said, Brother Zhou, your takeaway is ready. I'll treat you tonight. 
No money, no money. The tattoo takeaway Zhou Guangfu turned his anger into joy and whistled, If you know the boss, you have a lot of nonsense from the guests here. I will spare them once for the sake of your face, not for example. After all, Zhou Guangfu left with the takeaway bag. Li Yun observed it visually, and it was estimated that it was a takeaway for three people. Boss, has this person been ordering takeout here? To whom? In fact, Zhou Guangfu just now can be said to be his own takeaway, which means taking it home to eat by himself, rather than giving it to others. But Gong King Yu said, who orders the takeaway? Zhou Guangfu immediately said it was for someone else. It can be seen that he always gave it to others instead of eating it himself. I wonder who he gave it to. The owner spread out his hands. He has ordered takeaways from me for three years. From the first day I opened, I would definitely come to take takeaways every noon and evening. At first I thought there were casinos and factories nearby, but he ordered there were too few takeaways, so I ordered for two. Two people. Li Yun asked immediately, is it just a takeaway for three people? It's for three people. I only started ordering three people last week. Li Yun nodded slowly, and calmly said to the two women, I'm going out to get some air. Gong Lian Yi saw his intentions and wanted to keep up, but was afraid that King Yi would stay here alone, so she had to say, you have to be careful. Don't worry, I'll walk around, I'm tired from driving. Li Yun smiled and walked outside the door. Gong King Yu had a weird face, took Aunt Lian's arm, and smiled secretly in her ear, Aunt Lian, you are about the same as the husband whom a young wife asked to go out just now. Wife, husband. Gong Lian Yi was so ashamed that she stretched out her hand angrily and squeezed Gong King Yu's smooth jade face, Xiao Yu Yu, you are naughty again, let's see how Aunt Lian cleans up you. Wow. Forgive me Aunt Lien, he he. The laughter and noise of the two women dissipated the weird atmosphere in the store. The boss glanced at the sisters enviously, and thought to himself that the rich second generation would really play. Although these sisters do not look very good, they are exquisite and beautiful, with elegant and charming temperament, and their skin is white and smooth, making them look no worse than an eight-pointer woman. When Li Yun went out of the hotel, his car was parked outside, and after pretending to sit in the car for a while, Li Yun quietly escaped into the darkness. It was seven o'clock in the evening, and the sky hadn't completely dimmed, but the suburbs were vague, and the shadows of the people could not be seen clearly, and it was even more terrifying. It didn't take long for Li Yun to catch up with the figure in front of him carrying the takeaway. Old man, when I'm done, you guys have a play. Grass. Bring enough money tonight, I have money to gamble with you. Zhou Guangfu held a cell phone to chat with others by voice. Li Yun heard his tone as if he was going to play cards with someone at night. It's just, to whom does he deliver the food? Li Yun looked around. The sky near the night was very dim, and there were no people within a few kilometers. Li Yun could not see the village except for a circle of residential buildings near the road. No greenhouses for growing vegetables were even found, and the surrounding area was completely empty. Zhou Guangfu didn't ride an electric bike, but walked along the trail, chatting with people constantly on the road. Li Yun immediately noticed one thing. Zhou Guangfu didn't use his mobile phone to illuminate him. Obviously he was very familiar with this section of the road. It is estimated that he could find his destination with moonlight. Zhou Guangfu, who are you delivering food to? The conjecture in Li Yun's heart became stronger and stronger, and soon, the dilapidated buildings that appeared before confirmed his ideas. Zhou Guangfu is delivering food to the mental hospital. Moreover, this mental hospital was destroyed in a fire twenty years ago, and hundreds of people died in it. It is a very strange mental hospital. Zhou Guangfu, are you delivering food to ghosts? Fairy Bao Sylvan. Li Yun took out his pistol from the inventory. The silver white metal texture calmed his a little nervous heart. Because the mental hospital in front of me is really scary. The mental hospital is very large. 
The main body has four buildings, all of which are five stories high. In addition, there are also facilities such as a canteen and a playground, but it has long been abandoned, with overgrown weeds and abnormal decline. These buildings stood in the dark, without a trace of light showing through, as if they were sleeping ghosts, they looked very scary. Li Yun glanced at this place. These buildings have one characteristic, that is, they are all dark and the traces of the fire are clearly visible. Grass. Zhou Guangfu in front of him cursed in a low voice, his body shivered, and he seemed to be afraid of coming here. It's paralyzed, I have delivered takeaway for ten years, this horrible place, or is, cheating, I must win money. I'm not doing this torturous job. Li Yun heard Zhou Guangfu murmur an unclear sentence, and then he kicked open the door of the mental hospital and let out a harsh clang. Three idiots, come get the takeaway. Zhou Guangfu shouted inside. This voice became more and more weird in the empty night. Moreover, Zhou Guangfu was still shouting at a long deserted and empty mental hospital towards the night. What's more weird is that he still has a takeaway in his hand. My CAO. Li Yun couldn't help swearing in his heart. This Nima's replacement was an ordinary person. She had long been scared by Zhou Guangfu's neurotic performance and made her legs numb. She crawled and fled here. Who the saw this supernatural? Things are not scared? Zhou Guangfu is more than 30 years old. Could it be that he also experienced what happened 20 years ago and left a psychological shadow on it, leading to the delivery of food every night? Still, some of his relatives were burned to death in it, so Zhou Guangfu. Soon, a dark shadow came out of the mental hospital, overturning all Li Yun's previous thoughts. Grass, you idiot always wants me to call before he will come out. Zhou Guangfu scolded again. With the light of his mobile phone, Li Yun could clearly see the people who came to pick up the food. A muddy eyes, very dull, black and yellow skin, like a dirty man who has not had a bath for twenty years. Li Yun couldn't tell how old he was, because the man was covered with black mud all over his body. There were cracked lines on his face. He didn't know whether it was mud or wrinkles. In short, he was very dirty. Vomit. Zhou Guangfu retched, smelling the soaring odor of this man, his internal organs almost came out, and he couldn't help cursing. Three idiots, can't you take a bath? No matter how bad, coming out when it rains and rolling a few times in the mud is better than you are now. Li Yun gave a chuckle. These three fools are so delicious, they are really amazingly dirty. The three idiots were not angry even after being scolded, a smirk appeared on their faces, looking at Zhou Guangfu dementia, saliva came out. Grass. Zhou Guangfu resisted the nausea and approached him, handed the takeaway bag to him, and said, You take it away, I can't stand your scream. Hey, okay, okay, hee hee. The three fools took the takeaway happily, without looking back, jumping into the mental hospital like a child. Moreover, it is a psychiatric hospital that has been abandoned for twenty years, and the outside world has always thought that there is no one living in it. Li Yun took a deep breath. The selection event of the system was indeed correct. Zhou Guangfu, the three fools, the mental hospital, the mysterious man, and perhaps the fire that happened twenty years ago, there must be some connection between these people and things. Hidden in the dark, seeing Zhou Guangfu's angry expression, Li Yun moved in his heart and thought of an idea. Nima's, this fool is quite suitable to live in a mental hospital. Zhou Guangfu finished the task tonight, feeling relaxed, couldn't help but smiled and scolded the three fools, and turned around to go out. But at the moment he turned his head, he seemed to see a white figure, flashed by with a scream, and Zhou Guangfu was so frightened that his whole body froze. What, what? Zhou Guangfu's cold sweat dripped from his forehead, his face was pale, and it took a while before he reacted. He tremblingly touched his pocket with his right hand, holding a string of Buddhist beads tightly in his hand. Don't, don't be afraid, I am young and energetic and I have the consecrated Buddha beads from Tianlin Temple at a high price. 
Will I be afraid of you monsters? Two. A voice came from not far away, the cold sweat on Zhou Guangfu's forehead, this voice is? Two. There was another dull sound, Zhou Guangfu understood it now, it was the sound of a kitchen knife cutting the bone. Two. The sound of chopping bones with a kitchen knife for the third time sounded, and Zhou Guangfu trembled with fright. This kitchen knife, cut human bones, right? In the dark night, in the mental hospital, someone cut a human bone with a kitchen knife? Zhou Guangfu's face changed uncertainly, and finally he became fierce. He stretched out his hand and took out a folding knife. He opened it with a stern sound, his face was fierce, and he strode with the knife under his feet to the place where the sound was made, and shouted. I have been sending late night takeaways for more than ten years, so I am afraid of you evil things. I am full of vitality, and I have the ability to show me out. There was no one there. He he he. An unidentified male and female laughter sounded, which was chilling in the middle of the night. Zhou Guangfu could no longer pretend to be. In this way, he used his hands and feet together, and crawled, crying and crying to escape from the mental hospital. Li Yun, who was hiding, smiled faintly and ran after him. However, Zhou Guangfu didn't get far, so he rode an electric car on the side of the road not far away and drove to a village with lights on. Li Yun also vaguely heard that Zhou Guangfu yelled like crazy, Don't come to me, it's not that I killed you, it's none of my business. Ding, the host has made a choice, and the reward has been issued. Hearing the prompt from the system, Li Yun nodded secretly, did not return to the mental hospital, and went directly to the hotel. On the way, Li Yun thought about it and inferred from the information just now that there were people in the mental hospital, and there was more than one. In addition, Zhou Guangfu had never seen a ghost or a ghost, and seemed to simply deliver food to the past, but unfortunately there was no time to question him. Li Yun Seeing him coming back, Gong Qingyu's eyes lit up, immediately let go of holding Aunt Lian's hand stood up to meet him, her eyes were full of questioning meanings, how? Okay. Li Yun nodded, but didn't say much. There are many people here, it is not a place for chatting, Gong King Yu had to pout his mouth and sit down with him. There was nothing for a while. After the table full of food came up, everyone ate and chatted normally, but everyone did not drink, which made the boss feel a little strange. The rich second generation who played so wild, didn't actually drink? When the time came to 7.50, a temporary bodyguard whom Gong King Yu called Uncle Zhou said, Miss, he is here. Everyone didn't speak, the person Uncle Zhou pointed at was Emil Yang. After a while, Uncle Zhou looked at the phone and said with a weird expression, he just happened to come to us, and there was no indication on the phone where to meet. Gong Lianyi and Gong Qingyu both looked at Li Yun, waiting for his decision. Li Yun leisurely took a piece of fish with his chopsticks, and slowly chewed it in his mouth, don't worry, I already know where he is going, there are not many of them, there are only two or three people, just wait. Good. X2. The four uncles Zhou saw this situation in their eyes, and when they looked at each other, they could see the helplessness in each other's eyes. It was not long before Li Yun came to the palace, and he was still a guest, but he took away the leadership position that belonged to Gong Lianyi or Gong Qingyu, occupied the absolute command power, and fascinated the two golden flowers of the palace. Seems like two waitresses and one husband. But what made Uncle Zhou and others feel uncomfortable was that they could not find a reason to object. After all, Li Yun cured Gong Lianyi and he explained the knowledge of goo-worms and zombies, leading them to fight against the mysterious people who manipulated goo-worms. I hope everything Li Yun said is true, otherwise. Uncle Zhou still didn't quite believe him in his heart, and goo-worms were fine, they were just certain insects, but isn't it nonsense about zombies? They would never believe it before they saw it in person. Boss. Soon, Emil Yang's figure appeared at the door of the hotel. He did not come in, but stood at the door and shouted inside the store, Who is the boss? 
Li Yun picked up the cup, took a sip of the drink, and took a look at M. Yang through this action. M. Yang's look was very bad, his eyes were bloodshot, and his expression was tired. It seemed that he could not eat well and couldn't sleep well these days. I, I am. The boss greeted him enthusiastically, guest, do you want to order? Don't order. M. Yang was a little impatient, and drew out a hundred yuan bill and threw it to him, my car will be placed in front of the door first, and I will come back later, you will take care of me first. Hey? Oh. The boss glanced at him suspiciously, moved in his heart, and asked, do you want to visit a mental hospital as a guest? Broke in. Li Yun's expression changed. Didn't the boss's words just reveal that they also want to go to the mental hospital? Gong Lianyi seemed to have thought about this problem too, and her expression became a little anxious. Fortunately, M. O. Yang is now in a mess. He didn't hear the problem. He cursed irritably, there is a mental hospital here? Who the is going to the mental hospital in the middle of the night? M. O. Yang went out to call, Li Yun beckoned to the boss to come over, and said implicitly that the boss should not tell M. O. Yang about them. Although the boss was puzzled, the customer was God, and Li Yun also ordered a thousand yuan meal, so he agreed with interest. What? Mental hospital. M. O. Yang, who was standing outside the door, yelled, causing everyone in the hotel to look at him. Are you sure it's a mental hospital? Most of the night, this, okay. When he hung up the phone, M. O. Yang was so angry that he cursed again. Li Yun looked at his expression and it seemed that if it weren't for the phone, he might have thrown it. Boss. M. O. Yang walked in again and asked very unhappy, is there a mental hospital here? How do I get there? The boss's expression is wonderful. He had already guessed the purpose of Li Yun and others, and estimated that the target was not a mental hospital, but M. O. Yang. But M. O. Yang, why did he go to a mental hospital? For a moment, the boss felt an invisible dark cloud covering his small restaurant. At the same time, there was another invisible strange cloud covering the mental hospital where more than 100 people died. At the same time, an invisible crisis is approaching quietly. What is the truth of the matter? Look forward to 7 o'clock tonight. Boss. M. O. Yang impatiently interrupted the boss's cranky thinking, and shouted, What can I ask you? How do I get to the mental hospital? Mental hospital. The boss recovered, and subconsciously said, It has been abandoned for twenty years, why are you going there? Twenty years wasted. M. O. Yang took a breath, only to feel that there was a chill in his spine, from head to toe in an instant. You sure? Correct. The boss began to tell the history of the mental hospital again. As he talked, M. O. Yang stopped him drinking, and his lips trembled and said, Don't, don't talk nonsense. Hundreds of people have died. The college students are also dead. You, you? Am I a fool? After finishing speaking, he picked up the phone and called, and said in a pleasing tone, You, you adults, are you sure you want me to go to the mental hospital? Stop talking. Li Yun vaguely heard the adult's voice coming from the microphone of his mobile phone, but it was not really true, come, the antidote, birth, not come, only death. When the other party hung up the phone, M. O. Yang's entire face became darkened to the bottom of the pot, as if he wanted to cry without tears. This night, a person went to a mental hospital alone, not to mention that the hospital has been abandoned for a long time and still alive and ordinary people would never go to a mental hospital at night. A place like a mental hospital is too evil. Similarly, there are cemeteries, crematoriums, hospital morgues, etc. These places are very evil both day and night. But M. O. Yang had to go. He took out the flashlight from the car with a bitter face, and walked towards the mental hospital one by one. Boss, let's leave for now. Li Yun stood up immediately, and several people also stood up and walked out of the door. Hey, wait, are you going there too? 
The boss hurried to catch up, but saw Li Yun pull out a small blue book and show it in front of him. Hold, hold a gun license. After the boss saw it clearly, he immediately closed his mouth obediently, and said with a smile, Please, please, I will not disturb you, he he. Li Yun smiled and wanted to take the credentials back, but Gong King Yu snatched it away. Ah? Is this true? Gong King Yu looked at it repeatedly and asked curiously. Yes, really. This certificate was legally handled by Li Yun, with the help of Liao Hua, a big leader, and the care of various leaders of Zhonghai City. The certificate was handled smoothly. Although it is not a big deal, it can at least prove Li Yun's official identity now, saving a lot of trouble. Li Yun took back his credentials, Gong Lianyi asked Zhou Shu and several others to take the prepared bags. The seven took advantage of the night and quietly followed behind Emil Yang. Because there were too many people, Li Yun asked Zhou Shu and the four people to follow far behind, as a mobile force, and did not show up first. Not long after, Li Yun once again came to the door of the burned mental hospital. This, is the hospital where more than a hundred people died. Gong King Yu leaned against Li Yun nervously, and the few dark buildings in front of her were a bit scary to her. She felt a panic when she thought that so many people had died here, and they were all burned to death. If Li Yun and Aunt Lian were not by their side, she would definitely not dare to come here at night. Ahead, Emo Yang took a flashlight to the left and right of the mental hospital. He plucked up the courage and walked forward several times, but he dared not go inside. Li Yun Gong Lianyi, like King Yu, leaned half of her body on Li Yun, and asked quietly, Will there be ghosts in the hospital? Ghost, Wu. Gong King Yu put his mouth on her mouth nervously, for fear that she would startle Emo Yang with an exclamation. Li Yun smiled and whispered, It's normal to have ghosts, but didn't I give you something to deal with ghosts? Don't worry. We are not afraid of ghosts no matter how strong they are. Then, will there be zombies? Gong King Yu's big clear eyes flashed with inexplicable brilliance. It's like a person is afraid of watching ghost movies, but can't help but want to watch it. There is a saying that the more people who are afraid of ghosts, the more they like to watch ghost movies. Perhaps. Where is the female ghost? There must be. Hey? What about the zombies? After asking Li Yun several questions in a low voice, Gong King Yu finally showed a smile on her face, her beautiful eyes filled with smiles, and she began to look forward to the action tonight. Gong Lian Yi took a few deep breaths and calmed down. In fact, she was quite curious about these unreasonable things. Of course, the premise for all this is that Li Yun is by his side, otherwise the two of them would definitely not dare to come to a place like a mental hospital at night. M. O. Yang is going in. Li Yun and the two girls hid in the messy weeds, watching M. O. Yang wandering at the door for a long time before finally plucking up the courage to step into the gate of the mental hospital. Damn, you die, I don't believe there are ghosts in this world. M. O. Yang cursed loudly, emboldened himself, and strode forward. After thinking about it, he stopped again and played a song with his mobile phone. The vast horizon is my love, and the flowers are blooming at the foot of the endless green hills. What kind of rhythm is the most swaying? The cheerful tune of singing echoed in this dilapidated mental hospital, and in an instant, the dark atmosphere around was dispelled a lot. Puff puff puff. Gong King Yu suffocated a smile. She felt that this song could at least be called a sacred song a chanting chant that can dispel demons and ghosts. Let's go in too. Li Yun whispered, and followed M. O. Yang with his waist. The three of them were wearing black clothes, their faces were also covered with black masks, and their whereabouts were hidden, making it extremely difficult to be spotted in the dark night. After entering the gate of the mental hospital, Li Yun glanced at the guard room. The walls are already covered with vines, the guard room is messy and dirty, and various debris is piled up, and the peculiar smell of decay is blowing. The guard room is probably the only place in the entire mental hospital that has not been burned. 
walking into the mental hospital, there is a playground in front. The basketball hoop has collapsed. The original concrete floor is cracked with many lines, like spider webs, covered with moss and weeds. Fortunately, there is a stone road. Make noise. Grass, what the is this? M. Ol Yang's heart was beating wildly in front of him, swallowed, stretched his feet and kicked a scorched basketball with only half left, cursing in his mouth, pretending to be calm, but his eyes looked around and looked around. The basketball made a trajectory in midair and hit the wall of a building with a bang. In the silent night, in this deserted mental hospital, it seemed extremely harsh. Wow, ah! Suddenly, a hoarse cry sounded, and a black figure suddenly rushed out of the blackened building in front, and rushed towards the basketball quickly. M. Ol Yang was so frightened that he screamed, turned around and fled. Judging from the performance of his mobile phone falling to the ground, Li Yun estimated that his pants were already wet. But his arms were also held tightly by Gong King Ye's two women. Judging from the strength, these two beauties were also very scared. Li, Li Yun, what is this? Don't be afraid, this is a human, not a monster. Li Yun held one arm in one hand. The two women were graceful with slender waists and soft posture, plus the delicate bodies that trembled slightly when they were scared. They were really wonderful, which made Li Yun very enjoyable. No wonder boys like to take their girlfriends to horror movies. People. Yes, it is a person, it should be a nearby resident, or a person in a mental hospital twenty years ago. Li Yun whispered to them about Zhou Guangfu's delivery of food to the three fools. At the same time, M. Ol Yang in front had also reflected that this shadow was not a monster, but a mental patient. It's miserable. Gong Lian Yi couldn't bear to see the dirty three fools holding the basketball. Hastily. M. Ol Yang became angry, and a speeding run kicked the three idiots fiercely, and kicked him to the ground, damn, where did you get this crazy? Damn it, hiding in the mental hospital in the middle of the night, looking for death. The three fools were kicked and rolled around on the ground, but clung to the basketball tightly, babbling and talking, as if this basketball was very important to him. Li Yun said in a cold voice, another person who commits sins and cannot live. Li Yun sentenced M. Ol Yang to death in his heart, and only waited until it was over before fixing him, let him be arrogant for now. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose from the host. Option 1, investigate the origin and life experience of the three fools, figure out the hidden secrets behind them, properly place him, reward justice value plus 1000, free attribute points plus 1000, purple gift 1, extra reward recovery dan 1. Option 2, ignore, no reward. Trigger selection event again. Li Yun frowned. These three fools should have something to do with the mental hospital, and they also have a certain connection with Master Yu who is hiding here. But now he is very entangled, whether to investigate the three fools first, or follow M. Ol Yang, and then come back later? While he was thinking, M. Ol Yang picked up the phone on the ground and called the mysterious Master Yu again. Beep beep. The phone rang for a long time but no one answered him, causing M. Ol Yang's stomach to become angry. He took the poison of that adult, and if he couldn't find him tonight, his life would not be guaranteed. Therefore, he ignored the three fools and chose to walk around in the mental hospital, shouting while walking. Although the three fools were stupid, they were humans after all, which made M. Ol Yang bolder. Gong King Ye wanted to stand up, but saw Li Yun motionless, he couldn't help but squat down again, and asked in a low voice, Li Yun, shall we not follow? No hurry. Li Yun smiled slightly, the other party wants to hide and seek with us, then we will play with him. Okay. Gong King Ye didn't quite understand what Li Yun meant, but Gong Lian Ye was a little thoughtful. M. Ol Yang came to meet with the mysterious person, but the other party did not show up now. Did he notice them? We keep up with him. The three fools held the basketball and put it back on the playground. A man walked back to the building dementially. 
Li Yun chose to follow. The two women naturally had no objection and followed him. On the way, Li Yun took a look. This basketball was half burned, which looked very strange. Because it is difficult to light a basketball, and once it is ignited, it cannot be naturally extinguished. There is half of the basketball left, which means it was rescued. The three fools didn't go upstairs, but got into the dark first floor, as if it was his residence. Without the light, Li Yun couldn't see what was going on inside. He was about to get closer, but the peachwood sword in Gong Lianyi's hand trembled. Buzzing. A buzzing sound came from the peachwood sword, Gong Lian pulled it out subconsciously, and then, her eyes became extremely sharp, and she looked at the flower bed in front of the corridor. Who is watching? Gong Lianyi was very determined, swinging the peachwood sword, sending out a white sword aura, and hitting the weeds in the flower bed. With a scream, the weeds were swept away, and the swift sword aura hit a two-finger-sized insect. The insect could not even make a sound and was cut into two pieces on the spot. Gu Worm Gong King Yu immediately panicked. Li Yun patted her delicate shoulders to show comfort, and calmly walked to the worm to observe. Li Yun could not recognize this Gu Worm in fact, he only recognized two or three Gu Worms. This worm was wide, had a large mouth, and had a hole in the abdomen. It had wings like a bee, and it was strangely shaped. What is the usage? I fiddled with the corpse with a stick, and there was no poisonous gas spilling out. After a comprehensive judgment, Li Yun probably understood the purpose of the bug. King Yu, Lian Yi, let's hide it first. The three of them immediately hid, and the three fools were indifferent to what had happened just now, and they had not moved since entering his dark residence. Li Yun asked Gong King Yu to notify Zhou Shu and others to suspend the operation and wait for news. The three of them jumped to the second floor of the floor where the three fools were, and squatted down behind the fence, condescendingly monitoring the movement of the ground. This building has been burnt to black, and the three of them were smeared with stains when they approached. Of course, it is not the time to entangle this. Concealment is the most important thing. Waited for a long time. There was no movement in the mental hospital, except for a crescent moon and a few stars, and the abandoned hospital was silent. No one. Gong King Yu mentioned her throat with a heart, but she didn't worry too much, because the Beifu Peachwood Sword given to Aunt Lien by Li Yun was able to warn them, which meant that they could find the trail of the enemy. Is also dark. Both sides will see who can hold their breath. O.M. The Beifu Peachwood Sword shook again, Gong Lianyi seemed to feel something, looked towards a path, and whispered, Li Yun, there. The warning range of the Mahogany Sword is quite large. Well, don't worry, see who he is. Li Yun was holding the Sylvan Pistol in his hand, and he was also a little surprised why the Beifu Peachwood Sword could warn, but his colorful pistol could not. In the end, it can only be attributed to the fact that the Sylvan Pistol specializes in attack, while the Peachwood Sword needs to cooperate with the Innate Master to have combat effectiveness. There is a difference between the two. Strictly speaking, the characteristics of Sylvan Infinite Bullets are indeed very strong. Although it takes one hour to charge the bullet. Coming. With his keen eyes, Li Yun was the first to see a vague black shadow slowly drifting over. He couldn't see if he was flying, or was it because the black robe was too big to cover his feet? But in the dark night, the appearance of this shadow can be described as scary as a ghost. Gong King Yu's breathing suddenly became a lot quicker. Li Yun noticed this, so he held her little hand tightly. Gong King Yu glanced at him with a touched look, and then slowly calmed down. Gong Lian tightly held the Beifu Peachwood sword that buzzed as a warning. Fortunately, the sound was very soft, even softer than a cricket's cry, and could not be transmitted below. And it shook for a while, and Dao Mujian seemed to feel the master's heart, and soon quieted down. The black shadow was hidden in the distance, and after observing the three fool's door for less than two seconds, he quickly disappeared into the dark night. He also hid. Li Yun's mouth twitched, 
revealing a playful smile. Things are getting more and more interesting. Both sides know that the other party has come, and both hide themselves. Now it's up to whoever reveals his feet first. In other words, one party took the lead to escape from this mental hospital. Gonglian thoughtfully, the bug was placed in front of the three fools' door for warning. So, the person I sent to follow Emol Yang has already been known to them, and it was specially brought us here tonight. Gong King Ye bit her lip, she also thought of this. As long as you enter the mental hospital, you can quickly discover the existence of the three fools. Based on this psychology, the other party planted goo worms in front of his door and waited for an opportunity to sneak attack. It's a pity that Li Yun has a Beifu Peachwood sword for early warning. The other party's conspiracy is useless. It's okay, don't worry. Li Yun smiled and said confidently, if you want to play Yin, they can't play with us, and they don't have the capital to play with us. Let's go downstairs. Downstairs. Gong King Ye felt safe on the condescending second floor, perhaps because the first floor was overgrown with weeds and did not know when a disgusting goo worm sprang out. Although there was a warning from the mahogany sword, the psychological nausea and disgust lingered. Let's go see the three fools. Li Yun took the two women down the stairs without directly jumping downstairs with light effort. For twenty years, a strange fire burned all the combustibles in the mental hospital. Fortunately, the overall structure of the floor was still there, and it seemed that some rooms were not burned. For example, the room where the three fools live now. The three of them entered the door of the three fools' room on the first floor in the dark. Gong King Yu immediately smelled a stinking stench, which was like a garbage dump that had been placed for more than twenty years, all kinds of rotten food and the accumulation of domestic garbage is simply challenging the endurance limit of human sense of smell. Vomit. Gong King Yu retched a few times. She only felt that her eyes were crying with the pungent smell, which can already be called a biochemical weapon. Li Yun said softly, You are waiting outside, I will go in and take a look. No, I can bear it, go in together. The two girls were not squeamish girls. Although they were disgusting, they persisted. At most they couldn't wait to see what was on the ground. They were sure that the room of the three fools was similar to the pigsty. Li Yun shook his head with a wry smile. He also felt sick, but he still had to do what he should do. Walking into the room, Li Yun lowered the brightness of the phone and took photos of the room. The walls here have not been burned, but they are also extremely dirty. Gong Lian Yi glanced at it accidentally, and almost couldn't help turning around and ran out. Even she couldn't stand it, showing the degree of dirtiness. Three fools! Li Yun yelled softly, and the three fools sat on a rusty chair, and didn't know what to say. There is a medical bed next to it. Looking at the messy layout of the room, Li Yun speculated that it was the original consultation room of the hospital. When he walked in front of the three idiots, Li Yun wanted to find something on the table to prove the origin of the three idiots, but the three idiots suddenly became excited, and pointed his finger at the other chair placed in front of him. He 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 said something in his mouth. What? Gong King Yu looked at Li Yun and only looked at the three fools from the corner of his eye. After seeing him like this, he said, Is the three fools used to be a doctor here, want Li Yun to sit in front of him to see you? Maybe. Li Yun ignored the three idiots, letting him scream like he he ho, anyway, he was crazy, even if he made a noise, it didn't matter. Taking out a dust-free diary on the table, Li Yun opened it and took a look. Compared with the facilities in the room, the laptop looks very new and very clean. Usually three fools estimate that it is well protected. What was written in the note was the medical record of a doctor named Su Houd, but the font was scribbled, and the three of Li Yun struggled to read it. On October 12, 1999, I was seeing a patient Zhang Hua who had an attack. The patient had only a mild mental disorder, but after taking the medicine for a week, his condition became serious. October 18th, record, Zhang Hua completely lost the ability to communicate, his eyes were dull, 
and his expression was in a trance. He did not respond to any external stimuli, just like a vegetable. On November 23, Dean Yu asked me to issue a diagnosis certificate and let me sign it, but I didn't agree. In 2019, on October 12, more and more people fell into sluggishness, and the situation gradually got out of control. October 12, 2020, I have a hunch that something will happen. There is a problem with this record. Gong Qingyu said angrily while holding her little nose. Okay. Li Yun nodded and read it back and forth several times, remembering all the contents inside. This condition record book reveals several information. First, before the fire started, Su Hout had already noticed something wrong. Secondly, the head of this mental hospital, Yu Li Sheng, was probably the Lord Yu that M. O. Yang said. If it was, the fire would definitely have no relationship with him. Third, a fire broke out on October 12. Finally, it is basically confirmed that the name of the three fools is Su Hout. Because this notebook is not the original record, but the three fools wrote it down a few years ago, the date is very messy, and it is even written to 2020. But on the 10th and 12th, he repeatedly recorded it, which shows that it is very important. Gong Lianyi whispered, Unfortunately, it has been too long, and now I know that these things are of no avail, three silly. Su Haud, shall we arrange him to be admitted to a mental hospital later? Li Yun nodded, but he was surprised, why didn't the system prompt to complete the selection event? Is there anything else to know? After looking around the room, Li Yun didn't find anything, because he was so disgusting that he didn't dare to carefully search through the messy rubbish. Strange, what is missing? Li Yun put his eyes on the system prompt again, and when he saw the final reward, he suddenly realized, it turns out that it is. Resolutely took out a small recovery pill, Li Yun forcibly gave it to the three fools, the latter couldn't resist, and everything in his mouth was swallowed instinctively. After eating, the sound of hee hee ho from the mouth of the three fools stopped. Li Yun frowned, isn't the small recovery pill not enough? The small recovery pills are already very strong and can treat most diseases, including cancer and AIDS. A medium-sized recovery pill, capable of surviving flesh and bones, and regenerating broken limbs, is too strong. As for the real recovery pill, Li Yun didn't have it on his body, showing how precious it was. Fortunately, a small recovery pill is enough. Uh, hem, hem, hem. The eyes of the three fools gradually returned to clarity. After a few coughs, he turned his head to look at Li Yun a little sluggishly. He wanted to say something but couldn't say it. Are you so hout? The three fools nodded subconsciously. Okay, we are the police inspector, don't worry, don't be afraid, let's go out first, wait for a while. Li Yun took the lead to go out, the three fools, no. Su Hao followed tremblingly, the expression on his face was no longer stupid, it became extremely complicated. As for the two girls, Gong King Yu, they ran outside the door to breathe, and the girls really couldn't stand the dirty environment for too long. Ding, the host has made a choice, and the rewards have been issued. Li Yun was taken aback, the system really asked him to save the three fools, but fortunately he realized it. All the free attribute points are spiritually, and the gift bag is not kept, just opened. Ding, congratulations to the host for obtaining purple grade equipment from the purple gift bag, ghost binding rope. I. CAO. Li Yun shouted out in surprise, and Gong King Yu quickly asked, What's wrong? Did you find anything? Haha, <laughs> yes. King Yu, I will give you a good thing. Good stuff. Li Yun smiled and took out the ghost binding rope and handed it to Gong King Yu. Both women looked very strange, Li Yun just reached out his hand to his back, but was able to draw out a long black rope. What is this rope? Although puzzled, Gong King Yu trusted Li Yun and held this weird rope in his hand. The rope is not short, about two and a half meters long, and it's black all over, 
and it feels a little cold to the touch. Gong King Yu can't recognize the texture of the rope, but can feel it's extraordinary. Is this dealing with ghosts? Gong King Yu looked at him in surprise, and her voice became a little louder. Fortunately, she quickly woke up and quickly lowered her voice. Not bad. Li Yun nodded with a smile, and told her the purpose of the ghost rope. Ghost rope. Special effects, flogging evil spirits and evil spirits, warding off evil spirits and removing demons. Explanation, this rope is made of 300-year-old Ling Vine. It is hard and flexible. It can withstand the force of the innate late stage. It can lash ghosts and make the other party fearful and dare not to offend again. Li Yun has recently made up some knowledge of Taoism, knowing that Taoism has a magic weapon called Dharma Rope, which is actually a whip. The famous immortal rope tied in myths and legends is this type of magic weapon. The ghost binding rope is indeed a whip, with a wooden handle on one end and a snake head like pattern carved on the wooden handle, which can be used to grasp and whipping evil spirits. This, this, this. Gong King Yu's eyes widened in surprise, Li Yun. Is this for me? Give me a weapon that can deal with ghosts. Of course. Li Yun wanted to touch Gong King Yu's head, but considering that he was in that room just now and his hands were not very clean, he put it down. Actually, the acquired true qi can already cleanse oneself, the whole body is clean, Li Yun is purely a psychological problem. I gave your Aunt Lian a weapon to deal with ghosts, and of course I will give you one. Li Yun smiled, didn't you envy the peachwood sword in your Aunt Lian's hand just now? But this one. Weapons are no better than mahogany swords, and there is no warning. I hate it. Gong King Yu lowered her head in an annoyed manner, I am envious, but I also know that anti peachwood sword lotus is best, and I still have amulets. Gong King Yu chuckled, Little Yu Yu, are you satisfied now? Two of you, one for me. Just right. Well, he he, I'm sorry, Aunt Lien, ah, uh, no, Aunt Lien, don't call my name. Xiao Yuyu's extremely intimate name is usually called by Gong Lian Yi and her mother in private, making Gong King Yu extra shy in the public, especially in front of Li Yun. Xiao Yuyu. Li Yun looked at her with a smile, Gong King Yu showed an expression of shame, and warned her boyfriend with her eyes not to call that again. Xiao Yu Yu sounds nice, what do you think? Xiao Yu Yu. Ah. Gong King Yu went crazy to pinch Li Yun's waist, but Li Yun wrapped her backhand around her slender waist, making the two close together. Gong Lian Yi was a little stunned. Her little niece had indeed changed a lot. Very solitary and arrogant, but in front of Li Yun, she behaved like a normal girl. Su Hao's mind is chaotic. Who are these three people, and where are they? Also, why is it so smelly? O.M. Suddenly, the Beifu Peachwood Sword held by Gong Lian Yi shook again, and Li Yun and Gong King Yu almost immediately stopped messing around and looked around with alert. Is it me? Gong King Yu lowered her head embarrassedly, I was too loud just now. Squeaky. In an instant, countless sharp bugs squeaked and the entire mental hospital seemed to be turned into a nest, with countless bugs pouring out from all directions. Underground, grass, big trees, canteen, playground. Li Yun glanced around calmly. There were too many insects. It was impossible to see where so many insects came from. Cockroaches, ants, venomous snakes, cicadas, spiders, centipedes, scorpions, geckos, all kinds of insects that you can't think of, all come out in swarms, and some are natural enemies, but the insects are all ignored, and they go crazy around. Spread. This this this. As soon as Su Haud was sober, he encountered such a weird picture, and he was so frightened that he almost turned into a fool again, and his whole face became, well, his face was black, all muddy. Li Yun. What shall we do? Gong Lian Yi's heart was beating, this kind of weird scene completely disrupted her thoughts. The only thing she and King Yu can rely on now is Li Yun. 
let's go upstairs. A cold light flashed in Li Yun's eyes, and he said quickly and calmly, ordinary insects are useless to us. The enemy just wants to force us to show up. The next step is the real killer move. I have to say that this trick is very useful to force the appearance, no one can keep hidden in the swarms of insects all over the mountains. Killing move? What is it? Gong King Yu took her sword in one hand, wrapped the ghost binding rope around her waist, and quickly followed Li Yun upstairs. Su Haud was terrified, and he didn't have time to think so much, so naturally he followed. I don't know yet, but, Li Yun smiled when he came to the top of the building. The enemy used this crude method to persecute us. It can be seen that his strength is not very good. Later, be careful, we can defeat him. Okay. Before the war started, the morale was boosted. Gong Lian Yi knew what Li Yun meant, but still relaxed in his heart and believed Li Yun's words very much. The entire mental hospital is full of insects, and there is no need to hide them. Li Yun directly took out three lighting lamps that he wore on his head, gave them to the two women, and put on one himself. With the three headlights moving down, Li Yun could see the underground scene clearly. I saw countless insects occupying the ground, and many flying insects spread their wings and flew around in the sky. The sound of countless insects was connected together, making a huge roar, which can upset the toughest people. Am I dreaming? Su Haud looked dazed, and sat on the ground, if it is a dream, this is probably the most terrifying and bizarre dream I have ever had. The locust natural disaster is probably like this. Li Yun smiled faintly, and didn't care too much about the insects this time. This is the fifth floor, and there are not many that can fly up. Besides, the two girls are both innate and they are not afraid of these insects at all. Li Yun estimated that these are insects used by people who practice Gu. They have not yet formed Gu insects. They are just ordinary insects, and they can't make it into any climate. Although the purpose of forcing them out was achieved. Gong Lian Yi looked at the dense insects underneath, with an expression of fear on her face. Fortunately, these insects did not fly high. Fortunately, Uncle Zhou and the others did not enter the mental hospital. They were still watching from a distance, and they should have seen this group of insects. But the next moment, the chaotic bugs began to change. I saw countless insects began to gather towards the playground, thousands, no, tens of millions of insects gathered together, trembling, crying, biting, fighting, mating, reproduction, and death. Wrong. Gong Lian Yi covered her mouth and screamed, Li Yun. This time the bug, is cultivating the Gu King. King Gu. Li Yun and Gong King Ye both looked at her suspiciously, Gong Lian Ye anxiously explained, This is the record I have seen in some folklore books. Gu worm cultivation is very difficult. Generally speaking, I want to to make a powerful, aggressive, and vicious Gu worm, you need to put all kinds of poisonous insects in a container and force the poisonous insects to fight each other. The last surviving insect in the container is the goo worm. Now she looked at countless poisonous insects in a panic and began to fight, there are no utensils here, but the insects are also starting to fight each other. I suspect that the other party is cultivating goo insects, and they are powerful goo king level insects. Gong King Yu turned her head to look at Li Yun, what shall we do now? Don't worry, I'll think of a way. Li Yun took a deep breath staring tightly at the black and overwhelming swarms of insects on the playground of the mental hospital. He had to find a way to quickly eliminate them. Somewhere in the mental hospital. GGG. An old man in black looked at the group of goo worms and let out a hoarse and weird laugh, and said triumphantly, Nephew, look, the old man has been hiding in this hospital for thirty years, and he has also raised him for thirty years. Insects in order to cultivate the three souls and six souls insects, and finally completed on this day. This person's name is Yula Sheng, and the young man standing next to him is Shi Taining, the man in the six demon gate that controls goo worms that Li Yun knows. Wonderful. Shi Taining laughed and applauded, Uncle Yu, 
your three souls and six soul insects, you have collected enough souls twenty years ago, and have been raised underground for many years. What's more, Uncle Yu, you happen to be today. Let them gather to become Gu King, just a few people from the rivers and lakes who are not afraid of death. That's it. Shi Taining smiled, Uncle Yu, as long as you let the newly born three souls and six soul insects kill those people and absorb their souls, they will surely be more powerful, and maybe they can become real Gu King, three souls, and seven souls. According to Taoism, human beings have three souls and seven souls, responsible for managing the mind and body, and bringing supreme intelligence and infinite potential to mankind. Three souls and seven souls are unique to human beings. An agu worm was named the three souls and six souls insects, one can imagine its characteristics, a kind of insects similar to humans, with superb IQ. No, no, three souls and seven souls cannot be made, only six souls. Yula Sheng waved his hand modestly, the Gu King with three souls and seven souls is no different from human beings. Only the elder has one. I heard that he killed a hundred and eight masters, using their blood. He souls are fed as the main ingredient, and four thousand four hundred and forty nine ordinary humans are added to gather their souls. It will take seven thousand seven hundred and forty nine years to succeed. I'm this. Yula Sheng shook his head, three souls and six soul insects want to be promoted to seven souls, and they have to plan for another thirty years. Shi Taining smiled slightly. He did compliment Li Sheng just now. Although the three souls and six soul insects are extremely powerful, they are too difficult to cultivate, and few people have them in the six demon gates. Hey! Shi Taining saw three people jumping from the top of the building. He recognized Li Yun at a glance. But at this moment, he didn't become angry, but laughed again, Uncle Yu, it really is Li Yun that kid. It can be said to be three happy things. Ha ha ha, this kid wants to struggle again, but in the face of as many as tens of millions of bugs, even if he has three heads and six arms, what? Boom! Boom! There was a loud noise, the ground trembled, the muffled sound was deafening, the raging fire burst like a volcanic eruption, the flame rushed tens of meters high, and the brilliant fire light reflected half of the sky. In an instant, the entire mental hospital was caught in the scorching flames, even more violent than the fire twenty years ago. The difference is that the fire twenty years ago was evil, and it took the lives of more than one hundred people. And this time the flame is righteous. It kills and drives countless insects, turning the nest of tens of millions of insects that originally wanted to become the Gu King into nothing. Li, Li Yun. Gong King Ye was dumbfounded. She was already a little desperate. This is not to blame Li Yun. After all, anyone who faces as many as tens of millions of insects will be helpless. The enemy is too powerful, and the method is too insidious. This mysterious spell that gathers countless insects is a method Gong King Yu has never seen before, or even dared to imagine. But at this moment of despair, Li Yun led her and Aunt Lian to the fifth floor with light effort. They were responsible for resisting the swarming insects' swarms. Li Yun turned spells, conjured many bottles and cans. Peanut oil worth 98 yuan, a large can of number 95 gasoline, a barrel of oil, a large bag of starch and so on. In the end, Li Yun took out a large grenade and a shell that Gong King Yu didn't know what it was called. It was as big as a human thigh, and they all packed together in a swarm. Run. When they were ready, the three of them fled in embarrassment. The insects were very weak, but the number could be said to be endless. Not to mention the late congenital stage, even the Grand Master level could not please. The three of them ran far away. Gong King Yu's heart was beating very fiercely at the time, and there was a faint sense of excitement about doing big things. He turned to look at Li Yun, and sure enough, he raised the strange white pistol in his hand. One shot accurately hit the grenade, and the grenade detonated the cannonball, finally igniting and exploding all the combustibles together. As a result, this kind of shocking picture of the jaw was formed. Okay, 
Awesome. The heat was rolling, Gong Lianyi only felt that her face was hot, but she was extremely happy. A big pit was left in the playground, flames splashed, and a small half of the mental hospital was lit. Li Yun killed at least half of the insects. Although the remaining insects were controlled by certain spells, the insects were naturally afraid of heat. Drove them to flee here frantically. In an instant, the originally black and crushed insect swarms were completely scattered, and they all hid in the corner, let alone cultivating the Gu King, it was a question of whether they could gather again. What's more, these huge numbers of bugs have been sleeping for twenty years. They are all disposable consumables. It would take another thirty years to collect and multiply so many bugs. I will kill you. With a violent shout, Yula Sheng jumped out, sullenly looking towards Li Yun. These insects took him thirty years of hard work. It took him three years to establish the mental hospital. Then he quietly collected the souls, cultivated the insects underground, and finally burned the mental hospital, making it a cold place, more suitable for insects to grow. Unexpectedly, the three souls and six soul insects start with a fire and end with a fire. Thirty years of planning failed in one fell swoop. How can this not let Yula Sheng jump into thunder? He could not wait to cramp Li Yun to vent his hatred. What Yula Sheng didn't see was that Shi Taining quietly left after he jumped out. Little beast, take your life. Yula Sheng roared wildly and killed him with a billowing black air. The flames around him couldn't cover up the evil air coming out of him. In an instant, the air around him suddenly became cold. The two women stayed for a while, shocked by this cold aura, but Li Yun of the Acquired Realm was the first to react. Boom! With a gunshot, the bullets were shot out, Yula Sheng sneered, and stretched out his palm to grab the bullet that was shot at high speed, and sneered, Little beast, modern weapons are in front of the old man, what? Carrying a bullet with increased attack power and destroying attributes, it lies in Li Sheng's palm that a hole was severely drilled. If he saw that the situation was not good, he madly used his true energy to offset the impact, I am afraid this shot can his palm was penetrated. No, you are a in the hidden sacred valley. Yula Sheng looked at the white pistol in Li Yun's hand in shock. The bullet fired from this gun was unusual, carrying an extremely powerful evil force, just to restrain his insect evil demon gong that he had practiced for decades. Hidden Sacred Valley Li Yun smiled indifferently, the mere hidden sacred valley is not in my eyes. Of course, it also includes your six magic doors. What school? Besides the hidden sacred valley and the six demon gates, the third sect to cultivate immortals? Yula Sheng glanced at Li Yun suspiciously, but Gong King Yu and the two girls immediately believed. The person they like must come from a sect with a long heritage and mysterious sect, otherwise Li Yun would not be so. Awesome. Hee <laughs> hee, you are not qualified to know my martial arts. Li Yun tried to pretend to be forced, in fact it all relies on the system, he has a ghost martial arts. Yula Sheng's face was sullen, various thoughts flashed in his mind, and he suddenly smiled. No, you have no school. Otherwise, you little beast would not be able to break my three souls and six souls by that method. Li Yun smiled, neither admitted, nor denied, let you Li Sheng and him hide from the party, just guess. Little beast still has a cowardly smile. Yu Le Sheng looked at Li Yun with hatred in his eyes, and a black aura gushed out of his body again, you let my thirty-year plan be ruined, and I will catch you alive and become a man. Goo, let you never live or die. After all, shaking his robe fiercely, dozens of small insects fell from his cuffs instantly, each of which was oddly shaped, with fierce mouth parts, sharp limbs and an evil smell all over his body. After the bug hits the ground, it immediately scattered around, and cooperated with Yu Li Sheng from the front to kill Li Yun from all directions. Squeak! The sharp screams were extremely harsh. Li Yun secretly said something was wrong, the nine suns Tianjing Zhenqi running inside his body protected his whole body, and hit Yu Li Sheng again with a shot. At this time, 
you can see the importance of increasing the speed of Sylvan's pistol. Sex, Yula Shang hides in embarrassment. Originally with his strength, the ordinary sniper rifle would definitely not hit him, but in front of the Sylvan pistol, Yula Shang could only defend with all his strength. Lian Yi, King Yu, be careful, and protect your whole body with true energy. Got it. Look at me. Gong Lian Yi leaned against Li Yun and King Yu, her heart suddenly lightened, as if there was nothing to be afraid of in the world, her body was filled with an inexplicable and powerful force, her small cherry mouth opened softly, and she couldn't help but whistle. The peachwood sword in his hand draws a dazzling light. The lotus leaves are infinitely green, and the lotus is red in the sun. The dazzling sword light radiated from Gong Lian Yi's hand, like an ice arrow bursting from an iceberg, and like a drizzle in early spring, moisture rising things swayed silently. In an instant, half of the dozens of insects that rushed up were enveloped by Gong Lian Yi's sword energy, turned into broken limbs and fell to the ground. Bitch! You, you are looking for death. Yula Sheng was frightened and angry. Although these goo worms were no better than the three souls and six soul worms, they were all powerful goo worms that he relied on to protect himself. For a warrior of the common acquired realm, a single worm could gnaw his flesh and blood. Empty. Even if it is the innate realm, three or five besieged together, the ordinary inborn realm will have hatred on the spot. But now Gong Lian Yi had killed more than twenty with a single sword as if these goo worms had become ordinary mosquitoes and ants, and they were killed at will. Wow, Aunt Lien is so amazing, come and see me too. Gong King Yu gained a lot of confidence. Holding the wooden handle of the ghost rope, he swiped a circle toward the front. With a slap, the black whip hit the air with an extremely loud sound, which made Yu Le Sheng feel in his heart. Trembling, his eyes looked over like a ghost. No. Impossible. Yula Sheng gave a strange cry. Gong King Yu, a stinky girl who was dissatisfied with the two year old Hua, actually killed four bugs with a whip? Each of his goo worms has gone through several years, using special methods, plus his own mana for a long time, before he can cultivate one, it is very rare. It can be said that these insects are the root of his foothold in the six magic gates. Without them, Yu Li Sheng would have destroyed more than half of his strength. Impossible? Humph. I'll show you that it might be impossible. Gong King Yu yelled, threw a whip again, and beat the three insects that came to death. Yu Li Sheng could clearly see that he had a goo insect named Tiger Helmet Beetle, which was about the size of a fist. The whole body showed a metallic silvery white, but he was still beaten to death. How is it possible? How is it possible? Yula Sheng was about to vomit blood. The tiger helmet beetle is a goo worm that gnaws on hard ore. During the cultivation process, it needs to feed a lot of gold, silver, iron, and tin to create an unusually hard silver white armor. Although this one in his hand is not a complete body, it is enough to resist the sword energy of the innate realm. Not to mention the whip it is impossible for a hundred forged soldiers to beat it into fleshy flesh in one blow. Snapped. Gong King Yu whip over again, and a scorpion-shaped goo worm raised its sharp tail high, wanting to use it to fight the black whip. But, undoubtedly, being beaten to death by the bound ghost rope, even the sharpest tail gear could not withstand this whip, and it was directly turned into green flesh, which was very miserable. Hehe. <laughs> It seems that your goo worm is not that good. Holding the ghost binding rope given to her by Li Yun, Gong King Yu is now full of self confidence. With this whip, whether it is a ghost or a worm or a beast, let your fancy and whistle blow you all. Li Yun shrugged with a wry smile Sylvan's pistol is very powerful, but in the face of these large numbers of small and small goo worms, it is really not as easy to use as cold weapons. You. Yula Sheng trembled with anger, what the was going on? How come these people are better than innate consummation? It's a peerless master in the realm of masters. However, there are not many masters at the master level, almost all of them are monsters of the 70s and 80s, and Yula Sheng did not dare to provoke them alone. Miss, 
here we are. The four uncles oh rushed from outside the mental hospital, and the expressions on each of them were extremely shocked, as if it was hard to believe what they had just seen until now. The mountain-like insects were blasted away by explosions. When the four of them saw the insects scurrying around in the sky, they were so scared that they almost turned around and fled. Fortunately, they grew up in the palace since they were young, and they were deeply trusted by the palace family. Their inner loyalty made them gritted their teeth and came to protect the palace's eldest lady. Gong Qingya was 18 years old in her midborn congenital stage, and she might be able to break through to the Grand Master Realm in the future. Damn, you guys want to come and die too. Yula Sheng was furious, stretched out his hand and uttered a weird spell in his mouth. In an instant, seven or eight goo worms changed their directions, aiming at Uncle Zhou and others to kill. This is Goo Worm. Zhou Shu said in surprise. Be careful. Gong King Yu shouted, but the Goo Worms are not very powerful, as long as they are hit, they can be killed. It is good not to get into the body by them, it is easy. Surprised expressions appeared on the faces of the four of them. It turned out that only in the case of a sneak attack, Goo Worms can have the most powerful combat effectiveness when they penetrate into the human body. With their four innate mid-level masters and experienced combat experts, dealing with seven or eight goo worms is definitely not a problem. Let me try, how strong is this goo worm? Uncle Zo screamed, drew out the sword with a sharp sound, and aimed it at a long snake-like insect. There is a faint white sword aura on the sword, and ordinary steel can never stop the full blow of an innate mid-stage master, let alone a goo worm. Seeing that Long Snake Gu was chopped to the seven-inch position by the sword, Uncle Zhou and the other three people all showed happy expressions. Since Gong Lianyi was infected with Gu worms, they have been worried about this stuff, but now it seems that Gu worms are nothing more than that. Dead. Uncle Zhou slashed hard, and the sword light on the sword became stronger and stronger, and it seemed that the snake Gu worm would be divided into two in the next moment. But the next scene stunned everyone. Yes. I saw the long snake goo worm twisted its body, and the snake body, which was more slippery than ordinary snakes, was close to the sword. The invincible sword light could not do anything to it. Uncle Zo's sword aura turned out to be a rock climbing object for this long snake goo worm. Swish a few times, the long snake followed the sword, ignoring the sharp sword aura, and came to the hilt of the sword, spreading with sharp points. The mouth of the teeth, biting it at his wrist. Uncle Zo, be careful. No, what is this? Hurry up and drop the weapon. Boom. Everyone yelled in panic, but Li Yun calmly raised the pistol and hit the sword in the hands of Uncle Zo with one shot. Uncle Zo was shocked. The sword in his hand was hit by a bullet, and there was a clang of metal. The sword came out and flew out 17 or 18 meters away. Originally, the sword could not fly that far. It was the long snake goo worm. He flicked the sword fiercely in midair with its tail. With the help of the reaction force, it leaped forcefully and hissed again and bit towards Uncle Zo's neck. Go with. Oh my god. Only then did Uncle Zo react and quickly rolled on the spot, avoiding its attack in an extremely embarrassing posture. Luoming sword technique one style, wind and leaves move. Another uncle Zhang, who was in the middle congenital stage, raised his hand as a sword technique he was best at, sending out a white sword aura and hitting the landing long snake goo. Crack. With a shekhao, the sharp two rows of teeth suddenly closed, actually biting off this sword aura. Hiss. After biting off that white sword chi, the long snake goo uttered a letter provocatively, and the cold snake eyes seemed to reveal a ridiculous ridicule and even used these things to deal with it at a joke. This thing. Uncle Zhang swallowed. Goo worms were even more powerful than he believed. One can fight back and forth with mid innate masters. The scary thing is that the mysterious man in black actually has dozens of similar goo worms. Miss, let's escape. Uncle Zhou's expression was solemn. This goo worm is definitely not something they can resist. The lady just said big talk, she doesn't know the power of Goo Worm, 
right? Ha ha ha, it's comfortable now. Yula Sheng shuddered again and laughed loudly, idiots, now you know how powerful I am. Boom. Li Yun fired a shot, and with a snap, an ant-like goo worm exploded, and the internal organs spattered to the ground, making it dead and desolate. Uncle Zhou and Uncle Zhang. What's the situation? Hey, I see how powerful your goo worm is. A look of anger appeared on Gong King Yu's face, and he took a big step forward, slamming the whip in his hand, and hitting the snake-like goo worm. Long snake goo worm stared at the whip with cold eyes, Zinzi vomited, opened the mouth of the snake, and bit at the whip without fear. Call out! The whip pierced the air and made a sharp wind, but the long snake goo had excellent eyes and extremely fast movements. It bit on the whip accurately with one bite, and then looked at Gong King Yu mockingly, just about to bite it hard. Whip, but suddenly, it felt empty behind its body. What? Why? I actually... The long snake goo worm discovered in horror that the tip of the whip turned, and its body was interrupted by a whip. No, this whip, is weird. Poor long snake goo, it's not so high IQ, didn't realize it until he died. Cut, I thought it was amazing. Gong King Yu shook the whip in disgust, and shook the head of the snake goo worm. His face was disgusting, but his eyes were full of complacency. Yula Sheng jumped into a thunder, and he wished to this stinky the spot. Insulted. Uncle Zhou's eyes are almost staring out. Earlier, he was so majestic that he bit off a sort chi long snake goo worm in the mid innate stage, but couldn't even stop Gong King Yu's whip. Soy Mu hair. A resentment flashed in Yula Sheng's eyes, staring at the whip in Gong King Yu's hand, where did your weapon, come from? This is definitely a magic weapon, and only a magic weapon can dispel the evil spirits on goo worms with one move, and whip them to death. Goo worms are more powerful than ordinary worms. It is the evil spirit given to them by the practitioners. Without this thing, goo worms are only harder than ordinary worms, and they have no strength to fight against the innate. The magic weapon, even in the six magic gates, is surprisingly rare, at least not in Li Sheng's hands. Arms. Uncle Zhou looked at the whip in Gong King Yu's hand. It turned out that the young lady was not good at using whips, but now she uses whips to deal with goo worms. It turns out that this whip is so powerful. Hee <laughs> hee, where do you come from? Gong King Yu proudly took Li Yun's arm, of course it's me. Her face flushed, my husband, husband, give it to me. When Li Yun was mentioned in front of outsiders, she finally called Li Yun her husband. This meant that Gong King Yu had already regarded Li Yun as a person who would accompany her for life in the future. With Gong King Yu's cold personality, he originally disdained to answer Yu Li Sheng's questions, but Gong King Yu was very happy now and couldn't help showing off. The ghost binding rope that Li Yun gave her was so powerful that Uncle Zhou and the four of them couldn't deal with the long snake goo insect and she was whipped to death. The big gap is staggering. In that case, Miss Gong changed a wooden sword, and it seems to be. Uncle Zhou looked at the peach wooden sword in Gong Lian Yi's hand, his eyes became a little greedy. A weapon that can deal with goo worms, this thing is many times stronger than the so-called magic weapon in the arena. Li Yun smiled faintly, looked at Yu Li Sheng, and said jokingly, Do you have any other moves now? Zombies? Ghosts? Or stitch people? Yes. Gong King Yu said with a smile, Old man, you can use whatever moves you have. It's best to recruit all evil spirits and ghosts. Let me try the ghost binding rope that Li Yun gave me. Bound ghost rope? Everyone took another look at the rope in her hand. It turned out that fighting ghosts is the main business of this rope and fighting worms is just a way to go? Ha ha ha. Yula Sheng sneered, and said in an extremely cold tone, since you insist on looking for death, don't blame me when you go to the underworld. Dean Yu. A slightly old and sad voice interrupted his words and also attracted the attention of everyone present. Li Yun frowned slightly, 
and looked at the dark figure that stumbled out of the stairs. It was the Three Fools, or the doctor who used to be a mental hospital, Su Houd. You are Dean Yu, right? Su Houd's face is covered with thick dirt. He hasn't taken a bath for more than twenty years, and the stench from his body is enough to make Gu Worms retreat. Oh, it turns out that you have regained your sanity. Yula Sheng sneered, I thought that absence Gu had already chewed up your brain, so that you can only live a life of dementia and stupidity, ha ha ha. In fact, he was very surprised that absence Gu can destroy people's sanity and make people become idiots without knowing it. The fact is indeed the case. Su Houd has lived as a fool for twenty years, but he did not expect to recover tonight. Li, Yun. He meditated Li Yun's name silently in his heart, and Yu Li Sheng secretly decided that he would catch this kid later, and ask him which school he came from, and how to treat the sequelae caused by absence Gu. Sure enough, it really is you. Su Hout's expression was shocked, and his body trembled, and his eyes were filled with tears of grief and anger, Dean Yu, why are you doing this? Didn't you say that mental patients are miserable at the beginning, and you even lowered the cost for the patients? Li Yun smiled helplessly in his heart, asking this question too naively. Sure enough, Yu Le Sheng laughed loudly, pointed at the more than twenty goo worms around him, and laughed mockingly, why? Of course it's to train my little darlings. See? These are all goo worms that I have cultivated for decades. The more proud he was, the paler Su Hout's face became, Dean Yu, the patients who died inexplicably and became more and more ill were you the ghost behind your back. Not bad. Yu Le Sheng didn't have the slightest guilt, but rather proudly said, do you know why I opened this mental hospital and the address is located in the outskirts of Zhonghai City? Su Houd was extremely shocked, and muttered, for these mental patients. For the mentally ill, but not to cure them, but, for their body and soul. Haha, <laughs> it seems that your mental illness is indeed cured. Yu Le Sheng said with nostalgia, people have three souls and seven souls. The souls of ordinary people are very closely connected, but the mental patients are different. Their souls are loose and somewhat even out of the body inexplicably, it is very convenient to manipulate. So I did not hesitate to spend a lot of effort to open a mental hospital and collected many mental patients with unstable souls. Manipulating what? Li Yun frowned. Of course it is to manipulate their souls and put them into my three souls and six souls, so that human souls become goo worm souls. Everyone was shocked and looked at him in disbelief. Doesn't it mean that people become worms when their souls enter the goo worm's body? With such an evil, weird, and insidious method, everyone has never heard of it. Just imagine it and feel that the whole body is cold, and can't help but shudder. You, you, you are too vicious. Su so Houd fell to the ground and looked at him in horror. Vicious? Humph, what is this? Yu Le Sheng didn't care, those mental patients are not humans at all, and their souls are useless. Why don't they refine goo worms for me? After I become an immortal immortal, I will remember their contributions. Isn't it the best of both worlds? Everyone was so shocked that they didn't know how to refute him. Li Yun sneered. The only thing that has the best of both worlds is that I killed you and eliminated the six magic doors behind you by the way. These two things add up to the best of both worlds. Want to kill me? You are not worthy. No, Yu Le Sheng. Su Houd stood up fiercely after drinking his name, angrily said, I must call the police, and you must accept the punishment of the law. Hey, Su Houd, why bother? Yu Le Sheng shook his head with regret, when you discovered my secret, you wanted to call the police, and you just wanted to fight me? The result? Not only did you fail to expose me, you became a fool and suffered for twenty years for nothing. As your former dean, I persuade you to kneel down and beg for mercy immediately. Maybe I can still see it in love and spare your life. Yu Le Sheng looked at Su Houd indifferently. I... Su Houd looked painful, raised his hands and looked at it. There were black stains on them. I remember, 
when it was on fire, I was locked in a room. There was a raging fire outside. The inside was roasted to the point of fainting, but, I heard the screams of patients before they died, I, I. Ha ha ha. Doesn't it feel uncomfortable? Yula Sheng laughed freely, this is the end of the fight against me, but you should thank me, you have become stupid these years, I did not kill you, but let you continue to live in a mental hospital and live with your sick people, ha ha ha. Li Yun probably knew what happened. In order to cultivate his three souls and six souls, Yu Li established this mental hospital far away from Zhonghai City, attracting mental patients at low prices and winning a good reputation. But in fact, Yu Le Sheng is a member of the Six Demon Sects. He secretly used the unstable characteristics of the mental patient's three souls and seven souls to use evil methods to extract the patient's soul and put it into his three souls and six souls. In the worm body, trying to breed a powerful Gu King. Later, when Su Haud was seeing a patient, he noticed that some mental patients were behaving abnormally. Perhaps after a secret investigation, Su Haud was going to call the police to collect evidence. But unfortunately, he was discovered by Yu Li Sheng, and then Su Haud was locked in a room by him and made a fool with absence Gu. At the same time, Yu Le Sheng set fire to and killed everyone in the mental hospital, and Su Haud heard the patient's screams before his death in the room. Then, Su Haud became a real fool, and he was hidden by Yu Li Sheng to some place, and returned to the mental hospital after the limelight passed. Probably, Yu Le Sheng is not just to torture Su Haud. Li Yun guessed Yu Le Sheng's intention to leave Su Haud. Zhou Guangfu delivers food to Yu Le Sheng who is hiding in the mental hospital every day. Although he acts in a concealed manner, he may be spotted. So, Su Haud, a fool, came in handy. Even if someone accidentally saw Zhou Guangfu delivering food here, they would only think that he was a kind person and send it to Su Haud. But I don't know that Zhou Guangfu gave two takeaways. And Su Haud, in a foolish state, only needs a little training, he will send another takeaway to Yu Li Sheng. After this series of plans, Yu Li Sheng hardly needs to be out of the mental hospital. Zhen Qi can clean himself, and he only needs to come out once a month. Yu Li Sheng. After thinking about it, Li Yun said with emotion, I have to admire your forbearance. For a Gu worm, you plan for 10 years and hide for 20 years. You can use your perseverance elsewhere, why can't you succeed? Ha ha ha. Yu Le Sheng smiled, how can you mortals know what our practitioners are pursuing? You are doing nothing, and your short life is only a hundred years. How can you compare to us for hundreds of years, even a lifespan of thousands of years? Hey, ignorance. Thousand years of life. Everyone was deeply shocked. There was a trace of envy in the eyes of Uncle Zhou. Did this group of practitioners live so long? If possible, they also want to practice, gain great strength, and gain a long life. I don't know if you have ever heard a sentence. Gong Lian said impulsively, you only envy Mandarin ducks but not immortals. Although you have lived for a long time, your life is used for such unnecessary things. No matter how long you live, it is meaningless. When she said, you only envy Mandarin ducks but not immortals, she blushed and she couldn't help looking at Li Yun. Lian Yi. Li Yun smiled, actually, you don't need to explain to this kind of person, just say a word. What? Gong Lian Yi asked cooperatively, and Gong King Yu also looked at him. That is, the three souls and six soul insects you planned for thirty years were burned by us. How about it, cool? When Yu Le Sheng heard this, his entire face became dark again, so angry that his three souls were separated, his seven souls gave rise to smoke, blood rushed to his brain, the hair on his body stood upside down, and he sternly shouted, Boy, not today if you die, I am dead. After that, with a single move with both hands, several goo worms immediately jumped onto his body. Li Yun roughly counted, there were a total of seven gu worms attached to Li Sheng's hands, legs, abdomen, thighs, and neck. In an instant, 
Yu Lisheng seemed to be tightly bound by the Gu Worm, turning into an extremely weird appearance. Insect Evil Spirit Power Gu Worm Possession Method Yu Lisheng muttered a curse, and the seven Gu Worms lying tightly on his body seemed to have received some order, and began to gnaw at the master's flesh and blood crazily. This Seeing this horrible scene, Li Yun and others were stunned. The seven Gu Worms treated like enemies, biting Li Sheng's flesh fiercely and brutally, and blood spurted out in an instant. Yu Li Sheng's whole body became bloody, but his expression was extremely hideous, clenching his teeth. Staring at Li Yun fiercely, like a hell, a man-eating ghost. Boom! After Li Yun reacted, he raised his pistol and fired a shot at Yu Li Sheng without saying anything. But unexpectedly, the remaining dozen Gu Worms guarding him jumped up desperately, blocking this powerful bullet with their bodies. The Gu Worm on Li Sheng's body accelerated, gnawing various parts of his body into a big hole, exposing the bones in the flesh. Afterwards, the seven worms clung to the bones inside their limbs tightly, and their heads pierced into the flesh and blood, as if they wanted to become one with Yu Li Sheng. Don't get in the way, little bug, eat me. Gong King Yu threw a whip to kill the four Gu Worms, Gong Lian Yi did not neglect, and also used the Yin Grai Hong sword technique with a peach wood sword, several powerful sword auras would kill the remaining Gu Worms. Killed to pieces. Yu Li Sheng's spell was basically completed. Seven Gu Worms penetrated into his flesh and blood, tightly hugging the bones inside. Gradually, Yu Li Sheng's flesh and blood began to slowly recover wrapping the goo worms as if it looks like seven fist-sized sarcomas have grown. Li Yun fired another shot and hit him in the head. But Yu Li Sheng only raised his palm to block the bullet. Boy! Yu Li Sheng showed a stubborn smile, it's useless, my goo worm possession method combines the power of seven goo worms. No matter how strong your magic weapon is, it's impossible. Before finishing talking, Li Yun fired three more shots, one of which accurately hit the Gu Worm on Li Sheng's right leg. The sarcoma-like worm exploded immediately, a mixture of green and red flesh and blood. Sputtered all over the place. Another shot hit Li Sheng's abdomen, screaming in pain, and stepped back for several steps. A fist-sized wound appeared on his stomach immediately. Li Yun smiled indifferently, and said, It seems that your move is not good. I would like to know how many shots you can block me. Although Li Yun has only ten bullets left, it does not prevent him from pretending to be threatening. Yu Li Sheng's face became extremely ugly. His move is already a unique skill at the bottom of the box. The seven Gu Worms are the most powerful of his remaining Gu Worms. After they are possessed, they will die immediately, which is tantamount to a spell of death. But the guns in Li Yun's hands are amazingly powerful, and they can be fired continuously, and the bullets seem to be endless. How the is it? He he Gong King Yu smiled triumphantly, although my husband is only in the acquired realm, he is really the strongest, you disgusting guy die as soon as possible. As she said, the whip in her hand was slammed at Yu Li Sheng, but was grabbed by his backhand, and the power on the whip was forcibly ignored by Yu Li Sheng. With a strong pull, Gong King Yi was almost pulled over by him. Let go of the whip. Gong Lian Yi naturally couldn't watch her favorite King Yi being caught by him. He immediately raised the peachwood sword and made a move. The bright light of the sword was mixed with the power of the peachwood sword, and it was forced harder. Shang had to loosen the ghost rope. Li Yun took the opportunity to shoot another shot, hitting the sarcoma Gu Worm in Yu Li Sheng's left hand directly exploding it. It seems that the so-called practitioners are not so good. Uncle Zhou laughed, three, we and the young lady, we captured him alive. Ha ha ha, just to my liking, let's go together. At this moment. Don't move, put down your weapon. Yuan Cheng, 41 years old, is the director of Mingzhu District, Zhonghai City. He received a call to report the incident at around 9 o'clock in the evening, saying that Zhonghai City was close to the highway intersection and there was a strange and mysterious explosion. The skyrocketing fire light made it clear to everyone at the highway intersection. 
Yuan Cheng didn't dare to neglect, he didn't even have time to get back to the game, so he called two heavy case teams, at least twenty capable officers, each took their weapons and hurried over. On the other side, the fire brigade also received a call, and a fire truck came roaring in. Along the way, feeling that the matter might be very serious, Yuan Cheng deliberately made a phone call with the General Administration of China Shipping and was instructed, if no casualties are found, the scene should be sealed off, the truth is investigated, and the report should be reported in time. Strange, how could anyone create an explosion in the suburbs? Yuan Cheng still couldn't figure out why someone would engage in trouble on the expressway. Huang Xian State Banned Guns the security is much stricter than foreign countries. There are very few terrorist attacks, and Zhonghai City has been for five years. No reports of explosions have been received. The same goes for the people in the serious crime team. They thought some tanker had exploded, but the report they got was that it was in an abandoned mental hospital. Abandoned mental hospital, there is an explosion? Everyone couldn't figure it out. Some people speculated that there were some unstable social elements fighting there, and they quickly got their approval. When you get to the scene, stabilize the situation first, and all those who fled will be temporarily controlled. Yuan Cheng made arrangements in the walkie-talkie, but suddenly, the car squeaked to a halt, and the people in the car suddenly became nervous and asked what was going on. Yuan, Yuan Zhu. The driver yelled in horror, look out the window. Out of the window. What's outside the window? Everyone was taken aback, turned their heads to look out the window, and suddenly everyone showed a surprised expression. I saw a black area outside the window, and countless mosquitoes, snakes, and ants were alarmed by the sound of their car's engine, screaming frantically, and the sound of hitting the window glass made people panic. Bats, cockroaches, moths, mosquitoes, flies, venomous snakes, my god. Someone exclaimed, what the is going on? Why are there so many insects near the mental hospital? How many insects are there? Hearing this sentence, the driver suddenly had a clever idea and pressed the horn button forcefully. Drop. The harsh horn sounded, and suddenly, it was like a stone being thrown into the calm lake. More than a million bugs were awakened. From trees, Weeds, stones, etc., all bugs from all directions were shocked, like a rainstorm. To these cars. There is a saying that moths fight fire and kill themselves. But for the nearby insects, they all turned into moths at this moment, crashing frantically towards the car. You and you, we. The team members swallowed. Even with their rich experience in handling cases, it was the first time they saw such a strange thing. Yuan Cheng's eyes condensed, something must have happened to the mental hospital ahead, let's go immediately, and leave the bugs alone for now. Boom. While talking, there was a sharp gunshot in front of him, and everyone immediately woke up. Sure enough, someone was fighting. Okay, dare to shoot out in front of our heavy case team, boss, request to fight. Don't be impulsive, be careful later. But when they drove to the door of the mental hospital and got out of the car, they were shocked again by the scene before them. Don't move, put down your weapon. Seeing this group of plainclothes police officers with guns appeared, Li Yun was stunned for a long time. He was about to use the last five bullets to cooperate with Gong Lianyi and the two women will be killed by Li Sheng, but he did not expect an official person to come but thinking about it is right. He had a big explosion, and there was a highway intersection not far away. It must have been reported by someone seeing the fire. Don't move, put down your weapon immediately. Who are you, who? Director Yuan looked at Li Yun. To his surprise, this person was the only one holding a gun. The rest of the people were all holding swords, and he immediately understood that this was a group of people from all over the world fighting. But who is that dark person? There is also the one that is even more afraid. There are several sarcomas on his body. At first glance, it is the kind of villain that takes half an hour to kill in a horror movie. 
Ahem. Li Yun stood up, pointed the gun at Yu Lisheng, and shouted to Director Yuan, My name is Li Yun, do you know Liao Hua? Don't even think about it. Yuan Cheng pointed his gun at him and shouted sharply, immediately put down the weapon, no matter who Liao Hua is, wait for me to deal with it. Cannot do it. Li Yun shrugged and pointed at Yu Li Sheng in front of him, did you see this sarcoma monster? This guy manipulated tens of millions of insects in an attempt to refine the Gu King. You are not his opponents, let me solve it. Him. What? The team members all looked at the sarcoma monster. They are still being harassed by insects. Fortunately, after they came to the mental hospital, the residual heat of the explosion made the insect army afraid to approach, otherwise they would not even be able to get off the car. GGG. Yula Shang rolled his eyes and laughed strangely, and said, I am a monster? Hee <laughs> hee, who is the culprit when Yu Li Yun made this explosion? Hey, you idiots, why don't you catch these people soon? Live. Yuan Cheng and the others are in a daze, who are they listening to? You are Director Yuan. At this time, Uncle Zhou stood up, bowed his hand to Yuan Cheng, and said, My name is Zhou Jiaokai, a deacon of the palace family. We met once before. Do you remember? Zhou Jiaokai. Yuan Cheng had some impressions, but he was more interested in his other identity, are you from the palace family? Not bad. Uncle Zhou introduced him, this is Miss Gong Lianyi, the elder of our palace family, and this is Gong King Yu, the daughter of the family master. So that's it, then he is. Don't try to escape. Li Yun fired again, shooting at the escaped Yu Lisheng, Gong Lianyi immediately followed, and swung a white sword gas at the escaped Yu Lisheng, and said at the same time, Director Yuan, please capture this person first. We will explain to you later. Perhaps because of Uncle Zhou, perhaps because of Gong Lianyi's decent tone, Director Yuan finally believed in Li Yun and his party and chose to pursue Li Sheng with him. Yu Li Sheng. Li Yun and Gong Lianyi forced him to stop. They smiled while holding the winning ticket, and said, I advise you to surrender to science and you can save a life, because Director Yuan is on the side and no one will kill you, but if you insist on resisting, we can only kill you on the spot. The little beast is looking for death. Yu Sheng was furious. He originally wanted to take the opportunity to escape and wait for the opportunity to kill Li Yun and everyone present. But as a result, Li Yun still blocked his escape. Who are you scolding, you old fellow? Gong King Yu yelled and whipped at him again. Li Yun is her husband, and Yu Sheng scolds him, doesn't it mean to scold her Gong King Yu? The battle started, but Yu and Cheng and others discovered that they couldn't get in. This monster with five sarcomas on his body is very powerful. It looks like a thin old man in his fifties, but his strength is amazing and his body is extremely hard. After Yu and Cheng's warning was invalid, he tried to open his thigh. One shot, the bullet actually pierced his skin. Strange, it's also a pistol. How could Li Yun's white pistol deflate Yu Li Sheng? One shot made a big wound, and our bullets weren't effective at all. Yu and Cheng was shocked, so he could only choose to swoop on the sidelines to guard against possible enemies. Gong Lianyi is holding a peachwood sword as the main force, and Gong King Yu's ghost binding rope is flexibly supported and Li Yun, who is armed with a powerful gun and can shoot defunct bullets as a threat, is infinitely powerful in combination. No wonder Yu Li Shang used Gu after the worm-possessing method, he can still only run away in embarrassment. In the end, Li Yun shot Li Sheng's right leg with a single shot, causing him to completely lose his mobility. Fortunately, Yu Li Shang can't fly and his strength is not a bit worse than that of concubine Wanqing who can control flying hairpins. He was forced to death by the three of Li Yun with powerful magic weapons. Surrender. Li Yun actually had no bullets in his sylvan pistol, but still pointed at him with the muzzle, and said in a flat tone, You have no chance. Su Haud, who was watching from a distance, 
looked at Yu Lisheng who fell on the ground with a very complicated expression, and finally heaved a long sigh of relief. Everything is over, and the Dean will be apprehended and brought to justice. The patients and nurses who died tragically at the time will be able to watch. Do you think you can kill me like this? Yu Lisheng lay on the ground. The seven goo sarcomas on his body had been knocked out, his whole body was dripping with blood, and he couldn't be more miserable. But he still has a killer move. Boy! Yu Lisheng stared at him fiercely with hatred, I don't know where you got the three magical artifacts, but I want to use this to fight my six magic doors. You are still very tender. Even if you beat me, you can't kill me, you will die. With a sharp shout, a lot of blood poured out from the wound on Yula Sheng's body, which quickly soaked the ground, his head tilted, and he seemed to die. But everyone was shocked, and Yula Sheng definitely did not die, because the blood flowing out of his body did not penetrate the ground, but instead flowed and enveloped his whole body. Suddenly, Yula Sheng seemed to become a blood-colored mummy, exuding a terrifying red light. What the hell, are the Jianghe people so powerful? A gunman screamed in horror, this strange scene completely broke his understanding of the world. It turns out that those abnormally flooded insects were really caused by the sarcoma monster in front of me. Hurry up and attack him. Li Yun yelled, Gong Lianyi and the two women recovered from the shock, and quickly attacked Yu Li Sheng with weapons. But it was too late. Boom. The red mummy exploded and developed. Li Yun only saw a red phantom rushing towards him, fast as lightning. He only had time to stretch out his hand to block it, but the red phantom was not affected at all and went straight into it. His body. GGG, kid, you are dead. A weird voice sounded directly in Li Yun's mind, just as the system was talking to him, the difference is that the system's voice sounded deep inside, and this voice can only exist on the surface. After saying this jokingly, Li Yun took out a small detoxification pill and put it in his mouth without hesitation. At the same time, he found a medium-sized detoxification pill. If it doesn't work, eat one more. But this seems to be enough. The small detoxification pill turned into a magical power to flow all over Li Yun's body. Yu Sheng's natal goo, who was hiding in Li Yun's body, suddenly felt this repulsive force just like Li Yun's body had become a compact jade, white flawless, perfect, no foreign things can stay at all. All foreign filth was expelled. What is this? No. No, don't kill me, I surrender. Without finishing a sentence, a red light shot out from Li Yun's chest, and fell to the ground within two meters of flying out. Gong Lianyi was afraid that things would change and raised the peachwood sword with sword energy. Completely kill. Ding, the host made a choice to kill Yu Li Sheng, and the reward has been issued. Li Yun just breathed a sigh of relief. This is the end of tonight's action. Although the process was tortuous, the gains were a lot. What's more, the two golden flowers of the palace family saw a lot of magical things. I believe they will be able to fight with ease in the future when they face these goo worms, souls, and zombies. Moreover, Li Yun also harvested a recovery pill and a golden gift bag. The recovery pill was temporarily not used and belonged to the treasure at the bottom of the box. As for the golden gift bag, Li Yun is looking forward to another piece of equipment when opened together next time. The best is a cold weapon similar to the peachwood sword. Li Yun Gong King Yu threw into his arms, tears bursting into his beautiful and clear eyes. Okay, it's all right. Li Yun hugged her delicate body that was trembling slightly because of excitement, and stroked her beautiful butterfly bone with his right hand a few times to show comfort. Can Li Yun feel bad for his girlfriend? However, Gong King Yu acted like a baby for a while, then let go of her, and instead pushed her anti Lian into Li Yun's sorrow. Ah! Li, Li Yun. Gong Lianyi was so embarrassed that her whole body was tight. It was the first time that she was embraced by Li Yun so intimately, and she was still in front of her goddaughter or sister, which made her cheeks flushed with embarrassment. 
even the disguise mask could not stop the flush. Li Yun smiled softly, Lian Yi, are you afraid tonight? Over the past few days, Gong Lian Yi's favorability for him has risen to 97 points, but he has not been willing to move any more. Li Yun estimated that because of King Yu's relationship, Lian Yi was a little unwilling to let go. After all, King Yi was the goddaughter she had been watching when she was 12, but now Gong Lian Yi wants to serve Li Yun with her. No, not afraid. But even so, Gong Lian Yi didn't want to let Li Yun go. Instead, he gently wrapped his arms around his waist with his hands, leaning his head against Li Yun's broad chest, enjoying a trace of rare happiness. Because you have Li Yun, I am not too scared. After uttering this sentence in Li Yun's ear, Gong Lian Yi leaned on Li Yun's shoulder again. One second, two seconds, three seconds. Gong Lian reluctantly left Li Yun's embrace, her face was covered with happy blush, her head slightly lowered, like a shy little wife. Auntie Lian, how do you feel? Gong King Yu's words made Gong Lian Yi ashamed and annoyed. She felt that she was less and less majestic as an elder, and she was constantly teased by King Yu. King Yu, is your badass itchy? Ah, forgive me Aunt Lian, they are just asking, and nothing is said. Dare to say it. The two women were laughing and playing, and for a while, the strange atmosphere around them disappeared a lot. Yuan Cheng issued a series of orders, including extinguishing the fire, collecting evidence, reporting to superiors, and blocking the scene so that passers-by and villagers who were watching from afar went back to sleep. And those scattered insects, as long as the doors and windows are closed, the problem is not very big. The only worry is that they may eat crops and vegetables. Fortunately, the suburbs of Zhonghai City are full of greenhouse vegetables, and the loss is still acceptable. Li Yun Upon receiving the order, Yuan Cheng hurried over with his mobile phone and said respectfully, it turns out that you are the mysterious security expert. The leader of our general administration knows you and wants to talk to you, uh, don't worry. Not accountability, but want to know what happened. The leader of the general administration. Li Yun thought for a while, only vaguely remembered that he was called Wang Anji, not only the director of the general administration, but also a standing post in the city and he was regarded as one of the major leaders of Zhonghai City. Let the two women wait for a while, Li Yun and Director Wang talked about the matter roughly. But Director Wang had never come into contact with something like goo worms. If he hadn't heard what Li Yun said, he would have thought he was being teased. Li Yun, are you sure what kind of worm is causing trouble? Wang Anji's tone was shocked. He saw Li Yun two days ago and was already shocked by Li Yun's amazing hacking skills. Unexpectedly, only two days later, Li Yun suddenly said that he had encountered some goo worm. Ahem, Director Wang, do you know Liao Hua? I know, we met two days ago, and he introduced you to me. Wang Anji came back to his senses. Liao Hua was the leader of the National Emergency Response Team. In that case, Liao Hua must know the inside story. How about I contact Liao Hua for you? Trouble Director Wang. Li Yun smiled. No trouble, no trouble, you wait first, I'll be there later, this matter is a bit loud, I have notified Secretary Zhang, we will be on the scene immediately. Li Yun thought for a while, Director Wang, although the suspect has been killed, the scene is still a bit dangerous. There are many bugs, and there may be comrades. What are the worms afraid of? As for the comrades, it just happens that we will catch this group of wanton criminals together. Wang Anji was quite angry, I have called the soldiers of the brigade to go, if there are people who dare to make trouble, kill them on the spot. Li Yun shrugged and said nothing. As the general administration, Wang Anji's body naturally has an upright spirit that is overwhelming. Telling the situation to the two women, Li Yun asked, Why don't you go back first, you may be busy tonight for a long time. Do not. Gong Lian Yi shook his head and raised the peachwood sword in his hand, If we leave, what should we do if there are enemies? 
Li Yun, didn't you say that there is another person named Qi Taining who also controls Gu Worms? Li Yun was also surprised. It stands to reason that Zhou Guangfu sent a three-point takeaway, one for the three fools, Ano, uh, for Su Haud, and the remaining two, can't you Li Sheng eat all of it, right? Is this Shi Taining escaping because of the bad situation? Just then, the system prompt sounded again. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose from the host. Option 1, stay and search the mental hospital with the official staff, find out Yu Li Sheng's training room, reward justice value plus 2000, wisdom plus 1500, experience value plus 350000, purple gift bag 2. White Gift Bag 5, the host has a high probability of obtaining Gu Worm knowledge in the training room. Option 2, Turn Around and Leave. Reward Skill, the host who does not search for corpses is not a good host. Li Yun can't laugh or cry, this is simply a multiple choice question, no choice. However, the justice value is as high as 2000, which means that Yu Le Sheng's training room is in danger and may harm the police who search for it. Lian Yi, King Yu. Li Yun looked at the two girls and smiled, maybe the matter is not over yet. What? Yu Le Sheng has been hiding in the mental hospital for so long, there must be a lair here. Li Yun looked into the depths of the mental hospital, maybe we can find some useful things in his hiding place. Gong King Yu was excited, for example. Knowledge about Gu Worms. The eyes of the two women lit up and the eyes of Uncle Zhou and others became even more fiery. Although they and Li Yun defeated Yu Li Shang together, they did not obliterate their desire for Gu Worms or for powerful power. If they can obtain Yu Li Shang's practice technique, I believe that even if it is disgusting, they can still practice with their teeth. No one can resist the temptation to extend lifespan. Li Yun saw their desire, frowned slightly, and said calmly, after you find Yu Le Sheng's training room, don't move anyone, and listen to my orders. Otherwise, there may be all kinds of goo in the training room. Poison, you can't resist it. Hearing Li Yun's warning, Zhou Shu and the four looked embarrassed. Said it was goo poison, but it was actually just an excuse, the purpose is to make them not the contents inside. Li Yun did not immediately search but went to Su Hao to ask about the situation. He still had the memory of delivering food to Yu Le Sheng. After learning about Su Hao's life, Director Yuan expressed his sympathy to this dirty man who had been stupid for 20 years and said that he would report to the general administration and give Su Hao a medal of bravery to comfort his efforts over the years. That notebook is the result of Su Hao's heart. Gong Lian Yi said that in the future, he would let the butler contact him and give him a sum of money to let Su Hao live a good life. Although he is nearly 50 years old, it is good to get married. As long as you have money, it is easy to get married at the age of 50. Brother Liao, you are here. Not long after waiting, Li Yun saw Liao Hua jump from a military vehicle. There was also Long Xing Yun who came with him. It seems that Long Xingyun was assigned to the emergency team by the leader to investigate with Liao Hua. The details of the six magic doors. Can I not come? Liao Hua waved his hand and drove away the flying bugs, and smiled bitterly, if it weren't for your explanation, I would have thought that there was a resident evil here. This bug is, to be against the sky. This is what he said by a leader of a large position, which shows that Liao Hua's heart is shocked. Li Yun smiled, don't worry, you will soon see more powerful and weird goo worms, brother Liao. Let's go and search Li Sheng's lair to see what's inside. He intends to befriend Liao Hua. After all, fighting the six demon gates in the future will inevitably attract official attention. Just like tonight, it would be easier for Li Yun to have official status. At this moment, the system prompt suddenly sounded and Li Yun's consciousness also slowed down at this moment, and he could clearly see the unknown object that his fist almost collided with. It is a beautiful butterfly that is less than white and thick and dark as splashed ink. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose from the host. Option 1, kill the nine-winged black feather butterfly on the spot, 
reward all attributes plus 10,000, an additional god level skill, and an additional colorful level equipment. Option 2, choose to let it go and nurture her to grow up, no reward, and an extra bonus for Jiden, the host can get the feelings of the black feather butterfly. Li Yun He slowly slapped three question marks in his mind, and the system is giving him another problem. There is no doubt that this is another life choice question, kill or let go. Killing this powerful nine-winged black feather butterfly, Li Yun instantly received an unprecedented super reward, up to 10,000 points of all attributes, plus god level skills, colorful equipment, these three rewards are all very cool something. Moreover, this is also the first time that the system has given him two extra rewards. It can be seen that the level skills and colorful equipment are absolutely very strong. But the second option made Li Yun very entangled. She? The system means that the nine-winged black feather butterfly is a human being, a butterfly with IQ. Li Yun looked at the butterfly, ignoring its appearance, Li Yun saw its eyes with his supervision. Those eyes were small, but very bright, as if they were newborn chicks, looking at him restlessly and curiously as if they were looking at his own father. And many more. Get the feelings of Black Feather Butterfly? Could it be that? Li Yun did not want to crook it elsewhere, but another possibility this butterfly may have just been born. After thinking about it for a long while, Li Yun finally failed to kill her under this weird butterfly and the emotional eyes. Yes, this butterfly may really have an IQ. Boom. Li Yun's fist was abruptly stopped, and the fist wind blew forward, but the black feather butterfly did not move, floating quietly in the air, and Naughty fell on Li Yun's fist, and then flew again. One came to him and looked at him. Ding, the host makes a choice and gets a Jiden. The nine-winged black feather butterfly regards the host as its mother and father. Please feed the newborn black feather butterfly every day. Li Yun can't laugh or cry and his mother? Isn't this cheating? Newborn animals in nature will regard the live animals they first see as their mothers. This is the imprint learning in animal behavior. Li Yun has seen an experiment. It is said that this kind of printing and learning will make small animals have an incomparable feeling of reverence and love for the creatures they see at first sight, which is very magical. Unexpectedly, this goo worm has a high IQ, but it still retains this characteristic. What? Gong King Yu exclaimed, what a beautiful black butterfly. Everyone looked at the nine-winged black feather butterfly. The moment they saw her, they couldn't help but be taken aback, shocked by her beauty. The posture is light, the two pairs of wings are as silky as silk, and the color is a very magical nine-color black. Yes, black can also show a colorful appearance which is the so-called colorful black. This is a very beautiful color with black as the background color and colorful lines. The black feather butterfly gently its wings, but the jet black wings reflect the brilliance of the colors. It is really beautiful. What's even more amazing is that the black feather butterfly its wings very slowly and gracefully, but it can hover in the air like a hummingbird. Hummingbirds are the only birds in nature that can really hover and fly back and forth but hummingbirds rely on the flapping speed of their wings dozens of times per second. And this nine-winged black feather butterfly its wings very slowly. No, the black feather butterfly its wings at will, as if flying is her natural ability. She is called the nine-winged black feather butterfly. Li Yun stretched out his palm, the black feather butterfly fell on it obediently, and a pair of wings magically gathered up, like cicada wings, very supple. This is not an ordinary butterfly. Uncle Zo stared at the butterfly in a fascinating way, and said nonsense not to mention the name of the nine-winged black feather butterfly, how can there be a butterfly that can fold its wings together in nature? It's also a goo worm. Correct. It turns out that there are such beautiful goo worms, I thought they were all disgusting. Gong King Ye was very interested and wanted to step forward to touch the wings of this black feather butterfly but the newly born black feather butterfly was very afraid of life and refused to be touched by someone other than Li Yun. The black figure flashed. Came to Li Yun's shoulder. The wings were not yet spread, 
but they could fly freely. Everyone expressed their vision. After seeing this black feather butterfly that violates the laws of physics, Gu Worm can basically be determined to be real. Being tightly supported by the black feather butterfly, Li Yun had a headache. Forget it, just treat it as having a pet. Let's go in. Li Yun stepped into Li Sheng's training room again, this time no accident happened. This training room is quite large, presenting a structure of three rooms and one hall. The hall is about 100 square meters in size. It is fully furnished and can turn on the lights. I don't know where Li Sheng got the wires. There are several open rooms on the surrounding walls. At a glance, there are various items stored in them. Most people don't know them, and they don't dare to move around. They only know that they are related to cultivating goo worms because there are many bottles and cans. In addition, there were two rooms with closed iron doors. Li Yun shot out with a palm, interrupted the lock, pushed the door open, and found that it was a bedroom, which is probably Yu Li Sheng's. Hey, Li Yun, Aunt Lian, come and see this. Everyone didn't dare to move, but Gong King Yu and the two girls didn't care. King Yu saw a notebook on the table at a glance. When he opened it, he was surprised. Call Li Yun and Aunt Lian to come over. Book title, Gu Insect Theory. Three Day Dream, Poisonous Worm, Characteristic, The Person with the Poisonous Gu Dies Within Three Days, Cultivation Method, Put Five Poisons Into. Puppet Gu, Just Like Its Name, This Gu Can Control People, And The Female Gu Needs To Be Fed With Essence And Blood. The Cultivation Method. Yin and Yang Two Corpses. Li Yun raised his eyebrows and found knowledge about goo worms. This should be the method of cultivating goo worms recorded by Yu Lisheng. The pictures and texts in it are full of pictures. Not to mention, Yu Lisheng's hand painting is quite powerful, and the pictures of goo worms are lifelike, just like printed ones. The only pity is that there is no record of how to deal with these goo worms. It seems that Yu Li Sheng kept a hand specially for fear of being accidentally taken away, causing his biggest dependence to disappear. Because the Gu Worm cultivation method is very strange, the adult worms are also ever-changing. There are many worms created by Li Sheng himself in this book, which belong to him, and naturally cannot easily say how to deal with it. But even so, the value of this book is still amazing. Liao Hua's eyes are about to shine and he quickly asked, Li Yun, I will also make a copy of this on Gu Insects, is it okay? With this Gu Insect theory, the safety of the official agency personnel has a greater guarantee. Although Li Yun can solve the Gu poison, after all, the clone is lacking and cannot be taken care of at all times. At the same time, the four midinate stages of Uncle Zhou all looked at Li Yun with fiery eyes, and they were obviously very interested. Li Yun didn't answer right away. He quickly flipped through the contents of the book, and after pondering for a long time, he replied in their expectant eyes, You can read this book. Suddenly, everyone showed surprise expressions. But, everyone's expressions became tense again. Li Yun definitely has the dominance of the words now, and they have to listen to what they say. You can understand the habits of goo worms but it doesn't mean you can refine them. Li Yun closed the Gu Insect Theory and warned, most of the Gu worms in it are extremely insidious, contrary to social morality, for example, there is a ghost worm. It needs to put a special scorpion larva in a tomb where the Feng Shui phase is the seven ghosts locking the corpse, and then kill nine women born in the lunar year and cultivate with the scorpion larva to obtain this Gu worm. Everyone heard their scalp numb, and their backs were chilly. Goo worms are indeed evil things, whether they are three souls, six souls, or ghosts, the cultivation methods are extremely vicious, it can be described as frenzied and annihilating of human nature. It can be said that once you embark on the path of raising goo, even people with normal three outlooks will become a murderous metamorphosis. Then Li Yun, you nine-winged black feather butterfly. Long Xingyun looked at the black feather butterfly resting on Li Yun's shoulder, are you going to train him? As soon as this sentence came out, 
Liao Hua did not show any unexpected expressions. Gu worms are very insidious, but if Li Yun did this, maybe he could be accommodating, as long as he didn't violate the law. After all, Li Yun was the only official who knew about mysterious things such as goo worms and zombies. Li Yun frowned slightly and opened the goo insect theory again. Let me take a look at the origin of this nine-winged black feather butterfly, well, there really is. Li Yun found it quickly and quickly browsed the records inside. The nine-winged black feather butterfly is said to be one of the top ten evil insects in ancient times. I got it from an ancient cave mansion that has long been deserted. The name was also learned on the stone wall of the cave mansion. At first, it was in a cocoon-like sleep. After taking it out of the cave and injecting a trace of mana, the worm immediately wanted to live. It's a pity, it's a pity that the world's immortal law has long since fallen. This worm will inevitably die after it is born. If it is cultivated, the resources invested by the entire six magic gates may not be sufficient. In desperation, I can only seal this and save it for later. Characteristics, each time a wing is born, a magical power is obtained. When the nine wings are reached, they will go up to the blue sky and go down to the underworld. Cultivation method, according to the records in the cave, the black feather butterfly is born with the magical power to swallow, and can eat all kinds of energy-rich things. Li Yun frowned, stretched out his hand and gently grabbed it quietly on his shoulder, looked at the surrounding black feather butterflies with a pair of curious eyes, and carefully observed in the palm of his hand. This butterfly can make the fairy ridiculous. Babbling. The black feather butterfly flapped its wings and made a series of crisp and sweet sounds, which seemed to be in a good mood. Being able to make a sound already means that she is not an ordinary butterfly. With the crowd watching, she flew up again, took a step, and stopped, as if to let Li Yun follow her. This is... Gong Qingyi was so frightened that he held Li Yun's arm tightly, Gong Lianyi was uncomfortable, hiding behind Li Yun, some of them did not dare to see this horrible picture. This sense of horror is different from what I have seen before. Goo worms gnaw on human corpses, making them unavoidably sympathetic. In addition, these goo worms are densely packed, which can easily cause intensive phobia and a very disgusting feeling. It seems to be, Emil Yang. Li Yun wasn't sure, so he slapped the barbed wire, and suddenly the goo worms scattered and fled. From the performance point of view, these insects have not yet fully become goo worms otherwise they should be extremely combative and would not be afraid of Li Yun's fright. Perhaps Yula Sheng wanted to cultivate a powerful goo worm inside the wire fence using the traditional way of raising goo. It's really him. After the worms dispersed, Emil Yang's scarred body was exposed, already bitten by the worms so unnaturally. But the scary thing is that the bugs didn't bite his vitals, such as his neck, heart, aorta, head, etc. These were not bitten by the bugs. This caused Emil Yang to be unable to move, to die, and to die. He could only helplessly feel his own flesh and blood being bitten bit by bit. This terrible treatment is comparable to ancient torture, Ling Chi was executed. Perhaps it is more terrifying than Ling Chi. Uncle Zhou swallowed, allowing the bugs to kill him slowly and deliberately is also part of cultivating goo worms. This is, too cruel. After seeing this scene, he completely gave up on the goo worm cultivation method. Killing Emil Yang makes the insects more cruel. Maybe it will absorb Emil Yang's feelings of despair and resentment before his death, gnawing his soul after death, and so on. All this is to cultivate a stronger goo worm. Such a vicious method, I believe that as long as the human nature has not been wiped out, the people who have left a trace will not do it. Only the most maddening murderers, who have completely distorted personalities, would do such cruel things. What do you want to say? Emil Yang was not dead yet, Li Yun saw his lips move, and he seemed to be talking about something. In his eyes, there was a look of despair, and they became bleak and lifeless. Kill, me. Liao Hua had learned lip language and understood what Emil Yang wanted to say. Everyone was silent 
as if they had no opinion on it. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose from the host. Option 1, use a small recovery pill to rescue Emil Yang, let him be judged by the law, reward justice value plus 300, white gift bag 3, medium recovery pill 1. Option 2, ignore, no reward. Choice 3, kill him by yourself, reward plus 100 for justice. The system again gave a selection event. Li Yun didn't hesitate to shoot and killed Emil Yang. It is true that rescuing Emil Yang can gain more justice, but he has no hope of survival. The psychological shadow of being bitten by insects is too great, killing him is a relief. Boom. With a gunshot, Emil Yang died. Li Yun mourned for him in his heart. When Emil Yang was involved in the relationship with the Six Demon Sect, he was already doomed to perish. An ordinary person in the body refining realm, mixed with the world of practitioners, isn't this looking for death? Ding, the host has made a choice, and the reward has been issued. The corner of Li Yun's mouth twitched, and the system sometimes notified the extra rewards in advance, and sometimes hid them again, which is really cheating. However, he hadn't received the charisma reward for many days, and he thought he was at the top. Too high a charm value is not a good thing. If Li Yun takes a look, he will be fascinated by the girls and pursue him wildly, crying to give him monkeys or something, if the other person is very beautiful and has a good personality. Li Yun found it difficult to refuse. What a happy trouble! In Li Yun's heartfelt emotion, tonight's action officially came to an end. Li Yun didn't bother to ask for the things in this training room. He left it to Liao Hua to arrange some medical experts and professors to take the bugs away, conduct tests, tests, and anatomy to see if he could find more useful things. Brother Liao, am I leaving now? Li Yun and Liao Hua said hello. He was still directing the follow-up with a group of Zhonghai city leaders. Hearing that, Liao Hua took the time to smile at him, okay? Li Yun, you go first. Let's take care of the rest. If someone is accidentally poisoned, you should contact me first. If you don't have time to contact, use the detoxification pill I gave you. However, Li Yun smiled, my pill is not unlimited. Remember to save some use. It's really expensive. Understand, don't worry, I know everything. Seeing him patting his chest, he assured that Li Yun and King Ye had left, returning to the hotel and driving away. He gave Liao Hua a medium-sized detoxification pill and a few small ones, so that he could use it when someone was dying of poison in an accident. Li Yun estimated that Liao Hua might try to test the detoxification pills to see if they could be copied, but Li Yun estimated that it would be impossible to copy the things produced by the system. If Liao Hua did this, he would only be destined to fiddle. Back at the hotel, the boss looked at Li Yun with a wrong look. Li Yun took the initiative to say hello to him, and said, Boss, why don't you close the shop and sleep? I. The boss had a bitter face and looked helplessly at the many cars around, can I leave? Too many people came to the psychiatric hospital, including the police, the police, the fire brigade, and the soldiers responsible for maintaining order and protecting everyone. Later, there were some doctors, nurses, experts, professors, etc. who were wearing white coats and even wearing gas masks. Here to deal with follow-up matters. What's more, there are also people from the city's landscaping management department who drove a medicine tanker to kill all the insects scattered nearby to prevent disasters. Tonight, for the staff of Zhonghai City, it is destined to be a sleepless night. It doesn't matter to you right? You can go. Li Yun said a good thing for the boss, but the boss pointed away. Li Yun looked over. It turned out to be Zhou Guangfu, who was delivering food. He was being questioned by the police about delivering food to mental hospitals in the past two decades. Li Yun saw Zhou Guangfu's entire body withered, and he was no longer arrogant. Then I can't help it. Li Yun patted the boss on the shoulder and comforted, don't worry, things will be over soon, 
and you will be able to do business normally in the future. The boss was very grateful for this and kept saying that if Li Yun comes back in the future, he will give him a 50% discount. Li Yun smiled, said goodbye to him, and drove out of here. Tonight is really tiring, Black Feather Butterfly is asleep on her stomach, but Li Yun has one last thing to do. Li Yun and Gong Lian Yi were sitting in the back seat of the car, and King Ye drove in front. When there were only three people in the car, Li Yun could finally talk about some more private topics. Lian Yi Li Yun held her little hand, took out the Gu Worm theory, and said softly, Will you care about my decision? What decision? The decision to let you not read the book on Gu Insects. Will not. Gong Lian Yi smiled and shook her head. She had already taken off her disguise mask, and restored her fox and coquettish appearance, as well as graceful and feminine temperament. This smile seemed extremely gentle. Li Yun, King Yu, and I both support your decision, and will not blame you for not showing us this book, because you must have your reason for doing this, and we can understand it. Gong Lian Yi is very said affirmatively. Li Yun smiled, scratched her soft palm, Gong Lian Yi's face flushed, and her body trembled, making her whole body itchy by his small movements. Actually, it's not that you can't read it. Li Yun explained, First, I don't want Uncle Zhou so many people to know. Second, I warned Liao Hua not to pass this book to too many people, so as not to out of control. After all, the human heart is separated from the belly, and the Gu Worm should be treated with caution. After a pause, Li Yun said again, If you think you can show it to him, you can choose to give this book to them later. Gong Lian Yi said in surprise, You mean, let us also read the entire part of this book? Of course. Li Yun scratched her little nose, I believe in you, and in King Yu. You will definitely take this matter seriously. Gong Lian Yi smiled. Suddenly, she glanced at Gong King Yu who was driving, and then proactively kissed Li Yun on the cheek. Thank you, Li Yun. Gong Lian Yi's face was blushing. She didn't know what to thank Li Yun, but suddenly wanted to give him a kiss to express her inner excitement. Aunt Lian. What? I saw. Gong Lian Yi's face was red and hot, Li Yun laughed, and actively stopped Gong Lian Yi and kissed her fragrant lips. Gong Lian Yi's eyes widened first, and then trembling, passive, stiff, unable to resist. Afterwards, the body was soft again, jerky responding, clumsy, sweet, and happy. In the end, Gong Lian Yi fell softly into Li Yunkai, enjoying the rare intimacy with him. After a long time, Gong Lian Yi said quietly, Yun, this is my first kiss. Okay, I know. Li Yun caressed her hair. The fox beautiful beauty now has blushing cheeks, tender and sweet eyes, looking forward to her posture charming and unspeakable, soft and delicate, and beautiful in appearance, which is really lovely. It's a pity that King Ye was still driving ahead, and it seemed to be jealous, but did not interrupt the intimate communication between the two. Lian Yi, I will be nice to you in the future. Li Yun added, there is also King Yu, as long as you follow me, I will definitely not let you down. Gong Lian Yi was about to talk. Li Yun pressed her finger to her small mouth and smiled, Of course, this situation has developed now, even if you don't follow me, I will take you away. His domineering tone made Gong Lian Yu Fang's heart tremble, and she had forgotten what she wanted to say before, and now she just wanted to hug her lover tightly. It's just that Gong Lian Yi's heart is full of affection for Li Yun, but there is still a trace of worry that prevents her from fully investing in. What are you stealing for? Gong Lian, who was driving in front, asked fiercely. In fact, she was jealous. Snatch it, Li Yun raised his eyebrows, and said in a frivolous tone, Of course, let you beauties, be my wife. Gong Lian Yi was so ashamed that she hid in Li Yun's shame and dared not see anyone. Go to hell. Gong King Yu cursed shyly. King Yu, don't worry, you will be there soon. What about me? Ah, I don't want it. 
Li Yun didn't say what it was, but Gong King Yu already knew what it was, and her heartbeat couldn't help but speed up a lot. Sure enough, after she drove the car back to the mansion, Li Yun got out of the car first, pulled her out of the driver's seat, took her slender waist, and hugged her tightly. Afterwards, he kissed him bitterly. Hmm. Gong King Yu's long eyelashes trembled, and finally closed slowly, responding to Li Yun jerky. For a long time, the points are lost. Gong Lianyi, a classical and dignified beauty, was blushing on her beautiful cheeks at this moment, and she was so beautiful that all the bodyguards were stunned. Strictly speaking, this was her first kiss. Last time she simply bit Li Yun. Still jealous. Li Yun asked with a smile. Hey. Gong King Yu snorted, as if expressing dissatisfaction. Hey? Still jealous? That's no way, let's do it again. Well, don't, you big-eyed, boo. I'm not jealous. After letting go of the charming Gong King Yu, Li Yun hugged Gong Lian Yi, who was also flushed with shame, and was close for a long time. In the mansion, the maids and bodyguards were very happy to be back home, although it is now more than three o'clock in the evening. Unexpectedly, Li Yun, a kid, actually openly embraced the two golden flowers of their palace, and wanted to be intimate, making the two girls blush. But, Gong King Yu and Gong Lian Yi, these two beauties, one big and one small, let him be frivolous, without avoiding them, and looked shy but happy. For a moment, everyone was stunned. Hello everyone. I have brought your young lady and Miss Gong back safely. Li Yun Chiki, hugged the two women into the mansion like a left hug. Then, Gong King Yu, who was ashamed, bit his shoulder again. Don't let go? You pervert. Gong King Yu blushed and held Aunt Lian's hand, and the two beauties disappeared in front of Li Yun like this, and would never give him another chance tonight. Unfortunately. Li Yun smiled and licked his lower lip. The sweet taste of two female cherry lips still remained on it. They were exceptionally delicious. They are indeed two beauties of the palace family. Li Yun is deeply happy to have them. The only pity is that Gong Lian Yi seems to still have concerns. The favorability level stays at 98, but she refuses to rise. No words for a night. Li Yun took a shower and then went to bed ready to sleep until noon the next day, but unexpectedly, at seven o'clock in the morning, he felt a strange tingling sensation on his face, as if someone was there. Tickle his nose with his hair. Kaxia, don't make trouble. Li Yun waved his hand in a daze. He thought it was Kaxia who was making trouble. This girl had liked doing this since she was a child. But after the thing was shot, the missile didn't let go. Instead, it got more and more vigorous, jumping on his face vigorously, and it kept making clear and sweet screams. Eh, ah, ah. Black feather butterfly. Only then did Li Yun wake up a bit, it turned out that the nine-winged black feather butterfly he adopted last night was making trouble. You little fellow. Li Yun leaned against the head of the bed in a dumbfounded manner, stretched out her hand and nodded her wings. The black feather butterfly innocently made a crisp cry again, as if to say hello to Li Yun. No, this cry is very urgent, a voice that is longing for something. Little guy, what do you want to say? Li Yun looked at her suspiciously, the black feather butterfly flew back and forth, a pair of beautiful black wings flapped more and more eagerly, and finally flew fiercely onto a plate of fruit on the table, the wings shook and seven or eight apples suddenly turned into powder. Into her body. Then, the black feather butterfly flew back quickly, looking at Li Yun longingly with a pair of small eyes. I understand. Li Yun slapped his head, it turned out that this little guy was hungry. But black feather butterfly was not full after eating seven or eight apples. It seemed that ordinary food was nothing like nothing to her. According to records found by Yula Sheng in the cave, the black feather butterfly needs to eat something rich in energy to successfully evolve into a nine-winged butterfly. Energy-rich, nuclear power plant. 
Li Yun's brain hole was wide open, but it is estimated that it will not work. The system rewarded him with a Jidan, this thing is very precious, belonging to the golden grade item, the black feather butterfly should eat this. Sure enough, after Li Yun took out the Zujidan, the little guy's eyes lit up, and he happily circled Li Yun's head, and when he threw on the Zujidan, his wings vibrated again, and a happy face would be Zujidan. Eat down. Then, the black feather butterfly flew to Li Yun pitifully. Not enough. Li Yun was shocked. This is the first time he has obtained Zujidan. If the black feather butterfly can only eat Zujidan, he will definitely not be able to raise it. Nodding, black feather butterfly is still hungry. Li Yun had no choice but to put out all the pills, and the black feather butterfly cheered and pounced on them to swallow them. No way. Li Yun grabbed her beautiful black wings and told her with a serious face that he could only take one small pill a day. Li Yun had fewer than a hundred pills for building foundation pills, nourishing skin care pills, and detoxification pills. Therefore, if the black feather butterfly had to take a lot of medicine to survive, Li Yun really couldn't afford this little guy. Does it really take her to oil plants, nuclear power plants, and absorb that energy? Although I haven't tried it, according to the knowledge of chemistry and physical science, it should not work. Beeb. Black Feather Butterfly understood Li Yun's meaning, pondered for a long while, and after obtaining Li Yun's consent, swallowed all the more than twenty pills, and then turned it into a black silkworm cocoon. Then she became a, little elf. At noon, after Gong King Ye got up, he was surprised to see a little girl who was only three inches tall in the palm of Li Yun's palm, happily jumping around. Upon asking, I learned that she was the nine-winged black feather butterfly. A butterfly turned into a human-like little girl. This magical change made both Gong King Yu and the girls dumbfounded. So beautiful. Gong King Yu leaned forward and looked at black feather butterfly carefully, and found that she was only ten centimeters tall and looked like a cute little girl of seven or eight years old. She was wearing a black dress with thick black hair that fell straight to her hips. The skin is very fair and delicate, and the complexion is as white as fat, which forms a strong contrast with the black hair. Beautiful, delicate, and small, just like a fairy in a fairy tale. In fact, the black feather butterfly is now a cute and beautiful elf. Li Yun raised the index finger of his right hand. Suddenly, black feather butterfly seemed to see something interesting, and suddenly jumped on his finger happily grabbed the index finger and practiced the horizontal bar, still babbling in his mouth. B.A.B.A. -ba, what do you think? And so on, like a sentence that a child just learned to speak. She still talks. Gong Lian Yi looked at Black Feather Butterfly in surprise. Correct. Li Yun explained, I have a high IQ. I can understand what I tell her, but I can also understand it, but I can't speak well like a two-year-old. Don't all children be like this. Gong Lian Yumu smiled, holding Black Feather Butterfly cautiously only after Li Yun told Black Feather Butterfly that these two were not bad guys and could be trusted, Black Feather Butterfly accepted her. King Yu only spoke when he was two years old when he was a child. I remember it clearly. Gong Lian Yi raised the Black Feather Butterfly in his palm, and said with emotion, this little guy is really cute, Li Yun, will she lose her wings when she becomes a human? The black dress on her body is, and, Li Yun cut a sip of an apple and handed it to Black Feather Butterfly. The latter's eyes lit up and grabbed the apple the size of her head and ate it happily. The food was fairly fast, and it was over in a few clicks. It's amazing. Gong King Yu looked very surprised, this little guy ate something that was relatively large but his stomach didn't bulge at all. Li Yun smiled and said, her ability to smash food by flapping her wings is gone. What? Gong Lian Yi was a bit pity, how come the black feather butterfly became weaker after becoming a human? As if she understood Gong Lian Yi's words, black feather butterfly looked a little depressed. Li Yun stroked her head with his fingers, and black feather butterfly immediately became happy again, jumping from Gong Lian Yi's soft palm to Li Yun's arm. 
on. She followed her arm to the pocket of Li Yun's shirt. After yawning, she went to sleep, holding the soul-raising ring that Li Yun carried with her. Baba, Anan. Before going to bed, he said something Li Yun taught her. So, that's it. Li Yun shrugged and explained, in fact, it's not getting weaker, but the black feather butterfly is adapting to the current environment. After black feather butterfly ate his pile of pills, she succeeded in growing a second pair of wings. Amazingly, she lost the ability to smash food by flapping her wings, but gained the ability to eat food with her mouth, just like humans. The wings were also retracted and turned into dresses, and the magical levitation ability was naturally gone. All this is to adapt to the world where spiritual power is scarce. Li Yun speculated that the ancient myths and legends may be true. There were indeed demons and ghosts, gods and gods, and powerful goo worms like nine-winged black feather butterflies. But in modern times, the aura has declined and the monsters are almost extinct. It is absolutely impossible to cultivate the nine-winged black feather butterfly. As a result, the black feather butterfly converged her ability and reduced her energy consumption to adapt to this world where aura was scarce and there was no heaven and earth treasure for her to devour. In a sense, the black feather butterfly is really strong. After listening to Li Yun's analysis, Gong King Yu looked at him with questioning eyes, so, Li Yun, your pills can cultivate black feather butterflies. I don't dare to talk about training, I promise she won't die. Li Yun smiled. He still likes black feather butterflies. This little guy is even more cute after turning into a human form. He fed her a small pill for a few days. Fruit rice is acceptable. Seeing what the two women wanted to ask, Li Yun said, Well, you don't need to know the source of my pill. Although this thing is very precious, I can still come up with some. Gong King Yu spit out her little pink tongue cutely, Li Yun, you must come from a hidden school similar to the six demon sects, right? Humph, don't think I don't know. Li Yun shrugged, did not admit or deny, let them and others guess what they want. Gong Lian Yi frowned slightly, as if thinking of something, but didn't dare to ask. Li Yun found her expression and was about to ask a question when the system prompt came. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose the host. Option 1, ask what Gong Lian Yi is struggling with, reward Gong Lian Yi with plus 1, random green gift bag asterisk 2, and obtain skill, understanding. Option 2, do nothing, no reward, Gong Lian Yi will continue to struggle. Li Yun was stunned, what was Lian Yi struggling with? It stands to reason that Gong Lian Yi is now the innate late cultivation base, the real power elder of the palace family and the excellent junior King Yu, plus Li Yun is also very good to her, with the peachwood sword in his hand, which is completely unnecessary. Worry about something. If you have to worry about something, then it can only be. Lian Yi. Li Yun looked at her, are you thinking something in your heart? Tell me about it to your husband. Gong Lian Yi was so ashamed that Li Yun actually called her wife in front of King Yu at this time, making her blush all over. Gong King Yu gave Li Yun a roll of eyes, and she went to ask Aunt Lian what she was thinking. Actually, it's nothing. Gong Lian hesitated, and said embarrassingly, I just... I just think that Li Yun, you have a lot of magical medicine, maybe it can be cured. She is embarrassed to say the following words. Li Yun has a pill, but it is for people close to him. Although Gong Lian Yi also took the pill given by Li Yun, he could not actively let him give it to others. Otherwise, it seems greedy. It's okay, let's talk about it. Li Yun smiled, your husband, me, nothing else, there are still plenty of pills. Big bragging. Gong King Yu glared at him, but he didn't object to Li Yun's taking advantage of them. Gong Lian Yi glanced at Li Yun gratefully before telling what she had struggled with before. In fact, it is very simple. It is an old senior of the palace who was injured a few years ago, and has been recuperating for these years, but it has not been effective. 
What Gong Lianyi didn't say was that she didn't really care about the life and death of the elder named Gong Mingjian. After all, Gong Mingjian didn't know her well, and Gong Mingjian had lived for a long time. Inevitably, manpower is irreversible. She wanted to treat the old man, but she actually had another important consideration. Gong Mingjian still has a very respectable position in the family summary. If Li Yun cures him, he can reduce the resistance from the family and marry her and King Yu. That's it. Gong Lianyi's face blushed and her voice trembled. If Li Yun can heal Gong Mingjian, she will definitely be recognized by the palace family. By then. Li Yun nodded, and said confidently, I know, don't worry, it's very simple for me to treat patients and save people, and I can do it by giving you a pill. Ding, the host has made a choice and the reward has been issued. Just when Li Yun said that only one pill can heal Gong Mingjian, the system prompt came again. Ding, trigger the option event, please choose from the host. Option 1, give a recovery pill to Gong Lianyi, let her take the pill at the corner of Gong Ming's sword, reward skill, Lubin, mentally retarded 250. Option 2, give the medium recovery pill to Gong Lianyi, no reward. Option 3, ask concubine Wang Ching about Gong Mingjian, and reward a white gift bag asterisk 1. Li Yun looked dumbfounded, what kind of weird option is Nima's? 250 mentally retarded? Is it a mobile game called King? Judging from the three options, the third option is undoubtedly the most correct, but the reward is too small. Moreover, what is the relationship between Gong Mingjian and concubine Wang Ching? Shouldn't. Li Yun was taken aback. Could concubine Wang Ching actually be over a hundred years old? Li Yun couldn't help but feel a chill when he thought that the hot and charming girl was actually an old man with wrinkles. This is so sensational. Don't be so hurry. Gong Lianyi waved her hand quickly, the elder is not too serious. Wait, after some days, I, I and King Yu, her face became very red. Gong King Yu the same goes for his face. You and King Yu will take me back to the palace. Li Yun teased, successfully making the shy Gong King Yu burst out, pinching his waist and squeezing. Ahem, all right. Li Yun held Gong King Yu's little hand without moving her, and said with a serious face, I'm afraid it's not that simple. What? Your palace family is considered a big family, and I must have invited many doctors to see Gong Mingjian, right? The two women nodded. If it can't be cured, it means it's not a simple physical problem, maybe other aspects are involved, and it needs a long-term plan. I don't understand. Li Yun smiled, did not explain too much, put this matter down for the time being, and talked about it later. Later, he had to contact concubine Wang Qing, the recent development of things always hit him in the face, which made Li Yun very embarrassed. After lunch, Li Yun did not stay long, and chose to bid farewell to Gong King Yu's two daughters and return to Zhonghai City. King Yu, Lian Yi, take care. Li Yun gave the two beauties, the young and the young, a hug, and walked into the car that Gong Lian Yi had prepared for him under the reluctant eyes of the two women. Gong Lianyi ordered a driver to drive him back to Longyang County. Li Yun did not refuse. This saved the trouble of going to the station to buy a ticket. All he had to do was to sit in the car along the way. With his current relationship with the two daughters of the palace family, he no longer needs to care about these little things. The son. The driver asked respectfully, Is it near Zhike in Longyang County? I'll set up the navigation. Correct. Li Yun got into the car and sat down. Gong Lianyi was really nice to him. This car was her car, worth tens of millions, the sofa was very soft, and the back seat still had Gong Lianyi's body fragrance, which was extremely comfortable. The driver's driving skills were very good. The car slowly set off. Li Yun relaxed, took out his mobile phone and chatted with Fang Shui and Li Fang for a while telling them that he would return to Longyang County in an hour. Then, Li Yun made a call to someone who he didn't really want to communicate with. 
Hey. There was a lazy woman's voice on the phone, her voice soft and lazy, as if she was a seductive woman leaning on the bed, staring at you with seductive eyes. It's me. Li Yun said in a deep voice. Which green onion are you? A number character appeared on Li Yun's forehead. Hey, why didn't you speak? The seductive voice laughed, which green onion are you? Why haven't I seen you? Wanching concubine. Li Yun gritted his teeth, it's me, Ba, it's me, Li Yun. He was almost taken into the ditch by the enchantress. Ha 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 ha. Concubine Wanching smiled triumphantly, her silver bell-like laughter made it hard to believe that she was a centenarian. Li Yun got goosebumps, and asked quickly, Consort Wan Qing, how old are you this year? What? Consort Wan Qing didn't recover for a while. How old are you? Li Yun said in a smiling voice, I heard that your practitioners have a long lifespan. Perhaps your concubine Qing Qing is actually a hundred-year-old woman? I have to call you grandma. You you you. This time it was concubine Wan Qing's turn to be impatient, her pure and beautiful face flushed, making it hard to imagine that she was the saint of the six magic doors. Okay, stop teasing you, I don't bother to care how old you are, let's talk business. Li Yun pulled a city back and was in a good mood, but concubine Wan Qing's mood was not so good, and said angrily, I am 800 years old this year. It is the mother you have never met. Come and call me mom. Li Yun raised his eyebrows, and it seemed that his background from an orphanage had already been known by concubine Wan Qing. But it is estimated that concubine Wan Qing could not find who Li Yun's biological parents were. Of course, Li Yun didn't bother to look for it. Stop arguing with you, let me get it right. What business? Come and ask me for help. Concubine Wan Qing smiled slightly. You were showing great power again last night. I heard that a person in the divine refining realm called Yu Li Shang was killed by you. Li Yun's expression turned calm, and said, Shi Taining told you. He found two takeaway boxes in Li Sheng's training room last night, which meant that there was one person besides Yu Li Shang last night. Don't care where I know it. Concubine Wan Qing said, even if no one tells me that the people in the six demon gates want to check, they can quickly find out who is doing the trick. Unless you are from the hidden sacred valley. But she knew that Li Yun could not be from the hidden sacred valley. Li Yun smiled and said, What if I find it? What if I can't find it? You. Concubine Wan Qing was so angry for the first time and couldn't help crying coldly, Li Yun. Do you think you have some mysterious things and you are invincible? Have you known the six demon gates and the hidden sacred valley, do you know how much power our two families have? The six demon gates really want to kill you, let you run to the ends of the world, and within an hour, you will definitely die. Then let them come. Li Yun answered calmly. Before she got angry, Li Yun laughed, Okay, thank you for worrying about me. But please don't worry, please don't underestimate it, I am not that easy to kill. Concubine Wan Qing was speechless, and finally said angrily, Whatever you do, I won't be sad if you die, I still live according to my lifestyle. Li Yun seemed to think there was something in the words of Concubine Wan Qing, but she didn't say it, and probably wouldn't say it even after asking. By the way, I am looking for you this time, just to ask you a question. Ask. What kind of goo worm do you want to know? Consort Wan Qing smiled, as if she was not the one who was angry and angry before, and the person with rich emotional changes was not her. No, it's Gong Ming Jian. Gong Ming Jian. Concubine Wan Qing's tone became a little unpleasant. People from the palace family? By the way, you have lived in the palace family in the past few days with two beauties, right? Li Yun was helpless, consort Wan Qing, did you send someone to follow me? Why do you know everything about me? Don't, don't get me wrong. Concubine Wan Qing hurriedly denied, I didn't bother to send someone to follow you, 
but Shi Taining asked my maid and asked me what is the relationship between you and the six demon gates. The underlying meaning is that killing you will arouse my disgust. What she didn't notice was that her cheeks were flushed. Because she really sent someone to collect Li Yun's whereabouts and information quietly, and she always knew what he was doing. This kind of behavior is no longer surveillance, but, slutty tracking. What did you say? Li Yun asked calmly. Concubine Wan Qing was silent before she said leisurely, naturally tell the truth. Be honest. Li Yun frowned. This concubine Wan Qing always said halfway, making it hard to guess what she was thinking. Okay, it's okay, thank you for reminding me. Li Yun smiled, Shi Taining wants to come and kill me, let him come, I don't care about ordinary goo worms. There are six divisions of the six demon gates, heaven and humanity, Azura, and so on. Shi Taining is a beast, that is, in Buddhist legends, people fall into after committing evil, and can only be reincarnated as beasts, and slowly accumulate merit before becoming people. In the six demon sect, the animal path seems to raise Gu. Li Yun did not ask concubine Wan Qing about these matters in detail. Hehe, he, I hope you really won't die. Concubine Wan Qing smiled faintly, then turned to the subject, I have never heard of Gong Mingjian, and I am curious, why are you asking about my palace family? Because the system prompts. Of course, Li Yun could not say this sentence. I don't know. Li Yun's heart moved, the detoxification pill I gave you last time, did you give you an elder to eat, does she know? I don't know, I will help you ask her when I have time. Consort Wan Qing chuckled. Do you want to deal with him? Do you need me to provide you with some information? As long as I want to check, no one in the martial arts can escape my eyes. Her tone is extremely domineering, and she reveals a strong sense of confidence, as if the so-called martial arts in the rivers and lakes is a joke in her eyes. In fact, it is true. People who only practice martial arts are far from those of the six demon gates. The former is not much better than mortals, and the latter is already a means of cultivators. Don't mess around, it's not about this, you just help me find the information. Ro. Seeing her promise, Li Yun finally breathed a sigh of relief, and dealing with this demon girl was really hard. By the way, Qing Concubine, you have helped me several times, do you need me to do something for you? Humph, do you have anything to greet me? Except for the pill, I don't even look at the rest. Don't need pill. Li Yun laughed jokingly, detoxification pill, recovery pill, foundation pill, forget the foundation pill, I guess you don't like it, but the first two are pretty easy to use. Concubine Wan Qing couldn't help asking, what is the effect? Look, you still need it. Fuck, what kind of dirty words are you? Ah. That's roughly what it means. Need, the word is a bit vague, I don't expect concubine Wan Qing to understand it. As the two chatted, Li Yun's heart suddenly jumped and turned to look behind him.